What? I was just gonna lay here and, you know, hang out. No, just, I, I sleep with a nude, no big deal. We're gonna go to sleep, have a great night's sleep. That's all. Are you bafooking with me? You swinging that hiney in front of me all the way to this here village. Whoa, whoa. And you ain't gonna give it up, Wait, sister? That's my body. I'm just walking around. No big deal. Let's get real. Roll up to the counter person and say, hey, uh, heard there was some trouble or whatever. Can you give me... Uh, some kind of lowdown about that. Oh yeah, there's a, a yeah. group of four thugs that have been just doing whatever they want in, yeah, they're in probably town. Yeah, just chilling in some area, not they're, moving around much. Yeah, taking things. Yeah. Uh, you know, being yeah. general jerks. Uh, I don't know what if anyone's going to do anything about it, but it, uh, it would be great be if good some if they were gone. came along and took care of it. Yeah, no, I get it. Yeah. Uh, just uh, reward, anything, money, D gear. Eternal thanks. Uh, I'd probably give you some free meals and a free stay uh, anytime you wanted. I missed it, man. Shit. So at this point, I'm trying to keep the voices at bay, which I don't know if you figured out at this point, that alcohol keeps it down. Thankfully, the wine is helping. Um, but right now, I'm getting flashes, like Event Horizon style, when they're, <laughs> of what I'm going to do to this woman. Oh, jeez. Um, that <laughs> Warcore is basically oh, <clears throat> putting it... Um, right now, the, the image is cutting her from ear to ear and basically just filling her mouth with my semen. All right, uh, welcome back to Twits and Crits, where the buffest dudes on the internet play the most complicated game ever invented. Her name is Elise. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Look at that. That's wow. a good bump you got there. Yeah. Thank you. Jeez. All right, so who wants to tell us uh, what happened last time? What didn't I don't happen. remember. I think my head is killing. Me. More than anything, I think uh, Decker really showed that he is a man of the people, uh, toasted by all. Uh, uh, the people's hero. I think they came to call not him. Not great at cards. So if though. we get not great at cards, but that's fine. Lost with uh, lost with grace. Uh, uh, basically, led led rounds of, of singing, and now everybody loves him. I believe is what happened. That's, nope. that's so let's I just don't go think any of that happened. None of that happened. So we found out that Decker's in denial. That's mm. neat. Yeah, we found okay. out he's insane. Well, crazy insane. Well, only only the viewer found that. Derek knows. Oh, that's true. But he was he was in his own rage. Nobody so. knows about your semen dreams. <laughs> Oh, God. You know, the sexual tension between Grimo and yeah. Shattercock. Grimo's maybe not as adult and mature and confident as Grimo lets that's, on. That's right, you there got shut no down. sexual tension. I had the best night's sleep of my life. It was great. We learned that Shattercock's Mark boobs yeah. stand straight up even when she's laying down. Yeah, absolutely. She's got a banging body. Yeah. 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 Banging. Well, it's, it's just, actually, it's all she, sagging, yeah. Well, but once she takes off the brazier, they almost they kind of bigger. go up. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 It's all magic spells holding it up. She has sleep apnea because her breasts are <laughs> uh, Myriadis, uh, I don't think slept at all. <laughs> How did you sleep? Uh, I slept okay. I kind of woke up when there's a big dog fellow came in and rustled around on his bed. And sorry about that. <laughs> all that, but could have been could have been worse. Do we roll to recover hit points, or we just have them all back? Do we we full rest, back. so we get everything. Yeah. Okay. Uh, did we level up? Yeah, you well, you leveled up after the cave. Yeah. Oh, okay. The previous yeah, episode. Too. I just head down to the that. to the in desk and I drop off my letter that I wrote uh, during the night for my sister and my. Are your pants still tented? My pants are not tented. <laughs> I, I rolled um, for. But boner. the pleat is like permanently so, uh, <laughs> cinched into the pants. Those now. balls are swollen. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh. <laughs> it's hard well, to walk. So Vang Mai takes the letter and looks at this and he goes, "Where, the, what is this? Where does this go?" The Jaya, you. Tell me you're not familiar with the Jaya? Never heard of it. It's a beautiful place. You should check it out sometime. Please make sure that letter gets to my, uh... Just make sure that letter gets there. I'll do my best. Uh, anything for the trouble? <sighs> it's a silver piece. Oh, thank you. Who are you sending that letter to? Uh, Derek was back in that chair. Sharpening, sharpening his, his, his scimitar and observed Grimo come down and hand the letter. And then your beeswax. This is an A-B conversation, so see yourself out. Grimo, I need you to help me put my bra on! Uh oh, coming! <laughs> <laughs> and Grimo. Audience <laughs> applause, executive <laughs> producer. <laughs> Grimo's shoulders slump and he, he scurries upstairs. <laughs> Hurry up! My breasts are too high! <laughs> Coming. Oh, so your bra keeps the breast down. Yeah, yeah wow. it holds them down. Yeah. That's amazing. Um, <laughs> their nipples are always trying to. I am, I am crazy hungover, and I, I stumble down the stairs, uh, and I wake up, and I, I go to the uh, front desk, and I go, any, any mail? Did I get anything? Can I roll for mail? <laughs> sure, roll, roll for the mail. Yeah, I got a ten. Did I get any mail? <laughs> no mail. <I'm> sorry. <laughs> okay, maybe next time. Uh, Where are you guys letters from? 
I don't know. I'm, I mean, I'm watching this whole circus yeah. unfold in front of me. As I... Would you like a warm, hot meal, sir? Absolutely. Uh, One silver beast, please. Fuck you. Uh, fine. Yeah, that's good. I, I, I said that under my breath. Fuck you. Yeah, that's good, uh, silver. Do you have anything to wake? Uh, I need some... What's, I don't know, what's fantasy for caffeine? Rouge bowl. Do you have any rouge bowl? Never heard of it. Uh, <laughs> that doesn't salt. exist. Do you have any Veruca salt? We've got some really strong tea, though. Oh, that okay, that yeah. might get you up and going. Okay, I'll, I'll take some of that slanted tea. Um, <laughs> what? Man. The whole hill's on a slope. <laughs> it might be some spit in that tea. <laughs> you can't tell. What? You guys are weird. Roll to see if you can tell. <laughs> Slant tea on eyes. Oh shit, that was racist. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, so yeah, I, I, uh, I take some tea and um, a hot meal uh, to try to cure to cure this hangover. So I'm just munching away, and the, the orcs starting to stink a little bit, but it's still there. Oh, it's still there. Yeah, it's still there. It's quiet at this moment because I have a pounding headache, so I can't really hear any any voices. Green and Chattercock come walking down the stairs together. Uh, and I'm, uh -oh. I'm patting her on the shoulders. Thanks again. I really appreciate the help. <laughs> no problem. Um, <laughs> and I'm right behind him. I'm just kind of like, ugh. <laughs> 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 he heard the whole struggling. But just keep your arms down. Uh, oh, it's, it's really tight. Oh, <laughs> it's, 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 oh they hit me in the oh, face. It's touching my butt. <laughs> oh, come on down. <laughs> we, need, we need Miri to do the, the office face where he just goes, yeah. Oh, <laughs> the camera. Can you look at the camera real quick, yeah. Matt? I already did. Uh, <laughs> uh, Mary, where are we heading to now? What's, what's the plan? What's, is, where is Decker? Uh, I mean, I'm like, great question. Oh. Where, is for, Decker? Yeah, where is Decker? Where is Decker? Waiting Shh. for events to transpire. Shh. Uh, I, I, I will probably have woken up, and I'll be like listening for the hallway for people stomping out. Okay. Um, if things occur, uh, that's fine. But I'll, I'll probably peek my head out in the hallway. You should call for a late checkout. <laughs> <laughs> Just out the window. Hi! <laughs> I'm sleeping in. I'm Sorry. staying up here! Check okay. out at 11. Sorry, no, we can't budge. And then he goes, 11. Looks to the sun. <laughs> <laughs> no, I got, a, I got a little clock in the lower right corner of my laptop. Uh, There's no power. Yes, <laughs> there is arcane power. Leave face. Oh, man. There's no camera over there. Shit. All right, uh, so uh, some, some cheat. And uh, another guy that only has one hand uh, walk into the, the common room of the uh, hotel that you guys are staying at. As you all walk down, I guess he's still kind of peering in, waiting for something to happen, maybe, so he can jump in and, and miss this guy. Um, Miri, Miri, go but, talk to those, those bafooks. Okay. But some cheat goes, oh, uh, travelers, uh, new folk to this town. Um, I don't know if it came up yesterday, but there's a few thugs... Uh, that are taking what they want, pushing us around. Um, Sai Te here uh, is a fighter, but he's only got one hand, so uh, he wasn't really quite capable of doing this on his own, but... Doesn't sound like a very good fighter to me. <laughs> <laughs> How many thugs should, are we should talking? Should you... Four. Four. Should you feel like it's something you could take on, we would appreciate getting rid of these... these what are you going to give us? These ruffians. Well, we don't have a lot. Um, Probably something stupid like the inter eternal gratitude of this town. <laughs> I would certainly give you my eternal gratitude. Uh, so would Old, everyone yeah. in the town. Yeah. Um, I know we can offer some food, some lodging. Um, I do this. <laughs> if you would require some sort of payment, I'll see what I can do as far as is getting a few coins from around the village. Decker, how much do we need for this? I mean, probably more than it's worth. Here's the thing. This guy wouldn't be here telling us this unless there's some reason. still upstairs. Oh, okay. I haven't come down yet. I, well, I mean, it's hard to tell it's up to you. I feel like there's some jump cuts going on. Uh, so, I mean, what I would probably do is just be like, so whenever there's downstairs in a wall, there's like that little crack mm -hmm. right where the stairs meet the wall. I'd just be like peeking around there. <laughs> <laughs> so, that's, oh, okay. that's so where, Shattercock turned and asked yeah, you what um, you wanted to do. So I can see you. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah. I, as soon as you like turn and see me, I would disappear, and then you'd say what you said, yeah. and then I would appear again, yeah. <laughs> and, and then essentially say what I was saying, oh. which is, uh, uh, I mean, there's no reason for us to do it, and we'll probably miss the Moondog Brothers if we st spend too long here, but these things happen for a reason, usually, so we should probably just take care of this. I uh, understand if you have other things to do, but you will have the eternal gratitude of Jayen, and always a bed to stay in. 
Uh, and uh, away. food to eat. Derek's giving me daggers, so I would just like my head would just kind of disappear back <laughs> behind the wall. Um, I hear the voice in my head say, "He'll do," and so I perk up and go, uh, "We will, we'll comply uh, as long as we can bring your one-handed fighter with us." Mm -hmm. Mary, is that what we're gonna do? That's what we're gonna do. They need some help, and uh, maybe they'll they'll think up some info about uh, these moon dog guys. Grimo? We so. in. All right, let's okay. do it. What's the one-handed fighter's name? So Saite walks up and goes, thank you, Doesn't matter. Uh, strangers. I reach out to shake his hand and realize it's, uh, that's the wrong <laughs> he hand. You, he hands you the same hand. <laughs> yeah, just yeah. Let's do this. <laughs> just you got to give him a little over. <laughs> there we go. Plus it's, handshake. It's Saite? Yeah. Saite. <laughs> He's trying to see what it spells Taking backwards. Notes. Uh, <laughs> smart. So well, Saite. Uh, it's ooh, weird. No, I, I couldn't have done this on my own, uh, and I appreciate your help. Uh, these thugs shouldn't be too much trouble. I probably could have done them in myself, but uh, four on one is a little bit is a little bit uh, rough. Um, Did these thugs have a hideout or some kind of headquarters? I, I know nothing about these guys. Um, Didn't you I, say you fought them? No, I'd like to. I couldn't do it on my own. Where I, do they I'm hang afraid, out? Uh, you know, I only have one hand. Um, someone took my, you know, an evil bastard took my other. Um, and I'll get revenge on that fucker. But um, well, the mouth on this today one. we've got these thugs. We got some backstory here. Yeah. So how are we supposed to track down these buffooks? Who? Yeah. Just where point are they? us in the right direction. Thugs. Where do we go? Oh, thugs. they're down. They're they're down at the end of the yard. They're oh, uh, they're hanging out. Go. Hanging out That's at the uh, bar. Oh, all right. Let's go to the bar. Let's go to the bar. So you Come guys on, are going to help. You We're going to the bar, Decker. Yeah. Uh, like go Shoot. away again. <laughs> Should we create some kind of plan of attack? No, there's four thugs. Are you kidding? Okay. We got. You can send the one-handed fighter up there. He'll knock out half of one. I'll, uh, Do you guys follow this guy? Or what, yeah. What, well, yeah. I'll, I'll I'll like peek my head out and then come down the stairs and be like, I, if it's just four people, this is going to be pretty trivial. Don't worry about it. Mm. I got a thing. Uh, and then I pat my hand on Decker's back and I go, I can't wait to see what this thing is. <laughs> <laughs> You're going to be great out there, bud. <sighs> I'll, just, I'll mumble something under my breath. It's entirely unintelligible, but it'll be something like, we're trying to make paper drinks. <laughs> <laughs> I'll so, know I said so it. So this is the yard? <laughs> <laughs> well, you know. Uh, we don't have maps for everything. <laughs> no, I, I'm, 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 I wasn't being... That's just my voice. Giant <laughs> uh, is very flat and featureless. It's uh, weird because Adam texture, has a though. voice in his head yeah. Yeah. that he has to communicate with before he does the role-playing of communicating <laughs> with the voice in his head. We got little splurges all over yeah, there. Yeah, it's from all the rolling. Ah. That was a good one. That was a good. Maybe a little here. dense. All right, so we, do, do we just appear in the yard then? Well, yeah. Here, give me just a second. Oh, I need the walking. It's like, uh, yeah. yeah. We start snapping. Our well, these guys, these guys are down at the uh, the uh, bar. Oh, that's right. Uh, so they're kicking back a few drinks first thing in the morning. Uh, they're inside, so I don't know. Uh, Saite's walking alongside with you guys. Like, so uh, do we have a plan here, or are we just gonna? I'm gonna I'll march in and I say we march in. I'll just I'll put my hand up and be like this this, this can be psychic. If you, if you guys just think around it for a little bit, this could be very simple. We just have four people, just four four normal dudes. I'm talking to Saite at this point. What does Saite say? Uh, you know, they look like they know how to handle themselves in a fight. Mm. Uh, they look like they've been in quite a few in their lives. That's why I really didn't want to take them on myself. They they look like they can stab some stuff. Mm-hmm. Well, you want me to draw them out? With my curves. Oh. What kind of <laughs> weapons artillery they back in? Uh, you know, they, they're, they've all got really sharp things. Ugh. Um, I don't like the sound of that. <laughs> How big are they? Are they big? Yeah, they're they're all human. Um, mm. bigger than the average guy. They they look like they've mm. someone has them here doing something. I just don't know. Mm. Well, they have four sharp things. We have seven sharp yeah, things. We can. Yeah, so we got. Go. We've got odds. We can make this quick because we gotta move here. And, and honestly, if you, we don't have to kill these guys. Yeah. If you have a better thought, I got a better. But thought. I, I will stab them with you. Don't worry about it. Um. I have my one hand left. So, so they're just in a bar, right? Yeah, they're in the bar that they these guys were in last night, or you were there too. Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh. So I'll just turn everybody and be like, I'll, I'll go in there. I'll take care of a couple of them. Um, they won't know it's me. Don't worry about it. I'll be right back. And then I'll uh I'll enter the bar. Just kind of hang a left. Find a find a chair in the corner. Yeah, we'll call this the bar. Uh, oh, they're in the bar there. Yeah, yeah. We'll say this is the bar over here. Okay. So then Decker's is like about here-ish. So they're all kind of in a group. Yeah. Perfect. Their backs are to him. 
Yeah, they're at the bar oh. drinking. So I'll just I'll just sit down in a chair, throw my laptop up on a table, pop her open, turn <laughs> to boot up. There's a little grinding sound of the hard drive. AOL. Yeah. <laughs> uh, ten minutes. And then, yeah, ten minutes later, um, after the fan kicks on and it gets really loud, I'll uh, I'll cast sleep, which Ooh. is so. It's five Will you uh, first roll a stealth check for me? Oh sure. I guess they don't notice. I mean, Just to see if they can't smell his hair, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> or hear his laptop. Oh, <laughs> I know how that hair smells. Dexterity. Mm, it's a natural nine, but with with modifier, it's eleven. Okay. They uh, do not notice you walking in. Well, that's Fantastic. Good. That's good. All right. So turn on the laptop. <laughs> uh, I just ignore him like everyone else. Yeah. 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 That's that's hey, my. Are those women? <laughs> <laughs> they didn't see me at all. For you gotta leverage stealth check. <laughs> check <that out. laughs> I didn't even have to roll. <laughs> so here. Sleep five d eight. The total is how many hit points of creatures this spell can affect. Creatures within twenty feet of a point you choose within range are affected in ascending order of their current hit points. So essentially, I'm just gonna target right in the middle of the group, um, and then put as many of them to sleep as I can, depending on how many hit points they have. So as it starts with the creature that has the lowest hit points, each creature affected by the spell falls unconscious until the spell ends. Sleeper takes. The sleeper takes damage, or someone uses an action to shake or slap the sleeper awake. Are you guys like close to outside or anything? I'm, if he fucks I'm this up, I'm kind of looking in the door. I'm, I'm checking it out because I'm curious to but see what he's going to do. It's hard because your tits are pressing against the window. Yeah, it's so big. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody else is staring at my tits, yeah. not him. Yeah, I'm gonna hang back. I'm just leaning against the wall, lining the bar door. I'm I'm okay. very we'll close. Little we'll side tag. We'll say the door is uh, this line right oh, here. Okay. Right so there. he's standing at the door. I'm uh, I'm keeping my eye on our uh, our friend. Or one-handed friend. And then where is everyone else? Just kind of. I mean, I'm just gonna hang back here. Yeah, like kind of where we are. Yeah. Saite would be up with uh, whoever's close I'm, to I'm the. I'm keeping an ear out. Oh, I'll keep. You. I'll keep him close. That's okay. good. Yeah, kind of. <laughs> keep him close. Yeah. I went up there with those guys. Trust this close. guy. Oh, He's got yeah. a lot of guts. All right, so you're gonna roll for sleep. <laughs> yeah, I only have. It's gonna take a while if I only use the one die. So, hold on a minute. Do you want to use another one? Ah, uh, sure. What, what do you need? need? I six? need five d eight. So eight. No, oh, wait, that's an eight. Two. Wait. Oh, that's a ten. Oh, my bad. Whoa. Good thing we got those cup holders. All right. Wait, is it this one? Yeah. Oh, you already got I them. got them though. Yeah. Hiya. Seven, nine, fourteen. That's a one. Seventeen. Yeah. Okay. Six, oh, okay. seven, eight, nine. So fourteen hit points worth of dudes uh, will fall asleep. All right. You guys we'll can see. collect your dies. I don't know which one is anyone's. We'll say this guy. There we go. Who's just a little bit forward hunches hunches over, uh, and the other two look at him. Don't think a lot of it. Okay, yeah, they don't really think a lot of it. I guess they think he, maybe he was drinking all night long. Or so anything. one fell asleep? Hmm? One, one's asleep? This one? He's asleep? Yeah, the guy that's just a little bit. We know he has 14 hit points or less. That's true. That's <laughs> or the DMs being generous. <laughs> <laughs> or that. Uh, so I guess at this point, should we try and knock the other ones out? You Z rolled 5d8 and got 14. I didn't have a lot of good rolls in there. I, I, I've oh. been rolling pretty poorly this entire campaign, but that's okay. I'm just rolling with it. Kind of a shame. Plenty of time for things to turn around. Yeah. Okay. Um, are we killing these guys or just showing them the door? I think we should just show them the door. Okay. Bully okay. them. So, I'm still typing away. Um, <laughs> uh, I turn a... to Miri well, outside and I go, if this takes too long and we miss those Moondog brothers, yeah. I'm not going to get paid. And you told me I was gonna get paid. Just hang in there, give him a few more minutes, and then we'll just go in, all right? All right, I'm just letting you know where Shatter the responsibility talk. lies. What do you see with your tiefling eyes? My, my tiefling eyes? The same thing. Yeah, oh. I see the same thing everybody else does. But I gotcha. But what I can do is I can walk up to one of them and be like, hey, so, uh, hey. I'm new to this town. Oh, he yeah, clearly. Down. And, uh, yes. I was wondering. Oh yeah, I what, what are you wondering? I might need a place to stay later tonight. Oh, yeah? It's like 9 a.m. <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> you know, you know, Gotta get to work early. Uh, yeah, I know. <laughs> well, let's say you finish your drink, and uh, come with me, and we'll, we'll find a room together. Wow. Forward. Oh boy, yeah, uh, roll something for me. Yeah, sure. Um, <laughs> what do you want? Cock check? <laughs> persuasion? Perky yeah, persuasion. Check, yeah. Um, How those nipples doing? Yeah. Charisma. Unless it's you've got some, yeah, you yeah, can get persuasion, it. Yeah, persuasion, but do, what should I roll for that? 20. 20. We need to remind Dan at this point how Rock and Shattercock's bot is. 10 plus <laughs> 6. 
So it's a 16. Okay. That's persuasion. Uh, yeah, he's he's convinced. Okay. All right. Well, He'll turn back and just grab his things. And then he, come on out. I haven't Great. quite finished my drink, but... Yeah, yeah down that drink. All right. And you walk out. Yeah. Grimo's hearing all this, like, clicking coming from inside the bar. Uh, he's, he's like, what that clicking noise? It's constant, like, click a click a click a click Who are all these other people out here? Oh, these are just my friends. And then I go, Dick, no! And then I punch him. Oh, jeez. All right, well, let's roll for initiative. Fuck. What'd you get, James? Uh, eight. Bruce? Ten. Plus, oh, you, do you have initiative? No. Oh, you don't have anything? No. <laughs> uh, mine's eight. Matt? Six. Decker? Thirteen. Eight. Rexan? Did the three of us get eight? Yeah. Oh, wow. So all three of you need to roll, roll again. Twenty. Oh, shit. Twenty, oh. so twenty-two. Um, so eleven five. first. <laughs> yeah, doesn't matter. I'm the lowest so number. Sixteen roll. for me. <laughs> the punch roll. Um, actually, could you hand me your little name tags? That's kind of how I keep sure. track of this shit. It's pretty good, though. We got them. Half, half, half one number, yeah. yeah. I wanted, I wanted to do that. I wanted to do that. Yeah. I think Shattercock. I wanted to do that. And then... I want to know Jack was hacking in there. Reality. <laughs> Lawrence gave me shit earlier for not knowing that Shadowrun only uses D6s. Idiot. Yeah. <laughs> you are Fucking kind of an idiot. idiot. <laughs> yeah. It's stupid. It's not something idiot. everybody knows. I would normally agree Thank with you. Lawrence over something so trivial, but this is not trivial, I and I do agree with him. I don't, I'll, you, I'll be crying Thank tonight. It's fine. <laughs> you better. So I'll let you, uh, you all will get to go first, even though they rolled last, because uh, you had surprise, but you should get your punch in first. Okay. Um, so roll a 20. Eight. Plus three is eleven. Hits. Your wrist just collapses. Uh, so yeah, it, since it was just a punch, roll a uh, four for me. Four. So strength is Whoa. seven, right? He's gonna feel that in the morning. He'll be dead. Wow. He'll be dead. Super He'll dead. dead. <laughs> yeah. Roxanne is here. Plane worked. At least he's gets to have sex with Shattercock. Total? Yeah. Uh, well, what did you oh, want wait. me to add? That was a. F I rolled a four. Having sex with Shattercock is much like being sucker punched yeah. in the jaw. Right. Uh, yeah, more so poor people. Yeah. Seven. When those nipples dig into you, <laughs> it's rough. Well, they got a mind of their own, those those little girls. Oh God. <laughs> well, they, they just don't stop. They just keep digging. They can cut through glass. Oh, yeah. Absolutely. And other things. All right, Decker, Flushy what are you tissue. doing? <clears throat> so after, after he gets hit, he, he goes, these fuckers are after us. Oh, shit. Okay. Oh, oh. So they're on to the game, huh? Um, mm. <laughs> well, game on. <laughs> <laughs> well played, drunkard. Uh, what? So, is there anyone else in the bar? Or is it just these four dudes? Well, there's there's a barkeep and let's say a really saddled man in the corner. Okay. okay. Drinking by himself. I was because I was thinking about inciting a bar fight, but if there's no one else, it's no one else really early in the morning for sure. drinking. <laughs> makes sense. Makes sense. These are regulars. Only near to wells. Yeah, and Lawrence. Most of the people in the village are out <laughs> working in the fields. I like and... observing the human condition. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna cast Ray of Frost on the dude. Well, I guess I'm equidistant from both of them. That's not good. Actually, before I before I take an offensive action, I'm gonna survey my escapes first. Is there like a window? Um, I picked. Hey, I there's picked some windows across the front. I picked the seat closest to back the door. door. Yeah. So okay. So the door is like maybe here ish. Yeah. Okay, that's fine then. Um, I'm gonna ray of frost this fella right here, and reference. Let me look up what that does. I'm pretty sure it slows movement for one turn. If I hit with it, it does some amount of damage. So probably it looks it, real cool too. Is this guy? Is this guy knocked out? I think he just took four hits and then yeah. he shouted to his buddies. Oh, okay. but we got to jump on him. Okay, all right. So he's he's a little hurt. All right, rigid but frost. these guys are now aware. Yeah. Okay. A frigid beam of blue-white light streaks towards a creature within your range. Make a ranged spell attack against the target. On hit, takes 1d8 cold damage, and its speed is reduced by 10 feet until the start of your next turn. There you go. So do the attack. All right. So roll 20. It says ranged spell attack. I don't yeah. know if that's different than any other spell uh, attack. Yeah, I think it's the same. 20. So, so that's a 12. Do I add my spell casting plus ability? Spell casting and your proficiency. What is that? Spell attack bonus? The... Spell casting yeah. ability modifier. Yeah, and then you said proficient. That's plus three. You should have. And then and then your pro you you are you have a two point proficiency at this point. Yeah. All right. So plus five. So plus okay sure. So uh, seventeen. Seventeen. Yep. Yeah. Hits. All right. Damn, I already closed the book. You need yeah, to tab that stuff, man. I, there is no well. Yeah, I mean I, I wrote the numbers down, but. Book so. mark. <laughs> <laughs> you want to give me some bookmarks? Yeah, Absolutely. here you go. 
You realize there's gonna be 20 of these in this book, and I'll, well, whatever. Take them, man. Yeah. You got a pen? We can just write on them. Right on top. Yeah. You want me to just do it all for you? <laughs> if you could. Uh, 1d8. So. And which guy are you targeting? Um, this, this one. one okay. Base guy in front of me. Three damage. All right. Unless he has protection. And then his movement is slowed by 10 feet. For how long? Until my next turn. Okay. So yeah, uh, that was a frost. Ray of frost. Ray of frost. So yeah, Ray of frost. <laughs> he's bringing his. He's turning around to hear his buddy who's yelling. And he, he's also trying to drink at the same time and notices his body really <laughs> slow down. So something something's definitely going on. All he's right. he's hip to it now. You got hacked. That's cool. <laughs> <laughs> Is that your catchphrase? Yeah. yeah. Mm. I don't say it out loud, but I think it. Okay. <laughs> It's, it's the signature to all my forum posts. Shut up, I made a gift. You got hacked. Okay, let's see here. I think I'm going to. I'm probably better suited inside the bar. So I'm going to go inside the bar. <laughs> 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 That's the moment some trucker realized that Shattercock is portrayed by a man. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. That um, lady got a deep voice. And then I'm going to fire a magic missile at. So there's three. There's three bolts. But I'm gonna fire two at the at the guy that's already been hit by Ray of Frost. And okay. And um, one at the one on the right. I was forgetting the way magic missile works. It hits automatically. So it you does. just you just roll for damage, you roll right? For damage. damage. Right. I think it's I think is roll. it D6? I thought it's the four. He's always it's, it's one D four plus one force damage to its target. So I don't know if I have any modifiers on top of that. See, I guess it's three of the D4 you'll roll and then add one to each one. Okay. Two, so three to, damage to on that guy on the left. Yeah, there's two, two this go to guy? him. Yeah, so that's three damage, and then two damage. So five to that five one to guy. Five to that one guy, right? And then on the right, there we go. The one that's not asleep, right? Yeah, uh, right. And then the one on the far right takes four damage. Right on. Cool. Uh, anything else? Uh, that's it for me. Okay, no. Oh, you moved in, right? I moved in. Okay, dirt. Or um. What's up? Oh, dear. oh, sorry. I thought it was me. I didn't see that it was. Are they trying to jump the gun? Right? No, just honest mistake. Uh, <laughs> I'm very excited. <laughs> uh, so I'm gonna try and use the back of my back of my the like a like non-violent sword. sword swipe. Yeah. So the just blunt a, bl the blunt end yeah. of it to try and hit him again, okay. um, and hopefully do inflict more damage than my fist did. Uh, so roll twenty. 15 plus, Hits. okay, uh, and then it's 1d6, ooh, plus your strength, plus 3 is 4. That's to the guy outside, right? Yeah, to this guy. This guy's All right, so he, he takes the hit, but he's, you know, he's, he's, he's still, not really he's still phased going, too gotcha. bad. Uh, you good? Yeah, I guess right. so. You don't want to move or anything? No, I'll stay there. I mean, how close are you? I guess if you hit him, he's a little bit closer than that. Yeah, he's sort of like surrounded by the group because I let him out. Grimo. So I'm gonna do the same thing he just did with my short sword. And are you gonna are you gonna get up so you can get him? Take a step forward, maybe. Okay, thank you. So I'm gonna butt him with my my short sword. Okay. So it's an eight plus what would you? Oh, my short sword bonus, so thirteen. Hits. So then. Uh, I don't want to kill him, obviously. I just want to knock him out. Do you put a boxing glove at You're the You're not going to kill him. Arrow? <laughs> <laughs> so it's a... Uh, this is in a DC movie. It's a uh, 1d6 plus 3 piercing, so it's 8. Nice. It's good damage. Yeah. It's good, it's That's good, good damage. damage. Quality damage. It's good damage. Hey, Grimo. All the other weapons that. in the game are way stronger than mine. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so he's, he's starting to look a little bit rough. Um, he's, not, he's not bleeding profusely, but... But he's still he's, conscious. Yeah, he's breathing heavy and and looking pretty beat up. We ganked him. Nice. Uh, which uh, one? This guy? Rexan. Is he no. frozen? No, yes. he's. There's no, a guy that's that asleep. One's, yeah, that one's he's frozen. asleep. He's frozen. That's frozen. Okay. He's, no, he's still. Not, yeah, he's slow. He's not really frozen. So he's anything. he's still. What happened to him? He got magic missile. He just got hit. Okay, so this one's still okay. Yeah. So the problem is right now the uh, the tea's wearing off, and I'm starting to hear the voices. <laughs> A little bit, and right now, Thank really, you. it really wants me to kill Saitai. 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 My time. I am. I am fighting this off right now because I'm like, I don't. I, the bloodlust is. 
You want to roll for is it? Is it going to get really to fight the bloodlust? Yeah. Sure. Oh, okay, man. because it basically determines whether I make this look like an accident oh, or geez. I throw a javelin through the window and hit this man oh, in the neck. That sounds cool. Yeah, I'm a real creative type. Um, Shattering. So, okay, so I'm rolling to. If you if you want to fight I'm, off, I'm going to fight off the voice. So this basically determines whether he lives or dies. All right, so uh, you don't tell eleven. I think he. Oh wait, with my initiative, so that's ten. No, not what? initiative, not but. Initiative. Uh, We'll say below a ten is is when it gets a little dicey. Oh, thank for God! You. So okay, I think so he, he lives. It off. So I push him down. <laughs> I'm like, get down, you one armed freak! Uh, <laughs> and I run towards the window, and I get back there, uh, and I, I hurl well. my javelin. Okay, <laughs> yeah, you pushed him over. <laughs> yeah. Oh, so he's he's on the floor. Yeah, yeah. but every time you do that, he rolls away. <laughs> yeah. Like, well, yeah well, let's let's just there. let's all use our imaginations here. And you pushed hard. him down to a knee. Okay, yeah, so he's down, and I leap over, so I saved his life from me, um, and I aim my javelin at, who's the bigger threat? This guy, right? Because when, when will he unfreeze? Like, a couple days, or? I like, think it's the at, end at, of next turn. At the end he's of Lawrence's slow. next turn. Yeah, he's not, and he's not frozen yet. Yeah, he's, he's just, just he's a little bit okay, slower so than Okay, so I want to throw my javelin through his uh, uh, top of your urethra. Too neutral. Uh, <laughs> All right, roll a 20 for me. Yeah, well, I got to stun him. <laughs> <laughs> he will be stunned. <laughs> Uh, is the javelin? It's the javelin. Oh, yeah, so I rolled a five. And do you, you have, have a plus five? I have a plus okay. five. Uh, no, javelin. So the yeah. javelin goes through, crashes through the window, and just kind of hits his scout just on the oh. side, goes past, digs into the back of the bar. Ooh. Didn't just, hit this guy? Missed, bartender. missed him. Okay. <laughs> Damn. Okay. Yeah, the, the bartender is down okay. on the ground. Uh, the voice in my head just said, like, you know, get in there. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. That's okay. Okay, so yeah, Saite's turn. It seems like um, a pretty cool passive ability that you roll at the start of every battle to determine whether or not you get a strength advantage, uh -huh. but have chaotic nature, or you're just regular boring you, and yeah. you miss javelin tosses. That's <laughs> so Saite... Well, he's frozen, and I mean, he's slowly frozen, and now he's got a little cut to deal with. Yeah. He's going to think twice. <laughs> he's like, he's like, Ow. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> so Saite takes off through the door uh, and pulls out a spear. He's got a couple spears oh. uh, and, and show off. Hurls it at the same guy that uh, Raxon was. He didn't even need us. I know, right? What? Well, he, so said he didn't he, even need I us. Mean, he didn't alone, need us. he, he couldn't have handled this. Shit. So uh, that was a natural twenty. Whoa! Whoa Saite. He's better than all Ooh, of us. Yeah. Yeah. One handed, didn't grow his hand back. <laughs> Does he spirit cry hand. a little Holy bit? Holy spirit hand! He can roll a nat twenty, but he's still a cripple. <laughs> I feel better about myself. Let's see him roll two dice at the same time with different hands. <laughs> two angles. Ooh, how much? Yeah. So, so he nailed that guy for uh, fourteen damage. What? Um, wow. Well, like meta, he but fight this whole thing on his own. I mean, he, he wouldn't been able to get this far much, if it wasn't for us. Give that man a citation. Oh. For me. So see, there's a big old spear sticking out of this guy now. Okay. Battle. Wow. And he's bleeding. Pretty hard. Jeez. Okay. He really doesn't like these guys. Um, I think it's Miri's turn. Nope. <laughs> yeah. We didn't right. even talk to him. Man. Ask him if they're the right guys. <laughs> no, I start just throwing spear. One you crazy. They're, they're the right guys. <laughs> we got them. So he shouts as he tosses a spear. I'm gonna use my <laughs> mace to bludgeon that guy that's right next to me. And you've got advantage since you guys have this guy surrounded. Okay. So you can roll twice. If you and I don't. Yeah, I don't want to kill him. I just kind of want to. Bludgeon him in the knee or something so he can't uh, always the run off. Always I'm a short. I'm a dwarf. Yeah, no, it's fine. <laughs> Let's kick him in the ribs until he starts crying. Ooh. Thirteen plus that hits. Yeah. Uh, damage is a six, right? Yep. Six. Oh well, I can't read your sheet from here. Is that what the mace is? Oh right. Yes, the mace is a so six. six plus your strength modifier. Plus strength. Yeah. Oh, nice. So that's nine. Whoa. Wow. Boy, his knees are shattered. <laughs> <laughs> One of them is. <laughs> yeah, uh, so his his knee just. She cited him. He he drops to the ground. He's Boom. he's You'll got never walk the again. Li littlest bit of life left in him. Um, <laughs> That's what you get was, for stealing that ear of corn. <laughs> <laughs> was, was that the end of your turn? These guys are done. All he did oh, yeah. was bite his thumb. Huh? Was that the end of your turn? Yeah. yeah, I think so. All right, so yeah, I this guy is pretty pissed off that he's never. He's always gonna walk with a hobble for the rest of his life. If he, he lives, he has much uh, of a life. rest of his short I, shitty remember, life. Remember, I'm right here. <laughs> <laughs> All they were doing was having some beer on so a Sunday. He's, he's also got a mace and whips it around at Miri uh, to get a revenge knee. <laughs> <laughs> um, What's your AC? And for him, that, that's upper torso, right? Oh, 18. Wow. Oh, wow. I guess for him, yeah. Yeah. Could be hitting him right in the middle of the chest. All right. 
He completely misses his shot. Oh, that's pathetic. Uh, and then kind of falls down oh, into his own pool of blood. Just oh, crying. Oh, it's patella. Um, <laughs> it's, one on chance nose, to save like face and he botched it. <laughs> he's just, so now see. he just knows he's a loser and pathetic. He's, fucked. he's crying. His life's over. going to go after the dude that speared him. Oh, thank God. Wait, <laughs> really? He's speared him? Oh. and I are exposed. We are exposed. So this guy's frozen though, right? Well, he's yeah, slow. Yeah, he's slow, slow but he, that was like three steps. Okay. That took him half an hour. When, uh, he completely, I guess, trips as he's getting off his bar stool, kind of falls <laughs> oh, over. Jesus. Poor guy. Uh, this is sad. <laughs> we just rolled into these guys. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> One guy's asleep. Yeah, <laughs> the other I, guy's I got a spear in him. Outside the bar says, home for special needs. People. <laughs> oh. I just remember, this guy was like, yeah, I'm going to get laid. And there's just a... <laughs> <laughs> no, never spear, walk dead be, friend. Dead attack friend. from all sides. I was well, just going to call him out of the bar and tell him to get out of here. That's all. That's what I'm Back. <laughs> See what they I said. I have acid spell. Oh, <laughs> so, Beat him up and break his. So the other guy's attacking Saite. So, so yeah, the the other guy uh, walked up on Saite, um, pulls out a battle axe, swings at him, it connects. Oh, um, oh no, Saite! My hand, <laughs> my other hand. <laughs> if he dies, he dies. Yeah, that's, that's how I feel true. about that's Saite. True. He's a guest. Yeah. NPCs can fuck off. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> but he did so much damage. So much. Oh, I want to know damage. what sword he's got. So yeah, he connects. He connects with uh, his Guys, battle axe sword. hit. It uh, doesn't do a huge amount of damage. I get a sword. <laughs> um, you wouldn't know what to do with it. No, I couldn't hold it. <laughs> it's like Thor. Just drag it's it a, by the. It must be imbued with some sort of magical power, but everyone else gets it's a normal sword. <laughs> it's like ten pounds, dude. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so Saite, how much damage Shit. did he take? He, he took a, a hit. It was a good one, but mm. he's he's still he's there. The voice in my head goes, "Good, good, all according to plan." <laughs> Softening him up. Uh, I guess it's uh, so. Yeah, it's a uh, Decker. 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 Goodness. Okay. Decker's on deck. Uh, I'll show myself out. That's okay. Um, so. I have a really cool spell I want to cast, but I have to see if it hurts friendlies or not. Uh -oh. Do you really have to see? Yeah, cast I'm, it anyway. Who I'm, cares? I'm, we'll take it. I'm next to him. Saite is so cool looking. Thunderous Falls! Yeah, it's pretty cool. Tweet Thunder. that, yeah. Uh, Thunder, Thunder Weave. Is, yeah. Oh, Thunder Weave. No, it is Wave. Never mind. Oh, okay. yeah, uh, <laughs> Thunderous Wave. That'd right? be cool, though. Thunder, uh, Thunder, 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 Thunder Wave. Thunder Wave. Thunder Wave. Thunder Wave. Ooh. Yeah, really uh, force push. Yeah, basically. Okay. No, no, I can't call it that because. Well, in, in character, right. I'm getting really freaked out that there are these angry men near me, uh, which is why I might cast this. It does not say if it hurts friendlies or not. What uh, page are you on? That's on 282 slash 283. Wave of thunderous force sweeps out from you. Each creature in a 15 foot cube originating from you must make a Constitution saving throw. I'm guessing that means that it does hurt friendlies too. Yeah. Oh, that's no good. Great. Or is it? Just great. Also, Shattercox is yeah, in that range, too. What would okay. Decker do? It doesn't hurt me at all. Why the fuck are you kidding yeah, me? Yeah, Decker totally oh. do it. You would totally do it. Uh, maybe. I don't know that I need to do it yet is the problem. I guess the question is, does Decker care if he hits anyone? Hmm. Is he growing a heart? <laughs> maybe. Roll to care. Yeah. It's in a, it's in a <laughs> test, too. <laughs> How's it looking? It grows long legs? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> His heart grew three... Ish. 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 I mean, volume-wise, it didn't change at yeah, all. It's yeah, mostly stretched. It stretched yeah. out. It's got, well, it's got a bunch of electrical tubes on it. It's a, it's a waste of time. I wish Lawrence did just have a spell book. <laughs> <laughs> or or, or what, what you need doing. is a laptop that has all that stuff. So that way you'd literally have to go oh. through it. Oh, but it needs to be attached to his wrist. Are you, uh, that is exactly my character that you're describing. I know. Yeah. You mean, you mean That's what I was saying. Laptop. You should... That would make more sense. Like right now? Yeah, yeah. yeah. it wouldn't make more sense. It's weird that you, in the modern age, are operating on a more archaic level yeah. than your character is in this fantasy world. Uh, so there's bound to be an app, right? I don't know. Uh, so I would. Hmm. So where's the door ish? Like here? Oh, it's, it's right around there. So if, um, just surveying the scene, would I be able to exit the bar but still have line of sight to one of the enemies inside? Yeah. Okay, then I'll fucking do that. Uh, given that it's turn based, it doesn't quite make sense, but the moment that these guys come up and run up to Saite, I would be. Like snapping my laptop closed and fucking booking it for the door. Is that, is that I you? Think, I think yeah. the door was like right yeah. here. Oh, was it? We lured okay. him out and got him up against the wall next okay. to the door. Okay, so essentially what I'd probably do is I'd stay inside but right next to the door if the door is right here. Mm -hmm. Is that right? Yeah, ish. Yeah, what's your speed now? Um, 35 feet. Okay, so yeah, you can do that. Because he got those boots. Got those dash boots. Uh, and then I will uh, firebolt. Uh, I'll fire bolts the dude him. who no, I. He's gonna burn you up. <laughs> I it before. Oh, I'd have to roll real Get out of there, Shattercock. No, no. Shattercock. You might lose a tit. Well, if I, I see him. No! <laughs> if I see him running, I might follow him out. Uh, so, fire, make a ranged spell attack on hit, 1d10. 
Yeah. One blob just do this one side right. Okay. Yeah. Is that 15? Uh, that's gonna hit. Yeah. All right. And which guy are you this aiming for? Great. This guy maybe? Yeah. Uh, the one? No, the one that I was ready frosting before. <gasps> uh, I think that's. Hot and cold. Oh uh, yeah, you can see him. All that's right. right. So D10. It's what it's what they call me on the internet. <laughs> Wasn't that a Madonna song? Fire and ice. Ray of frost. Hot and cold. Ray of frost. I'm thinking Ray Frost. Ray of light. Was He's the guy. Uh, uh, Ray of light was the win Punisher. Windows 98. Ray Frost an actor. He's got to play the Punisher. Oh. Oh really? Oh. Nine damage. Yeah, Ray Frost. Him with the Ray Donovan. He took nine damage. Yeah, he did. Good throw. So yeah, the guy is uh, he's charred up, you know, oh, bloody, boy. blistered skin everywhere. His, his Most of his hair is kind of gone. Which one is that? Uh, this, okay. Yeah, this guy. Okay, I'll turn him upside down. So no, he's dead. not dead. Oh, come he's on, not now. dead. He's, he's, he's got the dead. littlest bit of life in him. Oh, sorry. I put so, him yeah, back yeah, yeah, right over there. Thank you. Thank you. Don't want to confuse the audience. Jesus, Adam. Respect the DM, please. Um, But yeah, he's he's in real bad shape. Uh, Shadowcock. I'm getting the fuck like, out of there. No, nope, what pussy? <laughs> yeah, you bet. Because Literally. I'm alone. Yeah. Except for Sante, who cares? So yeah, the door, the door was right here. <laughs> wow, two, so one, brave. One, two, three, four, five, maybe. Best of luck. Yeah, yeah, I know. Best of luck, Sante. Love you. <laughs> um, I love you. And then uh, I'm gonna kind of turn there and cast on this this guy. Okay. Although wait, is he? He's down at this point, right? Like he's like really hurt. Yeah, he's in real bad shape too. Um, I want to. You know what? Fuck it. I'll cast Blade Ward. Uh, so that in the case that I get attacked, um, isn't yeah. he Robin? A defensive spell. Yeah, it's a defensive spell. Yeah. So you're just um, surrounded by blades. So yeah, and I, I, assume... I don't have to roll to cast it. It just happens. Okay. So, so, so yeah, you. Ward of Blades. Uh, it's so basically cool. so you have resistance to. Yeah, so until the end of your next turn, you have resistance against bludgeoning, piercing, and slashing damage dealt by weapon attacks. Right on. Okay. Cool. So there you go. Op. Yes. All right, Derek. Um, I noticed that there's no one left with Sate in there, and I assume that this guy's done for, so I'm going in the bar. Ah, oh, damn it. Great. Le in. Leaving him uh, next to him like that, though, you do provoke uh, an attack from him. Okay. Because you are engaged in combat with him. Okay. What's your AC? 15. So he connects with his mace. Damn that mace. Great For rapper. three damage. Okay. And uh, go ahead and do your movement. All right, so he hits me, and I go, ow, shit, on my ass. <laughs> <laughs> But then I come in here, let's see. Uh, They're saying the door's right here. Oh. So one, two, three, four, five. Not really close enough to get melee range, or could I go here? Yeah, yeah you can. Yeah, we'll call that melee. Okay. So I come into this guy. Oh, and, then, yeah. uh, nice. and then I'm just going to try and do the same thing again where I use my sword, butt of my sword. Oh, so you're not trying, trying to kill him? him? No. <laughs> that's the guy that's been frozen, I think. Right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And he's like really hurt. Yeah, he's in bad shape. Ooh, Ooh boy. Two plus two, four, seven. So yeah, you miss him. Okay. Pretty bad. Primo? Primo's gonna shoot an arrow through one of the bar windows at one of the maybe the guy on my right. I'm knocking out all these games. windows. This guy? This yeah, bar. Yeah. Shoot him yeah. in the in so the knee. You're aiming for his kneecap. Yeah, 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 the success that Miri's had with knees, and I want to emulate oh, that. <laughs> so. Your roll oh. for insanity. Yeah. So, so I guess that Every fails because that would have been seven. Yeah, that misses. Oh, do I hit uh, Sate? <laughs> nice <laughs> not, try. Not that bad. So, uh, so you have a crossbow or something? What yeah, is I have it? a short bow. I oh, was hoping it, it would hit Sate so, yeah, if you, I missed it. It does crash through the window, but going through the window deflects it just a little bit and it twigs right next to that guy's oh, okay. foot, right into the ground, and just go ding. So Sate is fine. He's okay. You, you didn't hurt him. Well, kill uh, nice. Damn. You're going to die one way or the other. Raxon. Okay, so I use Action Surge. This is uh, allows me to push myself beyond my normal limits. Oh, no. Uh, I get two turns, basically. This is fantastic. So I'm going to jump. Actions. Yeah, so I, I move through the bar window that is broken. Yeah, yeah. Uh, mm -hmm. I move behind the sleeping man, and I want to rip his spine out. Mm. Okay. So you're, neutral. so you're gonna just try and put your hand right through his back. Well, I'm thinking I put my axe so I can dig a hole, and then I want to rip oh. it. I mean, I have two turns, so uh, I want to be able to dig a hole. And he's asleep, so I figure he won't fight back. Maybe you should roll to see whether you're insane or not. <laughs> uh, no, no, no. Let's, uh, no, no. I'm, just, I'm just saying that'd be a cool tr like treat. Like every you time. You were saying earlier, a cool like trait for your character. That sure. You roll I mean, to you want well, you want to see if I'm fighting the voices or not. I don't know. I, I think you're in, indulging right now, right in the now voices I'm just trying now. to quell the blood loss so I don't hurt any of you yeah. guys. So I say roll for hitting that guy in the back with okay. an axe. All right. That is a... Oh, oh no. I know. That hits him real yeah. good. I got okay, for this, damage? The yes. first time I've ever wanted one of my with party members to fail yeah. roll. <laughs> uh, is it 12? Great axe is plus 5. Oh, it's a 12. Yeah. yeah. No, no, so. no, 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 no. Uh -oh. Okay. 
Uh, so uh, that's a lot. Plus five. No, no, no. Plus three. Oh, so plus that's three. ten. Oh, sorry. Nice. Plus three slashing. Yeah, my bad. That's um, a lot. So that's yeah. the first one. Got yeah. him real good. So this guy's hunched over on the bar, right? Wait, yeah, you attack a... the sleeping man? Yeah, yeah. I, need, I need something. <laughs> <laughs> I really need something. Decker's okay. looking pretty you don't good understand. right now. <laughs> that's one action. Yeah, okay, one action. So nah, I was the bad guy. Is this, is this guy... Because now I want to pull his spine out. I want to wear it like a belt. You have to. You have to. Oh. The way it works is you can say your intent, but then you have to roll for it, and then yep. he'll tell you whether or not it succeeds, and then you can okay. describe the events. Of um, I'm wondering if I'm powerful Excellent enough, primer. if I've done enough damage that I can just kind of dig in there and just rip it you out. Find out. Yeah, well, yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah. Well, you, well, so he'll, are you going to use your hand? He, he'll wake up. As you the thing. Oh, he's awake. <laughs> you should just try and hit him as hard as you can. Okay. And then if you do, and then he tells you it's okay, then you could rip okay, his spine. Okay, I think at this point I'm going to try to separate the head from the spine uh, just enough so I can get like a clean belt. <laughs> versus face. <laughs> so yeah, I'd roll another attack. Oh, uh, attack? Not, not, or 20? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, okay. Please. <laughs> Oh, oh no. no! Hubris. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I just I guess so I, the like, from after your first attack being so wonderful, blood splurted all over your weapon. <laughs> yeah. Uh, and as you raise it again to go in for the cut, you pull back and this your axe oh, no. kind of flies backwards out of your hand and lands over Ooh. here. Ooh! Shit! Well, instead of to go get it. Ripping out his spine. I saw my hands massage. in a javelin. <laughs> you were consumed with uh, spine <laughs> lust. <laughs> Ugh. Hacking in there, digging. Yeah. Uh, Saite's turn. Shame, for shame. All right. Um, he'll go after the guy that's right here. Flame boy. He's the yeah. No, he's definitely. Well, I mean, he's a kind of. I mean, it's a different kind <laughs> he's of sleeve. Kind of it's gonna be the long sleeve. Right? <laughs> Wake up, sheeple. Please. <laughs> so Saite pulls, you a couple things about that. pulls the spear out of the guy that he that was oh, yeah. still in him, uh, and then goes back at him oh, with oh it. My God. He's the best. He should make With a new hole, hole hopefully. Uh, except he uh, he kind of is trembling from a, well, maybe a little bit hand. of battle fear, and yeah, and he can't balance the spear because yeah. he's only got one, and he kind of keeps it under his arm. But he tags it to the left a little bit off the guy's shoulder of his <sighs> of his leather up. armor. He is okay. such a fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> we should just kill him, right? <laughs> maybe. Mary. Does he belts? Mary's turn. All right, the spine is just fine in there. Spine is fine. So, down I mean, a hand, spine is fine. The guy that I'm next to out there, he's he's pretty much, he's down, but he can still attack, kind of thing. Oh, he can still attack, yeah. So, let's say I want to like, I don't want to knock him out, I guess, but I just kind of want to like like tie him up or make sure that he can't attack anymore. What what's, what what do I do there? Break his other kneecap. You would like try and knock him unconscious, I guess, right? Knock him unconscious. Okay, whatever. That's the easiest thing. So um, yeah, I mean, you could try and tie him up, but he's gonna fight you. All right. Because he's still he's still kicking. All right, so I just try and do one little bludgeon blow to the head to knock him out. I don't want to kill him, though. Okay. okay. Uh, D20. That's a six plus plus attack bonus, right? Yeah. 11. Should hit. Okay. So roll nice. for damage. Damn. He's on the ground. He's incapacitated. Oh, yeah, I thought he was he's almost dead. Yeah. He's almost dead. I just want to yeah, knock him out. But he's not trying to kill him. He, okay, he plus, he's, he's still trying, trying to, to attack. Out. He hit Derek as he ran Bonking off, him a so bit. he's still... <laughs> He's still got some life in him. Scabbed up his own. one, plus three strength, four. <laughs> four. So that gets him. <laughs> oh, got uh, him. He's, he's on his he's on a, one his one good knee, his busted knee is kind of over, and he just kind of flops, collapses. Nice. We'll call that. Yeah. Unconscious. Unconscious. Ko. Uh, you it's can like, still. We move don't know you or have you any proof of what you've done. Bleed. Let's torture him. Okay, then I'll I'll, I'll move as far as I can, which is five. Five spaces over toward the entrance of the bar, get there. or wherever, oh, as I close as I up. can. Marietta's fell over. As far as I can go, yeah, toward you can that. Put him next toward to there? Derek. Yeah. Hey, bud. All right, it's the monsters' turn. What are you? They're not monsters. Yes, monsters. they we are. We don't know that. What have they done? They were thugs. They could have like families at home. <laughs> Truly, who are the monsters? <laughs> By the culture of this you. town. Is it, yeah, like, I know. I am. Saite. They just talked a little loudly at night. Yeah. Going back to the Keep it down. I wish I could kill those guys. <laughs> those kids. We got yeah. some ruffians over at the bar. I hope we learned Saite tricked us, and he's like the real. He's the real villain. Thug? The real boss. Well, he's yeah. only got one hand. I'm not scared of him. Yeah. Okay, so he will, can't uh, type. Okay. He's only got half the keys. I guess he'll attack Saite. <laughs> Smart move. Mm, nice. Get some. Uh -oh. Good. Can we just I, don't know. I stopped trusting him. <laughs> Every time. <laughs> he lost one hand and now this is, he lost his other hand again. Uh, can we just call him Meat Shield? 
Yeah, I know. Sure. What if he was born with a hand on his foot? <laughs> yeah. I never told anyone this, so but this my foot is, is also a hand. Slashing attack! Oh. <laughs> that one's gonna go after uh, Derek, mm -hmm. since he just slashed. Derek. Ooh, hits. Okay. Four... Four damage. And uh, this guy kind of... It wakes up from his magical slumber yeah. uh, and turns around, pulls out his sword, and swings it at uh, Raxon. That's the name. Hits. Fucker. Maybe he shouldn't have extracted his spine. Six damage. Ooh. Nice. Ooh. Boy. Palpable hit. It's fine. I'm level two. Meaty. <laughs> I got Decker. more HP than I know what to do with. <sighs> Shit. Get him, Decker. You, you still just ran like a bitch. I'm talking to my. Look, that's the voice in my head. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> No further than any other character, but yeah, I'm I'm in the I'm in the shit. You walked up to a sleeping man uh -huh. and attacked him. <laughs> that doesn't make you a hero. I he need a defense. Bell. He threw a javelin at that other guy first and missed. And missed. <laughs> Broke a window for no reason. Yeah. Uh, hey, whatever. Firebolt uh, on same same feller who's all toasted up already. Uh, Lean away from the mic. Sorry about that. Which guy? Uh, the firebolt on f guy who's already been firebolted. Okay. Rub your spellbook at. Ah. Uh, people have negative reactions. People have phone 17. Oh, sure. Hits. Yeah, do. Yeah, do. Uh, D10. And. Oh, boy. Ooh. That's a 10, actually. Yeah. Is it? Yeah. There's no. Oh nice. Wait. There's a 1, but that counts as. That's 1. Yeah. yeah. Zero is 10. Yeah, yeah, exactly. All right, so yeah, you Ooh. got him. If you want to describe how your Oosh. firebolt uh, kills that fellow, oh, well, he's dead. I never, I yeah, I never really particularly. I just aim like center mass, so I, I imagine just catches him in the chest and boosh, just goes up like a pile of dry leaves. <laughs> okay, I'm like, oh, like the. <laughs> You're surprised by it? <laughs> well, not surprised, but I do kind of like visibly recoil at the ferocity of the fireball. Oh, you gotta own it, man. So your own violence bothers you just a little bit. I mean, a little bit. I didn't intend or, or expect him to explode like oily rags, but there he is, <laughs> screaming and flump, flumping to the ground like a pile of meat. <laughs> you weren't trying to knock him out. <laughs> he burst I mean, I wasn't trying to either, but he's attacking people, so that's I need information. <laughs> you did this to yourself. <laughs> Let's say he reacts like somebody who assumed that he was inoculated to violence, but then saw it firsthand in a very graphic way. Oh, Deckard. Oh, yeah. All right. Let's call this guy dead. Sorry. That happens. Ah! It's like, wouldn't want to ESRB you. <laughs> That's not really a hacker thing. They That's... didn't exist back then. So for some reason, Shattercock my time. got really confident uh, now that she's cast Blade Ward. <laughs> so she's nice. running back in. Nice. Uh, and also because she saw that guy explode into flames. So she's like, oh, I got this. So she runs in. <laughs> so like, basically, she was here. She was here? Yeah, she mm -hmm. was here. Um, runs in. And is it? Can't she get to there? Sure. Is that a possibility? OK, cool. Uh, and then, let's see here, I want to cast True Strike, True Strike. with my, the best um, spell, because I never get to cast it. Always hits. That's my favorite yeah, part. True Strike is, is true. the one that pierces your heart yeah. uh, with love. That's Shattercock. Yeah. Your father always resented you. <sighs> so it says, your magic grants you a brief insight into the target's defenses. On oh. your next turn, oh, on your next turn. Shit. On, uh, you gain advantage on your first attack roll against the target provided. Shit! Uh oh. Uh, you know what? Fuck it. Mulligan yeah, strike. strike now, too. Oh, okay. I'm just gonna stand there. <laughs> <laughs> you can get probably maybe further back, right? Yeah, you could just not move. And no, it's okay. I got Blade Ward. Oh, right. he's back okay. in character, huh? Yeah, we're alright. So, Shattercock just hangs out. Okay, you get advantage on your attack next turn? Uh, that's what it says. On your next turn, you gain advantage on your first attack roll against the target provided the spell hasn't ended. Okay. Uh, yeah, concentration. It's up to one round. I don't know what a round is. So. Is round a turn? A round is like everybody this whole, going. This whole thing. Yeah. Okay. So the end of your next turn. Cool. Right. <sighs> Provided right, you don't get distracted. Uh, but do uh, we get some? Oh, we, you get advanced. Yeah, Derek. Now it's me? Yeah. All right. Well, then I'm going to make my move around here Ooh. to back here. All right. And I'm going to do a reckless attack. Oh, boy. Because I'm pissed off because I got hit, which just gives me advantage. You already have advantage. Because I'm behind him? Uh, because you all have this guy surrounded. Oh, yeah. Give me triple advantage. Mm, that doesn't exist. <laughs> this means I get to roll three times. We'll, give you, extra, we'll give you a special advantage. Right? It's a reckless attack on an advantageous situation. 16. You got it. can him. only go up. Yeah. <laughs> Try again. <laughs> Boom. 20. Oh! One more. <laughs> oh. It's okay. You got that crit. Let's do the 20. The you third one didn't crit. exist. All right. 20. 20 crit. So I'm going to take my crit. 
uh, which means double damage, right? Smart move. Yep. Smart. So roll your damage. Uh, and 1d6. And it. That's a good damage. <laughs> Three. Hey, James. Smart move. Yeah. <laughs> six, six, then plus. Oh, I don't have to oh, roll sorry, it again? You, yeah, do it. If you um, want. What do you, should I roll the damage again, or do you just want to double it? I say we just again? double it. Okay. So that's six plus your strength. Six plus three. But so it would be more if I did two rolls, right? Or would you just take the two rolls plus my strength once? Yes, okay. plus your okay. strength right. once. So then You've nine. already cut him clean in half. I was going to say, don't is he have dead? Man, he should be dead. It's like one of those that the axe enters here, goes down actually there. hasn't been hit that much. So you got about 15 seconds of... <laughs> I, think, I think all he's taking is your magic missile. That's right, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. All yeah. right, Grimo? So is that dude I... I did. He's Talk unconscious. To about something. Is he, and you guys didn't tie him up or anything, right? He's knocked out. I'm gonna tie him up. My turn. I'm gonna. I'm gonna okay. Tie him up and then. Uh, I'm Roll gonna, your knots. Yeah, I'm gonna tie him up with my arrow and then uh, I'm gonna use my cunning action, which is something I acquired at level two, to just kind of hide. So that I sort of just hide behind look. the wall, like, like I'm, I'm below the windows. Behind, behind the unconscious man. Kind of like over here. Yeah. yeah. So. Sure, I'll just put you right here. You're kind of next to the door. Hiding, Thank God for you, you the window. No, I mean, I sit, <laughs> wherever you are. Tied up that guy, and I'm going to see what the situation is inside. You almost got a really... sister, but I mean, no one. No I mean, nobody. I don't know what's going on in there. I just hear clicking. You're pulling out of smoke? Just typing stuff. Rapid oh, yeah, tapping. smoking? Yeah, yeah. I mean, I'm, I'm always We're smoking. Calm the nerves. Raxan. Okay. I guess I'm going for all the marbles here. Um, you lost, you've lost the marble. Them. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, we're sworn enemies. <laughs> uh, so, is there is there a big enough uh, open wound that I can get a hand? In you that just hand? have to ask to do the attack, <laughs> and then if it hits, okay. then you can decide what I'm, the attack. I'm a detail oriented individual, I know, but he can't tell you. Yes, yeah. you could rip out. Because his I mean, spine. when I when I, I hit that axe, I hit, did I hit the the lower of the back or the higher of the back? Just say I mean, I you got, there's my a hand big old gash in the back. Of my the goal here is to get a hand in there. Which around we know what you're going. All you need to do is get his hit points to zero. Describe just, it for the audience. Yeah, yeah, yeah no, they know. They know too. Zero, and then you can do it. We all know. Yeah. Roll, roll a twenty. Yeah. Are, are you attacking with your axe or your hand? My axe is over here, buddy. Oh, yeah, well. remember? Yeah, get that hand. Do you have in a there. javelin? God. Too? Do you have anything else? I do have a javelin. You know, okay, yeah. You know, I'll use the javelin to just jam in there and sound loose enough. You should do the Kirk double hand hammer. Yeah, Kirk Fu. Okay. Please, Lord. We'll use the javelin. Okay. Do you guys think javelin? that he Just cannot kill him first, in this we'll blow, and then I can get there first? So. Seven <laughs> plus <laughs> five. Like yeah. Hits. Oh, thank God. Okay. And what is, what roll is the for damage. damage. Is a uh, it's on six? javelin is uh, plus three piercing. But you, roll for you roll spine. A uh, I roll for spine. I rolled. I haven't rolled damage yet. Okay. okay. I just I can't read with that. Oh, so uh, oh, I'm sorry. I do I do roll a six. My bad. Uh, which one is it? I'm the regular dice. The normal yeah, one. Yeah. There yeah. you go. Plus three is no. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, my God. You tear out that oh, spine. Geez. Okay. Oh, jeez. So, so the you hope, the hope here is, oh, I mean, tell me, do I, do I explain what I do? Can I do whatever I want to? Don't let him do that. Please, no. <laughs> well, so your, your javelin goes in, and yeah. you're, you're trying to free up some <laughs> <spaces>. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. The Human bodies are complicated. Like, I just woke up. <laughs> <laughs> well, he also <laughs> hit me. No, he's got a chop, oh, that poor guy. So you, you are seeing Did a little you. bit of spine. Yes. Uh, this, this guy. The white of the spine. He's got a little bit of fight left in him. Um, good for him. Wow. Good, good for, for him. him. Wait, so uh, I'm, I'm hitting all those discs, right? I mean, <laughs> missile train. I, yeah, you got, <laughs> you're, like kind of, you're kind of freeing up room so the next time turns. you can get I need to get a hand in there. I don't know if I explained <laughs> that <it> thoroughly. <laughs> you did. You're, okay. you're almost there. That's side turn. Daddy's yeah, getting yeah. a new belt. Uh, they'll never, they'll never steal saute. corn again. <laughs> he just, he's going to go after it <laughs> with the spear again. He hits. Oh, oh man. Saite is the best. He's okay. Oh yeah. Well, he, have a hand. Never mind. He doesn't have two hands, so he can't do that. But how are his nipples? I bet they're real pointy. They're perfect. Yeah. They're perfect. Little eraser nips. <laughs> Ariel is perfectly shaped. Oh, yeah. no, perfect. no hair, no bumps, no, hair. no nothing. That's okay, that guy's still looking all right, but he he took another spear right in the gut from right. Saitai. That'll be fine. <laughs> He's um, fine though. That's right. good. Miri. Oh. End it, please. End, End it, Miri. He's still. You said he's still doing okay. The, the guy, the enemy guy there. I mean, he he's bruised and bleeding and you know breathing heavy, but he's got a little bit of fight left he in him. He has two working right. knees. That's all you need. To I'm know. just gonna keep. <laughs> I'm just gonna keep going with my mace. I'm gonna try and. You should probably move just a little bit closer though. Oh. You want Which side? <laughs> but at like over a here? two foot level. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. So I move over there, yeah. And just I'm just gonna try around. and. Yeah, bludgeon him in the yeah, head. Watch your shit. Either damage boys. him or <laughs> knock him out if I can. 
But if I can't knock him out, then yeah, just damage him. All right, so you're you're trying to hit him in the head with your mace. Yeah. She's Twenty. Oh, oh. Hold on, he has advantage, so he gets to roll again. Oh. There's, no, there's no point. He critic. Mariatus the kneecapper. Two plus three strength, five. Uh, plus another two. Plus yeah. another two. Because you so well because you, you, it was a critical roll, so oh. you get double so you damage. Double oh. your damage. That's a good name for a oh, podcast. Boy. We should do right. that. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe I killed him and didn't mean to. Didn't kill him. All right. Uh, wow. Oh, this guy but you know the his kneecap is now the mace the to the head sends nice. him sends him back a step. We need to get our attack damage head. higher. These are some tough. How do we thugs. get our attack damage higher? Get better, better weapons. Strength. Yeah. More strength. Are there better weapons than the ones that are in the book? Hey, you you, you have a pretty really shitty sword. But they don't even really go up that high. <laughs> you'll get what better weapons. I have, my, I have a maybe, family great axe. Yeah, maybe you'll but come across a magical. It's, it's weapon. loose. You can grab it if you want to. <laughs> Listen, you can borrow it. Just, I got a javelin and a free a hand. JRPGs right. ruined this for everybody. You, your damage doesn't go up. You just yeah. get better playing. You get those fast boots. Yeah. See, move right. a little five feet. <laughs> so this guy uh, swings like the at the guy that last swung at him, with, which is Miri. Uh oh. Um, Miri's the hardest to hit. Yeah, with his axe. With little tank. How are you going to find Small. those kneecaps? They're way down there. A lot of armor. What was your armor? 18. 18. Jesus Too Christ. Too much. So yeah, he, uh, his, his axe just goes ching, like right on armor. your... You, you've still got a shield in one of your hands, yeah. right? Which hand? Um, your right hand. Sure. So his axe goes right into your shield and, and sticks there. Oh, oh, he's going off my character. Uh, the Terrible. guy that's uh, ah. getting his, his back operated on by Adam. <laughs> um, I am a doctor. No. <laughs> I know. I Don't worry. Night school. Don't worry. I'm a doctor. Swings his sword you're back. Around that spear, lean forward. Don't worry. Yeah. It's... I'm a doctor. I got. <laughs> <laughs> I got my axe embedded in his nervous system. That's where the rings. Humanly. Six damage. To Whoa. Raxon. Yeah, yeah. Whoa, Raxon. Sorry, I got plenty of hit points because we leveled up. But... Yeah, we're gonna have to sleep all night again. Yeah, I am down to eight. HP though. Wow. We were oh, supposed shit. to leave this morning to go to. You guys got to get involved in First everything. First fight of the day. It's cool though. I got. I think no I got problem. potions and stuff. It's cool. It's it's a quest. It's in, it's in character. Yeah, uh, oh boy. <laughs> it's a whole mess in here, huh? Float it. Fuck. All right. Um. You started it. You need to end it. I would like to. I'm actually gonna cast sleep again. Mm. So. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what it hit. So uh, as, as it was my chair. Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> felt it. it was me. I felt it. As previously explained, sleep uh, is just banking on the available HP of everybody. In fall. <sighs> Shit. I don't Shit. know if I can target actually. You're gonna put us all to sleep. Yeah, I just realized that. Maybe that won't work out. Will that heal me? Absolutely. <laughs> not. Put you right to sleep. Yeah. And yeah, I'm awake it. for spine. <laughs> yeah, it's everybody. Never mind. Can't target it. Uh, but, 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 what uh, would your character do? I don't know. I'm asking. That's why like you're hesitant to do it because you, Lawrence, don't want to cast sleep on the rest of your. No, party. no, no. That, that's me as a player not understanding the spell. If my character understood that, would not cast it oh, because it would be a waste mm. essentially. Mm. Um, if I put some of you to sleep and some of the enemies to sleep, it doesn't end the fight. What would Decker do? What would Decker do? I know. It's, I feel like Lawrence is more likely to do it. Decker might be growing a heart. Yeah, See, yeah that's where you go. Maybe. Stretching. It's, it's in that heart. tube. Yeah. I can't wait to rip it out. <laughs> Well, I would never hurt him, unless there's Kennedy. no one else around. Oh. <laughs> oh, yeah, you, you have a beef. Him. I forgot about that. He started it. Uh, so, I sure, fuck it. Another another firebolt. Why not? I'll put this poor fucker out of his oh, misery. Oh, boy. Oh, no. Um, so, it's th this guy that he's trying to operate on. No, my spine! Maybe you can burn up that Are spine you going to move closer you... to him at all? You burn Do I need to? Uh, actually, spine. yeah, let me, let me check what the... the there's a window is. over here somewhere. I, I'm still inside the bar. No, you're out. You're outside. You, I never moved. Um, you, you moved you outside. Left, you, what, isn't no, this your, isn't near that the your door, guy? But I was still inside. Oh, you didn't say inside. That's oh, why we put you on the outside of the bar. Oh, oops. But yeah, if you're standing at the door, that's right. Well, little we'll retcon uh, there. Fire range is one to 120 feet. So that's some amount of squares. Uh, you, you, you square. it's within range. I just don't know if uh, Raxon's right there. I mean, Between I can. You. I can obviously. Well, well you know well, what? Hey, you, you know what? That's fine. In character, I would probably still shoot a firebolt when I see this fucking sociopath digging around in some dude's back. <laughs> Just float it. Uh, all right. Oh, that's cool. Curveball. Yeah. Well, it's like so you are actually aiming. Fireball. You're actually aiming at Raxon. I am shooting at the enemy, and if something is okay. in the way, that's how it goes. I'm not aiming at Raxon. Okay. I only have roll eight, disadvantage. Eight HP left. Well, what is this? That's advantage? before the fireball. Roll twice. <laughs> take the lower. Okay. What did I ever 15. do? 
15. Ooh. Ooh wow. wow. That's weird. Okay. That's good Plus spellcasting. Five, right? Yeah, so 20. Hits. All right. Uh, uh, D10. What are the chances? Highly of accurate. 20. I know what I'm doing. Uh, five damage. Whoosh. So I send it right over Raxon's shoulder, I guess. So that guy's bleeding profusely from his back, and now he's charred up on his Damn front. It. Oh, shit. That's a um, waste. Actually, skeletons don't burn. <laughs> <laughs> he's definitely Raxon at this yeah. point. Uh, I think it's is it my turn. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This yeah. poor Shutter fucker cock needs is to just stop. Alright, so what I've been trying to do this entire time was stab him with two daggers. Uh, daggers are my proficiency. Um, so what do I, that, here's the problem, I've been trying to figure it out. What do I roll for those daggers? For the dagger? Yeah. You roll a, a 20. Yeah, roll a 20 minus your attack. strength, right? You have a minus on your strength. I have a minus strength. on minus strength, Minus two, yeah. but then plus two because for you're your proficient in it. So yeah. it even out. So just roll your 20 to see if you hit first. And this, this guy, I'm not trying to kill him. Just, I, actually, it's the butt of the, butt of the dagger again. Um, or, I mean, like... Maybe you have two daggers just banging on either side of his oh, ears. Yeah, that's a great idea. Okay, <laughs> all right. Two daggers, like yeah, two daggers banging on either side of his ears to knock him out. Four. Ooh. Oh no. Man, she's not good. But wait, but wait, you had advantage. You had, this, you had the advantage, right? I did. You cast yeah. And you have to roll again. So yeah. there you go. It's paying off. Ah, that's 12. better. That hits. Yeah. Oh, it is. Yeah, yeah, it does. Okay, so then, then the dagger is a D4 piercing damage. D4. But there's piercing. two of them, and he's Plus using your strength. Oh, you have two. Um. Yeah, I do have two daggers, but I'm again trying to knock him out, so no, no piercing at this point. Just sort of, you know, like that. Okay. So should I? I'll, I'll roll two of these. I guess? Roll two of them, but then you have to subtract two for roll your strength. for your okay. minus strength. Okay, mm. so that's Four. two. Oh, okay. Oh, two. six. Nice. No, you only subtract the one. Oh, the oh. once. Yeah. Okay. So you got six. All right, cool. That's kind of close. Cool. So the butt of your daggers. Yeah, bad ish. Because you tracked his weakness, yeah, and you right. said it's his head. That's right, yeah, because of the true strike, yeah. So, right, so yeah, you, you did the double gonk, and he, he collapses down to, to both of his knees. He's kind of doing a little woozy spin. Uh, you know, birdies are circling and out stuff. Though, huh? He's, he, you know, a big wind comes by. Boy, oh boy. <laughs> big rack sand comes by. Yeah, yeah. Extracts his eyeballs and his this, toes. This guy still has a spine. Oh, this Eric, guy, he might need to be put out of his Eric's misery. Story. Uh, Derek's turn. All right, I'm gonna try and do a finishing blow again. Not, okay. not to kill. Not lethal. Yeah, also reckless. Okay. Uh, I think that one hit. Wait, did it? Strength? 10 plus 3? Yeah, 50. yeah, that hit. Well, let's just see. All right, let's <laughs> roll one more time. Okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. Take the All bigger right, one. 10 plus 3, and then it's a 6. Plus 1, plus 3 is 4. Yeah, you got him. And I go, lights out! <laughs> Neat. All right. That was so that real cool. Like that. Falls unconscious right. because he's a light bulb. Ah, uh, Grimo, Grimo smoking up front. Uh, Grimo's gonna run up if you'll move him up to that guy that just got knocked unconscious and and then bind him with some of the Man. the rest of the rope that he's got. Grimo's handy with those Where those ties. Thing come from. <laughs> <laughs> he'd been Scares watching. he been watching through, like he was on the other side of the window, as you know, and so he just kind of like scurried through the, over the window and then. Like scurried over. Were squirrel. you like, were you like Joe Latruglio in Wet Hot American Summer? You're like, come on, Shattercock, you can do it. <laughs> You're doing it, Shattercock. You're doing it. Yeah. <laughs> no, we never saw any of the actual fight. Yeah, it was just on Grimo the whole time. So roll yeah, a twenty for he me. Finds that guy. He's like, shut up. Good roll. <laughs> Plus Is that a twelve. That's Plus a twelve. Okay, yeah. okay, it's fine. Oh, what am I rolling for? Uh, it's nothing. No, no, oh, no, no, no. This is a magic mystery. Raxon. It's okay. Uh, oh well. Just a little magic check. Odd. We'll check. Dan's tired. Maxim. Uh, so this is a skeleton now, or is he still alive? Oh, uh, he's barely hanging on. <laughs> oh, thank God. Okay. Um, can but I, this I, this I, might be the time to try your move. Yeah, yeah. No, I, I want to do my finishing move. Oh, the no. finishing move. Yeah, yeah. I want to just. I just. I mean, if he's. It's like a fatality. In yeah. yeah. Basically. Lights <laughs> go just down. A, there's an uh, an old Asian man in the corner of the bar with a long white beard going like. Yeah. Yeah. Finish <laughs> <you."> <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. I want to. I want to just basically grab him from the base of the spine. Damn it. Rip it out. So I'm gonna roll. Hold my, him up. The base okay. of the spine. He, he was asshole. facing you. So yeah, yeah. The tail. I want to pull down. Just. You oh. see Predator? Come oh, on. So he wants to rip it all the way up. Yeah. Oh, well, so I want a belt buckle. Get the <laughs> gold to pop out? Yeah, that makes sense. You just so, hear piano keys. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 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 So he's facing you, so we'll say you give him a little push first to spin him around. That's the idea. Yeah, and then yeah. you're reaching no. in there. Oh, yeah, I'm not a savage. Let's, let's roll with it. Uh, roll a 20. Right. Oh. Uh, Is that a 9? That's a 9, yeah. Oh, cool. Uh, that hits. Thank God. Oh, wow. Why? I mean, 
And just roll a... Uh, dark War? Yeah. Yeah, Dark Four. Dark Four. Dark Four. Oh, a six? No, yeah, no. Yeah, just a six this yeah, time. Okay. Please. Plus, mm. I don't know. Oh, no, no, no. We'll do your strength. That's five. Five is what he had. All right. So, oh. so describe your... <laughs> Someone's smiling your... down on me. <laughs> Let's let's hear about this. Okay, so uh, with my right hand, I just jam it on in there on his tailbone, grip, and I just rip the old grip and rip, oh. and um, I uh, and then like in one solid motion, I take that spine and head and then I just whip it around my my waist. <laughs> oh whoa! And, just, and I want it to just lock in. So is the skull uh, the belt? The skull is the belt. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. yeah so the tail awesome. goes right, what right into the ear hole. What do you say? Do you say anything when you do it? Uh, I say, better luck next Christmas. Oh. Nice. Oh, good one. <laughs> Lights yeah. out. Yeah. And then I go. And then I go. Where am I? <laughs> uh, yeah. I got then, your. Uh, am I? Can spine. I just now that everything's done? Can I go get my axe? Yeah, yeah. Uh, so battle's over. Uh, yeah, I do. I do a, a cartwheel. Whoa, cool! That's impressive. And I your pants stayed on because of the belt. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I got my axe back. Cool, man. So everyone got sixty-seven XP for oh, that fight. Wow. Sweet. Um, Numbers, man. Yeah, you're really hurting us here. <laughs> why? What's so, why even bother with the? So Saite five hundred four, I believe, is the new total. Oh, thank what? you. Yeah. Thank you so much uh, for your help getting rid of these these jackasses. Uh, it looks like we killed two of them and have two tied up here. Um, I'm not sure what we should do with them. Uh, if you guys have any recommendations, we don't really have a jail or anything in the village. This is Zaytay talking? So the, the, the two uh, yeah, yellows yeah. are the unconscious. Yeah, these two right? guys are unconscious. Racist. And that guy well, shredded. <laughs> one of them is never going to walk again. And the other guy is pretty hurt too. You can give them a warning and tell them that if they ever come back to this village, so too will we. I th yeah, I think they've learned their lesson. Uh, as Derek says that, I'm standing over him with my belt, which is of their friend. <laughs> <laughs> I just I just gesture to the belt. Yeah, yeah. I'm just pointing at it. Yeah, I'm, I'm smiling. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I mean, that sounds good to me. I like what Derek said. Okay, just threaten them with yeah. more violence. Yeah. yeah. If they don't get out of town. Yeah. Okay. What do they do? I mean, they're unconscious. Okay, oh. perfect. Tell Saite to dump Well, so they'll dream somewhere. about this. Yeah. Saite Maybe. can throw him on his wagon and just dump him somewhere. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I don't have a wagon. If I were oh, you, Saite, man. I would just wait for them to wake up and then just walk, have someone walk them out of town. You have one hand. You could do it yourself. If you really wanted to. Do you want to pee on them? Like, mark them? And then, you know, maybe we can find them later. No, I don't want to pee on them. Oh, All right? I don't oh, mark people. Pee. I mark trees. Oh, Thanks very these much. These are kind of... Hey, I mean, nothing. If a tree, Shut up. If a tree grows too wild, I don't know what I'm going to do. <laughs> uh, Decker will, will, like, flourish, type, and then close his laptop, put it away, stand up. We did the quest. Give us our gold, and we'll be on our way. Oh. Gold, huh? Yeah, you said you, said you would scrape sound. together some paltry whatever the fuck. Okay. It's poultry. Oh yeah, it's, 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 <laughs> yeah, it's a chicken. Oh, oh, no. Yeah. Oh, no. Well, I, need um, a, I need to heal. Up. Let me go find some cheat and see if he can gather some some money from the people in the village. I don't like the sound of this decker. Poor, sad farmers. Yeah, so yeah. I'm no, sure no. they'll be able to spare something. Should we just kill them? Can, can, can we check these guys to see if they have anything cool on them? Absolutely. So we're just as bad as them. Yeah, well, I mean, <laughs> we're just looting. Here's my corn now. Okay, I, like, stolen. I like how his moral compass kicks in after he's ripped the spine out of the <laughs> oh, yeah. This was that's, that's bad. That's bad. Oh, I see. All right, so you find nine gold pieces. Wow. Okay. Uh, 44 silver pieces. A drum. Like um, a musical drum? Yeah, just like a drum. Oh, okay. boy. Um, we just kill a march. We removed baby? music from the world, you guys. Oh. Yeah. Um, they actually they had a goat that was tied up outside. Free goat? That was theirs that... You guys How sexy is that guy? <laughs> <laughs> Twelve days of rations and two casks of ale. Wow, um, they also, if I don't know if anyone wants any of their weapons or armor or shield or have? anything. There's two maces, a battle axe, and a long sword, and is, two shields. Is the battle axe better than my family's battle axe? No, not yeah, at I all. I didn't think so. Stupid. <laughs> no, I, 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 my sword is. I'm Mary? sticking to my sword. Mary, you one of those things? Well. I'd figure I'm not gonna use them, but I might as well take them and sell them. Can we do that? I mean, yeah. If you find uh, someone that's got that wants to buy it, can I uh, take the silver pieces and then uh, and then go over to the bar and then say sorry for the trouble? 
Sure. Yeah. And throw it at the bartender, but then I go back and then I take two silver pieces back. <laughs> so that was forty-four silver pieces. Forty-four. Gave that guy forty-two silver no, pieces. No, I did just not. One, right? I'm, I'm just uh, so. I don't know if we want to divvy it up. Probably should do that. That'd be nice. That seems like that's like a fair thing to do. So I'm just gonna take ten, and then I'm gonna give him ten. The, the bartender, bartender ten, bartender. but then I'm gonna take back five for myself. <laughs> he so thinks he thanks you very much yeah. and. So no problem. Come back anytime. Shattercock uh, picks up the gold pieces and flips one to Decker, one to Miri, one to Raxon, one to Derek. Uh, the coin lands in the mouth of my belt buckle. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah. It just forms your belt buckle. And, and he goes, goes around the ice, talking uh, a little bit. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And then uh, one to Grimo. Um, so that, what that, was, that was nine of them. Right, so there's six. I, I think I've divvied up six, one for me. So there should be three more, right? Mm -hmm. um, who wants to hold on? To, I'll, I'll hold on to the other three. And if, if nobody has any problem. Thank you. Oh, that's, that's some good loot. I'm done. Character is basically thinking there's nothing to buy in the shithole anyway, so it doesn't matter. All right. Uh, all right. So um, you guys are just gonna leave the bodies with Saite? Yeah, I mean yeah, they're not there. Right? Yeah, we did. He asked that's us to take problem. care of the threat. Yeah, it's his yeah. problem now. Yeah. yeah. Well, before right. we leave, I'll I'll, uh, I'll pipe up and say, hold on, hold on, hold on. We haven't gotten anything out of this except some gold and some shitty weapons or whatever. Saite, you know anything about the Moondog Brothers? I I what. No. You're what's what's a moon dog brother? Nobody knows anything about, about these, about these moon, dog moon dog brothers. Um, I'll, uh, I'll go out to the. What, the no, what what are the moon dog brothers? The, you don't, Maybe doesn't matter. Don't worry about it. Maybe I've heard it's something a about of something. Outlaws. They're orcs. They're orcs, huh? Yeah. Orcs. Okay. Oh, there we go. Okay. Yeah, I've, I've heard there was a camp not too far from here on the other side of the Rathwalla. Yeah, so did we. Yeah, we got that on our map. Saite. I knew that. Saite. Well, Saite. Hey, hold on a minute. What would it take you? What would it take? Have you accompany us to assault this camp? Ooh. What do you want? Gold? Another hand? Yeah, we can build you a hand. <laughs> <laughs> Another hand three would right be there. wonderful. Do you do you have the ability to generate a magical hand? I was talking metaphorically, you dumbass. Oh. <laughs> you just saw him rip. True neutral. Oh. <laughs> um, I mean, I do have a belt. I wouldn't mind suspenders. <laughs> you fucking moron. <laughs> Crazy. <laughs> Uh, honestly, this psychopath makes me want to stay very far away from you. We did you a favor, uh, though. Yeah, you owe us, buddy. Um, I hate to say it, but us. Decker's kind of onto something. Just, well, let me uh, let me ditch these bodies somewhere. Mm -hmm. um, try and find someone to help deal with them, since you guys are taken off. Um, and I'll think about it. Think about a price. If you, what kind of price are you willing to pay? Are you gonna pay him? Depends now? what the town just gives us. We will. How about this? We'll take care of four thugs. Who are hanging out in a bar oh, doing nothing wrong? We already did in your that. Village. One. We just did that. Yeah, that's right. the price. Look. Well, we've already done that. You've... Eye for an eye. As we're talking about hand. this, I'm Come picking on. up their rations and handing them out. So, oh, thank you, oh, to, two to each. Should we just ditch this guy? So let me. Uh, you know what? Yeah. We had a lovely time in your town. Thank you very much for your hospitality. There was none, <laughs> and um, we're gonna go on because we had to pay for everything here, even though we saved this town from a bunch of corn stealing thieves. Oh, oh yeah, you, I'm sure you're welcome to stay a night in the hotel care. and get a free yeah, meal. Fuck you! Love to stay. So, oh, hold on, nights. hold on. Sate, you hook us up with a free night at that hotel. Absolutely. When we get out of here, we never see your your buffook face again. Grimo, you're in my room. <laughs> All right, I think that's a good time to stop uh, for today. Battle boner is raging high. Yeah. Uh, okay, the again. Battle boner. <laughs> All right, thanks for watching. Uh, thanks for watching. Oh, Thank you. I'm angry about helping Shattercock put on her bra. <laughs> that was wonderful. God, the friend zone it was just amazing. <laughs> I guess I'm going for all the marbles here. Um, you lost, lost the marble. Yeah. <laughs> so is there is there a big enough uh, open wound that I can get a hand in you that? You just mat? have to ask to do the attack, <laughs> and then if it hits, okay. then you can decide what I'm, the attack. I'm a detail oriented individual. Know, My goal here is bleeding. to get a hand in there. Which we know where you're going. Really so your, your javelin goes in, and yeah. you're, you're trying to free up some wrenches. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> <laughs> Human bodies are complicated. Well, he also hit me. So this is a skeleton now, or is he still alive? Oh, he's. Barely hanging on. Oh, thank God. Okay. Um, can I, this this I, might be the time to try your move. Yeah, yeah. No, I, I want to do my finishing move. Oh, the no. finishing move. Yeah, yeah. I want to just. I just. I mean, if he's. It's like a fatality. Yeah. yeah. Basically. Oh, I just go down. A, so he's facing you. So we'll say you give him a little push first to spin him around. Yeah, yeah. And then yeah. you're reaching nah. in there. Oh yeah, I'm not a savage. Let's let's roll a <laughs> roll a twenty. No, right. oh, no, no. We'll do your strength. That's five. Five is what he had. All right. So, oh. so describe your. Someone's smiling your, down on me. 
Let's let's hear about this. Okay, so uh, with my right hand, I just jam it on in there on his tailbone, grip, and I just rip the old grip and rip, oh. and um, I uh, and then like in one solid motion, I take that spine and head, and then I just whip it around my my waist. <laughs> oh wow! And, just, and I want it to just lock in. So is the skull uh, the belt? The skull's the belt. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice. yeah so the awesome. tail goes right you into s- the ear hole. What do you say? Do you say anything when you do it? Uh, I say, better luck next Christmas. Oh. Nice. <laughs> oh, <good> <laughs> Welcome to uh, Twits and Crits, the show where a bunch of buffooks make up words and roll dice on the internet. Um, yeah. Good intro. That's what man. we got. That was a good intro. People That's don't. What we got I got a good one for the next un, one. Uh, like, they, they don't get enough credit. No, I, I got a good one next time. Oh, you're already writing your next one? That's <laughs> repairing. Um, so, who wants to remind us what we did last time? Boy, boy. A lot of stuff has happened since then. Yeah, oh, what man. did we do? We got into a bar I fight. Remember. Yeah, that's true. Oh, that's right. You don't remember. Fight. You just cut it. No, I cut episode no, that was the five. Other one. Yeah. Not oh, six. Okay. So. We, we got, got into a bar fight because yeah. the town, because apparently wherever we go, people go, here's a bunch of strong, muscular dudes. That's right. And, we had to help out the hot, sexy woman. We had yeah. to help out the guy with one arm, right? Didn't yeah. he have one arm? Yeah. Giant. And he actually did most of the work. Oh, yeah. He John. was pretty cool. We stabbed first, asked yeah. questions I think that's later. Giant was the name of the town. Oops. Town. <laughs> Same guy. It doesn't matter. Armless. Ping yeah. pong or whatever. Oh yeah, it was guy. Hound two. Hound two. The, the, the one armed guy. Yeah. Saite. 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 That's right. Uh, uh, that's my favorite kind tain. of Thai. chicken. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Put a little peanut sauce on his arm. Cook it up. So we we helped them, and then after that, we went back to I guess. Was the bar the end? Oh, it, it ended when you guys decided to murder all those people. Yeah, well, we grilled them down, and then... I think two of them were left alive. Braxton yanked out a spine yeah, at yeah. some point. He wore it as a belt. Yeah. It's weird oh, to man, call it murder. Cool. <laughs> when it's <laughs> like, it's... It's self-defense, but preemptive. They, they were, were sitting there just murder. drinking. They yeah. were asleep. Someone was defense. asleep, and you ripped his spine out. Yeah. spine buster. I recall we didn't get a whole lot of details about what they had done. Yeah, but we right. murdered them. You, you rushed in there. <laughs> we got the experience right out of their heads. Yeah, and uh, I believe that we grilled one of them down about the Moon Dog Brothers. Yeah, I think so. Or Saite. We were trying to get Saite to join us. Yeah, that's right. Because he was the, clearly the best fighter of us all. Just call him Meat Shield from now on. And what did he say? <laughs> uh, I think he needed more convincing last time. More convincing. Um, Who else doing it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Jerk off. These waist. guys to get any info out of him. All right. <laughs> what? We got one hand left. Well, so. Wait, do we rest at all? No, no. So. Uh, the, the fight night. ended and we ended. So uh, I think as friends, we pick or... back up right yeah, in the middle I, of the on the blood. Saite uh, went to get the village elder uh, some cheat, and they were going to do something with the two guys left alive and the two dead bodies. Okay, cool. And we, so, looted. Uh, I think we looted as well, right? Yeah, I think you took some stuff from them. Do so. you write your characters at Thai restaurants? Or? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. It's all from the menu at the gotcha. local uh, Thai palace. When do we meet orange flavored chicken and his friend beef and broccoli? <laughs> oh, that's tomorrow, buddy. <laughs> yeah. So, what? So we need to convince Saite, right? Yeah, if you want. If we okay. want to. What happens if I show him a little nipple? Oh, oh God. God. That would probably get him. Wait. Really? <laughs> I'll do uh, that. Again. I'm going to need some clarification. Okay. Is your nipple small, or are you only showing a fraction of a very large nipple? Only showing a fraction. I have silver dollar nipples. Ugh. They're so you're like gonna, really mm. big ones that cover basically the whole, the whole face thing, of yeah. the breast. Yeah. Right. Oh, God. They're like saucers. Okay. Yeah, they're like saucers. <laughs> oh. uh, I can... I can I can give him a little bit of a. Well, he's off with the elder, right? Yeah, they carried so some body. They carried some body. Yeah, you're just showing your tits to the world. I'm hot. Your clothes on for now. I'm hot. Like just a conversation. You want to come with us? Nah, not really. <laughs> <laughs> what about now? <laughs> so Absolutely. did you say something? Yeah. <laughs> he has one arm. He can't get a rest. Can we do a short rest while we're waiting here? Well, I wait for him to get back. You just so want your hit points some back. Hit points? Yeah, that'd yeah. be nice. Yeah, so a short rest, basically like an hour. Um, that you got to do very got? little heavy lifting, kind of hanging out. Yeah, um, I got to read what arcane recovery means now. Oh boy! So you guys roll your hit dice yeah. to see what you recover. But you didn't take any damage, really. Yeah, did everyone? Yeah, take damage? I he took damage. Yeah, I, I didn't take any I'm damage. I'm at full HP. Remember offhand so. to get spell slots back during a short rest? I think you do. Mm. Ah, did you get it all back? I got yep everything back. Nice. Which nice. one's your hit well dice? The, it says, it says on your. Thing oh. which you have left blank. Maybe a D8. <laughs> oh boy. Wait, which one? <laughs> the box to the left of your uh, death save. <laughs> oh wow, I got all my health back. Oh, cool. <laughs> oh wow. I like how we uh, have what is a seven? The very first this thing we did. Seven. I don't think so, Lauren. And, everybody and people have yeah. still managed to get through it with blank parts on their sheets. <laughs> hey, I actually think you that's just awesome. lied to me, Dan. Did I? 
Once per day, when you finish a short rest, you can choose expended spell slots to recover. The spell slots can have a combined level is equal to or less than half your wizard level rounded up. The, so I get one back. The god of this realm there does not lie. He yeah. makes the rules, and you have to live by them. Or a challenge he doesn't him. remember. It was just half Sometimes your wizard level this whole time. Fadoy. <laughs> <laughs> we'll go with that answer most of the time now. Half your wizard level. Half your wizard level. All right, so, so you guys are resting. Um, oh boy. Let's say uh, Saite and some cheat. Uh, they. Was really mean. Take the two dead bodies out and toss them in the woods somewhere. Nice. Um, they've got the other two guys tied up to a tree. Um, when uh, when they come back, uh, some cheat is is holding one of the swords of one of the thugs and uh, shows it to uh, Grimo, who happens to be standing closest. He goes, "Do you know, do you know what the symbol means?" And uh, on, on the butt of the sword is a falling star symbol. Grimo takes a look at the symbol. He traces the outline of it with a cigarette. So what do I know? What do I discern that the symbol means? I have my my uh, thieves cant where I can see a, understand a set of secret signs and symbols. So what do I discern from it? Oh well, the the symbol isn't thieves cant, but if you want to like roll an investigation yeah, yeah, roll or, or history or something. Yeah, I'll do um invest. Well, whatever you want me to roll, investigation. Yeah. Do you have a bonus in any of those? Uh, so Ooh. 19 plus 3. Oh, fuck. Okay. Uh, so, yeah, you remember exactly what it was. And it's uh, the falling star is the symbol of General Iman Down, who's one of the general, generals in the Gael army. So. Wait, was he one of the generals we met before? No. Does this mean he anything to Grimo? He was spoken before. Because uh, no, no, other than the fact that apparently he has a huge, <laughs> huge uh, knowledge base about the army. Weird. Grimo does. Very yeah. selective. Oh, that's <laughs> curious. Um, so, does he then discern anything from this? He just recognizes it's the general's. I, I mean, I, you would you would guess that these these guys took were either some from. of his goons or maybe took the sword from some of his soldiers or so somehow it, connected. It's a good general or an evil general. Uh, I mean, he's a good general okay. as, as far as you would know. So then, if these guys are goons and thugs, they may have stolen the the sword Possibly. from him. Um, or, or maybe since you last knew anything about the general, things have changed. Okay, so I mean, Grima takes this information, but is everyone like asleep? Or are they? I think people are chilling in town in general. Are we just still hanging out health. at the bar next to um, next I don't know, the what corpses? Are you doing? What are you doing? The, the corpses, the dead bodies were tossed <laughs> and the, were the alive okay. guys were tied up to a tree real good. Hmm. Well, after we wrecked up the bar, I went over to the bartender and asked for a drink. Okay. So I'm just going to wait here. So you should roll for that until we move on. Uh, Can I have a drink? Something. <laughs> yeah, actually, no, you get a free drink for kicking out those, oh, those cool. thugs. Did, did we You're welcome. Um, okay. Oh, no, I, I'm in the corner of the bar, too. Um sort of like entertaining some of the locals and uh so i'm just standing there saying yeah yeah that's real bone um <laughs> you can t yeah you can touch it go for it yeah gather around please i, I turn, can do signatures i turn to sharpay or and i say uh <laughs> what's his that name Saite. The, the one like, guy? Sharpay. <laughs> the dog. i'm gonna change the name now i say i recognize this symbol this is from the general you know the one i'm talking about the famous one the one whose name I can't remember. <laughs> uh, where'd this, where'd this sword come by? You have any idea? Uh, I have Rebel no idea. Who are you? Back. You're talking to Saite? Yeah. Uh, I'm, I'm really not sure, honestly. Uh, these guys came into town a couple weeks ago. Um, generally weren't trouble at first, but then they started taking and stealing and, and doing whatever they wanted. Okay, I whistle back to the crew. Hey, hey, <laughs> fellas, we got this interrogation situation going on. I recognize the sword is from an old general. We gotta figure out how these buffooks came about it. It's the military. Did you can't try, trust the military. Did Grimo just try and whistle? <laughs> I, uh, I, I am impressed by Grimo's whistling. How'd you do that? Can you teach me? <laughs> sure. Yeah. Just put your lips together mm. and then go eat it. Unless you come in to uh, help me interrogate these. Oh, people. they act honorable. <laughs> Yeah, they act honorable, like they have lots of rules, like they're really organized, but they'll do whatever they want to. Sounds they'll come like to you towns. Got some kind of a beef with the military. I just know, listen, I know what it's like to, you know, be, have people think that they can do whatever they want to. It's the power, man. What, the what, power. Would you say being in the military is rough? <laughs> so, the deck will be scowling as usual. Get up from sitting wherever you're sitting. Uh, say, why did the fuck does any of this matter? 
We're out to kill the moon dogs. They might be moving on. We need to go. We're done here, right? I'm not done until I finish my beer, Decker. Mary, what should we uh, should we go talk to those people or what? Yeah, why don't Grima? Why don't you ask him about the sword? I don't know what it is. You know what it is, so why don't we? Uh... I'll go with you. Okay, we'll go. Ask yeah. him. Cause you want come Mary at us? Yeah. All right. All right. So we're gonna go try and interrogate one of the guys we the two guys that are at the left bar. alive. Yeah, kind of chained up to a tree and knocked out. Put a cigarette out, a cigarette out on one of their arms. <laughs> <laughs> he wakes up. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, should I roll to try to intimidate them? Yeah. See if it works. I feel like you just did. So wow. Eighteen plus, I guess, three for intimidation. Where's this sword come from? I've seen it before, and I sure as heck know it ain't yours. It belongs to a general, a famous general. You know the one I'm talking about. <laughs> you know the one she's talking about. So yeah. you just put your lips together, and what do you do? Wait, <laughs> did you come with us? <laughs> <laughs> I'm shouting. He's, he sidled up behind yeah. us. You keep doing that. You're doing great. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, the guy passed out again. <laughs> oh, oh, he's too intimidated. Myriadis, you're the toughest one of all of us. You gotta t- put this buffook in line. No, I'm not. You already intimidated him <laughs> oh. a lot. <laughs> just arguing Wait, with did each he pass out again? <laughs> no, he was real just pretending. Well. So, yeah. so, so. Oh, I thought he did pass out again. I'll slap him. Wait, I'm <laughs> not the guy. Yeah. So he, he pops awake again, terrified. Did you roll intimidation earlier when you rolled that? I did. 19? Okay, yeah. so he's terrified of the. Three foot tall, but also rested, Remo. right? Oh, he's no, he's, oh, he's in bad shape. He keeps getting sleep. Yeah, well, I don't know if unconscious yeah. is sleep. <laughs> <laughs> tomato, tomato. Can I ask another question? Answer the question about the sword. Oh, that, that, that looks like my buddy Craig's sword. Who's Craig? Craig. It's one of the guys you killed. His name's Craig Sword. <laughs> sure. <laughs> that sure as heck don't look like a sword belonging to Craig to me. But it, it was. <laughs> Okay. He was probably in the army. These are probably military guys. They probably left their ranks or whatever, and they came over here and they started wrecking up this village. And that's what they do. So, did you come with us? I'm shouting from across the bar. (laughs) From in the bar. Yeah. (laughs) Um. Wait. So then, if they're in the military, shouldn't they be respectful? Why would they be stealing? Ha! What? They would. Why would they be stealing? Respectful in the military. What do you think? What do you think we're doing? Okay. What are we doing? We're not stealing. The military hired us, a band of nobodies, We're not in the military. who shouldn't be trusted to go out and do a mission for them We're because they're lazy. We're mercenaries, dear. Why would you need mercenaries? It's bad news. <laughs> the military's bad news. All right. I'm pointing at whatever his name is. What's your name? Jim. Uh, Jim, you tell me why you were stealing. Uh, what were we stealing? Oh, uh, the stuff in the town. Because we we were uh, you know having fun you know getting some some laughs having some good times having fun yeah fuck these people well you know what I like having for fun putting out cigarettes on both folks and then Grima puts another cigarette <laughs> another on one. this Jeez. guy oh no you keep these things the last year of corn you'll steal <laughs> um all right well I'll, I'll put the I'll put my dagger up to it. I'm gonna kill you if you don't tell me what's going on what, what do you want to know. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I want to know where he got this sword from. It's and my sword. It's Craig. It's or my buddy's sword. sword. It's Craig. You lying. killed him. Why'd you kill him? <laughs> we were just drinking. Where right. did you and Craig come from? Do you guys want belts? Maybe we can make suspenders. <laughs> Ugh. What? <laughs> yeah, Mary's good. That's a good question. Where did you and Craig come from? Oh, we, uh, we came on a long trip. Uh, we were sent here by our general. I he, told he, you. <laughs> He told us to do some reconnaissance. We were actually looking for uh, for some drums More like and uh, nuisance. for some booze, <laughs> nice. and uh, you know we were actually just told to stir up stuff. We we're just following orders. You didn't have to kill us. Why would your general want you to make a ruckus here? I don't, do you, we just followed orders. We were told to do this. I didn't know I was gonna die. You're not gonna die. I think, I mean, I think we got everything we need out of him, right? Yeah. We should so, just kill him. The way I see it, we can go visit that, that good witch that you guys learned about. Glenda? Or we can go to the Moondog camp. I didn't tell you about no witch. I mean, I'm, speak, I'm speaking as Elise right now, so whether you choose to tell Grimo about the... Yeah, I'm speaking as James. Elise, I didn't tell you about no witch. <laughs> so the, the, the bartender owner guy runs, runs out of the bar and hands you this and thanks you for your services. Um, I can't read. <laughs> Decker, what oh, is it? Sweet. It says, thank you so much for all your help getting rid of those bastards. Uh, come back anytime. Wait, Decker, what, what was it? That's not him. 
I said fruit during coffee. That's really good uh, entertainment there, huh? <laughs> Reading something quietly to yourself. Hold on, hold on. Do I have to intimidate Decker? I'll, I'll, I'll yeah, intimidate Decker. Yeah, it creates a scene, James. I'd like to over. request that the DM stop handing things to Decker. He <laughs> <laughs> handed it to me. It was yeah. in the wind. I was actually passing it down to Peak, and I thought Lawrence would pass it down, but... It's in fucking character! Um, God, don't have to spell this stuff out. I was about to say, All but right, I so forgot Lauren character. So. All right, do it. Yeah. Five plus, plus six is He's eleven. Not hard to intimidate. So. Will you uh, roll a twenty for me, Lawrence? Oh, jeez, okay. <laughs> there you go. Yeah. What is uh, four? What is I don't even know what it gets added to. Oh, he won. Get, uh, yeah. So you, you're intimidated by him for the next few minutes. <laughs> Her, excuse Tell me. Tell him I was on that car! <laughs> oh, it's not, it was just a thank you note, that's all. Can I see it? Why? Because I'd like to see it. I've intimidated you. <laughs> hand the card to me. Fine. Or else I will fucking stab you. There. I just want to see. You are a very special creature. Thanks. Oh. Jayan, thanks you for your service to our community. You should always drink for free in our quaint village. Give me that. Yeah, boy, it was real worth being I'd a like dick over, drink. wasn't it? I wasn't being a dick! <laughs> yes, you One were. More. I just wanted to know! Done. One more. Hey, Decker, you can have the card back. I don't want it. <laughs> Give it to Derek so I don't ever have to buy him a drink again. <laughs> I like this guy. Grimo. Two more. Grimo thinks to himself that Decker is a really cool guy <laughs> for having that card. I don't have it. <laughs> right. But you did. That's just what Grimo thinks to himself. He thinks, wow, what a cool dude. But he gave it up. <laughs> All right, so oh, we don't know about the witch. Somebody knows about the witch. Well, what should we do, Derek? Uh, I think, uh, my ears perk up and I go, I think you should quit dragging your ass and we should go do something. Because I said dragon? When did you become and a he said rough. pun lord? I got it. High five! I got it. Nice job, Derek. Dragon? Good pun. Hold on, let me do this. Is <laughs> <laughs> your hand all fucked up? He's a dog. You got a paw. Oh, do you, do, so okay, I pull Derek for a sidebar real yeah. quick. I was like, should, should we tell the others about the witch? I don't. I don't know if it's worth our time. I'm a little tired. I don't. I from, don't who cares about a witch? Yeah, I don't care. I, don't I mean, care we're, the whole witch. thing was we the have moon, to get the moon dog, moon dog bros, so right? Or, gonna get us paid. I feel like we're just getting distracted. In Let's it. not tell them about the Here, witch. Here's the thing. I know we we assign Mariatus as the leader, but. Mm -hmm. I think it, you and me are pretty much leading this. I this mean, pack. it was I kind know. of. I mean, it's it was implied. kind of like. Yeah, yeah. 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 He's yeah. like the emperor okay. of Japan. Mm. Miria, I, mean, I just want to say you're doing yep. a beautiful job <laughs> as the leader. I don't, think, you're I don't think we hear them. We're we're we don't. We don't. Oh, okay. yeah. 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 A side conversation. Yeah, I know. So I think we just. We take this to our grave. Okay. All right. You follow your. Hey, Miri. What? As our leader, don't you think it'd be a good idea to? Move on to the Moondog Brothers camp? Yeah, that sounds good. Oh, leader. he says it and it's a fucking good idea, but I say it and it's everyone no, shut up, Decker. Miri. I think yeah. I'm asking Miri if he thinks it's a good idea. It's Miri's choice, really. Sure. He well, is our leader. Guys. Yeah, great leader. Let's see what Miri has to say. Let's see what he says. Okay. I mean, probably. They're probably gone. There we right have now. it. Wow. Oh, let's go. Cool. Best what a leader fucking brilliant leader idea. Probably. What a leader. Wow. That worked. Oh, my gosh. They're probably wow. gone by now, but if that's what you guys want to do, then okay. Let's oh, yeah, do it. That's true. It you know what? I'll watch your back. You're, you're a pessimist, but you're a realist, and that's what I like about that's, you, leader. We appreciate it. Yeah, we're really good. Well, it's nice when you all agree. Mm hmm. Absolutely. <laughs> yes, sir. Yeah, everybody rally behind a great idea. Man, you guys are awesome. And a great man. The best. Tamiri. And I raise up a drink, and yeah. I'm the only one that has one. I'm, I'm trying to whistle. <laughs> Decker, don't, don't worry about them, Decker. You and I are friends. We're friends. No, we're not. We're, you just yelled at me. Fuck you. Fuck all of you. God, you guys are assholes. I don't need you. You don't, clearly don't need me. So why should I be here, huh? Great question. <laughs> yeah, it is. Fuck you. I'm leaving. Tell me how your little full out shield on works. <laughs> Miri's shouting at him as he's walking out. <laughs> Tell me how your fold out shield. <laughs> so, Decker, did you leave? Uh, he'll probably make a big show of it. <laughs> <laughs> but does he actually leave? He'll walk outside and oh, then, yeah, just kind of stand there. And then nice. I go from inside the bar. You're standing right outside, <laughs> aren't you? <laughs> Grimo walks out to Decker and he says, "You know, that was that was pretty janky. What happened in Durham?" I apologize. You were the one that had the good idea, and you're kind of a cool guy. Thank you. I'm just tired of everyone treating me like shit. What did I, what did, I do to deserve this? You, nothing. He stole the card! <laughs> I hear you. Well, you, <laughs> yeah, you, you, you threw the card thing, but, like, <laughs> let's face it, you're the cool guy. <laughs> I just kind of lean out the door, I'm like, what? <laughs> <laughs> anyway, Decker, will you stay with us? You can go if you want to. <laughs> 
So, uh, <laughs> so you're, si you're sitting <laughs> in the corner of the bar <laughs> still, right? You're... I was waiting for Doug. Yeah, I was standing from inside the so, bar. So, uh, this, uh, the lady that was trying to hook up with Adam the other night, Sutor, kind of walks up to you mm -hmm. uh, and uh, asks if, if you've heard anything of the, the greater outside world. You know, a lot of travelers don't come around here very often. Do you have any uh, news or is anything going on out there that, that our little village should know about? We don't. You're asking me? Don't... Yeah, I've seen a lot. I've seen a lot, plenty of the world. Mm -hmm. And let me tell you one thing. You're better off here in this tiny village with your tiny little world. Keep your world small because once you start getting what out there, things start getting to bigger. Derek? He's drunk. No, once things start getting really bigger. Happening. Nothing's really happening out there other than the Moondog Brothers. You're just going to meet more these, assholes. These orcs are taking over this, villages. This woman is, totally, woman is totally right. Um, it... Not a lot of change, except everyone's a dragon now. And oh, um, wow. don't listen to Roxanne. All, He's insane. We all drunk also. Uh, <laughs> in order to go to bed, we all Again, stab ourselves in the heads Moondog, with knives. No, no, Whoa, no, Moon Dog Brothers. Yeah. There's a couple of orcs. Quit dragging your ass. <laughs> <laughs> What else do you want to know? I'll talk no, to you sorry. straight. I'll sorry, I, I just heard that things were bad out there. That you know, crops weren't coming in. That the people weren't happy. Mary, the, are things the king's bad out an there? asshole. Are things bad out there, Mary? Depends King. where you go. Ha! <laughs> All right, I was just you know we do don't get a lot of travelers, so yeah. I just looking just for news to see. If we're a bunch of mercenaries. I, I have a question. I huh? have a question for you. Are you for hire? Sure. What? No, fuck, we're already on a. We can't no, we're double not. dip. We're not Ding! Double dip! <laughs> There's no witch out there! As this is happening, Grimo kind of just like stands in silence next to Decker and like he like glances at him every once in a while but then just like tries to stand like <laughs> the cool like stoic position Decker's in. I'll uh, I'll elbow Grimo and be like, hey, you want to see something cool? Every day of my life. Alright, check this out. I'll like sit down, open up my laptop, and load up like, it's like a monochrome thing, but the screen like opens up and I'm like, Check this. I don't even need cards. <laughs> and I like to, I like tap something, and then a little uh, solitaire window will pop up. I'll be like, look like this. I move these cards around. That's cool, huh? Now, not yeah. being exposed to something like this would Grimo maybe be prone to seizure? You want to roll? You want to roll for yeah, seizure? <laughs> oh no! At this point, a griffin flies outside the window. No oh, seizure. Oh, no. Oh, Damn it! Uh, uh, <laughs> Wait. No. So you wanted a seizure? I don't know. <laughs> Uh, so do I kind of have like a fundamental understanding then of the technology <laughs> instead? No understanding. You're oh, just no, no, no. yeah. Okay, just I'll no seizures. Then. It's, just, it's just magic. Or... Type in something I, else and like I a. I don't know what your what your quest was. So tell me what you were talking about. You said oh oh no, th just that uh, there's uh, this couple that has some missing daughters in in our village, and if you guys should finish what you're doing now, or if you're doing I don't know if you've got extra time, there come back sometime, help us out with our troubles. They're... Little girls, Derek. <laughs> you like saving little girls. That sounded strange. You no, I don't care. Last time. Hey, it, how much are we gonna get pays? I don't care. Let me know. <laughs> so how much are we gonna get? Oh, paid? I have no idea. I wasn't like offering to pay you. I just I, I know some people in town might have things yeah, that you they go could use make a habit party adventures for. for people in towns that we've never been to before. We've already cleared out of this place of these soldiers, I our, guess. Our and leader said we should go after Moondog. Brothers well, now there's all. someone else to help. We should help them. But they don't have any money. <laughs> so charitable. We really don't have any money. We're pretty poor. Oh. Grima reaches out and tries to grab the cards that are in the laptop, but he can't. <laughs> right, Mary, you got to tell us what we're going to do. What are we going to do here? Are we well, going off the side quest? Or are we... What <laughs> happened are to these... To you don't know what girls? happened to these girls that just disappeared? They're, they went missing a couple weeks ago. Little girls, Derek. I, listen, I only care about getting paid. And if this isn't going to benefit me in any way, then I don't care about anybody or anything. No matter if they're little girls, innocent, scared little girls that probably are afraid and don't know where they are and should be with their families. I agree we're losing time on the moon dogs, but I'm for helping them. But if you guys want to go after fine, the moon dogs... Fine, Mary! Fine! <laughs> fine! We'll save the little girls! God! Well, that Jeez. was easy. Who, who else? Well, you're who else? the leader. I mean, we have to do what you say. Oh, yeah, we okay. have to do what you say. What are we supposed to do? We have to save these little girls, even though it doesn't even pay anything. We're not even getting paid. You've been for doing this, everything I've we're exactly doing... said the whole fine. time. Fine, just tell <laughs> us what what you know about the missing girls. Jeez, fine, we'll do it. Fine. So, what do you know? Oh, I, you know, I was just throwing it out there. You, you guys really don't <laughs> have to. You don't really have to to do this now. Grimo uh, kind of turns to Decker and he says. You know, my father left when I was really young. I didn't know him well, but I think he would have loved this. Yeah, I mean, it's pretty cool, I guess. 
Yeah, and he'll, I like, guess. <laughs> <laughs> maybe like, hey, I'll like look around. Hey, okay, check this out. And then I'll close out the uh, the my, or not Minesweeper, Solitaire, please. <laughs> and then I'll hit something up, and it'll pull up uh, an ASCII picture of boobs. I'll be like, I did that myself. <laughs> <laughs> You are a maestro. Yeah. <laughs> Grimo tries to grab at those, too. Yeah, that doesn't work yet. Huh. I'm the, working on that, the though. The boobs just reflecting in your eyeballs. <laughs> Glimmering. So, Saite, uh, the, the one-armed guy, runs up, and um, he goes, you know, I, I apologize for so brashly pushing you aside earlier. Um, I will come with you. you. You requested my help. You helped my village, and, you know, the least I can do is return the favor, and and give you a few days of my assistance on whatever quest it is that you've 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 got on you. Um, All right. All right. I know we don't have a lot of money to pay you, so this will be the repayment from the village. Wait a um, minute. Why don't we go to Moondog Brothers and then side Tago look for those little girls? <laughs> if, if that's what you would, if that would consider us uh, You're not even, the leader. I don't know. even True. Steven, then are you, are you trying to say you want to give this guy a hand? Mm, hop. I get it. What? No, he's missing an arm. <laughs> Mary, yeah, it's, it's missing about right here. Mary, oh, Mary, okay. Joke still stands. What are you doing, Mary? I want to help find the little girls, but no, I am <laughs> diplomatic if the group wants to go after the Moondog Brothers. It's not a bad idea to send. Fine. Jeez. Saite. Don't put a sword to my throat. We'll get the little girls. Right. <laughs> drunker and drunker. One okay. more. Um, <laughs> they're free. <laughs> <laughs> All right, search so you do, up. So do we ask for info on where these girls are, or are we just going to go wander around until we find something? Yeah. Oh, we should, we should well, ask Sa that What is Saite, or is that his name? Hmm? What does he know? Does he know anything? Uh, you know, I, I know the couple. Um, they live a few, few doors down from here. We can go ask them if they know any, okay. have any, have any idea. Let's so go wait, talk doing, to them. We're doing a quest for no reward? Hey, I just think people that need help should be helped. It'll come back to us at some point. Not sure about that one. I mean, so typically the way this stuff works, I've been through this situation before. <laughs> what a surprise. Uh, typically you do it, and then they find some money to give you on the tail end of it. Are, are these guys broke? They have The village is pretty poor. Yeah, that's fine. <laughs> I mean, there's like usually like a sack of gold under a bed or provisions or something. You can't just shortcut this whole process and tell us if there's going to be that at the end there? Oh, no. That's fine. Okay. <laughs> okay, who wants to go after the Moondog Brothers? Raise your hand. Hands up. One. Two. <laughs> I'll go over a deck of I girls. gotta do what Miri says. Yeah. Well, he's asking what we want to do. It's a trick question. What do you want to do? He wants to see who's loyal to him. You watch. I'm watching. I go wherever Deco goes. <laughs> she hey, knows where those boobs Decker. are. <laughs> he, sorry. What's Decker voting? What do you want to do, Decker? I think there's going to be a reward at the end anyway. This stuff doesn't happen for no reason. There's always somebody planning this stuff out, so... And plus, it's like, it's a side quest, right? We're not going to get hurt. So let's just knock it out, sure. A side, it's a side, it's a side quest. quest. Oh, sorry, whatever. There's the big thing you do, and then there's the little side things that pop up, helping people, rescuing dogs, whatever. I'm not sure what he's talking about. Mm. It's weird. It's like a different language. It's all pretty patterned. So let's go talk to the parents. What? Sure. <laughs> I'm Mary's confu I'm confused. You're confusing everything Mary. everything Decker's saying. Don't don't worry. You'll, you'll see, you'll see. Don't worry. Mary, we're too right, Do not seek wisdom from the village idiot. <laughs> I think he's something else I'm entirely. Right here. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so, so Saite um, kind of runs off ahead of you guys, uh, disappears into a hut, and comes out <laughs> as with, he does uh, at all. Classic Saite, yeah. <laughs> comes laughing out, maniacally. Yeah. Comes out with a, a man and a woman. They're both a little bit older. Um, Damn. DTF. Nothing really. <laughs> well, maybe. Oh. Maybe. They usually get into like that's like swinger time. Yeah. Yeah. A little old and bored of each well, other. Yeah. No, well, they're they're comfortable. For it. Yeah. Okay. Cool. I like Nothing to do but fuck. Numbers. I like where this story is going. So Saite introduces you to the, the couple. Uh, this is is uh, Ban and Tol Paka. Mm. That's uh, not food. They're uh, <laughs> broccoli. Ah. Uh, <laughs> they had the daughters that went missing a couple weeks ago. Um, a couple weeks? That's a long time. That's a really long time. So, so uh, this the the man speaking goes. Uh, Saite tells us you you want to help find our daughters. Uh, that's amazing. I thought the the trail was cold. We have no leads whatsoever, other than some you know hunches. Uh, but if you guys are willing to spend the time to try and hunt down these kids, it's just uh, you're just wonderful, wonderful, blessed. We're not people. making any promises. Yeah, I mean, blessed and everything, True. but there, you got like a sack of like a sock full of gold or something. Oh boy, shoe shoebox full of something. 
in uh, there somewhere? We, we have some coppers. Show your gratitude. There, um, that's starting. Yeah. Yeah. We have some. Okay. It's, it's all we have. Mm. You should offer them protection. Um, yeah, just rattle a few cages. I, uh, I, I knew a guy I that had a couple yeah. sisters back home. Uh, I'm sure he'd want me to help you. So you know what? I, I will. I knew a guy that has sisters. Thank you, kind so. small man. <laughs> Ouch. Oh, wait, what are your hunches? Yeah. Oh, um, you know, it was night and it was rainy when they disappeared. Uh, we were all sleeping. So we, we really don't know what's what happened to them. Um, you don't know which way or anything? Well, there is that evil bitch witch out uh, bitch, witch. At, the, a witch? at the crown First time I've heard in of this. the mountains. Um, Boy. This not, is a, not the good witch. There's a good witch out there, too. But we, we think it was that nasty bad witch. Um, What's her name? Um, we just call her the, the evil witch. We don't <laughs> know if she's got a name or not. She could be made up altogether, yeah, yeah. Uh, but it's really all we've got to go on. Yeah. That's it? No other hunches? <laughs> they, they just disappeared. Do you have any of their clothes? Any of the kids' clothes? We have some oh, clothes. Around? Yeah, we do. Can you get me something? Sure, sure. What in the world? The, the mom runs runs back to the hut. <laughs> um, and uh, uh, Toll, the, the man, goes, you know, it's, it's rumored that the old witch lives at the uh, crown. Uh, up in the Noke Mountains, um, somewhere around there. Uh, but again, you know, it was an old wives' tale that she existed at all. But that's our only thought about what might have happened to our daughter. Does the good witch know the bad witch in this wives' tale? Huh? Do the good witch and bad witch know each other in your wives' tale? Uh, n- I have no idea. I I thought that they were made up, but right. it's it's the only thought I've got about my daughters. You should is... be talking to his wife. She made up the story. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she runs back with the uh, with map? some children's clothes. There's Jean and Benet. Do you, do you have this <laughs> map in front of us or no? Uh, you've got a copy of the map. We'll say you, okay, you can pull it up. I'm I discreetly I'm... take the clothes from. Oh. All right, go ahead. No, go ahead. Do do your thing. I'm I'm looking at the map and I'm noticing. <laughs> Here, what are you, Nothing. What are you, no, ask about the map. Ask okay. about the map. All right, okay. So I was noticing that Eula... I was noticing that Eula's crown... He's a dog man. It's not that exciting. Let him smell so we can track it. Do the map thing. Okay, Look at the map. The, it's past the moon dog camp. It's really far. And... Should we... Can I see those when you're done with them? Nope, absolutely oh, okay. not. You can take these back now. Thank you very much. Oh, thank should you. Should we go that far past the Moondog Camp, or should we stop at the Moondog Camp on the way? Mary. Oh, God. He's RPing. In my map. <laughs> oh, he's actually RPing. Down his little glasses. Oh, this is upside down for us. I can't read any of this. <laughs> what, mount, what mountain are they on? Eula's Crown. Eula's Crown. Might not be on that map. Might look like an eye. What the heck's that? That's a different crown? Oh, yeah, I got added. Look at that. It's right there. Make a note. Scribble it in. Pencil where y- Eula's crown is. So, Mary, it's way past Moondog Camp. We're up here. It's like, yeah. It's like right here. We have to cross that river. So we're the Moraga River. I mean, so it sounds. It, yeah. It sounds like I have a hunch that there's they're not anywhere around here. Hmm. Um, and so. Uh, hunch. A hunch. And so, here's what we can Enough do. Hunches for today. <laughs> we can. <laughs> We can proceed. We can check the crown if you think that's where they might be. And we can find out if there's a witch there. But we have to stop somewhere along the way. Yep. Any help you can provide me right. is just, just exactly the greatest thing I've you. ever heard. So Some that, help. Does that, does that make if, you happy? Is that a good? little bit. You, I mean, this is turning into a lot more than a side quest. True. We have, we're, fri- we're fighting witches we, for nothing? I mean, come on. Not maybe. Honor? It's for, it's for their honor and gratitude. Yeah, that's worth a lot. Decker, you ain't never known a guy that had some sisters? No. Oh, uh, me neither. (laughs) But let's just, you know, Decker, maybe we go to the moon dogs, maybe we don't even make it to the crown. Yeah, well, well, we all get to die at the moon dog camp. Really excited about that. No, I mean, they're probably moved on at this point, so I don't think we're going to run into any trouble. Yeah, let's just scope it out on our way. All right, well, hold on. Should we we rest first before we do this? We already rested. No, like a long rest. Oh. Oh. Because I don't have any... Spell slots are gone. I can't catch them. Why don't you just ask Grimo to carry you? Hey, you want to carry me? Get some sleep. Uh, okay. It is, it is about. Then you're a little bustier than I need you to grab my boobs and my butt and carry me. Oh, oh. <laughs> Grimo to carry you. <laughs> it is about like ten in the morning. Yeah, There's one boob on either shoulder. Yeah, yeah. You guys woke up and and had that bar fight last time. 
I do not remember how much I casted last. Perhaps we sleep during the day and approach the Moondog camp under the cover of darkness. <laughs> <laughs> I like Grimo's thought! That's a it is a, uh, maybe about a, the better part of a day's hike away. The so it's going to take you a day to get there. And it's 10 in the morning. <laughs> face. No time to rest. Or we rest along the way, set up camp along the way. Mary, what do we do? I don't know. Who's got <laughs> their spell slots? What? Oh, it's fine. I'll I'm ready to go. Let's go, Let's and we go. can set up camp or find a cave along the way. You can also have a potion or anything you just drink up, or you have like self-healing. We don't even know if they're there, so we can go scout it out. Okay. If they're there, we rest. If they're nah, not, we move on. Yeah. That's not a lot of rest, but okay. There I go. Time's a waste, and let's go. All right. All right, so go. you guys are going to set out? Yep. Along the way, if we see something about your missing daughters, then we'll maybe send word we'll, or <laughs> We'll howl. <whatever. laughs> well, thank you, blessed people, uh, creatures. Um, anything you can do will be much appreciated. At this point, we'd given up hope. Creatures? So, uh, I mean, um, yeah. Sorry. Uh, no offense, sir. Some um, taken. No. <laughs> None meant, I'm sorry. But anything you could do will be greatly appreciated, and we will find some way to reward you should you return with our there daughters or, or news news of them. Yeah, I knew that was coming. It's okay, a, It's um, a three-way. <laughs> <laughs> we could be open to any sort of situation uh, uh, if you return That's the thing when they get past them. a certain age, they do anything. <laughs> what? <laughs> All right, so let's go to the Moondog Camp. There we go. Uh, as I right. leave, I see a uh, chicken being roasted. Like, sp roasted and go, I look at it and go, yeah. I'll see that later. <laughs> Things like you're sexual. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Is he the chicken? No, I could, I could be. <laughs> <laughs> All right, it, it, now uh, Saite runs up and goes, did you, did you guys really want me to go off on my own to find those girls? Because I'll do that, but I, I wanted to, again, remind you that I was... Offering up my services so we, we and repayment. we collectively changed our minds and said, "No, we're going to go to the go to the little girls. We're going to the Moon Dog first. It's on the way. It's on the way. Okay. So, so we're going to go. Someone to the explain that to uh, One Arm over here. You're with us. Okay. You're coming with us. We'll do. And then, uh, depending on the situation, when we arrive at the Moon Dog camp, uh, we may send you ahead to check out the crown uh -huh. uh, to scout it out. Uh -huh. Otherwise, you're basically <laughs> going to be making sure Decker yeah. doesn't fall on his face. Uh, Sir Chicken Stick, do you have any healing oh, potions geez. of? Your yeah, you know before we leave I'll go I'll go see what I can scrounge Give up. the shattercock and that will uh, chill her out. No, it won't because it's I need magic magic mana potions. She's yeah, she's she's ragging out uh, <laughs> Mana <laughs> I take offense to that. She can't, I'm whispering all this. So, uh, uh, so right. get her some I got you. You So yeah, you can hear. Um, <laughs> she's been having a lot of headaches. So if you can get her some mana, that'd be great <laughs> To shove up her pussy. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so Saite runs off. Okay. Yeah. Um, I guess you guys start walking out yeah, of town. Yeah, yeah. He can meet us on um, the edge of town. Yeah. He has to run twice as fast, though, because of his one arm. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. He's runs in circles. Yeah. <laughs> he's, he's, all, well, he's off balance. Yeah, he's off balance. That's the problem. So after doing shit ton of circles, he makes it back They're to you guys, right? and, okay. he and uh, he hands everything. you two two healing Me? potions. He goes, "Give this to your friend over there." Okay, not what I need, but thank you. Well, you didn't give me any mana. I said mana. I, oh, I didn't see the air thing you did there. Uh, <laughs> Are I, you blind too? One we can still man. use the healing potions. True. Okay, that's true. I'll hold on to those. And like Grima mentioned, we can just set up a camp along the way if we need to rest, or find a cave and then rest. These are all options. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, will you guys decide on a marching order of some kind? Oh yeah. Who wants uh, to be in front? Miratus should dictate what order we go in. He's our leader. Yeah, we'll, okay, we'll, space. He's falling asleep. <laughs> Use that one for a side I pick a random order and I'm in that way. I, I feel as if a magical hand is uh, moving me about. Yeah. <laughs> uh, oh, Decker's in front. <gasps> yeah. Cremo. It's Grimo's time to shine. Grimo, he needs shields. Jay is watching our back. Oh, interesting. Oh, wow, you trust him, huh? Nope. There's less things to get in the way of his he only has one hand, so it's more clear. I like it because Grimo has to take two steps for all the rest of our one steps. <laughs> <laughs> Keep kicking her heels. His, damn it. It's. All right, so you guys are marching along. Not mm -hmm. much is happening. Okay. Um, good. That's good. You yeah. know, you, you, you get to that river uh, after a couple hours, um, mm -hmm. and there's a boatman actually on your side of the river. Uh, that kind of waves at you, and uh, you know I'll, I'll 
take you all across for two gold pieces. Uh, Total? Two but, gold! Unless you want to swim uh, or walk a hundred miles in each direction, I'm pretty much your only bet. Uh, yeah, total. You, two, uh, two total. I don't. Uh, do you even have a uh, child's fair? Perhaps <laughs> while smoking. I know. <laughs> yeah, three gold. Cost it, more. Stop hate, it, stop. hate little little kids. Stop arguing uh, with the bobin. Screw Is children. That per per seat. No, no. I'll, I'll get you across for two. Oh, all, that's great. All, all of Mary. you, unless you make me take a kid. And Mary's, it's three. Mary's got two. Mary's got two gold. We all have two gold. At You're least. Right. So we have to split it. You've been I think it'd be easier three. if we just had Miri take this one. <laughs> I think uh, I think we we're all, good for it. Yeah, I'll we put all in some half. silvers. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I gotta look at some. You've been taking any uh, orcs across this river? Uh, I've seen a lot of orcs. Uh, try to avoid them. They tend to kill uh, people like me. Uh, I want to intimidate this man. All right. Uh, I, hold on. I th- all right. Are you, you trying to figure out the math of gold and silver? Or? No, he's trying kind to come of. up with a, I have a, I have a spell to, to transmogify. <laughs> okay, yeah. I'm gonna try to intimidate him with my skull belt. I'll do a thing. All right. Uh, is that my, my 20? Yeah, roll it, okay. roll it 20. Yep. Uh, okay, yeah, you got him. Okay. Um, what do you say? I say lower that price by at least half. Oh my gosh. Nailed it. Why you got it, free? absolutely. <laughs> Excellent. One gold, you and I'll take you all across. Well, then I, then I Whatever also, you say. Then I also tip him uh, another gold for all the trouble. Oh, jeez. <laughs> oh, you're, you're so kind. Thank you, thank yeah, you so much no for your, your, your right, help so there. across the river? Across the Excellent. river. Uh, make sure you check check your sheet there so that we take away your gold there. Oh yeah. <laughs> Good. You lost two gold pieces, Raxan. So yes. we're gonna say you guys crossed up here. Yeah. And uh, have a little, you know. Yep. Say four hours left hiking to get okay. to that camp. Um, All right. That would that would make it about, you know, two in the afternoon right now. Perfect. Four. Hiking. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> no two. So if we did rest now, then we did eight hours rest. We would be under cover of darkness right. when we approach the camp. Right. You guys but we don't know what we're now. resting for. Yeah. Shouldn't we, have, we, we get should... to the camp if we just get the, if we rest now and we get there and it's just a bunch of cinder, then maybe we missed them by a couple hours. However, if we if we get there and and uh, it's orcs. light and there's a bunch of orcs, then they're gonna see yeah. us and then attack. Why don't we just send the halfling out to go scout? Yeah, aren't you supposed to be sneaky? Hey, we got Saite. What about Saite? <laughs> 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 wow. He's already half dead anyway. <laughs> I'm missing one arm. Yeah. <laughs> it doesn't matter. Either way, we're sending out a half person. <laughs> all right, so we're sending Saite. <laughs> get out there, Saite! <laughs> well, we could still all head to the you, camp. I say we get as close to the camp as possible to see what the situation is, to see if there's worth something worth resting for. Okay, well then, uh, oh boy. I should have shipped Derek in the front, then. Yeah, that's fine. You go ahead. in the front. Because couldn't we there. rest... We could see the camp and then rest somewhat away from it. Sure, yeah. sure. You're you're in the mountains, so yeah. you know uh, wherever the camp is, you could probably be far enough away that no one's going to spot you. Um, exactly what I was thinking. You know, they might have scouts and stuff you'd have to avoid. But so where where are we and what do we see? Uh, you're about four hours away from that moon dog camp. You just crossed a river, so, so go, you see a river. You see some in. mountains yeah. going up. Let's go three. We want to head in. All right, keep moving. But there's no smoke Only on the horizon now. or anything. Uh, not from this far away, no. Okay. But so you're th- you're three hours away. Mm-hmm. Um, so say you're you guys have have gone up to the top of a huge mountain, looking down in the valley. You do uh, you see the smoke of some campfires uh, rising up. Uh, you notice kind of a dust cloud even further out, miles uh, north of the orc camp. Uh, just kind of the dust is is trailing off into the distance. You can the best one of you, whoever has the best eyes, kind of makes that out. Um, down in the valley, you see you see what you think is a little bit of a camp. Um, it doesn't appear that there's a lot of people left. Like there might have been a larger force there at one point, but uh, most of those people have moved on, and there's a uh, few people left. Um, I don't know if you want to go closer to check it out. Or... We can send one of us. <laughs> can we see what Close kind up. of people they are, or just? figures. Uh, we'll say you're a little bit too far away now um, to make out who's down there, but if you want to get a little bit closer. Grimo votes for the brave Saite. <laughs> I also vote for the Saite. Damn. All right. Uh, Zen, I, I vote for red shirt too. That's fine. <laughs> oh, boy, is that me? I don't know. He's not very sneaky. So what? He's one arm. Yeah, or bright. Oh, but he is brave. Brave Saite. I am brave. Well, but I don't know if you're as brave as Grimo's brave. Oh boy, Grimo, I don't know. Grimo, oh, the things that Grimo's done thus far, as long as we've is been in this party. Brave? Such heroism, such bravery. Wow. I, 
I couldn't imagine Grimo passing up an opportunity well, to I be the hero of this like, mission. There's like two towns back. They still sing tales of Grimo. I'm sure they do. Wow. I mean, I haven't heard any, Grimo's but like it must three be. Feet so, tall. Yeah. Grimo You're didn't even grow so up with impressive. the father. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, how brave of you to grow up without uh, a paternal parentage. I think that was the third song. Not as popular as the last two, but it's yeah. still good. Grimo, are you going or not? Grimo looks up at Saite, and he looks where his arm's missing, and he looks back up at Saite. He's like, I guess I could go. And there you have oh, it. Wow. Why, don't, why don't we both go? Our brave why don't we hero. both go? I'll, we... get up, I'll get up and walk over and just like pat Grimo on the back and be like, we're going. We can handle this. Deku? You too? <laughs> oh boy. This is quickly <laughs> not becoming a stealth mission. Yep. Deku. It was going to work, and now it's not going to hey. work. Come here. Fuck you. Let's go. Hey, Decker. I'm in. Let's go. What? Yeah. <gasps> Come on! Oh, I was getting- I was going to get like away from party. you yeah. and you! Let's go! So now you're all going? Grimo can't believe it! His two best friends! Hey Decker, have fun out there. <laughs> yeah, good. Hope it goes smoothly. So it's the three of you and- and oh, Saite? But before they leave, I pull out a string with a bunch of aluminum cans on it that make a lot of noise. <laughs> <laughs> I go, you well, need this! this. A <laughs> Who do you I hand that to? Ancient, ancient charm. charm. Alright, <laughs> here we go, the three cool. best friends in Saite. There we go. Jesus Christ. All right, so say you guys do uh, kind of go 20 minutes a little bit closer. Um, <laughs> There's less. Just so you can. Sting <laughs> <laughs> the whole it's also the only fighters, oh, really, yeah. of the group. Uh oh. Yeah, we left behind Dude, the guy who rips crawling. out spines. I don't know, I think we'll be okay. I, so, oh, okay. Cut. All right, so what happens? So, so you crest a, a closer hill and you can get a good look kind of deep down into this valley. Um, there's a little feeding creek. Uh, and you see a bunch of tents uh, on on either side of the creek. Um, get a little bit closer, uh, you see on one side um, there's some goblins with a bunch of uh, cages and tools. Um, mm. Oh, we'll so where, the south side. Um, you're up on a hill, up over the, all those cameras over, over there. So you're they not on the you're way, way yeah. up over here. We're not We're not the map map. Okay. You're not on that map. Um, on the other side of the creek, you see some orcs and a hooded horned creature. Um, both groups seem to be actually having a good time, like they're celebrating something. Uh, they're boisterous, <laughs> clacking their drinks together, telling jokes and, and, and shouting. Grimo's not even thinking about what's down there. He can't believe his luck. He's with his two best friends, two favorite people. He's so happy. And Saite. Doesn't care about Lion Saite. <laughs> doesn't care about the goblins, doesn't care about the orcs. Um, so can we see how many of each are yeah, yeah, around? Me, give me just a second. We have a pretty do brutal do habit of finding people or things that are having a good time and then just killing <laughs> yeah. them. Yeah, completely them. destroying them. Well, that's the thing. Uh, hopefully, I mean, they can't hear me right now because you and I are yeah. standing over here. Conversation you and I are having. Uh, hopefully, they're smart enough to not initiate a fight without the three I strongest fighters. I guarantee you they're not that smart enough. Uh, uh, what's, the, what's the blue? Is that a wolf over there? The okay, blue? so yeah, you, um, the goblins appear to be guarding all this stuff over there. There's, there's two wolves in the small cages. And then a huge, the giant thing. wolf, uh, maybe the size of a horse, the, the blue one over there. Um, it has six eyes and six tails. Its fur glows and kind of shimmers in the light. It has a little bit of a reflection. Is that the winged thing that you mentioned? A wolf. No, it's a, it's a giant wolf. Oh, I thought you said there was a winged thing. Oh, no. He said a horned. hooded thing. A hooded Oh, yeah. There, there was a, a horned hooded thing. horned creature over yeah. here a horned with the creature, orcs. A... But all we can see is this side, I guess? Yeah, you're you're on that side, so this okay. is a little bit more vague over here. Got it. Uh, oh. If you get closer, maybe so you can see what's going on. Should we go back and get on. the other three and, and try and take this down, or what do you want to do? We should circle around and see if we can identify the Moondog Brothers first. Or we could just hang out or whatever. <laughs> I guess we could do that. <sighs> what are you going to do when you hang out with all your best buddies? Like, yeah. you going to tell jokes, or...? Oh, it's just, Decker's got his laptop. So we could we could look at that. Shadowcock, you wanna see some boobs? No! I wanna go see if there are orcs on either side. Okay, I guess we could do that. Alright. I'll, I'll just I'll I'll like elbow Grimo a little bit. Since her head is like or his head is like right here, I'll just tap that a little bit. We'll we'll check it out later. <laughs> Grimo elbows him back. Right. Alright, so, so I guess now we circle around the other side. Uh like trying to get a better look at this camp but not moving in on it. Alright. Um Oops, sorry, side day. Minute. Saite, what do you see? 
Oh, that's right. You only have just one. Just point. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't see so good, you say. <laughs> Me, George. He's also Why does he sound like yeah. that? Because he always holds a stump. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. So over here, there's a couple of warps. Oh, God. Mm. Um, go. Now we're talking. Oh. Couple of other guys. OJ. OJ Simpson and Nick Gary, Nolte. Oh, Gary, Gary Busey. Busey. <laughs> so and you also see Raptors. Um, cool. Ooh. An orc. Uh, another orc. What? Um, and then uh, the hooded figure, which will be this guy for God, right now. He's the coolest. He's and got they've hood. got these kind of these giant wow. lizard bird creatures. They're they they look like they ride them like horses. Cool. Um, I don't think any of you have seen those before. Um, they're pretty rare creatures, but. So hold on. I've got. Uh, how big are their spines? <laughs> Arcana, history, investigation. Like, would any of those help me identify what? Yeah, the fuck history those are? or investigation. You could roll roll a twenty. Uh, oh, so boy. seven plus five, thirteen. That that okay, 12. so. Um, because they're so rare, you don't really know a lot about them. Uh, you've heard about the creatures before. They're called uh, Ishiguros, or Ishigurons, excuse me. Ah. Um, yeah, they're, they're, uh, people use them as mounts um, in the wilderness. Can uh, they fly? They can't fly. Thank God. Uh, so the, the males are more lizardy. The females have more feathers and are more bird-like. Um, but they're both about the same size. Um, and they can be tamed to be ridden. Um, usually not by creatures like orcs, though. Hmm. Okay. Well, guess... should we go back and get the rest of the party? You guys can take it. Well, uh, <laughs> as you shout. <laughs> yeah, yeah, get him, pussy! <laughs> Use your magic! You know? Uh, what will you guys say? We're gonna need... Let's, let's go back, but let's, let's... A lot more people. Let's take our time, though. No. What is wrong with you? Nothing, nothing. This is weird. These guys are outfitted better than they should be. That's true. Orcs usually don't have this kind of equipment. This doesn't feel right. Well, I mean, we can just kill everything like we always do, but still. Well, can we take one side of the river and then not worry about the other side? No. Because they can't fly. You don't know that. <laughs> well, do we are, do we have, well, that's true. I don't know, but you know. Yeah, those creatures can't fly. Can you make out whether them big bufooks or the Moondog Brothers? Maybe. Well, we don't know. I never remember. One has like an eye thing. One has uh, two cropped ears. Ah. And then. Is that the eye patch? Yeah, are we close enough to identify whether or not those may or may not be the Moondog Brothers? Um, someone roll a 20 for me for uh, investigation, perception, investigation. something like Try that. Try it again. Uh, uh, okay, that's better. Uh, 14? Uh, yeah, you, you see one of them has an eye patch. Okay. Hey, I'm gonna try the, to see. The, the other one has his back to you. Oh, okay. I'm gonna try to see what I can see of them. <clears throat> so, oh, there's 20. Oh! Oh, geez. Uh, yeah, from the description you got uh, earlier uh, in the first episode, you would say those guys are the, the Moondog, Moondog brothers. brothers. All right. You should send Saitane to ask. <laughs> hey, are you? <laughs> I'm from the town just along the way. <laughs> I only have one arm. I'm here with a band of mercenaries sent to kill you. <laughs> I was just curious. Are you the Moondog brothers? It's them! Set <laughs> right, so off the signal. We, uh, <laughs> Rattle the cans. What should we do here? Should we try and, should we try and take this camp or take the Moondog Brothers first? How do you want to do it? I think we got to call for reinforcements. We're going to have to ambush these guys. If we try to take the other side of the camp, they'll just run. And then we can't catch up to them on those mounds. Okay. This is going to be bad. It's going to be real bad. All right, so let's go back. Yeah, we need to go back. Maybe Saite stays here and keeps watch. <laughs> I like that. <laughs> Saite, you stay here! <laughs> You need to take your stuff, trust. though. <laughs> <laughs> I love us. So yeah, he's, put, sorry, just hold the idea of us putting him in the most dangerous situation possible. He agrees. He's like, yeah, I'll, I'll stay here, hold down our spot, Go and uh, make sure nothing else, these guys don't disappear or anything. Oh, what if we dress him up as an orc? Yeah, rub leaves all over yourself, and then they won't be able to see you. <laughs> hey, gorgeous it's me, the Moondog Brother. Oh, I messed it up. <laughs> <laughs> There's this uh, arm. <laughs> I remember keep my brains. So we go back. Gosh. Guys, 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 guys. My dog brothers. My dog brothers are here. Guys, guys, guys. Uh, we're we're all hanging out by a fire. Come on, guys. Chilling, we're resting. Let's go. Uh, Miri's uh, finishing a story uh, that he was telling, and so the last part of the yeah. story is 
Uh, and then Morden finished his creation and rested. Ha ha ha! Oh, Mary, the tales you tell. I don't think. <laughs> what <laughs> what he said Mary. You <laughs> said the tales you tell. Was he telling you guys the Morden Are you story? Right now? Uh, I don't think that was supposed to be a joke story. Oh, yeah, Derek! There's a part in the middle where he cried. Yeah. <laughs> <Remember> that. <laughs> <laughs> what? So we gotta go back! The Moondog Brothers are there! They're there? They're there! We Did, saw them, we know! Where's Saite? Oh, we left him back there! He just told you, me watch! What if- wait, hold on. What if- we don't know this guy. What if he works for the Moondog Brothers? You just <laughs> left him by- he could be telling them- We didn't think about that! You- what? Humans don't work for orcs, dude. Deckard's like, that's assumed. Says the man with the laptop. <laughs> yeah. I trust you. So I know. Right, okay. So it, it is about 7 o'clock uh, at night. I don't, you Quentin guys time. didn't do your long rest, as far as I know. You didn't do, no, the no, long, didn't do a long, long rest. rest. So that's what I was trying to say before, is that I don't I don't have either of my spell slots. So I have some cantrips, though. I have some cantrips. I mean, no, no one has a mana trips. potion for this, uh... I don't think those exist in this world. Really? So. Yeah, yeah, we, no. could, uh. we could stay here and rest and then have Saite come and, and wake us if he sees movement. <laughs> that means someone has to go down and tell him to do that <laughs> He's while we sleep. So Saite's down there right well, now, sitting at the camp, going like, Oh, boy, um, everything's okay! So, uh, <laughs> so while you, you guys do your long rest, I'll go tell Saite to give us the heads up, and then I'll come back to you guys. Uh, yeah, I'll... I, uh, I give Grimo a health potion, too. One Thank of the, the two I got earlier, and I said, give this the Saite. Oh. <laughs> Grimo thought it was for himself. Uh, I give, <laughs> okay, I give Grimo both of my, uh, yeah. I give, uh, him both, give him both my health potions. I just heard, okay, Google, go on. Oh. <laughs> Whose phone is that? Anyway, I mean, what is this technology? <laughs> <laughs> Where am I? Uh, Sound the horns. Yeah, uh, so I give Grimo both my potions and say, um, use these, but if you don't use them, please give them back. They're worth a lot. I won't forget you. And then Grimo runs off. Trips gets up. <laughs> <laughs> Be careful. Thank you. <laughs> Did you fall? <laughs> so what happens when Grimo comes upon Saite? Well, Saite's like looking out over the hill. Oh, okay. oh I was hoping he was and, dead. Uh, does Grimo sneak up behind him or something? Yeah, he like gets him to a headlock, wrestles him, and he goes, "Cool, Saite, it's just me." <laughs> oh, little man! <laughs> Hello, little man! <laughs> yeah, it's me, Saite. Where is everybody? Saite, we're taking a bit of a rest. You hang here. You see any activity here? You come grab us, okay? So, so you and me, we're gonna take them. Thirty le No, 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 Saite. No, 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 you don't understand. You are the sitting duck, Saite. You'll sit sitting here duck. like a little duck that you are. Don't tell anybody I repeated that, okay? Don't tell anybody little that. man, you're kind of rude. Saite, tell you the truth, Saite. I don't care for you, all right? What did whoa, I do? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Because, little man. Well, before you showed up, Grimo was the, the like one that sought after one of the group. But now everybody's saying, oh, Saite, come with us, Saite. Before it was Grimo, come with us, Grimo. Oh, Grimo. Well, way off. Grimo. Now, Grimo. Saite. Saite. I'm not trying to step on you at all, buddy. I thought uh, we were friends. <laughs> Short joke. Make fun of his arm. You know, Saite, I, I appreciate that. I'm, I apologize. But you're going to have to stay here, Saite. And then 30 leagues back, you come grab us, you see. Okay, I remember the camp. Leagues. You're not gonna, we're, we're not going to hang out? No. I only hang out with Decker. You're you leaving me here, uh, the weird guy with the hair? And that is the, true, Saite. That is what I'm doing. Now, Godspeed. Uh, <laughs> more than speed. Uh, Grimo. Grimo out. Mm, a little bastard, huh? Wow. <laughs> then he runs away. That was really nice when you did, gave him did the you, potion. Yeah, did you bring anything for me? <laughs> As he, As he runs away. away. He goes, oh, there's the potion! And he throws the potion back. To the guy with one hand. Yeah. <laughs> Think. Oh, yeah, can you can you see if Saite catches the potion with one oh, hand? Oh, no. No. Oh, he uh, no. drops it and it busts. Oh, it busts. It breaks! It breaks. Oh. Oh man! What an unfortunate Some life for Saito. Does, does Grimo hear he, the shattering? What? No, no. He tossed it and was running. Okay. Uh, Saite so, like gets into the dirt and starts gotcha. kind of licking Sucking what he it up, can yeah. from it. Oh, of course. Yeah. Hoping his arm grows back. <laughs> 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 of course, it tastes like mud. <laughs> okay, so I go back. Fish to you guys. pisses oh on my him. god! Right. Okay. So you guys have a long rest. Okay. Yeah. Well, I first ask Grimo how'd it go. Great, Saite's doing beautifully. Uh, uh, he used to thank you for the potion. He okay. can't wait to see us again. That's fantastic. I'm Brave glad. Saite. Okay, remember, if he doesn't use it, I need it back. You got it. Okay, <laughs> good stuff. All right. All right. Everybody's resting. So you guys have like a campfire and stuff? No. Oh, you no, know, no. Absolutely. Telling no. any stories overnight? Yeah. No, no. no fire? We sing loudly. No, there's smoke. 
Okay. Where there's fire, there's and smoke, light. and we're within walking distance of a rival camp. So we so. just stare at each other? Just go to sleep. No, we rest. Get, rest. Get go your to sleep. Well, back. someone needs to be a lookout. I don't need a rest, so I will be a lookout. Okay. So we take turns being a lookout. You can all take turns on. so that you okay. all get a rest yeah. at some okay. point all if right. you want. That could be assumed. All right, I don't need a rest. Okay, so. Then I guess we're all rested. Your spell slots are all back. Everything's back. So it's morning now? Because I was going to say, is it morning or is no. it middle yeah, of the yeah, night? Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you guys do a long rest, you We just do a Fallout style, like. Yeah, done. Okay. We just stood there staring. <laughs> time moved quickly. Okay. So uh, you actually wake up right before dawn. So sun's coming up when the you wake up. Time to strike. <laughs> All right. So we'll call that a good time. Uh, you guys are refreshed in the morning. Uh, you maybe you hear a rooster from all the way at this camp. Um, Saite. I only have one oh. arm. Remember, she sleeps in the nude too. Ooh. Oh, nice. Oh, there it is. I, I smell. <laughs> I smell Shattercock's muff oh. as I'm the sun fine. as the sun hits How it. Dare you? <laughs> yeah, your boots are stuck together and you stretch. Oh, <laughs> that sound. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that crease. <laughs> Does anybody have any douche? <laughs> <laughs> oh god, I almost spit. It's called <laughs> mana potion. <laughs> Alright, yeah, so we'll call that good for okay. today. Yeah. Cool. Alright. All right. Thanks for having us. Oh, DM. you're welcome. What's the blue? Is that a wolf over there? Okay, blue? so yeah, you, um, the goblins appear to be guarding all this stuff over there. There's, there's two wolves in the small cages, and then a huge, the giant thing. wolf. Uh, maybe the size of a horse, the, the blue one over there. Um, it has six eyes and six tails. Its fur glows and kind of shimmers in the Ooh. light. It has a little bit of a reflection. But all we can see is this side, I guess? Yeah, you're, you're on that side. So okay. this is a little bit more vague over here. Got it. Uh, oh. If you get closer, maybe so you can see what's going on. Should we go back and get on. the other three and, and try and take this down? Or what do you want to do? We should circle around and see if we can identify the Moondog Brothers first. Or we could just hang out or whatever. <laughs> I guess we could do that. <sighs> What are you going to do when you hang out with all your best buddies? Like, yeah. you going to tell jokes or... Oh, it's just, Decker's got his laptop. So we could we could look at that. Shattercock, you want to see some boobs? No, I want to go see if there are orcs on either side. Okay, I guess we could do that. All right. I'll, I'll just, I'll, I'll like, elbow Grimo a little bit. Since her head is like, or his head is like right here, I'll just tap that a little bit. We'll, we'll check it out later. <laughs> Grimo elbows him back. Wow. All right, so, so I guess now we circle around the other side. Uh, like trying to get a better look at this camp, but not moving in on it. Works. Oh, God. Mm, there we um, go. Now we're talking. Oh. Couple of other guys. OJ. OJ Simpson and <laughs> Gary, Nick Nolte. Oh, Gary, Gary Busey. Busey. <laughs> so, and you also see... Raptors. Um, cool. Ooh. Oh, an orc. Uh, another orc. What? Um, and then uh, the hooded figure, which will be... This guy for God, right now. He's the coolest. He's and they've hood. got these kind of these giant wow. lizard bird creatures. They're, they're, they look like they ride them like horses. Cool. Um, I don't think any of you have seen those before. Um, they're pretty rare creatures, but. So hold on. I've got. Uh, how how big are their spines? <laughs> <laughs> Arcana history investigation. Like, would any of those help me identify what? Yeah, the history or are? investigation. You could roll roll a twenty. Uh, oh, so boy. seven plus five, thirteen. Okay, 12. so um, because they're so rare, you don't really know a lot about them. Uh, you've heard about the creatures before. They're called uh, Ishiguros or Ishigurons, excuse me. Ah. Um, yeah, they're they're uh, people use them as mounts um, in the wilderness. Can uh, they fly? They can't fly. Thank God. Uh, so the the males are more lizardy. The females have more feathers and are more bird like. Um, but they're both about the same size, um, and they can be tamed to be ridden. Cool. Um, usually not by creatures like orcs, though. Hmm. Okay. Well, guess... should we go back and get the rest of the party? You guys can take it. Uh, <laughs> as you shout. <laughs> yeah, yeah, get them, pussy! <laughs> Use your magic! You know? Uh, what would you guys say? We're gonna need. Let's, let's go back, but let's, let's a lot more people. Let's take our time, though. No. What is wrong with you? Nothing. Nothing. Welcome to Twits and Crits, the show where uh, white people play pretend swords for an hour. James, <laughs> wait a minute. No. Yeah. James, no. Elise no. is here. We're, I'm Latin American. Fuck.
<laughs> Bruce is an Indian. I'm Native American, yeah. yeah sure. And, and uh, before I forget, uh, everyone gets inspiration for doing so awesome. And yeah. yeah. Everyone? Thank yeah, you yeah. for pity points. No, y'all did great work. Thank you. So. Uh, noted on my sheet. Uh, did anyone know. already yeah. have inspiration? Oh, man. You're banging did Cy get one, man. Did Cy oh, take it inspiration? Hmm? What did he no. do? Absolutely no, I don't think he deserves not. it. I don't think he deserves it. He's not even role playing. Jesus. <laughs> That's a min-max for sure. I love shitting on Saite. <laughs> He's just using that one arm, getting it out buff. Actually, can you give Saite inspiration and we can take it from him? <laughs> oh, yeah. So can I need your inspiration. It. I want to throw it at him and have him drop it. <laughs> it just falls in the river. Uh, so can someone catch us up on what we did last time? I don't remember. Oh, a lot of a a tiny brain hunting. hunting. Yes. Fuck. We were in the town. <sighs> yeah. We were. Some lady told us that their kid's getting kidnapped mm -hmm. by a witch. Um, and we're doing a bad this. Witch. We're, we're doing, doing this for a witch. No reward. No even reward. though there was a there's a there's a false promise of a three way, yeah. but. <laughs> An imagined false promise. The, yeah, the, yeah. the the further we get away from that three way, the less chance it's going to happen. <laughs> I wanted some forty four year old titties in my face. But. We crossed the river to the orc camp. After that, I, right? We went to the orc camp. We Saite invited himself along. <laughs> no, we invited Saite. Oh, he was our quest reward. Basically. We found yeah. the camp, and what we believe to be the Moon Dog Brothers yep. oh, yeah. are at the camp, and then we decided to take a nap. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> we found them. There you go. We stood in silence for eight hours. All right. So yeah, you guys woke up. Um, at the end of the last episode, um, the sun's coming up. Well, we lost the cover of darkness. <laughs> Perfect. Wait. I'll, uh, I'll, uh, I'll, like, I'll get up, shake out my hair, and, like, knock the leaves out of it. You know how it is. Uh, and I'll go, I'll, like, nest falls out. <laughs> <laughs> I'll nudge Grimo, uh, wake him up. <gasps> like, hey, Grimo. Hey, that I mean, Decker. Got a little upgrade here for you. <laughs> Sit down. <laughs> open up the laptop. Pull up the boobs again. So now they're bigger. <laughs> what? Uh, Shadow cocks over to the side, uh, totally naked. She has a <laughs> bottle of water and she's splashing it on her, on her vagina because she has to clean off. She's taking a shower. That's what they call a, a bird shower. She's I'm just curious if this shower. is what Bruce thinks arouses people. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Grimo should be um, into Shattercock's situation, uh, right. but he can't get over these large breasts that Decker oh, has presented to him. I'm, I'm pretending, I'm watching, but I'm pretending to be asleep, and I'm just kind of like curious <laughs> what vag lips look like. All right, it's all clean. Decker, how do you manifest this? Oh, it's, you know, it's all in my head, and I just kind of type it out. It, it, you know, it's a process, right? Every every day I come back in and make little adjustments. Here. Now Shadowcock's bending over, uh, doing her stretches. <laughs> Still so naked. All, stretching all, all completely, totally yeah. naked. Uh, <laughs> they start stretching out, doing yoga. <laughs> downward De dog. Decker. Only downward dog. <laughs> Is there any way you can make them bigger? Oh, I don't know. The screen's only so big. Mm -hmm, but you know what? Maybe there's some maybe there's some shapes on this keyboard I haven't found yet. I'll, I'll you know what? I'll look around. I, I like where your head's at, though. Shattercock found something that looks like a trampoline. She's ju jumping up and down it. I'm I'm doing this. <laughs> right, so I'm, yeah. <laughs> what's Shattercock's goal here? What she what she? That, those are her right? morning routines. Okay, just that's, how she, that's how she keeps routines. in shape. Okay. Yeah. Jeez. God, not she everyone found, has an agenda, man. Yeah, you gotta clean yourself and do your stretches and trampolines. Karimo thought it was strange she found a trampoline in the inn as well. <laughs> <laughs> She's just finding trampolines yeah. everywhere. <laughs> she likes to do that. Yeah, they're prominent in this world. <laughs> I like it. Well, you know, certain people pray to Mech every day. Shattercock um, finds her little mini tramp. Uh, does her yoga. Starts okay. I, so I'm, I'm watching and I go, and I'm finished. And I look over at Myriadis and I go, so what's the plan, boss? And I wink at Derek. <laughs> but I have a helmet on. <laughs> yeah, what's I up? I ignore his wink. <laughs> <laughs> what's up, Doc? Wow. <laughs> Well, <laughs> did you bring carrots for everyone, Mary? No. Um, no. I think they will find some in your rations. He's That's right. That's where I found mine. No, I have um, none. Yeah, I don't have any either. It's just a water skin in hand. You don't have rations? What did you do with your rations? It's just bread. I don't have carrots, is nice. what I'm saying. Yeah. Not I have carrots. I got go, all Derek. the chocolate pudding. So I found mine in my rations. You guys, you got to be in there somewhere. Shattercock actually reaches down below and pulls oh, no. the There it is. <laughs> there oh. it is. It's marinated. All Which those, hole was all it those in? people, those viewers who think Shattercock is innocent, demure. She <laughs> just pulled a carrot out of her vagina. Oh, hold on, she's just she stores it there. She's big oh, though. Yeah. I thought it was weird. <laughs> Shame on you. So, oh. Miri, in case you didn't see, uh, Saite is down there watching camp. He found the, the orcs down there. I did. Um, yeah, you told us last night we should go see what he sees, and then hopefully they're still asleep. Maybe we can surprise attack him. Mm. Something like that. I got some ideas, but I'll okay. wait until we're down there to help spell it out. All, All right. right. <laughs> 
So should we all march? Spell we're, it out. We're marching down the hill. All right, we're go. marching <laughs> down the hill. We're our traditional oh, march Oh, hey, song. I hope Saite doesn't die today. <laughs> nice. <laughs> all right, so you guys get real close to, you know, Saite... Uh, oh, th- I'm so glad you guys are here. <laughs> it, was, yeah. it was really freaky yeah. to be here all night yeah, by yeah, myself. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Shut up, um, <laughs> You're good to fight. You're good to fight. You're good to fight. All right, get uh, your weapons. We're about to go. Uh, okay, so I'm a little tired. complaining. Do, do, do a lot of sleeping. No big deal. Yeah. No, you um, did a great let job. Let the adrenaline Has power you. Moved? Has, what, what did you, uh, what did you observe? There's been some regular morning routines going on down there. Not much is going on. Um, they slept. They drank real late. Oh, um, yes. so my they, they were, are they moving? Like they're going to move camp anytime soon? They were partying. Soon? Yeah, they, some of them, um, the ones on the north side over here, uh, have been packing up stuff. But not the orcs? Um, loading up. Yeah, the, the orcs. And uh, it looks, I, I can't really tell who they are, but it looks like they've been packing up stuff on those uh, lizard birds. So the, things. the arrangement's still the same. Everyone's over here, everyone's over here, no one moved? Yeah, generally the, okay. the, go- the goblins and whatever they're watching over there gotcha. uh, hasn't moved. So no. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to squint at this little fucker, uh, try and identify what that is. Um, should I roll nature investigation something? Yeah, roll something. If you got a bonus, tell me what it is. Oh, okay. That. Oh shit! Oh boy! No, no. Well, that's a three. His glasses uh, fall It looks off. like a big wolf. <laughs> they <brave. laughs> Big right. wolf, you say? Yeah, it looks like a big wolf. It's got, like I said, it's six eyes, six tails. The fur is strange. Right. Like it shifts but in it's, colors. It's in a cage, so clearly, there. Well, it's in there for a reason, right? It doesn't have to be. Oh. So, I'm working on something. Like right. on my laptop. Okay. I, I got. I got a new routine here. I think I can let that wolf out. Which might be a good distraction. So we let that out. It takes care of all those guys over there for a while. We hop on the Moondog Brothers in the confusion, get them out quick, and we go. I don't think we can take all these guys. Cool. And especially if I let that whatever the hell that is out and about, we don't want to fight that. I uh, I pull side to side and go, "Can you do a push up?" He does. <laughs> he pops down, and does ten nice. And I, I look at him and go, and I go, "Nice." Thanks, thanks. What I want to want to do more than that. Oh, prove it. I can do two push ups. Oh, I just did ten. <laughs> that was dumb. I'm actually. I want to see where this goes. I want to oh, okay. see who can do more push-ups. Okay. <laughs> um, I start doing push-ups, but I'm on my back, um, and I'm lifting my head up over and over. Oh, those kinds of push-ups. Yeah, and I do thirty-five. Wow. Oh man, this guy is a monster. Sure he should yeah. roll, roll for that. <laughs> <laughs> He's got a lot of strength. Yeah. Eight. I did eight. <laughs> you right, should yeah, roll here. for push-ups. Kramer looks at Saite doing push-ups. He's been Saite nothing but a thorn 16. in his side. 16, okay. 16 reverse time. push-ups. Okay, I'm, I'm right, now push doing... Push-up fight. I'm doing a headstand push-ups. I, I watch them do push-up five. fight. I look at the sun coming up over the ridge, yeah. and I look back at their push-up I fight. also do five. Okay. Uh-oh. I did 17. 17. Well, I can't do 17. I did a backflip. Uh, let's see how many backflips I can do. 11 backflips. It's not as good as you. Uh, We break into a rap battle. (laughs) Uh, 11. 11 rhyming words. Dope rhyme. I got 15 rhyming words. And ended with one about your mom. Uh Uh-oh. You're a suck ass MC. Yeah, you called out my mom, and I'm calling out your dad. Uh, 11. (laughs) (laughs) 11. Oh, 20. I, oh, uh, man, like, hey, I cry. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was about the size of your dick, I oh, guess. This thing? This, this is my dick. <laughs> it's my called ins- my inspiration. <laughs> but that, that was that. I crossed the line. Yeah. I was in the heat of the moment. Same. I'm sorry. Yeah, I you crossed the line, I, I now have I now have respect for Saite, and I hug him. <laughs> he can't hug you back. He, he gets yeah. the stump on the back. Yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah, I, I rolled a 16, so it's a really good hug. Again. It's a good hug. I feel better about myself. So Shattercock's looking at the river trying to figure out if, let's say we attack these guys and they see, can they make it across? Yeah, yeah, you could get across that. You could. It's shallow mm-hmm. enough. Okay. Uh, your your movement would be slower across the water, right? Uh, but it, right. it doesn't come up past the chest. So uh, like, it, any any creature, oh yeah, his plan I like his plan. Could probably yeah. make yeah. it. Well, it's, it's good Should as long as split up? that doesn't come after us. That's I'd say point. we stay as far away from that side of the river as we can. Who Agreed. has the most stealth, Grimo? Grimo's pretty stealthy. Yeah. Okay, should take uh, Saite with you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm, just, I'm pretty stealthy too. If you want, if you want me to go along. Of course, Grimo wants you to come along. Wait, why are you guys? Right. You don't need to go. Oh anywhere. no, we're not going. Over, no, no, no. Oh, Grimo's okay. not going over. What there, if yeah. we all go? Who has like projectile weapons here? Just me with my bow. I have them. And you, you, I have guys have, you guys have magic, I, have a javelin I, I guess. As well. and, and crossbows. And we should be doing a projectile attack from up here. Absolutely. So do you want to do your thing first? Yeah. Yeah, sure. Uh, and then we, uh, which which brother should we try to take out first? Ooh, good question. We should pick a target. But this guy's alone. Before. Maybe we could stealthily. Yeah. 
muffle him oh, and idea. take him out while he appears to be pissing behind that tent. I'm, I'm still of the mindset that we should put some twigs and some like green paste on Saite. Like Predator? <laughs> yeah, well we dress him up like an orc and put him out there. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> and he goes, hello! That's orc language. I am orc! <laughs> I'm missing an arm! <laughs> I'm not human! No! <laughs> Poor Saite, oh. he's gonna die. He doesn't so look fast. like an orc, but he knew our password. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Dan, do we have to do initiative before I cast something, or can I just cast it oh, as we're doing it? Is it uh, Are you gonna like attack somebody? No, no, it's well, just it's you can a, cast it, some we sort of. Lawrence to, or, so we're gonna try and take that out first before we have Decker open the open the cage. I say we open the cage, we let that be a distraction, then we ambush these guys while they're trying to cross the river. Here's the, th Here's the thing, though. If, if they, if you open the cage and it runs around, this guy might move. And at that point, we won't be able to stealthily take him out behind the tent. Well, he won't be looking at us. Um, but he might, like, go out here. If we have range shot. stuff, we can still hit him. So you guys are up on a hill over that way. Oh, right? that way. You're, you're not possibility okay, of there. killing just this orc and no one noticing. Uh, you could be sneaky enough to do that, possibly. Should we take that first, though? So you see what I'm saying? We take him out, then we let the wolf out. Okay. Where where are we? Out? So we're over here. We're over up there. on a, a, like a ridge yeah. up over so here. Can we, can we come so around? You, I would say you're about a 10-minute yes. hike down the hill to then? get to this camp. Can we go around and, are and get to the outskirts of that encampment? You can try that. Shouldn't we go... That thing will just kill you. Should we go over here, though? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I've seen one of those before. Can we go around to that encampment? Where is our starting point? Where are we? Over there. We're like all over here. We're up on the hill where Saite was looking down overnight. Gotcha. So then, can, is it's there just, like an I was to overlook to this area here? Oh, no, this is, you're kind of go down into a valley and then there's a mountain up this way. There's no way to go around like this. You could probably go all the way around uh, before approaching. That it might be something we want to some do time. to avoid this and get on that side of the river. Can most of us move around and some stay behind over here? Sure. If you want to split the party up, I, that's, I that's dangerous. Know, yeah. Generally dangerous idea, yeah. I guess we should probably take this side first, then, right? If we're gonna let the wolf out. Yeah, let's say we should not here, be on that should, side. Should, yeah, no, we we need to move. Well, has, someone has to let the wolf out, though. I can do that. Yeah, I can do that too. If 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 he doesn't succeed, I can try. I think we should just ignore this side yeah. and then go over here, let them sort out that, and then they'll have to get to us if mm. they hear us over here attacking. But if we attack on this side, then those guys might try to hightail it away from us. Yep. So there is no way to overlook this area. Yeah, I, I'll say you can get over here and, and look down, sort of. Because I mean, like, going we, on. let's say we all take shots with bows and arrows. Is that a possibility? To yeah, do? you'd you'd have to get within this map, though. I would say to to start attacking them with bows and arrows. Okay, so are, are we not within this map? No, right now you're still up uh, where Saite was looking out. Let's say we move over there. Okay, so you started to move over yeah. this way. Let's say we did that. Okay. Everyone's moving over there. Yeah. Is as that what you want to do? Yeah. So as you get closer, uh, Derek. Here's a voice in his head. Boy, you. My ears perk. Yeah. <laughs> what? Free me. Help me. I'll turn to Derek and be like, what? What? Who, what's, what, who said that? Are you okay? No one's talking. So you, you catch it. As, as you're kind of hiking over, you, you sense this voice coming from the far side of the river now as you're starting to go across. Come back and help me. Free who, me and my sisters. Who are Time you? is of the essence. Who are you? What? We're right see, here. Am, see, I, am I the only one hearing this? Do you guys hear this? What? No, they no, don't, they what? don't hear no, it. No, I've never heard anything. The river? Uh, no. <clears throat> what do you smell with your dog like there's nose? A, <laughs> I'm I in a large cage. Oh, okay. Southern side of the river. Let me out the now. Animal? Yeah, there are animals. Uh, has, he, has he done this before? What are you, what are, what's wrong with you? I don't know. Uh, Come on. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I feel oh, like Raxan right now. Explain, oh. explain what's happening to you. That's not a good thing to hear. You guys don't hear the voice asking us to let something out of a cage? Please. No. Absolutely not. No. Dog brain, you losing it. <laughs> Dark magics are afoot. We must stop it now. What's I will help you. What's the voice saying? It's saying to let it out of the cage. It and its sisters. Okay. So it's the girls. It's probably those things in the cage. You're not at all concerned about the fact that a voice is just appearing in my head right now? I'm no, concerned about that. I'm not concerned about it. I mean, you got flipping. It crazy. happens. I'm going to throw this out there. Something strong enough to talk to his mind, it might be clever enough to lie. True. But it's also I'm magic, not so. lying. <laughs> you can hear them, too? What? It can hear us? It can hear you. What are you saying? You or... Wait. You it and your friends. Said, I can hear what you're saying. It just said that it wasn't lying. How can it hear us if we're way over here? It can only hear what you can hear. 
Well, the answer is magic. Oh. Hold on, let's you... try a test. Say something now. Elephant. Elephant. Oh, All right, voice. I don't have time what for these say? these games. <laughs> oh, he, oh, so he's talking to the voice now. What did it say, voice? No time for the games. Something about a fant, elephant. Dog I don't man. know. You tell the creature that we'll release it if it will fight for us. I will absolutely fight for you. Hurry the fuck up. <laughs> Jeez. Oh, oh, oh. Mouth on this ask thing. the voice, or ask the, ask the voices if they used to be human. <laughs> ask them! Did you used to be human voice inside my head? <laughs> no. Yeah. No, you, no. You should hurry up, though. No. But the, okay. the wolves talking to you We have a plan. Head? We have a plan thing in my head. <laughs> yeah, I, and I will it help you with that. It does involve freeing you. Oh, that's the good plan. Did. That's But good you plan. have to be patient. Mm. Hurry. So, yeah. wait, 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 wait. Decker, do, are we, should we let them out of the cage? What? I, I'm still a little lost on what's going on here. That thing is talking to you? I think that thing in the cage is talking to me. Cool. Okay. Yes, what you is, can confirm. That thing in the cage. You should probably let it out. Call me Upe. <laughs> and let I'm out, just going to call you uh, thing in the cage for now. Let out its sister wolves, too. Those are, <laughs> apparently, it knows those other things, too. And it wants them out. Those it are my sisters. It wants everything out. All right, uh, thing. We'll let you out. You gonna help us? You gonna help us attack these guys? What are you? Uh, my name is Cho Volkupi. I've uh, been through these mountains for hundreds of years, protecting this place. So Recently what captured are you? by the Moon Dogs. Not who are you? I'm a spirit of the forest. Please help me. What's he saying? <laughs> it says it's a spirit of the forest. It defends these forests. They were captured by the Moon Dog brothers. That's what it's saying. So Horrible have, dark so magic have, is afoot. I have religion, so arcana, we, can I roll any of that to verify this, or is it pretty uh, apparent? Yeah, what do you want to verify? That that a spirit of the forest looks like that. Okay. Or and can guess, talk to minds or something. Sure. What, oh, whatever that counts. Good roll. Oh, that's nice a good roll. roll. Nice roll. <laughs> Checks out. 28, okay. Yeah, that's, uh, I think that's pretty valid. I think that's, that's okay. what spirits look like. Okay, well, we're gonna, we have a plan. We have to get the guys on the other side of the river. So what we need to yes, do... Yes, you, you should. We should stop those people. Okay, we're going to. If you hang on for just a second, <laughs> voice in my head. We're going to. And the plan is to let you out of the cage, so that way you can cause a distraction on one side. Wonderful plan. So can you wait maybe a couple minutes for us to get in position so we can do an attack? Absolutely. All right, then shut up. Oof. Rudeness from this one. Wait, so we need to time it, though, so that... That cage is open while we're attacking. How here, are right? you planning to open this cage? Uh, I can I can make things move. So I was just gonna I was gonna. There, there's there's a the huge latch. lock on the door, which is why I can't get out. So both Decker and I can unlock I, I, like individually a cage. I think you can unlock a cage and I can unlock a cage because I have thaumaturgy as well. Oh okay. I, I wasn't yeah. using thaumaturgy. I was gonna I, use. A, or I'm sorry, uh, mage hand. I have mage hand. I was gonna use unseen servant. Okay, so mage hand will just. Like basically, like cast a hand in front of the cage, and then I can like fuck. fuck Does with anyone the have a one. thieves kit? I do. Yeah, but then you have to get close. Oh wait, no, I don't. Well, you could give so. the hand. I wonder if you could give the hand the kit. Hand like. can only like. I didn't know hand could move things. It can. Oh, yeah. Okay. Like ten sure. pounds. You can use your action to control the hand. You can use the hand to manipulate an object, open an unlocked door or container, store or retrieve an item from an open container, or pour the contents out of a bottle. Sounds See? like they're locked though. So yeah, they, they might be locked. You gotta find a key. So yeah, if, if you have a lock pick, you could unlock it. You could also smash the lock until it breaks. Hmm. <clears throat> and also, can I can move my open? I can move my hand. So if I have a thieves kit, I can give it the thieves kit and move it thirty feet. Yeah, 30 somebody feet. should just You're have to get a lock closer. I do. I do have to get closer. Yes. So how would so, you unlock the door? I would send my servant around looking for a key, and hopefully find the key and then go unlock the door. Because oh. a servant is like a servant is like a three foot entity that can walk around and go much further than. And it's invisible. It has like one hit point. Cool. Uh, and it has like an amount of strength, so it can it can obey instructions, and then it can like come back and report and things like What's, that. What's what kind of lock is it? <clears throat> Spirit in my head. <laughs> is it a like key? A regular old lock. Yeah. Well, there, is it there, a key? There is it a key? But it's it's smashable. It's pickable. It's <laughs> not special in any way. Okay. Oh, since they don't uh, really care. I think one of the goblins might have the key. Decker, do you want to give it a shot first? Yeah. Yeah. I can okay. give your servant my thieves tools. Yeah, the problem is people are going to be able to see the tools yep. uh, floating around. So let's try this. I'm just going to send my little guy in to scout for me. I got a little so buddy. So what we're going to do is we're going to try and send a small, sit down invisible man. <laughs> can one of you not just come, come and, and smash this well, lock? Well, you know, hey, these guys put you in a cage, didn't they? So yeah. maybe we don't want to get in over our heads, we're but we're trying to get you. So we're you trying to figure out, out a situation to make this happen. Then the numbers are even. We can take them. Yeah, okay. that's what we're gonna do. How many of these guys can you kill if you get out? Ask him that, Derek. How many guys can you kill if 
I think you can ask him. Can I just you hear can only me? tell you what I don't he know. says. I don't know how this works. I, yeah. can, hear, I can hear what he says. Oh. So you, how many? I can I can rip a lot of throats out. He said I'm a, hundreds of years old. He I said he can handle a couple ones. of them. Two. Got the other two as well. While you're talking, I'm like I'm looking around for a twig, and then if I find one, I'll like smash it up in my hand, and then I'll just like reach over and like rip some cloth off of Myriadis's. <laughs> Hey, what the heck? Hold on. Fine, don't worry about it. Doing? Smash it all up. Open the CD drive. Cram it in there. <laughs> the drive, start typing. And then, uh, and then, like, I imagine, like, the, the grass just kind of splits apart where the dude stands. And then I'm just talking to the air, and I'm like, okay, what I need you to do, <laughs> be discreet. He's right? got it, too. <laughs> <laughs> no, he's right here. And I just yeah. push something, and you, like, see the grass little move a little bit. This plan is stupid. All right, I need you to look around. What a wise old being. I know. <laughs> look around and find a key. But you better not make too much of a ruckus. Don't trip on anything. All right, I'll go. I'll just shut the air. So we're sending an invisible thing to you, I think, right now. Mm. Um, and then we're going to try and get you out of this cage. Okay. But you have to be patient. Okay, so that thing gets to the to him or not? Hey, where does your thing go? Uh, he's going to go into this area of the camp and just like look around. Look at all the goblins. Look at their belts. Look inside tents. Try and see if there's a big gleaming, sparkling key lying around. Uh, it, it looks like the the Defoe next to the fire there uh, might have a have a key ring dangling mm. from his his belt. That's a lot of keys. And then it's like let, looped through his belt. Yeah. Ah shit. Uh, okay. And then I'll I guess he'll come back and report that. Yeah. Or wait. Mm. What's this? Do slight? I just know what they know? Does it say you have a telepathic link? Mentally command to move and interact. Multiple simple tasks that a human servant could do. Fetch, clean men, fold clothes, light fire, serve food, pour full wine. Clothes. Uh, okay. So basically I can just control it mentally. So um, yeah, I would say he needs to come back to tell you. Don't okay. sound like you have a psychic link. All right. What if you, you don't have a psychic link? Uh, well, I can command him mentally, but I don't think we can communicate, if that makes any sense. I just tell him what to do. I mean, you could try to tell him to lift those keys. Yeah. Uh... I, okay, so I guess is this. An, I guess if we're back in character, I, I guess it's hard to tell sometimes. <laughs> <clears throat> it doesn't really work that way. Um, he's not that strong. It's so goblins wearing a leather belt, and the key ring is through the belt, so we'd have to cut the belt. Uh, which this guy might be able to do. Think he can do that? Oh, he can't talk. I keep forgetting. Uh, so like, fuck, fuck. Does anyone have like a small knife or anything? Yeah, I got one. Or maybe they have knives around here or something. Yeah, I have like a, a little dagger. Okay. Yeah. Right, let's try that. I'll give that to my little guy. Like, all right, I need, you're gonna have to be fast once you do this. You slip the knife under the belt, rip it back, grab the keys, run, and then shit. We're gonna need somebody to collect them because he's not gonna make it. But to the won't cave. that alert all of them? All mm. right. This plan isn't working. <laughs> I'm gonna go back over there. I'm gonna try and break the lock. Oh, it's brilliant, horrible. brilliant oh, idea. Thank you. I'm gonna go over there and I'm gonna try and break the I lock. I don't know if you should do that because then they'll see. You guys get in see. position and get ready. Oh no! Well, get he breaks ready. the lock and then he's got the wolf and he can take out all the goblins. I know what these guys could run. This is a bad. Get why you have run. to get ready. Oh, yeah, we always have to get in position is, right now. This is all so us. That way you can stop them if they're going anywhere. I still think the little guy can do it. We should at least give it a shot. What's the worst that happens? I think like they, he gets we alert everyone when an invisible thing starts stealing. How is that better well, than you cracking a lock? At least let's try it. Steals the key and then he's invisible. He goes over there, he opens the cage. And then this all happens in a matter of seconds, so then those things fly out and do what they're going to do. Tucker's right, though. But maybe he gets away with it. Maybe he gets away with it, but they've already alerted the goblins to something else being there. Not necessarily. Yeah, How's no. that different than you walking in with a big hammer and smashing a metal thing? I'm not going to wave my hands and say, I'm about to smash a lock. I'm just going to smash it. Let's As opposed it, to a thing fumbling with keys and then trying trying every single key until it opens. Let's say it doesn't look like any of those goblins have a sight line currently on that cage. Also, none of those goblins have a sight line on that <laughs> Thanks, cage. <man>. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, buddy. <laughs> that Fine, was, fuck it. That was, there's a deity against me here, so. That was, that was the wolf talking this out there. Right? Remember uh, that like the tents and the trees and everything's 3D, so mm -hmm. you can think about sight lines well, as I if think, people will be I alerted to something. you should go after the keys. You should smash the lock, and I think we should try both. Hey. I think that's what we should do. Do all of it at once. You guys still have to get into position, because if we something are. goes wrong... We're ready, Derek! Don't you worry! All right, it doesn't seem like it. Shattercock puffs up her chest. <laughs> <laughs> Knocks Derek over. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think, leader? Since everyone else is... Someone just has to act. Some combination of that. <laughs> okay. Getting the wolf out, whether it's... Derek, 
and uh, Decker's little guy, or one or the other. And I think, if we can, to the best of our ability, try and stealth this guy closest to us here on this side. But of course, once the wolf's out, all hell's gonna break loose. So, I just think we should do as much as we can to limit the numbers, if possible. So, like, everything at once, right? Yeah, kind of as they're, to the best that we can, they're about to get this guy out, we're trying to stealth that guy, and then all hell's gonna break loose anyway. That's right. my thought. So whoever stays back with me, we can all shoot at this orc here. Derek will go over there, Decker will use his invisible thing, we'll be good to go. Alright. While everyone's good. talking, I've already gone. Well, <laughs> yeah, well, somebody just has to act, because this is just everybody talking. All right, I was gonna give you a spell, but oh well. Oh, <laughs> oh he's no. gone. He's gone. Derek's gone. Before this, can I? I can cast an aid spell on everybody sure. that gives them plus HP. We all have aids. Do this. <laughs> Thanks. Aid. Oh, except for Derek. Yeah. How much aid? Uh, hang on. Well, it's not on everybody. It's up to three. So oh. I have to. Pick. Oh. Ooh, to pick. favorites. Playing favorites. Uh, your spell bolsters your ally toughness, resolve, blah blah blah. Three characters, five HP. Um, so Derek's gone. He's out of range. It's just a healing spell. It bolsters spell. your allies with toughness and resolve. Up to three characters within range. Each target's hit point maximum and current hit points increase by five for the duration. Oh, cool. The duration is eight hours. All right, who are you going to give it to? Um, I am going... Derek's out of range, so I am going to give it to Raxan. Since he is a melee fighter, gets in the fray. Uh... Anyone else down on hit points? Everyone's all healed oh, up. That's healed right, up. long rest. Did yeah. you say it was plus five hit points and then yeah. what? Plus five, plus five. HP, that's it. yeah, yeah. That's yeah. it, okay. So it increases your maximum for the next eight hours. Yeah. Sweet. I, I've come around and I'm gonna try to lift the keys from that goblin. Oh, oh boy. With my sleight of hand. What happened to the little spirit guy? So 19 plus five. Jesus. Yeah. Everybody yeah. agreed it was dumb. Well, I, didn't Grimo, agree. I wanted you to do Grimo it. Grimo wanted the spear guy, and Grimo he saw someone of smaller stature being stepped over, and he said, "I can't stand for this." Uh, uh, wait, didn't Grimo happened? step over? Well, much. Uh, <laughs> he wanted to, he wanted to see the little. Everybody didn't want the little guy doing it. So Grimo ran off so on his own. He got the keys and succeeded completely. And he said, "That's for you, Decker." Ro can you roll a stealth check? What was that? that I just, so... Yeah, I just rolled to get the keys. Oh. So 10 plus my stealth is 7, 17. Okay, Whoa. yeah, so they have no idea that you did that. I okay. want to come up behind the cage. <laughs> so Does he know that uh, Grimo got the keys? I don't know. I also gave my aid to Shattercock and uh, uh, Gre uh, Decker. Do you want to give it to yourself, Miriam? No, it's okay. <laughs> okay. So we'll, we'll say just as you're, are you, were you going to try and smash that lock? Yeah. So you're winding back, and he, uh, Grimo comes running around, curving around that far tent there. And he says, this is for Decker. And then he unlocks the cage. What do you mean this is for Decker? Decker <laughs> you was trying understand. to send an invisible man over here. And you all shit on him. <laughs> <laughs> but then you just went and you just got the keys anyway. Yeah, So nobody... you shit on Decker too. No, 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 no. you misunderstood. Cause... He's going to be pissed. <laughs> no, Decker's shouting. not going to like that you I did this. I speak louder than words. I'm shouting so. this. I'm out. Right, yeah, I'm out. <laughs> so uh, Upe uh, busts through the cage. Uh -oh. Got the right key Please. on the first try? Yeah. Wow. Which Please, one is the big uh, one? There, was, there were only three keys. The big wolf? Yeah. Uh, so please let my sisters out. Okay. Oh boy. Where We're are those unlock keys? Those beasts. <laughs> okay, there we go. Same key. All right. All right. Thank you so much, uh, young adventurers. Uh, what can I do to help? Uh, we we must hurry. Uh, dark magic is afoot. We should stop these creatures as soon as possible. We need you to cause a distraction and attack the goblins on this campfire. I can do that. You want it right now? Uh, yes. Yes. All right. What about us? We don't know. Yeah. I don't oh, weren't you supposed to be getting into position? We, Isn't we, that what I said? Been. As we you were going, and you said everything was okay. Have, yeah, I know. We have been in position, right, ready to shoot. Let's roll initiative. Then do it. We'll just there do it this. Is. Jeez. <clears throat> Ooh. So mine's ten. Six. <sighs> Plus, oh, you don't have anything. That's nope. Right. Oh yeah, there are uh, Sixteen. Matt. One. Mm. Decker. Eighteen. Raxon. Uh, three. No, actually zero. Oh, so minus minus your, yeah, minus oh, no. one. Doesn't matter. And it's let's just go. <laughs> right, it slips in mud. That's For okay. the record, Lawrence, it seemed like everybody nixed your plan. No, I didn't. I didn't either. <laughs> I wanted to do that. That's why I, I just had to make something happen. So I had to go around there. 
Because there was a lot of talk. It's fine. Not a lot of action. I wanted to see the little invisible man. I want to see the little... I still want to see the little invisible man. think about a little invisible man. I can see the grass move. <laughs> Maybe you could conjure a little invisible woman. Oh, I could. If, oh, boy, uh, awesome. Maybe a little so... invisible wife. A little invisible Maybe. kid. Maybe. Maybe a little invisible house. <laughs> Grimo wouldn't say no. To an invisible woman. <laughs> if, you can th if you can imagine hard enough, there's always an invisible woman next to you. <laughs> always. I'm looking forward to myself, because no one else is going to care enough to do it, make a hyper cut of all the greatest Decker moments. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just getting shit on and yelled at. All the <laughs> I have a plan. No! I, <laughs> I was very much in favor of the little man. I was definitely in favor of that little man. I wanted to the see The best it. thing is, you don't have to feel bad. That's my favorite part. So where's the little man doing now? Gone. But I, I noticed that we do Where's a lot of Decker's like... Decker's card thing? Uh, it's on it was there. right up there. It was right up there. It was there, yeah. It's right there. In front it's of in front of you. Oh, fuck. We do a lot of discussion, and sometimes Damn, you just, gotta, you just gotta do what you're gonna do. You just gotta... This is 8-bit pale hell. Oh. <laughs> Chol Volk Oopy. Oh, those nice. are the three wolves? Yeah, they are. Nice. What does that spell backwards? <laughs> <laughs> God, there's a lot of fucking people going yep. here. Well, most of them are wolves. You can probably stack the wolves, right? All right. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So, yeah. Oh, what did you want Saite to do? Oh, did you guys fuck. communicate any plans yeah, to Saite? You guys are with us. Yes. Okay. Saite, stick don't with us here. Fuck up. Yeah, just don't we're gonna, fuck up. Can, I, can I just push him out there and go, get him, son? Does Saite have any uh, uh, projectile weapons? Two handed long one? Uh, he's got a spear. <laughs> um, he can throw that. He's right, clearly yeah. the most powerful out of all of us, so we should send him for us. All right. Well, I mean, because, like, the thing is, is when they act over there, what's, I mean, basically, I wanted to shoot, I wanted to go, like, on, on three type thing, but they're already doing No, stuff. we still can. This is all happening, like, It's like, like within seconds. Well, I know, but yeah. when, when he says, like, okay, go, okay. and then they attack, I guess that's our, that's our cue to fire at this orc. I feel like, yeah, we're waiting for noise to happen over here, so mm. we don't, okay. we don't know what they're doing now. Um, he ran off, then, then so Remo I, I pull, ran off, and. I pull Saite aside, and I go, hey, look, I know you're just now joining us. But I want you to know that this is your story. This is all about you. All right, We're nothing. It. We're just passing it. through. You ever, you ever get that feeling that there's something bigger than us just watching you? Saite takes an arrow through the eyes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and I want you to own that. Right. You're the hero of this story, and you're going to live forever. Hero! All there right. he goes. Uh, you pumped him up. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Now he's all psyched. Yeah. There's a spear at the orc that you wanted. Oh, so. Yeah. so he does? So then yeah, yeah. I'll fire my crossbow you, at that. You kind of got to take turns at this yeah, point. Yeah, yeah. It's, oh. it's all happening at the same time. Let's be stealth. He, he, he's he's being first. Quiet. If you told him to be quiet, he'll be quiet. That's the thing. You yeah. see, he, went, he whispered, hero. Yeah, yeah. It's, it, it's your story. <laughs> <laughs> that was cool. So uh, Saite took those couple steps forward, hurled a spear oh boy. Uh, right into this orc's back. Did he fall on oh, his own spear? Uh, no, he, no, he didn't kill him, but he did mm. some good damage. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm not dead. I know. <laughs> spear in his back. Mm. Man, not exactly the most yeah. stealth approach. Yeah. Tossing a spear into someone's I did back hype him up, and though. And not killing them. I kind of, I need like a suicide bomber right now. Probably should have had Remo <laughs> backstab. Oh well. Stealthily. Yeah. What, from over there? Well, maybe Grimo shouldn't have run off, but what can you do? Hey, Grimo does what Grimo does. Yeah. Somebody has to make something happen, guys. We can't just talk forever. That's true. What if we send a little invisible man to like, I don't know, tickle that thing? Nobody just wanted to do that. that. Just yeah. Bruce and I Push and the spear in further. <laughs> just, <laughs> just slap it. <laughs> right, so now who's turn? <clears throat> so it's Decker's turn. All right. Uh, I'm going to cast sleep in this area. So we'll call the exact de description of the range. 90 feet. Oh, that's easily 90 feet. Each square is five. Oh, absolutely. Okay. You could probably you know, maybe put this one to sleep, too. Well, sleep doesn't work that way, sadly. And I'm sure that those have a lot of hit points. Uh, so I'm just going to try and get rid of the, the tiny men. They can fall into a fire. So let's see. A bit, bit. Hmm. Die rolls are not on here. Oh, here it is. Do you still do you have the tiny man active? 5d8. No. Oh. Uh, I mean, I guess I could. He could run up his standing abs. There. I imagine the tiny man is basically like that guy in Saving Private Ryan that's looking for his arm. <laughs> <laughs> uh, can I borrow four other D8s? Yeah, we'll I need one more. <laughs> Thought I had enough. Sorry. <laughs> ah, fuck. Boom. 16. Well, those are good. 18, that's a good roll. 21, 26. 26 hit points worth of creatures should fall asleep. 26. Whoa. Uh, so these two. Uh, Good night, OJ. Don't fall asleep. <laughs> Good night. OJ. These three? No, it's these two. Guys. Just those two. Okay. okay. <laughs> Do they fall asleep in the middle of a conversation with that other guy? Yeah. <laughs> well, we, I know yeah. we just woke up from sleeping yeah. all night, but. You should be investing in farms. <laughs> Did the orc. 
Is the orc asleep or no? The orc, no, they, he didn't roll high enough to okay. knock the orc out, but he got those two guys. All right, Derek. Hit it. Um, all right, well, I'm going to tell the wolf that it should go uh, start start mauling these guys. Um, the goblins? The goblins. Got it. And uh, and then I'm going to make my way to the edge of the river, right, kind of so towards that tree. If you're not going to attack, you can move twice. Your, my you dash? Can, you've, yeah, you could dash to 60 feet. Okay. Does that mean you get down on your hands, start <laughs> running? <laughs> oh, wow. It's like a full sprint. Yeah, I like that. You guys sure. don't understand how this works. Grimo should throw a ball in the air. And <laughs> um, <laughs> catches it with his mouth. So I'm going yeah, to just move me to up against where that The problem is he's just going to bring it is. back. <laughs> so yeah, how many squares does that mean you can move? You can probably uh, go more 12. than that, actually. You can move 12 squares. So you were like here? Two, three. Yeah, sure. Just waiting in sure. the water. Yeah, uh, yeah. <laughs> guys, hold on. Yeah, ah, the current. It's really cold. Oh. All right, that's what Derek did. All right, so um, wolves. Yeah, move the the blue one towards. Uh, you wanted a commotion, so yeah. he's going to move towards uh, the Defoe that had the keys okay. um, and attack him. He's just going right at his head. Oh, oh Jesus! <laughs> that is a commotion, indeed. See? Good job, Chovolkopupi. <laughs> Got too many characters. Can't wait for the fan art of that one. <laughs> Imagine how many dicks it's gonna have. Was, this, was it six? Seven tails, six seven heads. Seven tails. Seven it's like Naruto. Yeah. I was say it's like udders, but they're all penises. Yeah, they are. Mm. You might have run through there. Just running, they're all slapping you in the face. Uh -huh. hey, look at all the attacking. Okay, yeah, so he like uh, he went right after his, his uh, head, took a huge chunk off of one side Whoa. of it, and he <laughs> fell over dead. Whoa. Oh wow. Nice. Um, so those two, uh, say the, cl the closest to you can run after the other uh, Defoe. <laughs> Both of them? Uh, well, one at a time here. Um. Slow down, slow down. <laughs> Steady. <laughs> it's a very long second. <laughs> uh, so he, he goes after one of his ankles uh, and, and gets it for... Ah, my ankle. My ankle. <laughs> Be the hell. You've gotten it for this much damage. <laughs> All right, yeah, he, so he rips one leg off of that god. Oh, oh, my God. Oh. Um, Avenge me, it, Harry. It falls to the ground with just, you know, it's bleeding everywhere, oh. but it, it has the tiniest bit of life Somewhere force Somewhere Saitae goes. <gasps> yeah. yeah. So the other PTSD, wolf goes Jason. after the goblin uh, next to the campfire. There you go. Oh, God, no, oh, no. bring Saitae back an arm. Yeah, <laughs> just sew this on. <laughs> it's all dead. <laughs> just bring him the leg. It's fine. It also right. has some of the elbows, so it's like two elbows. <laughs> so that wolf actually kind of trips a little bit and uh -oh. skids through the dust. Oh, no. Oh, really dumb, wolf. stupid wolf. Oh, what a fucking idiot. So, uh, That's free help. Yeah, shit. Uh, monster's turn. You got a lot of rolling to do. Dag, got yo. A lot of rolling actually, I guess they're mostly movement. I tell you, he's dead. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the hero. I'm the hero. Well, are, are I'm the all hero. the monsters alerted to that there's something going on? Uh, well, this those is certainly turn. are, and those two Sorry. dropped to sleep right sleep. over here. Um, do these guys, so we'll, any we'll of these guys, play. know their stuff up yet? Um, we'll say we'll this say guy these has guys a spear in his back. We'll say these guys aren't are quite sleep. sure. This guy knows something's going on. These guys, <laughs> something's going on. They not at all, but it's early in the morning. <laughs> we'll say this the collective over here isn't quite sure what's going on yet, um, but the goblins over there certainly do. Um, so Defoe uh, turns to the wolf that just took its leg off, <laughs> my uh, leg, and tries to stab back at it. Come on, Cho. Survive. <laughs> and, and completely misses. Yeah. yeah. Nice one, Cho. So uh, the the goblin with the wolf next to it that kind of uh, tripped up a little bit there on the dirt. Oh, yeah. So he gets he gets stabbed with oh, a no. scimitar oh. uh, right in the side. Oh, uh, <laughs> ooh, just two damage. Oh, that's good. So. He's back in. Uh, <laughs> like all right. At first I was ooh, but now I'm ooh. <laughs> Do you speak dog? No. Yeah. yeah. I'm translating. Um, <laughs> like so you're in the river. Uh, Good luck. The goblin behind the tent runs to the wolf next to the fire, also swinging at him with a scimitar, and uh, actually trips and falls and impales himself. <laughs> oh, oh no. shit. It was his first day. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna turn my life around. It was one week from Goblin retirement. <laughs> it was it was a credit. He rolled a one. Oh boy. Um, he, oh, he just got back from vacation yeah, with Sarah and the kids. Okay, yeah. Okay. Just one more day, honey, and I'll be done. Got his so boat. Yeah, he's he's still around in the world. Shape. Oh, he's dead, uh, or he's no, no, he's not dead. He's but he's, he's okay, got okay. his own scimitar through 
right through his shoulder. Okay. Been there, done that. Yeah. Who has? Right, so what are these? What are these two do? Um, say. Should they just uh, drown the, themselves? I'm trying to remember which ones have attacked. The one closest to Decker, I mean, uh, Derek, runs over to Derek. Oh, wow. I don't know how he saw me, but. All right. You weren't sneaking or anything. You were just dashing, dog man. I guess, but I'd be more distracted by the sound of screaming and blood and guts. <laughs> and demon wolves. I mean, look, that goblin just killed itself, so <laughs> I, I'm, I'm guessing they're not very smart. Does 13 hit your AC? Uh, no. All right. So he's chomping at you. Uh, doesn't break through your armor. Chomping. Oh, the goblin. Um, yeah. He likes to. He likes to bite. Oh, all right. He's stabbing a at you. <laughs> it doesn't get through. So, you're staring at it. so that guy will uh, run over to that uh, wolf. As well. Oh no, it's all getting ganged up on. Oh, uh, he also trips. Oh um, no, into the fire. Oh, nice. oh, geez. Right in there. God, it's special um, teams over here. They barely, <laughs> these wolves barely did anything. <laughs> we just should have just sounded yeah. a horn Made and loud noises. killed themselves. Gobble, gobble, gobble. <laughs> Run around circles. One drowns in one foot of water. One hangs <laughs> itself. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> kicks a chair out. Take this! It's a lasso, but it just goes. Oh! Out. Yeah. <laughs> so this guy turns I love around. These goblins. Uh oh. Uh oh. He's got a spear in his back. Yeah, he's got it, a spear in his back. So it's it gonna catch a lot of wind. Yeah. <laughs> he smacks it on a tree. He, he, he screams. There's there's uh, oh, no. people around. Uh, be aware. What's going on? Something's up. And what do you call Saite, the hero of time? <laughs> he can't really see too well through the trees. Oh. Um, so you know, you guys are hidden in the trees pretty well here. So he starts stumbling around and finds Saite. Oh, oh there it is. Oh, no. Poor Saite. He just brought him his he brought him his stick back. Who could have foreseen yeah. this? <laughs> Not I. <laughs> You're the hero. Yeah. Up on the hill. You got it, babe. Good job. Yeah. So uh, that orc swings at Saite with his great axe. Yeah. Uh, and it definitely hits. Oh, um, oh, my arm. Yeah. <laughs> my other arm. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, for nine damage. Oh, oh Saite. Saite. That's at least a You're hand. the hero, Saite. Yeah. This is your tale. It's the end of it. They'll sing <laughs> songs with you. <laughs> Short songs. <laughs> what would you say is a hand's worth of damage? Uh, Eleven. Okay. Oh, wow. Okay. But uh, yeah, so Saite, 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 yeah, it's just slipping. Saite, Saite no. takes, the, takes a great axe right in the chest. Oh. It falls back. Oh. He's fucked up. Oh, Real oh, bad. Jeez. Way to go, um, guys. He's bleeding uh. profusely. Um, but yeah. that's bad news. <laughs> He's in bad shape. What you gonna do? Hey. Um, <laughs> but yeah, since you guys kind of had this uh, coordinated-ish plan going, yeah. we'll say you got you got kind of the jump on the rest of the monsters here, and they won't get a turn this round. Awesome. Yeah. So uh, Grimo. So I'm gonna move my five space speed or whatever. I'm gonna shoot uh, my short bow at that big guy. The axe in the air. Uh, because my short bow only shoots 80 feet, I'm going to roll for 320 feet, but with disadvantage. So I'm going to roll twice. Is that more than 80 feet? I think it is. I think okay. 80 would be 16 squares, I believe. All right. Uh, so I'm going to have to roll on disadvantage. But I'm going to aim for that big guy with the axe. Nice. So first roll is 18. Ooh. Good roll. And then my second roll is 20. Oh. So wow. plus my attack bonus is 5. So yeah, does that hit, hit him? Yeah. <laughs> what a shot. Um, Over the tent as These well. are loaded, yeah. by the way. Uh, mm -hmm. Rolling crazy well. And then... Oh, uh, uh, no. So I only have four damage on him. Okay. Man, what a shot. And he goes, ow. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you guys feel that? Away. Is there a breeze? <laughs> a little fiber. Four? Yeah, four. Four. But now he'll think that we're attacking from this side. Oh, nice. Smart. Yep. I <laughs> yeah. Oh, okay. Uh, it's going to be... Oh, boy. I'm really far away. Um, I guess, you know what, I'll take a shot uh, at this orc with my crossbow. Uh, how does this work? It says I have a light, a light crossbow plus 20 arrows. And typically, how do, the, how do you roll for crossbows? Oh, uh, how does that work? Let's pull this guy out. Does anyone else have a crossbow with those stats right there? Well, well isn't it, what did you just roll? Please. I just rolled a d20. A d20 no. plus what modifier? Uh, my modifier on the sh on the short bow is five. Because I don't so think I have a modifier for, have... for the crossbow. So I mean, you my, roll... It is a proficiency though. So, so crossbow is a d8. Okay, for, for, your, damage? for your damage, but uh, yeah. What do you know? What the attack bonus would be? Well, it would be whatever. Uh, if he's not proficient in it, it would I just am. be. Oh, you are. Yeah. So it would be uh, plus two, two right. plus either your dexterity or your strength. Okay. So um, what's your dex bonus? <laughs> Zero and strength is minus two. Oh, well, so, zero. Yeah, so go down. So dex. you get plus two on your attack roll. So you roll twenty. Okay. Twelve Ten plus two is twelve. Does that hit? 
It does no, not. Right, that's Sorry. Mm. <laughs> Plank? That's fine. I'll, I'll remember. Just need to do it once. Just, just misses. Okay. So it kind of s- sticks into his shoulder armor, mm-hmm. but it, it's hanging there. Raxan. Oh, it's Raxan's hand? Raxan's hand. Okay. Oh, boy. Well, Saite's got a pretty good handle on what's going on over there. <laughs> so, that dude is fucked up. Yeah. Um, are these things, these things are going to attack? And what is this? That's a man? Yeah, so that was the cloaked figure with the horns that you, oh, shit. you haven't gotten a good look at him. Okay. Mm. The emperor. <laughs> yeah, who yeah. really could be. Oh, He's boy. He's the dark magic. Um, the four spirit was talking to me in my okay. head about. Um, I do a pretty sweet combat roll. Um, <laughs> Where? To which way? I get. I got five squares. I can move up. Right here. To I'm him? Off. No. Oh. Saite's got that. Okay. He's good. <laughs> I want to get behind this tent. Okay. So I want to move up. Five squares. Yeah. One. Or I can move. Yeah. That's five. There. Okay. And I have my javelin, so I guess I should try to take out one of these dumb birds first. Are they hostile? Are these birds hostile? They're like mounts, right? Yeah, yeah. So they're, so they're they'll do whatever they're. I assume they're if, if if provoked, they would probably attack you okay. uh, without command from their. You, you know, know actually, I'll, I'll go for the them. I'll go for the big man. I'm I'm aiming for his uh, his Achilles tendon. I want to knock him down a peg. I'll chop off his foot. Yeah, wear well, it on my head. Uh, the, yeah. I haven't got there Use yet. Use it as a pacifier. Okay. Right. Well, little pants. Uh, uh, stretches it up. <laughs> steps into it. <laughs> Come on. Eleven plus. Uh, for initiative, you get five. I think I get plus your strength. So that was oh, a sixteen. My strength, yeah. Sixteen hits. So yes. roll damage. Okay, and that's my. That's yeah. One damn it. Plus something though, right? Oh, uh, plus my. It's next to the jab one over here. Yeah, yeah. One plus. Uh, piercing. So. Oh wait, I'm sorry. I think I rolled the wrong one. Sorry, I was supposed to roll six. That was. Is this six? No. Nope. Which one? Six, six is, is six. My bad. Sorry, I rolled the wrong one. Sorry, yeah, it was a four. Worked out well. yeah, better. Plus, better. Uh, plus three piercing. Nice. Seven uh, damage. Seven damage. Yay. Which one did you attack? Uh, the big guy man. with the sword. Oh, big man. That's right. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So this, this is uh, now that you're closer. You see, this guy has an eye patch. Right. Um, yeah. This would be the one with the cropped ear. So that's Gron and Grun. Ah, Mary. Creative. Oh, the Gron Grun brothers. <laughs> <laughs> Gron Grun Grun and Grun Gron Grun. I'm gonna run down there and try and help. Saite out and <laughs> Lost Cause Man. Oh, the only dear. good one out of us all. Bludgeon, bludgeon this orc to death. Uh, Bet he's gonna hit Saite. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> Chops off his leg. Two. Oh, oh, no, 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 <laughs> Come up on Marietta's. Uh, so yeah, you just whipped like him. Inside his head. <laughs> two, isn't know. two isn't bad enough to do something horrible. Oh, uh, but God. with with your mace, some you kind of you swing and you hit that spear that's sticking out of his back. Oh it, no! It kind of deflects the shot you were taking oh. at that orc's head. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Saite, hit it. Oh boy. Um, Saite okay. runs. I'm the hero. We never hear from him again. <laughs> just runs out the <laughs> So Saite. Uh, Grabs his other spear. He has he has a couple. Wow, nice. Um, on his back. So grabs his other spear and jabs it at that orc that's right in front of him. Mm-hmm. Oh, spear is for a guy with one hand. <laughs> Where does he keep them? That's what he's got. And a whole lot of heart. Well, half of one. Yeah. <laughs> Can you do the equivalent of losing a hand, but for your heart? <laughs> right, so, so he stabs him right into his chest. Yeah. Um, Get him, Saite. With which hand? Or don't. The, the one hand he's got, which oh. is his left hand. For five damage. Nice. Is it? So it sticks in there real good. I was say, he's taking a pretty good amount of damage now. Yeah, that, that, his back. that work is uh, bleeding profusely from the chest and the back. Um, so both sides. Uh, Decker. Okay, uh, I have a question. I want to cast Charm Person. What, is, what does rolling with advantage mean? Does that mean you, you can, can roll twice okay. and you pick the higher number? That's what I thought. Uh, this says, so I want to Charm Person on the Mysterious Dude in the Cape, or the Hood. It says uh, it has advantage, saving throw of wisdom, but it has advantage if you or your companions are fighting it. Does this count as fighting it since we're engaged? Mm. And I guess it feels... Yeah, yeah, we'll call this a fight. Okay. Uh, so let's see here. I guess I just cast on it and it has to make a wisdom saving throw. Does that mean I roll something? Uh, what, what is... 
I'm sorry, what does Charm Person say? Uh, one action, actually I would have to get closer to it, so I'm gonna move up, but... How close do you need to get? 30 feet, actually I don't think I can get that close this turn. So, maybe this will be for next turn, provided well, nothing okay, happens. Yeah. Technically, you're you're not attacking, so you can double dash, right? I could, yeah. So but you I need can't. to be within 30 feet to attack him, right? Yeah, uh, to, to cast. But you're pretty far away now. What's your What's your run? 35. So it's 7 squares? So 14 yeah. square? You can go 14 squares. I could. Five, and then do six, it next turn. 7, 8, 9, 10. You can no, live can, in, can can live in that tent. Range. You could get close if you yeah. wanted to. It's up to you. Well, it, yeah, but I. But you I wouldn't be able to do anything, through. and then the monsters are going to have a turn before he does. Yeah. So. Well, the, but but you could get what is it? One, two, 14. three, four, five. Sneak six, around in those seven. trees yeah, over stay there. Stay in the trees. One, two, three, four, five, six. No. I'm one of you. No, no, I can get in range <laughs> in two movement turns. I'm just curious how the cast would work, and I don't need to know for this turn because I can't cast it yet. So where do you want to go? Uh let's see here. There's still the invisible guy. I guess so. He can't do any damage though. Yeah. What if you I'll give him a knife? Move there and cast on, the, cast on the orc. I'll just do a cantrip. <laughs> I'll fire bolt him. It's just uh, a yeah, ranged spell attack on hit 1d10. D What's your attack? Man, I'm fucking casting in this game. Uh, spell attack bonus plus 5, so d20 plus 5, I think. Okay. Oh, that's 10. Oh, hits. Oh wow! Okay. Nice. Uh, there we are. Whoa! One damage. <laughs> Fuck, man. Where do you? Which one are you casting on? The that, one that's that right orc. there. He takes a lighter and just the axe yeah. burns his nope. foot. The orc that's right. Oh, oh, that yeah. one. Shit. The one that was next to yeah. these guys, right? So he's taking twelve damage. -ish? Dying uh, as slowly yes. as possible. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Torturously slow. Uh, Derek. All right. I'm gonna. I dodged away from that guy's thing because he still swiped at me. Mm -hmm. Don't know that so I take my two hand axes out and I'm going to recklessly attack him. All right. <laughs> <laughs> like the reckless. So roll 20 for the Gerblin. 17. All right, yeah, you hit. Okay, I get advantage. So you I hit. Can, you can well, roll Maybe again. I get a 20. Yeah, yeah do it. Four. All right. <laughs> Which one um, do you want to use? And so I get to attack twice, right? You have two hand axes? Two hand axes. Yeah, yeah, so roll twice. You would only add your modifier once, and then okay. recklessly attack. What do you get for that? Uh, that that's what that's would the give advantage. me the advantage. Okay. But it means that I'm at disadvantage if he attacks me back. Five. Four. And then add your strength modifier. Uh, so 12 total. All right, yeah. Uh, you end that guy's life. Oof. No, yeah. if you'd like to tell us how you do that with your two axes. Uh, yeah, so he came at me, and I do this, like, swirl move, and while I'm doing it, I pull my axes out, and then one chops him across the chest, and then because he, he comes down, the other one comes right across his neck, chops his head off, cool. spirals into the air. Fucking awesome. So his, oh, his head goes flying? Yeah, his head goes into flying the water. into the air. It lands... It lands in the water and then floats down the stream. <laughs> nice. Winking cool. at the wolves. <laughs> yeah. But it's all shot from his perspective, so it's first person. <laughs> and you don't realize what happened until you see that, that uh, oh. Derek's on the riverside and the guy's Wow. Away. It's dark. <laughs> yeah. That's, that's pretty evil. That's and probably, uh, that's and that's I'm played by most... Clive Owen. Oh, you are? <laughs> <laughs> um, from which movie? All of them. Oh, shit. <laughs> That's the coolest those one. Those BMW shorts? Yeah. Those are pretty good. I love that stuff. Those are great, yeah. All right, it's the wolf's turn? Yeah, yeah so uh, Upe, the the wolf that's in blue right there, will just go after the goblin that's right next to him. It. Mm. Wow, really? Mm. Mm. One of the mm. tails got in the way. Oops, where did my Started chasing go? one of its many tails. <laughs> so it went after the suicidal we'll one? It actually gets advantage because the other wolf is right next to it. There you go. Roll that again. Hits. Ah. It's nice to be a god. <laughs> <laughs> These wolves are so great. How do they get locked up? I'm wondering that. Snuck on them. I ponder to myself as I look over at Saite. Yeah, so yeah, he, uh, Poor guy. The Cho takes a bite out of just the middle of the belly of that goblin that's standing oh, in front of him. Pulls it out and a bunch of stuff just goes spilling yeah. out the does, the, does it loosen up the scimitar that's already inside him? <laughs> <laughs> uh, and kind of just jiggles the stuff in its mouth a lot, get spraying blood wow. up, up, over everybody over there. Is he okay? Oh, <laughs> he's done for. Oh, jeez. Oh, Is he guy. okay? <laughs> so uh, tug, tug, you guys okay? And then he'll use his move, or its move, to come around the other two goblins. Uh, between, there you go. Twix. That was a long way. Um, Twix. <laughs> so the other, the wolf next to that Defoe over there will mm -hmm. go. Defoe has doesn't have a leg, right? Oh yeah. Oh, oh no. man, these oh, goblins. Yeah. Are He's like side but the bottom 
He's yeah, like, he's having trouble with that one. He's, he's, he's snipping at him and can't quite get him. Gosh. But that goblin is uh, pretty mobile and agile. Uh-oh. He lost some weight. Yeah. <laughs> he's, been, uh, <laughs> please, please, please. he's stronger now. Yeah. So this other wolf will take a take a claw at the goblin that's in the fire. It pushes his face back down into the coals. <laughs> his All right. Ball. Yeah. Oh. And in ends his life. Oh with that, gosh. That swipe. Extinguishes. <laughs> like, like the goblin reaching for help, and yeah. the wolf goes slash. Yeah, Why no help you? for you. Does yeah. he move at all? He stays there. Um. Well, if he uh, no, he, he'll he'll stay there until the next turn. Okay. Um, monsters turn. I think the monsters just went. <laughs> oh, brutalizing. Just pulling out entrails. Yeah. All right. They're the heroes. Yeah. <laughs> so this guy turns to his brother. He goes, brother, let me take care of these children. Uh-oh. I will meet you at the spire once I've had my fill of morning blood. <gasps> the guy in the hood over here. Is he talking He goes, about now, him? now. We have no time to delay. These guys. Do, do that. Oh, yeah. Yep. Do it. Hop on their uh, Ishigurans. If only we had a whip. And then. Pick up those things right now. We can, we can in this turn, they make it to about here. Oh, oh Jesus. Man, They're fleeing. I, I knew that guy was important. You should have thrown a javelin at him. I wouldn't have killed him. You don't know that. Yes, yes, I do. You could have um, ended Star Wars before oh, Empire Strikes Back even begins. <laughs> I'm sure that wouldn't fuck with Dan's plans. <laughs> so this orc stands up. Um, I guess he he sees your cool fucking move over there. One, two, three, four. Makes it to there. Gron turns. I guess uh, sees you over there. Also moves. Oh, no. The plan is working. Kind of, yeah. Actually, yeah. It is. Except I wasted a pretty good javelin throw on that fucker. Yeah, well. He'll remember you. Or won't. Um, <laughs> what would you have written on that javelin? So this this orc Property of Raxan. Uh, two four two. Uh, Fantasy uh, Mary. Please return to my dad. <laughs> <laughs> oh. So that orc has his axe, kind of spins from Saite, swinging at uh, Miri, and Miri takes the shot on the shield. Oof, deflects nice. it perfectly. Nice. Like a battle master. <laughs> He's nice. right right on that roll. <laughs> Now's the perfect time to strike back. <laughs> Gotta organize all my string, hold on. All right, so uh, Defoe Wolf uh, goes after the wolf and misses completely. Nice. Um, There's one more And then, okay, there. yeah, the, the Gerblin that's between those two wolves takes a swipe at the big sued. wolf. Uh, show. <laughs> Ooh. And uh, misses completely with oh, the Oh gosh, these goblins! Um, comedy. Yeah, it's, it's it's like a comedy scene over there. Uh, ah. Those those two guys are asleep. Yep. Um, this guy follows his master. Ah. <laughs> what, what kind of sound do they make? <laughs> All right, good. <laughs> I like that last part. That's the inflection. <laughs> chicka, chicka because doo. it's feminine. All right, Grimo. So you hit that guy with the sword that's on the wing thing with your javelin, right? No. Oh, you didn't. Oh, this, okay. This gentleman who's long gone. I would try to hit him in the air, but that's not where our story is taking us. So <laughs> I will again fire it at that guy. Oh, axe man? But uh, I think this time, actually I can move up and try I to get I can throw more. you across that river. No, I think now I should be in range of him. Um, throw me! Yeah. 16 squares. Who are you aiming at? I'm aiming at the, the big, big guy, guy with the axe. So I, or I only rolled eleven. Or I only run. rolled eleven. So yeah, your your crossbow bolt whizzes right past his head. Now it is you're serious. No, oh, fifteen. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I think. I, are you done? No? Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm um, okay. Actually, you know he, actually, what? I, 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 he I, sees the crossbow whiz by and kind of like lips, licks his lips. Oh. Uh, oh he catch it? Good. And he goes, I love the taste of halfling in the morning. Oh, he's coming after you. Oh, he's You're familiar with us. <laughs> 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 Do you know the gyre? Um, all right, so I'm just going to kind of move. I, I'm good here. I'm going to cast Magic Missile. All right, so what it says is, uh, when you cast a spell using a spell slot of second level or higher, which is what I'm doing, the spell creates one more dart for each slot level above first. What does that mean? So you get one more slot level, so you get one more dart, so it'd be four darts four total. Four darts, got it. All right, Do you so, have second level spells? Yeah, yeah that's, that's, what I'm, that's what I'm doing now. Level two. You got a, you got a second level slot at level two? That's no boy. Cool. That's I, a lot I, I, if you did, that's cool. But I don't, that's what I thought. Looks like you did. Never mind. I, I, don't, I, mean, I, don't, I don't have to. I can just cast three. That's fine. Uh, if, you, if you're worried about it, I'll cast three. No, I'm not worried about it. I just didn't know that you would. What are you doing? I dropped my dice. Oh my every god, every time. time. Every oh. time he drops his dice. <laughs> Sorry. Idle hands. When you get a second level thing at the second level? Not necessarily. It's, yeah, it's super not always, complicated. It's not always like that. So it's like, 
Well, that's not... So, Magic Missile is a, a level 1 spell, but you can cast it as a level 2 spell if you have yeah. level 2 slots. Uh, that's, I guess that's why I was asking. Since actually, it's weird. at second level, you don't have a second level spot. I'm sorry, Shattercock. Okay, that's fine. I'll just cast three then. I, could, I swear that's worded differently, but okay. yeah, no, it's really yeah. fucking confusing. Well, okay. so yeah, you have three darts to send wherever you want yep. in the in the area. Seven plus six is thirteen. So who, who are you so, shooting well, the darts at? I guess I'm need to roll this. Four, it. right? Uh, yeah, I'm shooting at these three here. Okay, one at each. Yeah. All right. Um, and then, so yeah, it automatically hits. So you yeah. just roll for damage for each one, if you will. Target deals one d four plus one force damage to its target. Okay. So three, nice. three to that first guy. Yeah, let's hit the first guy. Uh, two. So that's so it's just one d four four plus one force damage to okay, its target. Okay. So yeah. So it's actually. So that was four the first one. Yeah. And, that one, and what the was the second three. roll? The second roll was two nice. plus one is three. And then the, and the next roll is four plus one is five on the bird. <laughs> Whatever that is. Ah! Well, that's what, oh, yeah. He's not riding on it, though. How much was it against him? Five, five to the bird. Five to the bird. <laughs> <laughs> I think it might be under your chair. Still looking over there? <laughs> okay, so. What did he drop? Yeah, you, you connected on all those guys. <laughs> um, none of them are really hurt too badly, but, uh, you know, they each feel the impact. Of course. Get a little burned. Oh, well. I was just something else. <laughs> Maybe camera four. Probably not. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone is looking for dice. <laughs> See a piece of edamame. Yeah. Oh boy. I'll roll that. <laughs> That's oh. a D two. <laughs> Don't worry about it. It's you know he won't be needing it. It's in the thick carpet. I'll just use someone it? else's. It's a red one. It's my D twenty. <laughs> the red one. Most important Here. guy. Yeah. <laughs> oh, do I get a big one? Well, Sweet. that's the one that's most fun to play with. What? I'll drop mine. <laughs> <laughs> this is good. <laughs> You want a big one? No, I don't. I like mine. They've been working for me thus far. All right, you Braxton. can still move. Oh, okay, it is your turn. Oh, good timing. Uh, you you want to move? So these? these. No, uh, no, no. I'm good. Okay. I'm good there. Uh, boar. I guess. Okay, so action surge. I can push myself beyond my normal limits. On your turn. That's like KO can times one. Uh, yeah. So you can take an additional cool action. To start with. Um, okay, so I'm going to use action surge. Okay. So I get. So I get two moves. So two I wanna, actions. Two actions, yeah. Yeah, so I want to use one of my actions to get as close to this guy as possible. So you're over here? Yeah. Fuck Saite, he's, he's got his own problem. <laughs> can I can I just action surge through this tent? Like a, just like a... Wow, just yeah, we'll say, well, I'll That's say you cool. can get all the way over there and make one actual attack. Nice. You're, so you're going to use your dash as one of your, <laughs> as your action surge. Okay, yeah, action surge behind him. And then I want to swing my great axe at the, the at big man. Grun. Okay, the Grun. At Grun. All right. Okay, so roll my giant. That's a my, big die. I don't know who needs to that on the screen. It's bigger, table. which means the numbers don't are roll bigger. That on the screen. Oh, it's not on the screen. Draw. Sorry. Four. There's, There's a roll a four. Yeah, it's fine. That should should be okay, right? Yeah. I mean, it just means it won't scratch. You're dropping heavy. So unfortunately, <laughs> I guess too. through through your dashing action. You got a little too exhausted to swing <laughs> yeah, efficiently. Uh, but I get another one. No, you, no that you, was you your dash. You dash. You dash. Oh, three actions total. Fuck. I guess uh, I can use my the inspiration. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I'll use my inspiration too. Because, cool. God, it takes a long time to get a turn in. I'm trying to make There's the too many people. <laughs> That's fine. All right. right. It's all right. Four nice. times better. Much better. Plus okay. anything? Is that what the initiative? Plus your great axe. No, my great axe, which is, is plus five. Yeah. So there you go. Yeah, yeah it definitely hits. Okay, that, that's plus three slashing. So then damage. Three. That uh, would be with, the, that's actually my twelve. Sorry. Uh, twelve. That's twelve. Well, that's yeah, 12. like twelve. Okay. So give okay, a throw it on here, Dad. <laughs> okay. All right. uh, eight plus three, three. slashing. So that's eleven. Yeah. Nice. Uh, eleven damage to Axe Man. Yeah. It's a grun. Or yeah, Grun. 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 That's Grun. I'm an okay. man. Uh, oh, so do I hit him? Oh, you got him. Oh, fantastic. You got him good. Okay. Uh, so I guess I do like a really cool <laughs> axe move where like, it's almost like uh, cool yeah. yeah. like, a... You look like, 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 like hoop. Davy Jones sure. from the Monkeys. Yeah. <laughs> or like, Pirates of the Caribbean. I mean, the dance is kind of more of the damage, but the axe will be doing the uh, <laughs> okay. uh, right. uh, pain. And... um. I aim for something that will put him in a wheelchair, um, like the spine. Sp spine's too easy. Um, <laughs> so he did last. Oh, you know, what? I'm going for his Achilles heel. I want, okay. I want, I want him on the ground because obviously we need information cool. out of this guy. Um, but I also spit on him a little bit. You know, we have two. Adam's people. Adam's move descriptions are sleep. always really strange <laughs> because he's like, 
I want to hit him in some sort of way that when he goes home, his children will respect him. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, I don't want his family to recognize yeah. him. Yeah. Sometimes mental damage is worth That's way true. more. That's true. Think about it. This All is right. not mental damage. Yeah, I'd say you, you connected on his, his Achilles heel. Nice. Um, he doesn't go down, though. He either. doesn't go down. Yeah. Um, that is one... Badass work. He's so thinking like, like 16 um, damage or more than that, I think. Ow. Uh, all right, Miri. Uh, I got a quick question. Yeah. How does... I'm not going to use it now. I don't think this is the time. How does my reaction work? I have to do that on my turn? Yeah, so like if, if you, you say you would be standing waiting for someone to come around a corner and you say, hey, this, when this guy comes around a corner, I'm going to swing at him or I'm going to cast my magic at him or like... If this guy does this, then I'm going to do this. Okay. It's got to be pretty specific. So I have to anticipate it. Yeah. Kind of. All right. It's just for my fighting style. I can, like, protect somebody. But anyway, just curious. Uh, nice for now, ideas. I'm going to try, and I'm embarrassed, but I'm going to try and pick up my mace and finish this work off nice. right in front of me. Oh, you've still got the mace in your hand. It just kind well, of deflected I know, but it was like, spear. Oh, I got okay, you. I didn't, He's okay. picking himself up. Oh, you're yeah, getting yeah, yourself yeah. together a little bit. And you have Should advantage on this oh, I, in case okay. your first 20 doesn't... Yeah, so you need to roll two ones. 13. All right, roll it again. 13 plus, plus well, you can roll it attack again, right? bonus, right? Yeah. Five. Okay, so I'm that's 18. That's going to hit, again. but yeah, roll again roll to see again, if you can get a crit. I'm proficient with it. 13. Oh, no! <laughs> Mary. That's 13. All right. Plus it. So, so yeah, roll damage. <clears throat> this is a that six. Works. No, you got to... Uh, 1d6 plus, it says plus my strength modifier, which is 3, so nice. eight. Wow. So you end that work if you want to tell us how you do that with your mace. Yeah, so again, I'm a little embarrassed from that last miss, and I kind of <laughs> make up for it, bring it way above my head. Actually, no, I have my shield in one hand, so and I just bring it down right on his oh. forehead. Oh, Ooh, man. Way. Oh, that gets stuck well, in his head. It's also good, too, because oh, you carried his last strike. Oh. It was pretty cool. So you humiliated oh, him. Oh man! So yeah, you kind of, you almost like turtled him. So you, his oh. head kind of. Oh, oh his, neck, his neck broke. Oh, you got him. You monster. <laughs> oh, you're right, Saite. I got you. All right, yeah. You say. Yeah. You kind of saved Saite. Now Saite. the hero Saite gets to <laughs> act. So yeah, Saite pulls the spear out of this orc's back and starts running at these Whoa. guys. Man, he's crazy. I love he's Saite. bleeding Whoa. out. Yeah. He's a little delirious. Hero. Fucking psycho. <laughs> And so he can't attack, that's it, right? Yeah, he, he kind of expended his dash to... <laughs> his do eyes kind of roll back on the back of his head, and he's like, I'm... that's my story. He's gonna get expended. No, so. Daddy needs a new necklace. Mm. Uh, uh, Decker, are those, still, those guys still asleep? Yeah. Nice. How long do they stay asleep for the entire time? It's like a forever? minute. Uh, uh, let's see here. Uh, falls unconscious until the spell ends, sleeper takes damage, or someone uses an action to slap or shake the weaker sleeper awake. Nice. So, forever. Yeah. Or until uh, you until take damage. They pass out from, Let's uh, just never wake them. Yeah. <laughs> Leave their bodies like Rip Van Winkle. <laughs> well, as long as Decker doesn't take damage, we're good. No, we can, as long as they don't take damage. Oh. We can drag them in no, the river. The duration is one minute. Oh, it is? So, oh, okay. it would be ten turns. Oh, okay. Oh, oh yeah, you're right. Turns. Okay. It is. Plants. Uh, <laughs> I can't do it's shit. like Anna. <laughs> Everything's out of range or behind a thing. Okay. All right, cool. I guess I'll just move. move. Little guy, the little invisible guy. <laughs> oh, with a man. Oh, the, little guy, the little guy's gonna do something Gash, great. I... Go, Hollow Man. <laughs> there. Was that? The, would you like to do anything else? You have a. There's nothing I can do. Okay. You, did, um, you dashed, so yeah, you can't. Do I could action. either move and not be in range of anything, or dash and hopefully things are in range next turn. Can I throw Grimo across the river? <sighs> yes. Good. Uh, if if he's like, gonna fight you, like, like, that's not what Grimo wants. But Grimo can't control. <laughs> if if Grimo's like squirming and stuff, you're gonna have to roll at disadvantage. But if he's if he's in for it, uh, I say you rolled at advantage. Grimo, Grimo would have continued to just projectile fire arrows at the bad guys. But if that's what you're gonna do, you there's can nothing. Shoot an arrow as you're flying. <sighs> That'd be pretty cool. But also, if you throw Grimo into the fight, Grimo's a severe disadvantage. He is fastball special. You do whatever you're gonna do though. Well, I, I want Grimo's consent. I, I turn to you Grimo and go, Grimo, you want me to throw you? <laughs> it's going to take you half an hour to get across this river. Uh, <laughs> he's, he's taking a really long time thinking about it. You just got to act whether you're going to act or not. Just do it. Okay, I'm... I'm oh, no, you're going to kill Grimo. You're going to kill Grimo. Gonna I'm kill just going to run across. I'm going to go, fine, and then I got to start trying to make my way across this oh, river. Ah, you should have thrown him. That'd be great television. Well, you didn't want to do it. No, no, no. I, I mean, I can't control what your character does, though. So, uh, crossing the river, you'd have to move at half speed. 
that's why it'd be nice to be thrown or throw. <laughs> All right, I'm throwing Grimo. Yeah, what would your character Smart essentially move. do? I'm throwing Grimo. You should get up closer to him if you're gonna toss oh, him. Grimo, no. This is unbeknownst to Grimo, though. This really happens. So you're like throwing him. Yeah, would like you roll a twenty? I don't like it either, but it's stuff. something I can do if he's gonna do it. I'm really worried that's, about Grimo. That's D &D. Oh boy. Nice good throw. Plus um, strength three. Yeah, uh, that's a successful throw. <laughs> Twenty-one toss. <laughs> do you maybe how, how throw him is... past all the enemies? <laughs> uh, I go. <laughs> I, just, I just say Grimo, get ready, and grab huh? Grimo by the back, and then just yeah. one spin. <laughs> Even though it's still Derek's turn, would you roll a twenty for yeah, me? Yeah, I get to roll. Do you have any bone acrobatics or athletics or? It's a one, but I reroll. I reroll on one because I have lucky. Fucked. Thirteen. Nice. Would you like me to add something to it? You have acrobatics or athletics. Or... I have plus five acrobatics. All right, so really? that's eighteen. This is the perfect plan. Yeah, I like it. You're like, uh, you're yeah, like those little uh, female gymnasts. I love it. Where were you aiming? Your... Where were you aiming to get them? Just it's on close the other to side. the other side of the river. Yeah, we'll do I do the cool thing where I shoot the arrow in the air? Down. <laughs> you got an 18? Yeah. Uh, well, it gives you an arrow shot. That was pretty sweet. Yeah, yeah, it was yeah. pretty cool. So 18 plus 5 oh, yeah. on the arrow. That hits that orc. Cool thing ever! I'm so glad you did this. Oh, dear me. It's, it's, dead. Dead. it's already oh, dead. Dear me. So 4 plus 3 for damage. So, oh, damn. That was awesome. That was a great shot. And I guess I shoot the big guy. Oh, you're going uh, for sure you don't want to hit right, this little guy? I'm going after this guy. I know he's going to try to attack me, but I'm trying to take down that big guy. Grimo's a hero. That's so true. I can't stop right. him. I attack the big guy. Too heroic for this time, for this age. <laughs> what does Grimo say after Grimo gets tossed? This is unexpected. That's like his other catchphrase. This is unexpected. <laughs> what was the original catchphrase? There was That's no original. Rich. Oh, yeah. yeah. That's rich. Oh man, good. Everyone doesn't that say that anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone doesn't say that in the so last episodes. You could still make uh, some more movement if you'd like to. Uh, just movement? Only yeah, movement? Because it looks like, well, you did your action, which we'll call that throw, yeah. and you moved uh, two squares. Yeah. So I mean, you've still got 20 feet of movement. Uh, I go, I go, I go, yes. <laughs> and then I start, I start trying to splash my way into the water. It looks like the scene from Wet Hot American Summer when Dro Joe Latruglio is watching the uh, Ken Marino try and save the kids. <laughs> yes, he did it. He did it. I'm so sorry. move him three squares forward. You're right in the middle there. Dead center. So yeah, water's probably up to uh, you know your your hips yeah. probably. Wait, is it there or there? Man, I hope these wolves come the to my there. rescue. I hope this guy. Yeah, I know. He's nice. like, where are you going? All right. Um, Wolf's turn. Yeah, so uh, Upe goes after that last gerblin that's next to him. This, which one's Upe? The big the blue one. The big one. Yeah. Oh no. Connect. Kill him. Oh, come Kill him. on. Murder him. I want to hear this. Swallows its genitals. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you should be throwing it's the still wolves. still alive though, yeah. <gasps> Wolf toss. Nice. The irony is it swallows it without biting him off first. <laughs> oh, which is just... <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, yeah, so uh... It's so loud. He, he does a simple bite to the neck, tears a little bit out, uh, you know, it's just shooting blood on his uh, on its little sister there. Uh, that gerblin's done. There we go. Oh, wow. That's um, what I wanted to hear. And then Upe uses uh, the rest of its turn to move. It has 50 feet of movement. Oh, boy. So, uh, Which way is it going? It's going to go, it's going to head this way. Nice. Well, what, you have it half across yeah. the water. So probably like right there. So how many was it to the water there? I mean, it was One, 50 two, up to three, here. Four, five, six. Where I moved it to, it was like 50. <laughs> Perfect. So I can count. Right on the cross section. Um, <laughs> so uh, the other wolf goes after him, but he's only got 40 speed. Five. <sighs> 10, 15, 20, 20, 30, 30, 30, 40. Cool. So one less. Yeah, that would be halving it. So we'll yeah. do that. And then uh, the wolf. The epic, <laughs> the the epic, epic battle. battle. Yeah, yeah this is astounding. Through there. Bite, miss. <laughs> Bite, like miss, yeah. trip, miss, Dirt. miss, miss, oh. minus one, miss, oh. miss. Yeah, uh, another, another no, bite I... and a miss. Oh, Damn it! At the most agile uh, goblin in existence. One legged. And he goes, "Fuck you, wolf." <laughs> <laughs> At least that he there. jumps on his glider. A place to talk. Yeah. As his leg bleeds yeah. out. Yeah. Monster's turn. Oh boy. There's not many left. Yeah, thank God. Three. All right. Can and roll guy. for snoring <laughs> from Nick Nolte. I want to know so if we'll say no he goes. Bring me my drugs. Approaches the halfling, oh, which no. he can't wait to have oh, for Grimo dinner. Says, bring it. Uh oh no! Don't bring it, Grimo. His football punts him back. Yeah. Grimo is dead. Thirteen. <laughs> 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 for my AC, yeah. fourteen. Oh, 
Boom! So yeah, he uh, he brings his axe, uh, and Grimo does a little duck move. Um, like I don't quack, know if he's got. Or... I don't know if he's got a phrase to say. <laughs> duck to you. Oh, nice. Nice. Uh, <laughs> not, not like duck oh, you. Yeah, it just you must be the goose because I duck duck. Uh, no, that's not. Grimo just catchphrases just exactly what he's doing at that time. Okay, gotcha. <laughs> Breathing. Sandwich. <laughs> so uh, Gron avoided damage. Uh, jumps over the fire. Let's so make sure he doesn't fuck that. Oh, he's up. trying to no, wake those guys it. up. How the fuck does he know? Wakes these dudes up. You get the it. fuck up, oh, assholes! Shit. Damn, dirty mouths in this land. Well, They're works. Yeah. They're, mm, to them, it's kind works. of a nice thing to say. Oh, okay. It's like gentlemen. <laughs> um, bird thing. And Yay, bird, bird thing. Uh, turns. Where's bird thing? Squash, 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 squash. <laughs> uh, with you know, he's got a huge old. Kind of like a raptor's head, and, and goes after uh, Raxon's arm right there. Oh man! Wow! Bring it! Um, I have plus five. Raxon is Raxon dead. Does terrible. Grimo things is to dead. Yeah. <laughs> Everything ends with Grimo is dead. <laughs> six, six piercing damage. Ooh, uh, that's fine. Yeah, <laughs> that's fine. <laughs> I mean, I got plus five from. Uh, I don't even Mariana, care. So I'm thing. good. That's true. It's it doesn't right. even hurt. I don't give a shit. Oh, Buy me again. I want you to. Yeah. So minus six health. Yeah, minus six. Okay. Grimo, you're up. You know my armor classes? Oh, because it's piercing. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Alright, Grimo, show him you're the hero. We know. Yeah, yeah. Grimo. So Grimo takes out his short sword and he makes a play to stab the orc that's directly in front of him. What's the catchphrase now? Stab! Time, time for a stab. <laughs> oh. I'll take a stab at this. 14. So it's 14 plus 5. Nice. Hits. And then, uh. Hit ya! Damage. <laughs> stab time. Damage. Roll it! Oh, oh, damage. Oh, wow. damage is 9. Woo! Holy shit. That orc's gotta be dead, right? Mm, These almost. are loaded dice. Oh, how? Uh, well, it's because that's the first time this orc has been hit, right? No, he's like he's been the dick beaten and up on. The really? He he basically falls to two knees uh -huh. and he's he's doing a number like he's got birds and lights it's spinning to finish around him his thing, head. Yeah. So I I take it and I stab him in the side and I say, "You didn't duck that, did you?" Goose. Oh. Goose. <laughs> nice. <laughs> is it? You have like another little weapon there? No, just my short sword. I stab him. Bring it out, back into my sheath. Nice. Pretty sweet. Very cool. Yeah, he's he's a pretty cool guy, so. <laughs> no. no. <laughs> All right, yeah, we'll, we'll call this work dead. Really? Oh, nice oh, finishing really? move. Yeah. Whoa. Good stuff. All you gotta do is ask. Unex was that try, was unexpected. I was gonna try and uh, I thought that's what you were trying to do. <laughs> I thought you were doing like a second move of some kind. Oh, no, 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 no. I don't have any oh, bonus what? action. Oh. That was, right, I was so just, this guy comes back to I was just demonstrating what would happen when I stab him. Okay. All right, so I'm gonna move, Just I'm just gonna do dash. It's gonna be 12 squares. One, two, three, four. Oh, there. That's where I'm going. <laughs> Do you need projectiles? Maybe you take it out of it? Uh, no, I'm terrible at shooting, so I'm not going to do that. You got that crossbow, though. Raxon. Yeah, I guess I'm chasing down this guy, and I need, I'm need. i just focusing on this bad boy, so um, I scurry the bird. Just fuck this bird, okay. man. So oh, if, if you leave the bird's proximity, he will get a, an attack on you. Fine, I'll kill the bird. So is OJ and Nick Nolte, are they also orcs? No, they they um the goblins, right? They're kind of escape you by now I guess you're all close enough. They look like they might have been prisoner escapees with the Moondog brothers, part uh, of the prison break. Ah. Uh, they're so human? Um, human or Yeah, yeah, they're both humans. Got it. Okay. Yes, Nick Nolte is a human. Uh, uh, okay, yeah, so Jason I um Hafkin? Man, I, I am just mad at this bird, so I I, I, I just <laughs> oh. pull up my great axe, I'm just going for its neck as fuck this thing. Like the Nazgul. Yeah, that's just what like it's that. like. All right, rolling uh fifteen. Hits. Excellent. Big money. Um, okay. And then roll for damage. Doo -doo -doo. Uh, 12 plus 3 slashing, Ooh, so 15 God. damage. Holy shit. Um, and I, I look at it in its eyes while I do this because I am just pissed off that I lost 1 HP. <laughs> <laughs> How much was it? Well, How much damage? I'm 12. Sorry, 12? It was 12 damage. Yeah. No, well, 12. 12 plus something. It was, it was thir uh, 15 damage, though. <sighs> Holy fuck. That's ridiculous. Is that bird dead yet? <laughs> Almost. What? It's it's bleeding out of every the huge okay. axe wound that it's got God. is just oozing Raxon's blood. Raxon's gonna try to crawl in there. Um, I know. <laughs> Wear it. I, yeah. I, I mean, my, my, by the by the end of this morn, uh, I shall have my throat down Yi's throat. Your throat down its throat. All right. I appreciate it's a, it's that. A, it's I can't wait same. to see that happen. Yeah. <laughs> he shoves his hand inside the axe wound. I want to. <laughs> I want to pull out whatever unborn children are inside of that thing. <laughs> mm -hmm. It lays eggs. So it responds by opening its on mouth shoulders. and going, ah! Like, yeah. like that guy. And then and my eyes widen as I see an entry point. <laughs> oh. yeah. Ugh, gross. Mary, what? Mary's turn. Mary, please. 
Save us. So I'm gonna from who me? Dash. <laughs> That's the only thing I can do. Are still in the woods? Yep. I can move ten squares because I'm 25 feet. Just okay. pulls out another carrot. And I'm basically following Shattercock. So I'm like, I'm with you, Shattercock, and, and I'm trying not to can look you at her ass, but I kind of can't help it. Oh yeah, she checked out my ass. Yeah, you like oh, trip and then you fall. I'm trying not to, but I kind of can't help it. Oh, so you're like your, head, your nose gets in between her butt cheeks. <laughs> no, I'm, not, I'm like, not as fast. I can't. She goes. I'm not. Ooh. Brown nose. No, I'm not as fast. I can't keep up with her quite that much. And that's a good thing. You're behind her that um, time. Yeah. Real quick, the, those guys didn't move in the last monster. Yeah, turn. I was gonna bring that gone? up. They, uh, they're gone. Okay. Yeah, I've uh, assumed. I didn't know if they're they were just watching, watching in the yeah. wings. There's their birds. Oh, just good bird pun. All right, watching I was waiting wings. for somebody to notice. Thank you. Saite's up. Oh boy. Do it, Saite. You're the hero. Get out there. Yeah. Um, all right, he takes a uh, strafing motion and hurls a spear at uh, N- Nick Nolte. Yeah. <laughs> With one arm. It's like virtual over the other one. Yeah. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> it's all about the right stump angles. stump actually has a little nook. So this is my ball. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> cool, yeah. He puts a stump up. <laughs> he is the bow. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> Did he hit him? Uh, he hit him. Yes. I'm just trying to figure Nolte. out. Where Saite wins, wins again. There you go, Saite. <clears throat> He's really, he really does have it all. Yeah, he really Everything does. you could ask for. <laughs> King among men. Yeah. Everything you could ask for. All right, so yeah, that uh, Nick's got a, a spear just right in his belly. How much damage did he take? It took a lot. All right. uh, pretty much half of his life half, is gone. Okay. All right. So uh, I really want to cast this, so I'm going to cast it this turn. And I'm banking on the fact that orcs don't have a lot of wisdom. Uh, but the spell, the die roll, I'm not so sure about. Uh, so it says... Is this you, charm person? Yeah. You attempt to charm humanoid you see within range. It must make a wisdom saving throw and does so with advantage if you or your companions are fighting it. it fails, if it fails the saving throw, it is charmed by you until the spell ends or you, or you and your companions do anything harmful to it. Charm creature regards you as a friendly acquaintance. When the spell ends, a creature knows it was charmed by you. All right. So, so what, what, is your, your spell what is your spell attack there? The Plus five. Def- no, the default one is 13. Plus three? Uh, it's just 13. Okay. Oh, that's the spell save. Um, yeah, so that, okay. this would be a wisdom saving throw against that 13. Oh, I just I just throw a 13 at him. Uh, yeah. Oh, okay. It's just automatic. Damn, I was going to burn a lot um, of, uh, I was going to burn a shitload of uh, inspiration to make oh. this happen, but now it's <laughs> Fuck. So I thought he, I was going to roll so, something. And he's got advantage against it, right? Yeah, he gets to roll twice. Damn it. All right, sorry. Oh. Oh. That's why I wanted to know how it works. Oh, well, whatever. It's not so a fun Don't, don't talk, try and charm the boss, right? Oh, man. What? I... Don't worry. I have nothing I'm else. I have something to do. I'm trying about. to do cool stuff and it Throw never fucking works. I was gonna yeah, say. God damn it. I feel the same way. I should just not just, be here. Fuck. Just distract him with titties. Ah, Charm OJ. Somebody next gets time. launched over a fucking river. Other people get to do backflips. Like, you're, 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 you're like, like fail, fail, fail. fail. <laughs> 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 I know how that feels. If it wasn't a like super high roll, probably would have given it to you. Derek. Um, okay, so I'm gonna run up next to Grimo, this other guy. And I'm gonna go into a rage, burst into a rage, cool. and I'm gonna try and attack him with my fun. hand axes. Do you have like a, a rage quote <laughs> or anything? Uh, uh, I, 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 I go. <laughs> <laughs> oh. that like nice. the pirates game. <laughs> <laughs> oh, as well. well. I have advantage. Oh, good, oh, good, good, good. Better. Ooh, do you add anything Ten to that? Plus Ten plus. Better. Uh, three for my strength and two that's, for my hand. That's axe. what you needed. Fifteen. Um, so I get to roll some damage. My, uh, so this guy is on his knees, dazed. Yeah. Oh, you're gonna finish. <laughs> I just steal this kill from Grilo. Oh, you're gonna finish. Oof. Oh. Six. You got him. Two plus you got three. Him. Punch in his face. You, you yeah. want to describe you how you want the minimal damage? So, you get that so I come up behind and I go into my rage as Grimo's about to put the finishing <laughs> blow. And then I do like a hurdle move over <laughs> with two axes, and I bring it right down into awesome. him, and then rip him to the ground like that. Wow. Wow. Fucking cool. Yeah. So Some of the blood like guy. gets on Grimo's face. <laughs> it's like a nice Eyes wide open. for our relationship. All right, the wolves turn. <laughs> All right. Um, we'll start with the oh the epic battle, the biggest yeah. battle. Ah. Yeah. Ah. Fuck. <laughs> Wait, no, that's a seven. Hold on. Oh. Let's see if seven. This would be the poker face time, Dan, where you go, oh. <laughs> hey, there it is, it's a crit. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> He's dead. Yeah. Oh, his crit. face is you gone. You guys might have to go help him out over there. Ah, fuck it. No, nope. we're, we're not going to do that. Uh, what about these two? All right. Uh, yeah, yeah, we'll say his 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 brother. 
Or runs, sister, excuse me, their sister. Runs sisters. back? Yeah, take, starts heading backwards to try and help out. <laughs> oh, there we go. Hold a waste. <laughs> all right, so uh, Cho uh, Bokupi makes it all the way to OJ. Yes. Ooh, uh, but is exhausted after Aww. that sprint. Aww. Oh, no. Um, and, and, and just what barely misses a, with a, a, a little... I know, but it's OJ. Piece of shit. He always gets away with it. Oh! He's got a point there. Oh, nice <laughs> He's, got He's a in jail currently. <laughs> Adam should do a stand-up routine that's only him making <laughs> OJ jokes. <laughs> There's no jokes you have to you make. You guys hear the one about OJ? You just called it! Was that nice! All, okay. Was that all the wolves? So, yeah, that was all the wolves. <laughs> Alright, that so, monsters. Turn. Monsters. We'll, we'll start with this uh, Fuck cool you, battle bird! <laughs> How is it still moving? Um, I don't know. I'm gonna rip its fucking jaw. <laughs> We knew so that. yeah, it's got its it's got its claw. It's it's going after your uh, the little bit of exposed face you've got. Yep, I'm moment. just smiling. The one claw that's You're still excited attached. about this. Yeah, <laughs> me and the uh, the orc head on top of me are just excited. Right. Like you do whatever you want, man, because it's over. I'm guessing he hits. What, sure. What's your AC? Uh, 17. Oh, plus one actually, so 18. Um, he does nothing. What? Uh, eight damage. Fine, whatever, man. Oh boy, jeez, you, you're taking a lot of damage. It's okay, there. I'm good. It doesn't even feel how it. How much? How much do you have left? I have 11 HP, but I, I saw the potion too, so I'm fine. All right. I'm, so this oh. thing is just dead. <laughs> Defoe Gerblin back in the corner oh, uh, and his wolf friend. Uh, Sorry, it continues. Was epic of fights. No. Two That's disabled things. Yes, again. Missed. Yeah. Like right. goblin and a wolf. So it's a, it's a wolf biting at nothing and a goblin <laughs> just spinning yeah. in circles. They're, they're, with they both have really poor our depth perception. God. <laughs> Two old people fighting. <laughs> there, um, what the, right. So that, yeah, we'll say OJ swings at the wolf that just came up on him. <laughs> Ooh, critical. What? Oh, jeez. Um, OJ. Yeah, I mean, it was pretty much a critical on Nicole, so. <laughs> <laughs> Way! Yeah, 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 another one. Nice. So uh, OJ's got a mace. Double kill. Um, he does thirteen on uh, thirteen damage on, on a god. Yeah. Oof. Guys, we could kill the god too. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> <laughs> Don't tell Raxan that that thing's a god. <laughs> no, He'll try and kill it. I respect that god like I, a man. I respect that wolf. <laughs> this has murdered so many things. <laughs> its head's gonna be on top. <laughs> All right. So uh, Grun. Uh, sees all these assholes back here. Um, what does he? What should he do? He's a rounded motherfucker. Except um, for there's, there's <laughs> this. Oh, Sante. Yeah. has <laughs> 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 got one arm. Yeah. He's bleeding. <laughs> you bring it I'm here. <laughs> yeah. Come on, come on. Oh, oh no. boy, that's cool. that's a good one for Decker though. This oh. should be a cliffhanger. You should have thrown Nick Nolte <laughs> yeah, by Green Mike like survived. survived. The axe comes down. All right, so he swings and hits. Ooh! Um, no, Saite, no. Um, you know, what are you going to do? <laughs> That's Braxton <laughs> off the side. What are you going to do? Braxton <laughs> pulls himself, his concentration out of his own fighting. <laughs> Get him! Yeah. So yeah, he brings his axe down right into Saite's shoulder, oh, um, and Saite crumples to the ground. At least he has that healing potion uh, that he can't use on himself. Which shoulder no, was it? It also shattered, yeah. shattered on the ground. Was it the shoulder that had the arm attached to it? <laughs> no, he's opposite oh. in his battle. No, oh, no, well. no, not that side. <laughs> it's not looking good for him. I know. So They're enough. gonna sing um, songs of him. They'll forget his name. <laughs> so Nick, uh, he'll come out around. Remember Salty? <laughs> that one arm guy? <laughs> Ooh, another crit. Good Whoa! Well, Careful, um, these humans are bad news. So We're gonna just... Uh, rapists and thieves <laughs> with critical hit yeah, abilities. I mean, OJ Simpson well, and Nolte? Uh, uh, <laughs> they're used to murdering. <laughs> <laughs> He's practiced. <laughs> so is that wolf All still right. alive? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, he's, he's doing funny. He, he's he's pretty strong. He's got like ten thousand HP. He's yeah. good. Um, Grimo, so yeah, Grimo. So I'm gonna shoot an arrow at the big guy. Axe man. Axe man. Sorry, I was gonna go off the table. So nineteen, 19. plus five. Damn girl. That's a hit. It hits. And then five plus three. Eight. Wow, these are the like most consistently high rolls that I feel like I've seen, other than Peak's really low one earlier. Oh. <laughs> but then you made up for it. At least it's hot. Yeah, this is Vegas. It's if this good. was it's Vegas, you'd be fun. killing it. It's just on my no loaded dice. Your betting on do the they high do D&D, Vegas? Oh, they should. Yeah, for every crit, you get your money or something. Doubles. I don't know. 
World Series. I'm of just making conversation. How's the big so, orcoon Axeman doing? Um, he's actually still okay. Still you know, all of his okay. wounds are bleeding, but he's, we he's all just need a to get real on fucking badass. Yeah. yeah. All right. Well, then I'm um, gonna. He'll respect you. I'm gonna move up just a little bit here and cast Witch Bolt. Ooh, which on one? that dude? So which cool. one? I'll let <laughs> me cast it and find out how it fire. Oh, oh right, shit! Nice. So then, get? That 19. 19. So that hits. So then, which bolt is a beam of crackling blue? <laughs> it's 19 plus 6, so 25. So there you go. A beam of crackling blue energy lances out toward a creature within range, forming a sustained arc of lightning between you and the target. Uh oh. Make a ranged spell attack against that creature. On a hit, the target takes 1d12 1 yeah, lightning Whatever. damage. Decker's in between in the line this of is, fire. Uh, this is the one I was telling you about. Getting hit would be more interesting. I just keep than casting. Else I've done, so. I keep casting, and it, like so every time <gasps> if I'm connected to him, I just keep hitting. You keep hitting him. Yeah, that's so, cool. So it's 1d12, which is this one. But uh, do I get a miss? Do I get a, sure, I get a good saving throw, throw yeah, of some not? kind? You have, you have to roll 25. Oh, yeah, I know. Yeah. You're, so yeah, your blue lightning goes and hits him. Yeah. Um, and then it's 1d12. Uh, <laughs> of course it is. Of course it's 2. Okay. <laughs> there you go. Ow. Yeah. yeah. I know exactly. Ooh, that was lightning. Did you hit me with Christmas lights? Or? You have the lasso of truth around him. Uh, all right, right. Rexon. The coolest looking thing Again, in the world. It's time to do some I'm finish this bird, bird stuff. In there. All right. <laughs> Let me finish this bird. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's a lizard, right? Lizard bird. Well, I mean, velociraptors were birds. That's true. Birds of prey. Oh. Got him. Okay. Oh, no. So I don't even use my axe. Um, What's he going to use I now? use my hand and just rip. <laughs> I'm just oh, pulling its fucking jaws apart. Don't you have to roll for damage? Doesn't matter. <laughs> oh, yeah, Maybe roll, it does. Roll a four. Yeah, four, four for your yeah. hands, bro. Uh, the four, the four is a triangle. Uh, Tiniest one. I, mean, you add I guess one I should two. use my no, hands. No, you said your hands. Yeah. <laughs> you'll, you'll still get it. Right. Yeah, yeah, I mean, it's it's a d4 plus one is two, and that's okay. the exact life right. that the thing uh, had. Okay, I mean, my that plan it, it really, was... It really is. That would be great if he threw Let's hear about it. Like, yeah, no. Go. So I grab I grab, grab his jaws, I pull him apart, mm -hmm. and then I just shove my right hand down its throat, and I can see the outline of my knuckles. As it drives down to its juggler, and I, I rip its intestines out. Okay, good. And then and then I take the intestines, I yep. wrap it around its neck, okay. and, and then I, I strangle it. Okay. It's already dead. But uh, right. And then I swing it yeah, around my head, okay. <laughs> swinging yep. yippee yippee yippee. Yep. Uh, I am God. I am God. Do you push it into the campfire too. <laughs> Uh, no. It seems a little like overkill, doesn't it? Yeah, I don't. I'm not. I'm not. You're not a monster. I'm not a monster. So like we'll, we'll say your turn ends with this thing spinning. Yeah, well, I'm, I'm perpetually <laughs> I'm been perpetually been spinning right now. This thing is just slinging. Did you want to move everywhere? anywhere? Since uh, you didn't have to move. Yeah, I'll do a little jump. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> uh, shit. I guess I should get back a little bit from prisoners. I don't know. Um. How much can I move? I can just I have time to move. Yeah, yeah, you didn't 30 move feet. at all. So all right, I'll get I'll move squares. over to Decker as uh because we're gonna do a combined attack so That's we can take down this big lightning. dude. Cool. I know. Well, I, I guess Don't the beam's worry, going. It's only two damage. Yeah, I know, but it still goes between them. It, it's like being in a hot tub. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Feels so good. Nice. Uh, Miri's up. Uh, I think I can still only just move. Can you throw anything? No, I don't have any. I mean, I could, Grimo's but I don't have any like things that are meant to be thrown. <laughs> Grimo loves you don't to have be a thrown. spear or a javelin or a uh, bow. Throw oh, your mace. I, mean, I thought you were picking up every weapon that every. <laughs> I did. I didn't died. pick up any things that are meant to be thrown. I could throw like my mace, but it's not meant to be thrown, and I don't no. have dexterity. It you would could, be bad. Do you have a hand uh, axe? I do. You can, you can throw, throw a hand axe. Yeah, but I don't want to throw it. Why do I have to throw it? Oh, you don't have to, but you could. I mean, you, you can move up? up and then throw it and yeah, try well, to. I'm I mean, gonna, I'm gonna move sort of. Where do you want to go? Saitez right now is to, going next help to Raxan <laughs> on his left. You said and as, I, as I move up, I see the trail of blood coming from the bird to him, and I'm like, oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah. And then I see the. Pretty sweet, right, bro? Bird. Yeah. And this is my first look at that wolf god, and I'm like, okay, that thing's fine by itself. So I'm like kind of positioning myself with these guys to finish off the, the dude there. The giant axe man. Yeah. Okay. Gron, Gron. So I moved more than five. I don't. I can't do an attack. Right. I don't think. So okay. I'm good there. I mean, we're we're team. We're right. building. Yeah, I know. This is gonna be sweet. So, Saite. Prison, prison shanks. Saite. Oh, cool. Uh, so when you He's when dead. you <laughs> <laughs> when you fall unconscious, you basically you roll uh, for three yeah. turns in a row. Yeah. Um, if you roll over a ten, it's a save. If you roll under a ten, it's a failure. So three failures, you're dead. Yeah. Three saves and you're alive with a health point. Um, and he just rolled a twenty, so that's two saves. So he's still unconscious, but he's he's doing okay. Wow, got it all. What a lucky guy. <laughs> <laughs> all right, Decker, your turn. I'm doing quite well, quite. 
Uh, all right. I'll throw a fireball at him. <laughs> Saite? <laughs> Don't you pick Put your own spells? Put him out of his misery. Huh? Don't you pick your own spells? There's just no combat spells? I, I had a few. Um, I picked spells that I thought would lead to interesting scenarios. Uh -huh. Like the charm. Every last one got shit on. So if they we're fail. doing really well just hitting things with sharp objects. <laughs> yeah, cool. And fire fantasy, arrows. fantasy, fantasy. Yeah, fantasy. Yeah, I know. If I had known <laughs> how... We could do anything in this world. <laughs> 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 if I had known how any of this campaign went gone, I would have made several very different decisions. That'd but here we idea. are. What? This is your fault, Dan. Decker's, Decker's, Decker's yeah. great. No, this I didn't is mean your fault. He just rolled poorly last time. Did not mean that as a... As a slide against Dan. Yeah, if the charm was two more points, you would have charmed that thing. No, no, again, oh, didn't mean 13. that. 13. Localized what are we doing? specifically to Firebolt? That. Yeah, Firebolt, uh, 13, I guess plus 5. Against Orcman. And how much damage? D10. Nice. Presuming I hit. Yeah, you hit. Okay. Ah, uh, 4. This is what it's like to be a caster, ladies, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> it's just, you roll. Well, now, right? Yes. But later on, you guys are going to have all kinds of cool spells. Miss. We'll be deities. And we're just gonna be stuck here ripping guts out of the birds <laughs> and swinging them around <laughs> our head. Caveman. It, it would definitely will swap. Tossing halflings. <laughs> sure. I know, I know. <laughs> if we just play for nine if more the months. the show doesn't get canceled. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Derek. Uh, I'm going to uh, run up here, and then I'm going to, I guess, throw uh, a hand axe at Nick Nolte. Right on. So roll a 20. And add uh, two in your dex modifier. It's going, it's going, it's going. 10 plus four, it's 14 total. That was it. At, you were supposed to roll a 20? I oh, just you rolled a 20. This that was a not 20. a 20. That was a, that was that a 12. Was a, oh. Yeah. They look very similar. Oh, you're even better. So 19. Yeah, that hits. All right. And, and that was on Nick. Yeah, Nick Nolte. Oh, poor guy. And 1d6. Nice. <gasps> uh, so that's. Six, I got a six, but I'm at a rage, so I get the additional rage damage. Of Which plus is two. two. Yeah. Damn. Nice. So eight. The rage carried through your axe. I was threw it really angrily. <laughs> like you meant it. Like my eyes crossed a little bit right yeah. before it went. <laughs> kind of like me through Grimo. All right, so we'll, we'll start, I think. All right, yeah. Uh, we'll start. Yes! <laughs> we'll start with the, okay. the greatest on, combat uh -huh. that's ever happened. Oh, fuck. Um... Something happened, I hope. You need to just lie to us. Yeah. yeah. yeah I will next time. Um, should next, next time. time. So, and now the other wolf runs up. Uh, oh, there it uh, is. And it has advantage. Oh. oh, and he gets him. Yeah. 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 He got him. The longest there battle in <laughs> wolf history. <laughs> wolf history. They'll, they'll bark tales about this someday. <laughs> <laughs> so, is it dead? Yeah, it's not dead. Oh, no, Jesus Christ. Jeez. <laughs> I know at least was going to say that. <laughs> All right. All right. Now, the, the All right. I feel like they could run away just leave that guy. <laughs> come to this <laughs> room. Right? I mean, what's he going to do? Us? No, he's like... Okay, yeah, so uh, uh, Upe there will we'll take a, a snip at OJ. Let's see. Um... All right, yeah, so uh, he just latches on to the top of... Uh, Nick's head and pulls it, pulls Whoa. it off. Cool. Curls it in the air behind him, lands in the fire. Oh boy, uh, Nick's, Nick's you dead. said? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Cool. I get, oh no, 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 I did say. Did I say yeah, OJ? Yeah, you said OJ. Okay, yeah. All right. So, Woo. Yep. All right. Cool. Um, what's the name of that? Wolf? Why did we do Upe. anything? Upe. I give Upe a thumbs up. <laughs> <laughs> that that just a Love Sorry, your sense of still be slaughter. All right, yeah. it's a monster's Wait. turn. All right. Not many um, left. Yes. Oh no. Uh, He's still alive. Gerblin uh, <laughs> swings at that wolf. Um, no arms cuts left. off his own head. <laughs> <laughs> God. Oh, he's checking. Just lie. Just lie. That's okay. Oh, oh so he, he hits one of those wolves with his scimitar. Yep. Pulls it out and uh, takes a step Dies back. Dies a heart attack. Takes a step back, <laughs> a getting, back. Uh, provoking an attack from both wolves. Nice. Oh, there we go. I like what he's doing. Month. Dead. Oh, yeah! Yeah! I mean, I miss him already, <laughs> but yeah. none of us actually know what's happening. Yeah. Yeah. So far away. God, we'll hear about it later. Yeah. <laughs> you don't get it. We were biting at him, nothing happened. <laughs> so there's Nick Nolte right. and Axeman. He should really be focused on Saite. Well, well, the... Yeah, yeah. Saite's I don't understand. Down. <laughs> Why would he turn his attentions from Saite? <laughs> Saite's unconscious. I know. He can so, get uh, a threat. Nick swings his mace uh, and connects with Upe there. All right. Upe. Um, 
rolled a 20. But he should have stayed in that um, cage. That's the second 20 Nick Nolte's rolled. Yeah, no, no. <laughs> <Those guys. laughs> I'm on fire. <laughs> I wonder if that phrase has ever been uttered before. <laughs> uh, okay, and then uh, Grun over here Critical takes a step Nolte. forward. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Who's this? Decker. That's, oh, Decker. No. Fucking his great axe Fucking down do it. Decker. Finish it. <laughs> <laughs> Decker's like, please. <laughs> Come in and help me. <laughs> Decker's going to have to roll a new character. 15? Oh, yeah, that hits. That hits? Oh, yeah. Um, what is your AC? 12. Oh, okay. That's not bad. Yes, it is. Yeah, so, mine, mine is ten for seven damage. Okay, that's nothing. Yeah, we'll that's get through. We'll get through that's this. Not as bad as I was expecting. All right, is that it? Oh uh, yeah. So that, that was the monster's so turn. So I'm gonna fire an arrow at the big guy. If it hits Saite, there's nothing I can do. <laughs> <laughs> Unfortunate. You're gonna have to roll at disadvantage. So that's, that's a two. Two. Uh oh. Well, so you can do it again. Any, anything would. Yeah, oh, but if it's I roll a one, worse. it's lucky oh, though. Oh yeah. So, oh. so to disadvantage. So okay. does anything happen if I miss that big guy? <laughs> Poor Saite. Uh, no, it, it, it it's right next to Saite. <laughs> bounces off a rock. Yeah. Bounces off his armor. So uh, uh, you know, <laughs> you're actually uh, Grun is swinging his axe uh, at Decker when when you do that, uh, trying to do another attack. Uh, the arrow slings, kind of moves his axe a little bit, and then the arrow digs down into Saite. Oh, um, no. But it's like into his stump, which is made of wood. Oh, um, and he has his arm back. <laughs> <laughs> He's more powerful than ever. He's arrow man. All right, I'm just, I'm just going to cast uh, the lightning on You got your bolt, so 12, man. right? Thank you. Whoa! Jeez, 11. Shit. There you go. That's what I needed. Oh, that's awesome. All right. Raxon, you're up. All right, okay. yeah. Uh, Grun is really starting to bleed profusely. He's, He's got... All of his hair's been burnt off. He's okay. got charred skin. He's in gotcha. pulse of the beam. And just okay, I move. I move behind Grom. Uh, I go down to Saite real quick and whisper in his ear. I was lying. Aww. And then I get behind. Uh, I'm going. For, I'm going for his. Yeah. Going for Grom's neck uh, with my axe. I like calling Grom. I think it's what's his name. Run. Grun. Yeah. Yeah. It doesn't matter. Yeah. So he insults him. He, he insults him before it does. Rolling for my uh, great axe. Uh, three. Four. Ooh. Oh boy. Oh boy. Saite's right there. Um, no inspiration. Damn it. You can use a bonus action to regain hit points equal. No, that's nope. just hit points. Use inspiration. Oh, you don't have inspiration. I already use it. Does anyone want to add Did you one? action surge already? Yeah. yeah. So your, your great axe just, you know, in the middle of combat, everybody's moving around. You just missed them by a couple inches. It right. swings past, digs into the ground. You did this. <laughs> um, you did. Some would say karma. Um, <laughs> Miri? Miri. Time to jump in there, buddy. Yeah. <laughs> All right, I run up there, and again, since I'm short, I'm going to try and hit him somewhere in the leg, cripple him, bring him down as hard as I can. Nice. Blah, blah, blah. Cool. Right. <laughs> blah, blah, blah. <laughs> Please don't miss. 13 nice. plus, plus, I'm proficient with it, attack bonus 5, strength and proficiency, so plus 5, that's 18. You got him. All right, 6 for damage. Maybe 6 plus 3. Plus three strength, so six. All right, so yeah, you killed Grun. Whoa! Oh. I wasn't trying to kill him. Oh, he said okay. specifically to bring him to the ground. Yeah. Okay, so uh, describe in which way you'd like to bring him down. All right, basically I right full force into the knee. That Ooh. knee just bends the wrong Shatters way. Oh. And he crumples, and he's oh. in pain. Oh, and he is oh. no more in terms of a threat. Cool. So yeah, he falls down unconscious. All right. Should we just... No more knee. Should we pick it up there? Well, uh, what about Nick Nolte? Nick Nolte. Uh, he died. Heart attack. <laughs> He's not dead. <laughs> Drug overdose. What is Decker could do something about it? <gasps> How about Nick? Yeah. Is it my turn? Oh, yeah, it is. Oh, yeah, yeah Saitase. Oh, well, yeah. oh, man. I <laughs> oh, that was He's dead. Uh oh. <laughs> Glad I reminded you. <laughs> it's just a throwaway roll for Saitase. <laughs> Decker, what do you want to do? Oh, no, man. Do you have any sort of attack cantrip? Yeah, that's what I've been using. Firebolt. 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 Hit him with that firebolt. All right. 15. How much? 15. Hits. Cool. Does he die? <laughs> For how much? Two, Two damage. <laughs> Two damage? Oh, <laughs> no. He's dead, right? No, he's he died. Not. Oh, oh he's, he's not, not dead. dead. Really got to pee, Dan. All right, I'm going to run over to Nick Nolte. Uh -huh. Here we go. And I'm going to, I'm still in a rage, so I'm going to try and <laughs> you get break. Him. I have my second hand axe. <laughs> got him. I get a roll again, though. See if it quit. <laughs> All right, 12, 12. Um, you rolled two 12s? Yeah. Well, because I had a side advantage. And then... What's I tell you? Three plus two. Um, and then can I use that to pull out my other axe and sure. hit him again? 
Six. All right, he's dead. How do you? Yeah. Do you, want to, you want to do another finishing move described uh, there? Well, that was part of it. So I ran it's up to cool him, then. like lighting a match. And <laughs> <No>. <laughs> I, ran up, I ran up to him and then slashed him at the neck while pulling out my other axe, which is already in him because I threw it. And then I brought that one back down. Wow. And then and then cut him down while staring at Decker. Decker's throwing little fireballs. I'm like hitting the ground. Magic. <laughs> All right, so yeah, you guys uh, whooped up on everybody. All right. uh, probably a good time to stop. Man. Uh, we can pick it up next time. I want to find out what Grun has to say. He'll tell us. Well, tune in he'll next week. <laughs> You'll have to find right. out next time. All right. right on. Cool. Thanks, everybody. Thanks, everybody. So this guy turns to his brother. He goes, brother, let me take care of these children. Uh-oh. I will meet you at the spire once I've had my fill of morning blood. <gasps> the guy in the hood over here. Is he talking about He goes, about now, us? now, we have no time to delay. These guys. Dude, do, do that. Oh, yeah. Yep. Whoop. Hop on there, uh, Ishigurans. If only we had a whip. And then, <laughs> save things right now. We could, we could In this turn, they make it to about here. Oh. Jesus. So, uh, I really want to cast this, so I'm going to cast it this turn. And I'm banking on the fact that orcs don't have a lot of wisdom. All right. So, so what, is your, what cast? is your spell attack there? The plus five. Def, no, the default one is thirteen. Plus three. Uh, it's just thirteen. Okay. Um, oh, that's the spell save. Yeah. So that, this would be a wisdom saving throw against that thirteen. Oh, I just I just throw thirteen at him. Uh, yeah. Oh, okay. It's just automatic. Damn, I was gonna burn a lot mm. of uh, I was gonna burn a shitload of uh, inspiration to make oh. this happen, but now. <laughs> Fuck! I so thought he, I was gonna roll. So and he's got advantage against it, right? Yeah, he gets to roll twice. Damn it! All right, sorry. Oh, that's why I wanted to know how it works. Oh, well, whatever. It's not so a fun don't, to don't to try and charm the boss, right? Oh man, what? I don't you? worry. I have nothing I'm else. I have something to do. I'm trying to do cool stuff and it Throw never fucking works. Out. I was gonna yeah, say. God damn it! I feel the same way. I should just not just, be here. Fuck. Just distract him with titties. Ah, <laughs> yeah. All right, I run up there, and again, since I'm short, I'm gonna try and hit him. Somewhere in the leg, cripple and bring him down as hard as I can. Nice. Blah, blah, blah. Cool. <laughs> blah, blah, blah. <laughs> Please don't miss. 13 nice. plus, plus, I'm proficient with it. Attack bonus 5, strength and proficiency. So plus 5, that's 18. You got him. All right. 6 for damage. And D6 plus 3, plus 3 strength, so 6. All right, so yeah, you killed Grun. Whoa! Oh. I wasn't trying to kill him. Oh, he said okay. specifically to bring him to the ground. Yeah. Okay, so uh, describe in which way you'd like to bring him down. All right, basically I write full force into the knee. That Ooh. knee just bends the wrong Shatters way. Oh. And he crumples, and he's oh. in pain. Oh. And he is no more in terms of a threat. Cool. So yeah, he falls down unconscious. All right. Should we just... No more knee. Should we pick it up there? Well, uh, what about Nick, Nick Nolte? Uh, he died. Heart attack. <laughs> All right. Uh, welcome back to Twits and Crits, everyone. Uh, I guess Funhouse is taking our friend simulator to the next level of fantasy role playing. I don't like <laughs> That's when he interjects the next level. Humor. <laughs> the next level involves stimulation. <laughs> <laughs> Full uh, who wants to let us know or remind us what happened last time? Oh boy! Quickly, because we got a lot to do today. Uh, Derek threw Grimo across a river. That's All right, right, let's do this. Yeah. Grimo nailed a midair shot. Yeah, if Grimo I recall. was just hitting hitting him like we, he wants we met to a wolf hit lord. pussy. Quick, overall recap: we spent most of the time near a river but the moon well, we we planned out a battle that we took we fought the the we found the moon dog brothers they got away though didn't they? Well, one, of them, one of them yeah. one of them got escaped away. with the yeah escaped with one of the brothers oh, with the the emperor palpatine that's right the, the, yeah. hooded, the hooded yeah. figure a horned fellow yeah. but yeah. along the way we managed to free a mythical uh forest spirit the which equilax looks like a lar- yeah the equilax <laughs> which looks like a a large wolf that Despite its all power, still managed to get captured by a handful of goblins. Had a bit of an attitude too. It did. Yeah. It's no. concerning. Yeah. Is Derek attracted to that wolf god? No, no. Derek attra- is attracted to uh, big tittied um, dog male, dog females. Dog females. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Uh, I make sure. Not not other dogs. The dogs have <laughs> six giant boobs or eight giant boobs. Just nipples, teats, mm-hmm. yeah, crusty teats. crusty nipples, teats. <laughs> Nice. All right, so yeah, I think we we, we cut off last time. <laughs> you guys Dan we nailed it. You guys just downed uh, Gr- Grun, yes, uh, one Run. of the Moon Dog Brothers. Yes. Whichever, I, don't, I can't. Uh, remember. I not that. to be confused with what's Grog. the other one's name? Grun, Grun, Grun and Grun, 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 Grun. and Grun. Yeah, okay. right. you guys got Grun. You're He's doing a great job, Dan. Thank you. <laughs> um, your friend Saite uh, fell in battle. Oh um, no! Who? I forgot. Wait, he's dead. 
<laughs> well, he's a, he's unconscious. Oh, God. The, battle ended, right? the battle ended when he was unconscious. He did a couple so saving Someone throws. might want to help he's him. He's the worst. Oh, that's right. What am I going to do? I don't. I didn't keep that piece of paper. Um, <laughs> Not, nobody cares about yeah. Saite. I'm gonna, Not even Dan, <laughs> who created Saite. <laughs> Decker's going to walk up to Saite, lower his shades, push him back up. Turn around. Oh, oh wow. Boy. You should 3D print him an arm. Is that that character <laughs> moment you wanted? <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, everybody, for playing along with us. Karimo uh, runs over to Saite, if you will. Where's Saite? Over there? Wow, this that's is taking a rare run. Time. Time. No. He's rotating. Oh, is that him there? No, no he's, he's the, the big orange cone, cone guy. Oh, he runs over to Saite. He starts looting his pockets. Oh, wow. oh, oh no. no. Uh, I, I move over to Saite and I pee on him a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> why would you do that? He helped us. He's not My dead. family that is honorable. Mostly. Oh, okay, yeah. that's why. What do I find? Shit down his throat. What do I find on Saite's person? Let me dig around. He's got he's got a spear. Oh cool. Uh, he's knife. not dead. <laughs> he's just unconscious. Yeah, he's just unconscious and you're looting him. He's got about 13 silver pieces. Oh awesome. That's wow. pretty good. Uh, he helped us. Do you have any free, pictures you know? of his family? Yeah, he, he okay. actually, it's like a little doll thing. <laughs> that, uh. He's probably got from like a dead daughter or something. Oh, a dead daughter. <laughs> oh, okay. As as Grimo tries to get away with the silver pieces, I grab Grimo by by his pants, huh? and him up, and say, "He's not dead. <laughs> Give it back." Give what back? The stuff that you stole is gold or is silver pieces. He has so little, and you're trying to take it all. I'll split it with you. I'll take half. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> well, he, he also he has a nub. You know, he's only got yeah. one arm. So, so I, yeah. To fix that, I, I get some branches. I put them together, and then I give him a new arm. <laughs> you try to put him <laughs> throwing twigs on a <laughs> unconscious man. I just, well, since he's already cut a little bit, I just sort of jam the stick into oh. his nub, and I go, here's your new arm, buddy. I fixed you. <laughs> so, so have we looted Grun yet? Oh. No, no. Uh, so I, oh, oh. Yeah, you, you guys well, got going pretty else is doing that. Yeah, I'm yeah. going straight for Grun. Okay. I'm going to go check out Grun. I'm going to loot Grun's See, body. See, he's not dead either. He's uh, unconscious. Oh, that's right. He's unconscious. He's unconscious. All right, well, I'll dig through his pockets while he's unconscious. All right. Um, I'm just gonna include all the other shit. You guys are looking around, okay? Okay, yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah I didn't yeah. divide it up by yeah. who's who here. Can I, I want to roll investigation for no reason. All right, do it. What do I see? <clears throat> um, well, here. Six. So, you, <laughs> you are, uh, you're looting through Grun's pockets. Yep. Um, you actually, you find a bracer. He's got a bracer on one arm. Cool. Uh, kind of a cool little thing. Awesome. I don't know if you want to read that. Ooh, bracers of pound. Left arm. One of two. Sweet band. Uh, the left arm of a pair of magical bracers. The creature cool. gains plus one to attack or damage made with melee weapons. That's your specialty there. I know, right? Uh, when fists are pounded with its twin, uh, each person must simultaneously say attack or damage to gain this benefit. Oh, awesome. you get two, so you're like, uh, like <gasps> fusion. Yeah. yeah. Like Saiyans. Well, awesome. yeah, you saw, you saw him and his brother, like, pound. Pound fist oh, before. So his brother has oh, yeah. cool. oh, okay. um, So now we're just murdering these guys to get their cool shit. Yeah. Welcome right. to RPGs. This game. Yeah. Nice. Rexan, Derek, Miriannis, who wants this? What? I'll take some bracers. Who wants it? Just one. It's just one bracer. That's fine. Yeah, it doesn't work now. That's until, fine. Until it doesn't work it. now. No. Maybe we should. You need the other one. Maybe we should see what the other stuff you get. Well, no, I'm gonna hand this out because I can't okay. use it. Okay, okay. So. Um, well, I guess I'll, I'll hold on to your trash for now since you don't want to carry it. He can hold on to your trash. I'll hold on to your trash. You so, right. so, how how good are you looking through Grun? His pockets here, like are I mean, you pretty good. I, I not have, just his pockets. No, like I have every like, fold of yeah, skin. I'm looking at the cargo pants right. right. on. So, so as Shattercut kind of gets down uh, towards his crotchal area, you actually you hit kind of what feels like a metal thing. Oh. Mm. So you you reach down in his pants and you pull out uh, pull out a cock ring. piece. A oh, ring. A cock oh. ring. <laughs> I had a cock ring. Oh, well, right. It, maybe it was around his cock. That's what the bracelet was. It's the ring of canine control. While wearing this ring, you can use an action and expend one charge to cast dominate monster. On a beast that has canine slash wolven ancestry. Well, you don't have ancestry, right? Because you got turned into. Technically, no. Uh, the Technically, ring... I don't have ancestry, but I am wolven. The ring has three charges and regains one d4 expended charges daily at dawn. Sweet. So while we're cool, I will right. definitely wear this. <laughs> Aha! Aha! <laughs> now I can control. Dogs. No, we've already gotten past the phase of the game where we're fighting wolves all the time. Also, it says ancestry, so it's not going to work on me. Uh, Sorry, bro. I don't know about that one. I, I do know about that. I dog ancestor somewhere in there. Nope, I don't. Where'd those dog ears come you know, from? You should just uh, try it three times on him and see what happens. Where'd those yeah. dog ears come do from? It. Try it. Where'd those dog ears come from? They, they came from a spell that happened, okay? It's uh -oh. magic induced. That's what I'm I don't have a wondering. dog parent. All right, so there's, there's a little bit of other shit lying around when you guys are rummaging. Right. Uh, there's a platinum signet ring, which is worth 50 gold. 
Uh, 139 silver pieces, 73 Jeez. gold pieces, wow. uh, six silver goblets worth 15 gold each, uh, a bunch of hammers, a rope net, four wedges of cheese, and two healing potions. Jeez. No one was writing that down. Nope. So I'm gonna have to say it again, or I don't you guys know don't you want eat. the stuff. We're gonna pass it on to the treasures. Gonna... Uh, carry the two, and there we go. We figured it out. Well, should we split up the? <laughs> Should we split up the gold pieces evenly amongst the rest of us? We should split it up based off who contributed to the fight. I should, I think we should split it up evenly. <laughs> I don't think that's fair. You Grim wouldn't. Grimo was wouldn't. taking names out of there. He risked his body across the river, but he'll split it up. I, I do think Decker maybe deserves a greater share though, because you know he's kind of our, kind of our leader now. What the hell are you talking about? No, I don't think so. Well, he's like the coolest guy we got here. That well, is who true. cares? That doesn't mean he gets a larger split. He nearly pissed himself earlier. <laughs> Miri, you're our leader. What should we do? Oh, he's writing it down. <laughs> How many cheeses? <laughs> Four cheese. Okay. Four cheeses. I want half of that. Miri, what should we do with the gold? Gold. Split it evenly. Okay. Aha! Diplomatic. I like that. Wait, when he says pieces. even, he means I get half of his portion, too. Um, Calm down, dog boy. I, I notice that Grimo is trying to brown nose the shit out of Decker, and I am suspicious. Ooh. <laughs> is that what the I'm orc suspicious, too. <laughs> Roll well, the, the for orc suspicion. The <laughs> orchid is also suspicious. <laughs> hey, are you going to do so anything about that? We both look, and we're like, did, did you see that? Is you get... Hang on. Uh, 10, 12. Pull out your abacus. <laughs> so you get 12, 13. Oh. Whatever. 13, 13 cool. gold pieces. Wow. How do well, 12 actually, points. How do we three, split three up the repeating. cheese evenly? <laughs> I say rack. No one answered. Answer. There's four pieces of cheese. There's two healing potions as well. There's four pieces of cheese. How many of us are there? Nope. There's six nope. of us. Nope. I was adding it to mine. So then I take a piece of the cheese 12. and I eat it. There's 12 pieces. And I, so now there's three and then you guys can split up that. <laughs> uh, everybody gets uh, 275 experience. Yeah, but oh, sweet. As well. 23 silver pieces split evenly. Or that's what we each get from 139. There are a lot of numbers getting said aloud. When yeah, do we sorry. level up? Yeah, Good somewhere. question. Not today. Tune in next week. Uh, Pay money for us right, to level so, up. What, yeah, what are you guys doing here? Do what's, what's Dwarkar doing? Your 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 demon guy. <laughs> what's going uh, on there? Well, it's daytime, so he's asleep. Okay, he sleeps yeah, during yeah. the day. Yeah, damn. Cool. All right. <laughs> Trying to catch up. Jeez. I didn't know it's the blood. I didn't know if all the no, blood. No, no, no. The, like, the bloodlust. Bloodlust has been quelled for now. If you notice, we've been murdering a lot. <laughs> a lot of murder. Yeah, it's when there's downtime it starts to get ugly. Um, but I, I do think we should uh, throw Grom, Grog, Grun, <laughs> Grun. Uh, I think we should tie him up on a tree, hang him upside down, so the blood rushes to his head, so he wakes up quicker. I nudge Saite with my foot. Go tie that guy up, Saite. <laughs> he's passed up. Use your new hand. Does anything happen when I nudge him? No, he's he's still like dying. <laughs> oh, so in, unless someone wants to okay, heal him somehow, I give Saite uh, my die. healing potion Don't if he's gonna that. be a bitch about it. Wow. No one's got a power or anything. Put it on his chest and walk away. <laughs> I do, but I'm tired. Wait, so uh, what do we do with the two healing potions? Do those go with Decker again? I'll take one. I'll take them. Give, just give well, no, I don't want to give them to Decker. I'm I'll just, take one. All right, Beer gets one. I've been holding him and nothing bad. I'll happened. do my uh, lay on hands of Saite. I feel bad for him, which gives him five HP. Ooh. Hey, whoa! More fan <laughs> art potential. Spitting <laughs> 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 up teeth. Ah, <laughs> oh, there's a stick in yeah, my yeah. arm. Yeah, sticks himself <laughs> in his new stick on my money. Do you like it? Yeah, he starts. Starts rooting around in like his pockets, looking for his his daughter's oh, no. little doll, and starts starts really kind of freaking out. Sight they, day. They, <laughs> you were out, and uh, before we came up here, we saw them all over you, and oh, it was a travesty, Sight day. We tried to stop them, but mm. we couldn't do nothing yeah, about it. You never had a daughter. <laughs> nice. Oh. <laughs> That'll work. <Sight> day. <laughs> <laughs> do you say that? Yeah. <laughs> oh man. Jeez, poor Sight day. What does he say? <laughs> uh, he, he uh, he's a little woozy. He's coming out from Can't being almost anymore. dead. Um, the shock of his you know most precious possession being gone. His arm. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, his new arm's freaking him out, but he's kind of digging it. Like he's learning to move it. Oh, like, cool. Yeah, his sticks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah good. He's kind of learning how to wield it a little. Good, you got a new arm. You could go tie that guy upside down. <laughs> Use your two arms. Uh, uh, I want to go talk to the dog something. beast thing. Oh, dog. What's its name? Uh, that would be Cho. Cho or Upe, whichever one you wanna. That's the spirit. Yeah, yeah. See, let's see. Wait, the the big, the big one. Because there's three dogs, right? Yeah, there's three, three more there. over there. 
still They're still fighting. <laughs> <laughs> the battle continues. Uh, while that's all happening, I run over here real quick, cut off this goblin's arm, and rip the skin off as a sleeve to give Saite like a nice skin. Ooh, and now it looks oh, like a man. Yeah, it's got some it's, skin on, a, it's on the tree. Oh, the tree, tree yeah. Oh, okay. oh, so yeah, the flesh is rotting. Don't have names, that one, no. But right. was asleep right now. What? No, no, I'm being helpful. You're just freelancing? <laughs> all right. He thinks he's being nice. Yeah. <laughs> um, I help uh, those who are less fortunate. Oh, that's, that's sweet. How did you get in my head? Oh, uh, you know, telepathy. Uh, yeah, yeah, t uh, telepathy. I can speak directly into what the minds of, of lesser creatures. I'm a forest spirit. You're a, fo um, you're a forest but spirit we really that don't got have... captured in a cage that we had to save. Yeah, well, they used a lot of magic and stuff. He's a lot of magic and oh. stuff. There's a man in the hood. What about him? Who is the man in the hood? It, not too sure. It's some sort of tiefling, uh, cre <gasps> uh, magician of some kind. That's me. Wizard. <laughs> oh, um, I can't hear any of this. That's right. Oh yeah. Huh. Yeah. Unless you're. I don't know. You're no, we're having well. an out outside conversation. Oh, it's outside. Okay. Yeah. Wait, is he talking but, with a little dog mouth? That's really adorable. <laughs> dog. dog. It's, a, it's a big dog mouth. Oh, it could, it's like, even cuter. Just like bite the over your head. Yeah, like, yeah. I don't want you going inside my <laughs> head ever again. <laughs> I can't make promises, uh, but we all need to hurry up. Uh, there's no time to waste. Those people you saw run off uh, are off to create dark magics. Oh. Uh, you should stop them, and I need to go and save my brethren. My brothers and sisters, my people are out there, twisted by the dark magic of these people. As you've seen, I think, I can assume you've been killing them and... We saved you, a forest spirit, from a cage. I think you, you give us some sort of reward. <laughs> oh boy. Uh, I, I helped kill all those people for you. He did kill a lot of people. We would have killed them anyway. <laughs> You saved us a little bit of time. We saved you a lot of time because we got oh, you out of that greedy cage. Greedy little man, huh? Oh, here, I, I'm not little. Here, I, I walk up to the dog. What's the dog's name again? Cho. <laughs> Cho? We're calling Cho. The I dog. say, I, I get on one knee, I put my axe down as to uh, give thanks to him. I say, Mighty Cho, thank you for all of your work and your great people for what they have done for this land. Can I ride you? <laughs> I nudge Absolutely I, not. I nudge I hate a bow. <laughs> get down there, you yeah. disrespectful whim. <laughs> so, uh, you, you asked for a reward, young man. Uh, Cho walks up, and uh, you're not wearing sleeves or anything, right? No. So he does a swipe, like, right across uh, the top of your arm here. Ow! You get, you get a couple of claw marks. He goes, uh, here, here's the mark of the Volk. This will do you well in the future. It hurts! Mm. Uh, so, yeah, I, my sisters and I need to get out of here. We need to go save our people. I slap um, it. <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna start a fight with this thing? I slap it. With a god? It goes, scratched he, me, he, and I'm gonna hit it back. He goes, I'll give you that one. Yeah. Uh, Mark of the Dirk. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> and, and then he does- People he, know you're a stupid wolf spirit. <laughs> then he, he, he licks you in the face, slobbers up your Aww. face. Aww, uh, he loves you. T and takes off guys, across the river right. with his little sisters. They ditch off into the river. I'm watching it going, stupid wolf spirit yeah. with my tail's wagging. Yeah. So normally- I'm, I'm crying. <laughs> <laughs> normally, uh, as Decker's usually cool and composed, uh, normally like very uh, resentful of everything going on, but this time, subtle change. He just looks a little confused. Just not sure of what's going on. Something doesn't add up. Decker, what's wrong? Drinks tequila. <laughs> <laughs> I noticed. It does, yeah, it smells. Potions. I noticed you looked a little confused. <laughs> Something's weird here. Are you. He just like reaches out and thumps you in the forehead. Ow! What? Why did you do that? What? I don't understand. I don't either. I wanted to see how you'd react. Oh, okay. Why would you fuck me in the forehead? Are you... Is somebody controlling you? No. Hmm. No one's controlling me. Are you sure? What is wrong with Decker? Why are you Damn. asking that? Decker, pardon me. You are the coolest guy here, but I'm sorry. You cannot treat a lady this way. Yeah, no. Whatever. Tell us your wizarding insight, man. <laughs> <laughs> oh. We should probably rest. I'll... We'll talk about it later. Okay. Yeah, we'll talk about this later. Um, I, I'm now suspicious of Grimo because, more suspicious because of how, how much she was talking Decker up and Decker's acting a little more weird than usual. <laughs> more weird than you? <laughs> well, I'm, I'm fine. I gave, I gave that skin off of his dead thing. <laughs> should we, should we uh, uh, investigate? Yeah, we should. not in Instead of just leaving the the Moondog bro should there? Or do we, yeah, we should do that. that. Should we check any of these tents? Or at least time up or something. Is there we do anything that in there? We kind of check. Okay. That long Is list that all of part shit. of the stuff? Yeah. Okay. We should probably There's some silver, by the way. Yeah, How's that silver going? I gave you all 23 pieces each. If I if I investigate I and roll for it, can I determine <laughs> what direction they are heading in? The, yeah, uh, yeah. the other Moondog brother and... 23, yeah. 
So 16 plus Jesus my... What, what is she doing? Doesn't matter. Yeah, they're, 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 I, like that, I like that sometimes Elise just goes, I'm just gonna... <laughs> All right, 18 <laughs> plus you seven. You know, what are you doing? No, yeah, you, you see them. They went off east. They went off uh, east, northeast. okay. Got it. Nothing else to discern maybe where. Like if I see around the campsite, I don't see anything like Trail. they've left behind, like maps or anything like that. No, no, uh, nothing left behind as far as maps. The the giant lizard bird creatures left a path that you can probably follow most of. Oh, yeah, um, those things. The uh, hmm. Grun there might have some information because okay. uh, he's not dead. You also, you did hear, uh, you know, as those guys ran off last time, you heard them mention something about a spire. Oh. Um, a shire. <laughs> a <Adjusted>. shire. <laughs> Joya? Well, let's let's interrogate we, this fucker and yeah, see what we can wake him up. Who wants to be the interrogator? Raxan, you I, seem adept I mean, at torturing Oh, no, it? I'm a helper now. Are you? Uh, I gave that man an arm. I'm all helped out. That's not what that's not what help is. I mean, well, right now I'm overcome by sadness because I didn't get to ride a dog. So Shattercock, Shattercock, uh, <laughs> as they argue, Shattercock goes over and straddles... Uh, I think you tied him to a tree. Mm. Oh, we did? I, I suggested we did that. Maybe you didn't do it. He, 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 I suggested yeah. it. Shattercock okay, yeah. straddles um, him. Nice. Lowers his uh, his face. Lo very, very slowly, kind of lowers, lowers herself onto him and then pushes her boobs See. up against his face. Mm -hmm. Smothering him. Yeah. And she goes, oh. titty boarding. Hey! Like that really, really sexy. Oh, shit. Yeah, yeah. Is that sexy? Oh, oh hey! Yeah. No fuck, I'm See, Bruce home. is smart because he clarifies what it's supposed to be <laughs> when he says it because it isn't. It's narration. Yeah. And then. Ugh. He wakes up. So he slowly wakes up. He wakes and he wakes up. Goes, up his, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh, my God. We <laughs> 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 love you, Al. And, and he, and Does he, he speak common or, or? Yeah, yeah, he speaks oh. common as well. But he goes, hey. And he goes, ah! Because <laughs> his knee has been caved in. Oh, uh, yeah. So he's in the horrible fucking pain. Poor guy. And he's just, he's he's like into you and all. But uh, <laughs> yeah, he's, yeah, he's, he's, he's in a lot of pain. Well, calm down, Glenn. Everything's fine. We left you alive. So, kill me now. No, no. Okay. Please kill me. Kill. No. Give me give me a weapon, put it in my hand and kill me. Where did your brother go? Where did your brother go? I'm not telling you anything. Uh kill me. <laughs> kill right. me now, please. So I have to do intimidation. For, awesome. Uh, so what I'll, have you been doing this I'll, whole time? I'll roll for it. <laughs> I was <laughs> turning him on. That's yeah, what I was doing. Well, Sex intimidation. This, uh, Derek's on the other side of the tree, urinating. <laughs> he goes, "This is my tree now." <laughs> so wait. <laughs> uh, are you? I pet Derek on the back and say, "Good boy." <laughs> are you? Are you human pissing, or did you put a Hu oh, human you put pissing a with a slightly raised? Just slight. kind of turn yeah. to the side. <laughs> yeah. Hips open just a bit. Also, right. you should probably tell her what she wants to know. All right, I'm rolling for intimidation. Uh, what is that? Nine plus six is fifteen. Cool. Uh, yeah. So that's that's what happened. All right. Did I intimidate him? So he's like, you know what? I changed my mind. Please don't kill me. I'll tell you whatever you want to no. know. No, I have no uh, plan on just, killing you. Just leave me alive and try and maybe help me get out of here. I'll do whatever you want. I can do that. So I'm where'd your brother go? Oh, uh, yeah, uh, Gron. He he went to Ravon Spire uh, with uh, the Tifling, with the Bard. Yeah, we saw that Tifling. Tiefling, I don't know however you say it. Even though Man, I'm, I don't know I'm either. a tiefling. Well, for where you come from, it's probably <laughs> yeah. pronounced yeah. tiefling. Yeah, I pronounce you it took tiefling. The southern You're the southern dialect. Allowed to say that. Regardless, Kron. It's your word now. Who, wa who yes. was that tiefling? Uh, his, his name was Banos. Um, he was actually who we sprung from the prison. You, you guys don't, you don't really know anything, do you? Prison? Yeah, tell, you know, us prison your, break. tell us your story. Yeah. We know that we get paid whether or not we chop your head off right now right. or not. No, I'm, back to peeing. I'm telling you everything you need to know. You don't gotta kill me. That's true. That's true. I just didn't yeah, he was, your uh, tone. He, w he was the, the guy we sprung from prison. The whole prison break, all that mess, it was just a cover to get that guy over to uh, a temple uh, under Ravon Spire. Grimo Rude Fellow of the Gyre here, you've probably heard of me. I'm <laughs> it's not an AA meeting. around these parts. <laughs> <laughs> Look, Gron. What are you going to grun? I don't care. You all, you look the same to me. What are you going to do once you get to that spire? What's the plan? You, you know, I'm not too sure that it's... Banos, he, he was, he's a dark magician of some kind. That's like me! Uh, he's a drummer. So he, he's got musical magic. I, they're doing something evil up there. I don't know. I was, I was paid to get him out. And we were headed home uh, to find our tribe and go to war. So the drumming I was cave. just getting him one place and we were done. Uh, really wasn't expecting... You know, a bunch of losers like you to take us down. Losers? You're tied up? No, not you, baby. Oh, okay. Mm. Well, I'll make sure. Losers? Grimo, <laughs> Grimo looks at him. He doesn't like the way, the familiarity between this this orc and Shattercock. He does not like it one bit. 
So you're still straddling. Oh, absolutely. Oh, yeah. So yeah, raging well. boners starting well, to lift, lift you up. Oh god, that must be rough. Yeah. It's like a seat back. That you oh can boy, yeah. It's like yeah. A yeah. Board no, it, we're good. Uh, not good. So <laughs> is your hymen retractable? Hymen? Are you kidding me? She has no, no hymen. <laughs> I guess there's something like a bone sheath that pops over. Yeah, regrow it. Oh, I could regrow my hymen. Yeah, regenerative abilities. Like the Batmobile from the Tim Burton films. Lay on hands. So I guess. We can either leave you tied up here and alive, we can kill you, or would you like to join our party? I'll come along. It sounds like a great idea. We're gonna idea. have to carry him. He's got a shattered leg. Hey, do you have like a stick? I could crutch. I'm a pretty strong guy. Uh, Raxen, this guy mm. needs a stick. Oh, uh, so I look for something and I go, what about this? I trip, I fall, my axe hits him in the head. Oh, <laughs> oh, no. oh, oh, oh no. no! Which he? Oh, there he goes. Grom. Or oh no. Oh, yeah. He calls him a different name. Every time. <laughs> oh, Grom, no! <laughs> and I go, who was that? <laughs> <laughs> so I guess Grunt is dead then. Yeah. yeah well. Right. Oh well. Take his Whoops. head off so we can bring it back to show that we killed him. Agreed. No, who oh, could I already do that did that. Proof. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's state. already it's already on top of my head. Yeah, I go, Good thinking, Grimo. There you go. <laughs> How did he know what I was thinking? <laughs> yeah. That's it. What else can we I did do it. with this body? <laughs> All right. We, All right. we won. Well, should we? So they said the where the what spire? The spire. The Revon so yeah, spire. spire. Should we oh, follow? I do. I do take. Can you bring out the map again? Yeah. Hang on. Let's check the map. I do take there his. There it is. Uh, Thanks. Yeah. Yeah. You still got to untie it though. Yeah. Can I use his shattered kneecap as one of my shoulder pads? <laughs> oh yeah, that'd be awesome. Cool. It's shattered uh, though. I know. It's like uh, curves picking <laughs> it up. It's gonna be yeah. Thing. It's gonna not be very good. Building yeah, a nest. If can someone can shatter stuff. it, it's gonna have junk all oh, over. Someone can... want to get all those little Sing token you? guys. Yeah. It's gonna smell real bad. Mm-hmm. What you think the orc head? The two orc heads I have now. So should we go back to town? Those are starting to get juicy. Should we go back to town for a rest, or what do you? Well, here's that we were we we said that we would stop by the girls, the witch's place. Now we're going in a different direction. Yeah, that's right. We said we'd we'd go through Elia's crown. Sounds like dark dark magic, dark drumming is kind of a more important deal. Agreed. But we're only here to get the Moon Dog Brothers. Unfortunately, the last one is involved in some kind of satanic bullshit. This or he's just in a company. band. We need to ask for more money. Where's what? uh, where's what's his face? I agree with Decker for the first time. <laughs> I, I thought it, what it stopped say? being he about money, and now it's more about more the, the fate of the world. Yeah, I don't know. It's, it's always about the fate of the world. That's the way these things always Not go. Not the fate of your world. It's just a guy in a robe. Yeah, but it sounds like they're summoning some dark shit. Maybe opening a portal. You know? Or maybe portal. it's just a guy in a robe that these orcs that we beat up, by the way, are uh, trying to hang out with. I don't know. They're right. trying to get paid too. We're trying to get paid. So, so I have a question for the DM. If we go to if we go to Revan's Fire or Ulysses Crown, is there, can we do a long rest? Uh, you can place? do a lot. Like you could just be like camping overnight. Do a long yeah, rest. That'll be a long recharge. Sure. All right. And sleep. well, so we have to well, we have to decide where we're going. Yeah, are we going to the witch? Or are we going to Revan's Fire? We've got like Man. one episode oh, yes, Mary, left. He's so. got his face buried in the map. <laughs> My well, map's not updated. It, it's up. <laughs> <laughs> so I, I guess it's I'm up to our, 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 uh, our brave leader. Do we squander the whole season by fighting a witch, or do we squander the whole season? <laughs> <laughs> of right. The time of the world. Passage. Uh -huh. Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I want to find and help help the girls. We have no idea if they're. At the witches, no one knows where they are, right? Is that, am I <laughs> right. correct? Yes. So it is we, should, we should keep our eyes out for them as we go to the spire. So that means follow we the money. Fast. <laughs> keep, 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 Look, keep, 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 keep. Uh, Grimo oh. says to himself in, in Halfling, I can't believe I'm going to say this. I love my sisters so much. If we don't go stop the Moondog Brothers, then it won't matter whether we save those girls or not, because the whole world will be destroyed. And we won't get paid. <laughs> Who's gonna pay us for this? What are you talking about? That's what the army's paying yeah, us for, is to get the Moondog Moon Brothers. Dog that was the whole, I mean... Awesome. So Grimo yeah, votes... Yeah, maybe they're not paying you for this. Grimo votes Maybe we're just doing this out of the kindness of our heart. Yeah, that's it. I also wait, forgot what my wait, letter wait, said. Yeah. Ron, Ron Spire is my vote. Most of y'all are getting paid. <laughs> that note. <laughs> it does right, to us. I'm with Grimo, Ravon Spire! So let's head to Ravon Spire. Does that mean we're losing what's his what's his gas? Well, what about Mir Miri's? Miri's got to tell us whether or not we're doing that. He's well, our leader. There's what? another opinion out did. here too. If we if we if we speed run listening. the Spire thing, maybe we can, <laughs> we can get to the witch. <laughs> yeah, we swing around, grab him on the way back. We can make it. We can make some bonus content, some DLC, <laughs> if you will. <laughs> no, really, was it? For this. Maybe was it last episode? Would they? They're at the witches, or the yeah, witch knows there. where they are. They're still there. They'll be there. The when girls. Iliad's crown is where we were gonna go. They said that's the them. only lead they had, though. 
Yeah, no one really knew anything about it. Right. They just okay, said it's a scary witch. It's really some yeah. vague clues to a, to right. a quest. Most abductions, no first 48 hours. Right otherwise, yeah, they're right. gone. It's a cold case. That's yeah, what I thought. So. <laughs> so okay. I said, do it. I said, since, <laughs> so. I said, since nobody really knows where they are, we should. I want to find them as much as anyone else. Let's just keep our eyes out for them and get that other moon dog. Perfect. My eyes oh, perfect. are open. <laughs> Swing around, grab them on the roll. way back. All right, so, so, so we don't even have girls. to stop. We'll oh, six. Mm. I'm gonna move. look for little yeah. girls. Maybe you're 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 still Ten. in the camp. I look behind the bush. I'm looking for children. Oh, yeah. okay. I, didn't, yeah. I didn't see I didn't the girls. girls. Oh, oh, 14, 14, 14 plus one. Fourteen. Oh, yeah. little girls. Oh, did we save them? Oh wait. Did we, we save them? Oh, wait, wait. What'd you roll? I thought we were all just no. rolling and looking no, for the didn't. little girls as we're going through the countryside. Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> no, nope, that's wrong. So have you guys left the camp? Uh, yeah, yeah. Grimo's taken off. All right. Well, before you before you leave, like Saite, you know, he's pretty much dead there. That's right. You guys keep forgetting about him. You're still here. I healed him. I gave him five HP. That's enough to give. And a new arm <laughs> on your own cripple. <laughs> kind Mr. O'Probbles, thank you so much for the healing. Um, he didn't know. <laughs> just take I, a I long this, rest. We'll see you later. Good, good place for us to part ways. I, I helped you all out uh, with the fight. I think Primo's I should probably go home and walking away. rest up. Oh, no, Saite, thank you. You were crucial to this battle. We wish ya the best. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah Grimo's already, he's stopped mid Saite's speech. He's taking he's off gone. after the footprints. So, so Saite reaches, one thing that you didn't find, I don't know how you didn't find this when you were rummaging around on his person, pulls out a couple of cigars and hands them to Mary and, and goes, that, I know how you, you might want these. <laughs> <laughs> you thought it was something All else. All right, thank you. The good thing about cigars is Just, you'll never know. They smell bad anyway. But anyway, okay. That's the character um, I like, <laughs> like Decker's sense what's, of humor. What's in these, Saite? That's fine. Never mind. Oh, Never they're mind. just regular cigars. Some uh, wacky tobacco. Miriam. Good trading material, lit. good celebration material. Are they Nothing good? tricky here. Or what's what's the uh, fantasy on. version? I'll Here's trust my you. question to the party. Do you think Saite trusts us? No. We should kill then him. we shouldn't trust him. What? He, yes, he does. He, he totally trusts us. He just gave us his ass cigars. He's no. wearing the skin of a goblin. That was his fault. Wow. On a branch that's been crammed that into was his all arm. His fault. I know. You keep saying fault. <laughs> As in not favor. All right, well, whatever. Saute, bye. Bye bye. <laughs> so as he's walking away, well. his little stick arms yeah. getting stuck on trees uh. and the brush and stuff. Uh. Do we start throwing rocks at him? <laughs> <laughs> you can. Boo. Who's that loser? Roll this in. You should roll this in. Hit him with a rock. Yeah, you try to hit him with a rock. Yeah, you, you <laughs> <laughs> try to hit him with a rock. Where are the Bye bye. He trips and falls off a cliff. Keep throwing rocks at him. Oh God! His wounds infected from the sticks. <laughs> yeah. Oh jeez. Derek finds a way to pee on him off the cliff. <laughs> You're mine now. <laughs> I own you. How far does it look there from that camp to uh, that to far. over here? Oh, like five minutes. <laughs> five minutes. It's really yeah. not that far. Well, we have to well, go over a mountain. We gotta go to the Jim Jammy Mountains or whatever. These what did it? It took us a day to go from the village to here. Well, there's a little Jim scale down. right here. Most, yeah. So what? Twenty miles. Tarl? 25 Kilometers. miles? 25. Death Looks roll. like 25. I don't know how to read that upside down. Miles. 25. Sorry. All right. No, that's two days. It's going to take you guys two days to get oh, there. Two days. All right. Okay. So and we rest. We long rest eight. in between. Yeah. You want to. Yeah. We should set up camp. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So we're um, like. We'll say the, the, the first day passes, you guys. Uh, you're hiking along. Nothing singing really our, going on. Singing our song. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Do you, do you have a song to sing? Shattercock. <laughs> <laughs> Through the muffy mountains and the whispering of queeps, Shattered are the best friends I've ever seen. <laughs> uh, Everybody else knows Encore. it. Oh, yeah. well, oh no, the, well, I only know the song The Legend of Saite. Uh, <laughs> for he was a man with one arm and now he has two. Saite! Saite! That's the only song. Oh man. Well, anyways, we, we have song. a good time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We, we are good friends. Uh, does except Decker, for Decker open his laptop to Grimo at all? He's just or maybe I, I, I go. We're walking along, and I got my pack. I go, Hey, Decker, uh, oh, yeah. you got anything else in that laptop? Oh uh, yeah, the battery's a little low right now. Uh, that's that's okay What's though. What's a battery? Yeah, so about that. Um, AB conversation, see yourself out, Decker. What you got on that laptop? Uh well, we'll look at that in a second. Um, I'm just curious. So, you pretty much feel like you're in control of yourself, right? What do you mean? Yeah. Have you ever, uh, you played a game, right? Like a board game? 
Oh, I play cards with you. Okay, Remember, yeah. I beat you real bad. What was that game yeah. called? Flabbity Gooks. I mean, I didn't, I didn't know how to play or anything, so you kind of took advantage of me, so it doesn't count as a loss, but whatever. Um, so, uh, so, but yeah, when, when you're playing the cards, the cards are just there, right? They're just, they just serve their purpose, and, and they go. But you're the player, right? Uh, yeah. Yeah, uh, I'm kind of used to that. I thought you guys were, like, cards, but you're not. You seem to be, like, people, which is weird. I don't know, this is, this is oh, have you ever heard of a place called o Ohio? Uh, Ohio, is no. that near the Jaya? Are you my friend Swibbledy Dick's kid? <laughs> Swibbledy Dick's? <laughs> you, you my, my uncle Swibbledy Dick's kid? No. He, is this? I don't know. Fell off the roof at a young age, got one big foot. <laughs> <laughs> Always smells weird. <laughs> Not bad, just weird. Uh, no, I have no idea who you're talking about. Uh, so... There's, there's a certain thing that I do a lot. Uh, I play games. Um, Cause and, you're a cool guy. Yeah, well, yeah, yeah. Uh, and I, I thought I was in one right now. So, I was, I was doing my thing, and then there was a thunderstorm outside. Right, heard this blinding flash, and then I woke up here, and this place seemed to be exactly like all of the games that I play. What do you mean? You were just asleep and then you woke up? Uh, sort of. I guess that's one way to put it. I thought the same rules applied, too. Um, and that... So, let me put it this way, alright? We go into town. There's a lot of people all around. But they don't say anything. They don't seem like they're doing much, either. They're just kind of walking around and not doing anything. There's, like, people in this world that just well, don't do much. What else would they be doing? Yeah, right? Uh, they're just there to kind of fill everything out. Uh, what? I don't understand. This is the people that live in their lives. They're just doing the thing. Yeah. Kind of like going into battle with someone. And them not contributing at all. It's like they don't do much. Like they're just there, taking up space. Are you still running this? <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm walking two steps ahead of them, and I'm listening. <laughs> list, my ears perked, so I'm listening to the whole thing, and I say things over my shoulder. Well, did you nothing. forget about that spell he did on you? What? <laughs> no, I remember the spell. Okay. You have to wait for the right opportunity. All right. If you don't like it here, why don't you just go go back to Ohio? Yeah, I can't. So, uh, and I kind of like shoot a look at Derek, and then turn back. So that's kind of the problem, is I thought all you guys were like the people in the towns that just walk around and pretty much don't do anything. Which is fine, because they're not people. You can do whatever you want to them. You know, like, come on, let's be honest. You guys were fucking with Saite pretty hard. Well, yeah, he's not. Saite was a big loser. That's yeah. Why. yeah, I mean, they're all big losers. <laughs> let's put it that I thought you guys were all Saites, and it seems like you're not Saites. I don't know, you're, you're behaving in ways that aren't very Saite-like. I'm trying to explain this. It's pretty complicated. I see a bush that looks like Saite and I throw a rock at it. <laughs> <laughs> I thought he was back. <laughs> Boo. Deca, I, I, I don't really understand what you're trying to say here. Well, yeah. We're just your buddies, your adventurers. What, what's the last dream you had? Uh, uh, no comment. Yeah, sure. Grimo, I think I remember what it was. Oh, please. <laughs> Weren't you dreaming about a really hot tiefling? Well... I like, kept losing her clothes? Uh, she may sleep in the nude. <laughs> that's all I say. <laughs> yeah, sure, that's it. Smirk. <laughs> Mouth agape, he's going... Uh, <laughs> I did it. He's just keep walking drooly all <laughs> bad. <laughs> well, do you, ever, do you ever feel like you figure out the rules of your dreams? Or that... Do you ever regret anything you've done in a dream? Oh, I've regretted some things I wake up to, and then Grimo's got clean, clean as one bed sheet. <laughs> oh, I understand. Do you ever understand. feel like you're stuck in second gear? <laughs> <laughs> like it hasn't been your day? Maybe your month. You forgot week. Week. <laughs> or even your year. <laughs> With this lightning, was it like rain? <laughs> yeah, it was rain, it was lightning. So, I guess let me put What is lightning? <laughs> <laughs> I was basically playing a game of cards with other people, and then there was like this flash, and then I woke up inside the card game. Does that make sense? Wait! I think I figured it out. You're inside the game! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think so. So except you were playing at something, you were a player, but now... No, I still, still am. But no, this is real life! It's not I'm though, real. So, well, hold Grandma's on. Grandma's real! I think I figured it out. Okay. He looks stupid. Yeah. And he's crazy. Just like Raxan. Alright. Yeah. Uh, so that means that out of this party of six, a third of us are crazy, a third of us are horny. Yeah. And I'm not getting paid nearly enough for this, Mary. <laughs> <laughs> 
Does this have something to do with your deployable shield? Uh, a little bit. <laughs> well, <laughs> nice. so on that nice. note, I'll sit down, open up my deployable shield. I'll tap a little bit. I'll cast prestidigitation, which I love saying. Um, do you need me to roll for it or just go? No, just go. All right, I'll make a big glowing set of ASCII boobs in front of the party. Ooh. And then I'll just like, see, look, it's this. You say this is real, but I can change what happens from this thing. So it's like me. It looks like me. <laughs> yeah, I, I know. Uh, I'm kind of a, I'm talented in that way. Uh, what I'm saying is, I shouldn't be able to do this if this were real. But you're a wizard. You're I, a wizard. And this is real. We're all real. I guess I'm still figuring that out. I'll be there for you. <laughs> is what I say. I love that show. Sure. It just started. <laughs> and then I put my arm around Decker and go, it's okay. My grandpa also had castle madness. <laughs> castle madness. He had the donkey brains, and we fixed them real good. Do you want me to fix you? A little a little decaying chunk of orc falls off a head and lands on my shoulder. Yeah. Just go, oh. Decker, now that we're on the subject, I mean to ask you, how do I get myself one of them laptops? Yeah, they don't... Just brush the entrails off. They, they're not here. They're not here. I haven't found any. Oh, so you mean then we go to the next village, maybe we go back to Jayan, I pick one up? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, sure. I'll close my laptop. Yeah, that'll work. We'll do that. Uh, yeah, so I'm s still figuring things out. This is weird. It's real. Sure. Don't, don't believe that. But it's not fake. It's somewhere in between. So... Well, let's put it this way. If you were playing a game, would you want to win? Yeah. Then start playing to win. I have been. Doesn't seem like it. I won combat without doing a thing. What's the, what's winning to you? Fighting, earning it. Sure. I got paid, so. Not <laughs> yet. I don't know, man. Stealing money off of a half-dead orc is not getting paid. Yes, it is. Taking a contract, completing your mission, that's getting paid. Miri? What? Sorry. <laughs> I'm just sort of tuning them all out of this <laughs> um, I'm standing by a wild horse whose legs are ready to kick you in the back of the head and go, if you want to fix your castle madness, this will help. <laughs> <laughs> you just found a horse? <laughs> There's wild horses. I found a horse! <laughs> I, I don't know, it's, it's a mule creature of some sort. <laughs> so you guys are going up and down mountains, over water, through trees, whatever. It's uh, nighttime, so ready for a rest, I suppose. Sweet magic. Um, Here, I'm gonna need help my pants! Oh, coming! Come on. This is so tight. <laughs> Oh boy. There's so much gas built up and peeled off. So Grimo <laughs> goes into Shattercock's tent to help her with her back pants. Hold still! Oh, oh, hold on, hold on a second, hold on! It's really wet back there! Oh, God, give me uh, the towel! Oh, here, here you go! Oh, there goes my top! Oh, no, we don't even discuss the pants! <laughs> We've already done this bit. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Grimo comes out of the tent. He's he's helped Shattercock. His his hands are like <gasps> red and raw. Oh, uh, oh he, raw. That sounds oh. good. He he lies yeah. down next to next to Decker. Tiefling skin, man. Hey, hey, Decker. Yeah. In this uh this fake uh world that you're in, have you ever considered maybe uh, finding somebody that was like a son to you? <laughs> I'm still trying to figure out if I'm alive or not. Oh, I see. Yeah, that hasn't crossed my mind. Also, I'm... I'm like 22. <laughs> <laughs> I see. Well, sweet dreams, sweet dreams. And Grimo goes to sleep. Yeah, Alright, so yeah, you guys, you guys are sitting around the fire, uh, resting, starting to drift off. Uh, you, hear, you hear birds filling the skies. Uh, mm. The winds start to pick up and blow the trees around, kind of in, a, in an even rhythm. Can I roll um, Arcana? to see if I can figure out what that is, or what that means. Uh, you could just hold on like five seconds. I'll hold on five seconds. <laughs> Dude, this, this campaign moves so fast. <laughs> if I don't put a flag in the ground early, I miss so many opportunities. Um, so something odd kind of happens in your periphery. Uh, it takes you a minute to realize what's going on. You may maybe think you're drifting off to sleep for a second. Uh, cool. Whoa. Small house with giant raven wings. Bird legs Whoa. drops from the skies and kind of lands in the trees nearby. Birdhouse. Uh, <laughs> there's a birdhouse over there. <laughs> I don't want to so, alarm anyone. Do you guys remember all that talking you did about how real all this stuff was? Yeah, can it's I pretty, be, pretty real to me. The house. Can I be oh, magic out in front? I'm smoking one of Saite cigars and I just kind of look at it. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, it is working. <laughs> 
So an old, withered, wrinkled woman steps out. She starts puttering around the little oh, house, picking up fuck. sticks for a fire. Mm -hmm. uh, she gathers up a little chicken that was tied uh, to a string to the house, flips it around, like snaps its neck, goes and pits, picks up an axe and starts chopping, trying to take its head off. Ah. Um, yeah, so she's she's kind of puttering around, I ignoring you guys completely. Okay. Um, I'm unzipping my pants as I watch this. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> Which part specifically has the chicken killing? Mm -hmm. Which part of your pants is being unzipped? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Two chickens getting choked tonight. They're taking off the leg yeah, parts so they turn them into shorts. Yeah, I gotta like untie parts of it. Uh, no, I was getting ready for bed as I'm watching it, so I'm all confused. Uh, I was sharpening my, my like always. sword, and then I kind of stop and stare and look at everyone else, see what their reaction is to the house that just floated down to us. Uh, does anybody else see the bird house? Yeah. And the old woman? And there's an old woman that just killed some birds. Yep. Yeah. The dead yeah. chickens. Yeah. yeah. Not impressed. I'm like in my laptop <laughs> tapping away and like I'm trying to figure out what's going on here. Um, can I roll now? Sure. All right. I'm just investigation or can like whatever. plucking feathers off this chicken. Uh, seven. Um, but 13? 12. 12. You've 12. heard of witches and wizards and stuff. Clearly you're, you're one of them. You're tapped into this magic source. The, uh, the lands of Gael and the surrounding areas are actually known for having lots of witches. Several of them have little houses with bird wings or, or little oh. little cottages with other animal features on them. Uh, not all of them are bad. Some of them are evil. Some of them are just kind of neutral. Uh, but they are magical creatures for sure. I'll uh, tap, 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 tap. Hit, it, hit, a, hit a button very emphatically. Like, I think that's a witch. <laughs> Uh, she goes, good witch! Oh, a good witch, thank God. She keeps plucking the chicken. Although witches do kind of... Also, she does notice us, though. No, she heard heard him say that. Yeah. Oh, okay. Right. She's uh, just not paying you mind. She knows you. you're there. She's yeah. just not really like... Yeah. Well, there are witches around these parts, but... Well, it's weird that she would just kind of choose here to chill out. You had this. Do you think she knows anything about them two girls, Mason? Maybe. I should probably ask her about the demonic magic. She seems harmless enough. You want to ask her, or do you want me to ask her? You, you ask her, man. She's too beautiful for me to talk to her. <laughs> okay. I put my cigar down and still kind of give it a suspicious look. And then I I uh, kind of get up and walk over towards her. You, you could bring that with you. No. I leave it there. Okay. I see. Uh, well, that, that was her saying that, though. Oh, I see. She's like, I enjoy that an occasional smoke. Oh, oh. Oh, well, here. Have, have this other one that I have. And I... I Run back and light it on the fire real quick, then give her a fresh one. one of our cigars? Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Yeah, she's... <laughs> Thank you, little man. Takes it one drag. <laughs> sure. <laughs> uh, and I asked, hey, you wouldn't happen to know anything about uh, some missing girls from Jayanne, would you? Maybe one of your hmm. colleagues or something would know something <laughs> that you've heard from? Uh, I have a bunch of sisters. Uh, you know, kidnapping children does sound like what one of them would do. Uh, she's kind of a nasty little bitch. Really have no idea where she is, but she's been known to take kids. What? Hmm. What's her Could name? You, yeah. Where she? Where does oh she boy. live? Uh, she goes by lots of names. Who knows what people call her these days? What uh, do you call her? She she has a little uh, old tower cave thing. It kind of ports around. I don't know. Uh, last last time I heard, she was up in these hills though. Uh, quick question: Does your house fly? Oh yeah. You mind giving us a ride? Oh no, no, not a no way. Why not? No, no. What no if uh, our little friend here makes sweet love to you? Uh, I mean, if you got any, <laughs> <laughs> I guess I could step up for the cause. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, do you have anything to trade or or, or pay for the ride? We do. What, we have a laptop. What, yeah. Oh. What what is that? Magic. I'm not, not sure. yours. Ooh, I like uh, magic. Yeah, it's magic. Could it be mine? No. Maybe. Absolutely not. I don't know. I'm digging this cigar, though. Oh. She just starts puffing. She actually turns away from Miri and keeps about doing her business. Oh. So we need something to give her gold? You should find that little that little bitch, though. If you do, you know, there might be a reward for you. What brings you to these parts of the woods? Uh, I mean, uh, I think Shattercock's calling me. I gotta go go help her with your bra. <laughs> what kind of reward? Oh, well, what would you do for? We've been what getting kind of a lot of vague like? promises <laughs> from a lot of strangers. I, I can give you those. And I'd like something specific. What kind of reward can we get? Hmm. I'll give you this. find your witch sister that you can't give us any information on. <laughs> I just don't know where she is. I haven't seen her in a long time. I wish I could help. 
You, but she, you know what? I'll give you this. This is what we'll do. And she p- picks up that axe that she chopped off the chicken's head with and hands it to you. Mm, the Orc Ripper. Ooh. This is an average-looking hand axe, except for a carving of a dwarven rune on its handle. And then it's got stats. Mysterious stats. What brings okay. you to these woods, I ask again? No, oh, you know, I pop around here and there, looking at important things, important times, checking stuff out. You know anything about world-ending dark magic? Like Banos? You know Banos? <laughs> there is some evil in these hills. Yeah. Uh, over over near the spire, Ravon Spire, near that temple, there's something awful, awful dastardly going on. Uh, you worried about that? Uh, dark, mm, you know, it won't affect me. Mm. Uh, you mortal people would probably have... Yeah, uh, fucked, yeah. Hard, yeah, it's not gonna be good. No. Um, well... Are you interested in gold? I like gold. I will give you gold if you drop us off near that thing that's probably going to end our world. Hmm. Um, world ending. I didn't know it was that dark, but it's kind of it important to us. Uh, we like it here. Uh, I think Decker doesn't. I don't speak for everyone. I'm just talking about <laughs> oh. me and my two friends. Um, <clears throat> but uh, we will pay you handsomely if. Uh, if you give us a ride, should we have I'm a guy with cut the shit out of her? Should we have a guy with decapitated heads on his head being our negotiator? I'm all right. He's he's doing a good job yeah, so far. I mean, if anyone else wants to do it, please step up. He's doing but a good job. Good job. Right. I noticed no one else is really trying to get a ride you, on Birdhouse. <laughs> you guys do ask an awful lot of questions, but young man, you seem to be facing great demons in your life. None more than those inside. You know, taps your chest. Yeah, I'll give you a ride all right. in the I, morning. Okay. What I'm about not the getting on us? that thing. What about the, I will. I'm in. What about the rest of us? Can we go? Sure. Sure. Yes. Nice You're job, all paying Robinson. though. Okay. You're all paying. Yep. Uh, how much? Yeah. Never. What you got? Oh boy. Uh, oh, I, we, I will three take it. Three gold pieces. Cla- yeah. You're lying to me. I'm absolutely not. I can tell you're lying. Hold on. Do you want me to roll? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. You got an <clears throat> intimidator. This is for deception. Actually. Uh, fourteen plus four. Ooh. So eighteen deception. Take that, we itch. Oh, you got truth-telling magics. Shut up, Decker. <laughs> <laughs> you said 18? Yeah. Oh, yeah, she actually buys it. Boom! Even though Boom. she shouldn't. Boom. All right, here's your three gold pieces. All right, and everybody else has more than that, though, You right? paid up front? No, they're all, they're all three. They all have three. Just three? Yeah, that's pretty much it. That's all they got. I right. can tip you in a couple silvers, uh, but that's all my gold, and I'm sorry. Men weren't meant to fly. Grimo, Grimo can't. He he's so taken by this beautiful old witch that. Uh, <laughs> Why are we interpreting that she's beautiful? <laughs> well, she's she's well, actually Grimo. slowly growing younger. It's oh, a little bit sweet. imperceptible. Okay. But she's uh, probably reminding Grimo of her mother. Yeah, he's Grimo's got mom. weird oh. taste and issues. So he he ha- just hands over twenty gold pieces. Oh shit! Damn. Uh, <laughs> he, he covered my fare. Right. So she kinda, she cuts her eyes at you. Just kind of shift inside. <laughs> <laughs> Do you guys have an outlet? You got an outlet in here? Got a USB charger? So, what? She's, she says to you, she goes, live in the moment, young man. I've been trying. So real quick, can I take the axe from Derek and examine it? Or is there any significance to it? Because we can, I can just skip it. I think it's just an item. I mean, it's, it's a little it has a, cool little axe. If you want to look at it, but this is a down payment for me trying to find that other witch. Sure. So you can't keep it, but you can look at it. It has a dwarven rune on its hand. Yeah, I'll give it right back. <laughs> All right, look at it and give it right back. Oops, he lost it. Yeah. And so then, uh, the, the old woman uh, has a little fire going. She's got a pot on there. She's starting to cook up her chicken. Oh, that's all it is. So what can you tell it? What do you, you guys you... ask a lot of questions? Well, this this you is each get sorry. one more, and I'm done. I'm done. <laughs> <laughs> all right, fair enough. Can I have something of, that's in that pot? <laughs> Some <food>? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> what can you tell us about the magic that's brewing over there on that spire? Well, it, it's certainly dark magic. I can feel it deep in my bones. Uh, some sort of... I'm, I'm thinking blood magic, blood rituals, What what's coming to the tip of my tongue. Mm. Uh, I'll go check it out sometime if, you know, if I can be bothered. You guys, though, Thank you. since you can die, should look into it, maybe. Well, you're flying us there. It's not a question. <laughs> <laughs> That's not a do question. I, do I know anything about blood magic or blood rituals? Uh, you do as a wizard, absolutely. Uh, as a DM, I don't know what to sure. tell you. Okay. <laughs> Just didn't know you, you know a lot about the magic. Yeah. Maybe you have an idea of what's going on. Okay. Does, uh, anybody <laughs> want any information? 
What's, who's you sipping on over there? This is really good uh, chicken, chicken soup. soup. Yeah. Oh, jeez. Well, yeah, I guess anything with a bone in it, you're gonna like. Does anybody want to keep watch while we all go to sleep for the night? Uh, I still have my one question I want to ask the witch, <laughs> but it's kind of more of a personal issue. Is there a way where I can go inside and we can just talk this out? Or is there like a quiet place we can go so it can just be the two of us? Sure, yeah. If you, if you walk over to her, she'll, she'll snap her fingers and okay. a bubble can kind of pop okay. up around you guys. So uh, I tell her, uh, I mean, you guys can't hear any of this, but uh, mm -hmm. I say, um, <laughs> so I, I don't know if you've noticed, but there's a curse on my family. Oh, I can tell. Yeah. I can read it on you. I, I assumed, and I, I've actually been looking for someone like you. I'm pretty sure it's why my, my dad banished me from uh, our homeland, and I wanted to, I'm cursed by this thing called Dwarf 4. Um, Dwarf Car. Dwarf right. Car. <laughs> it <laughs> changes <laughs> daily. There's two of them now. Um, so the way this curse works is I have to pass it on to my son, but I don't Dark. want kids. Oh boy. And I don't think, I, I think I'm gonna die with this thing. Is there any way you could help me rid myself of these evil spirits without having mm. to pass it on to a child? So you wouldn't wanna just, you know, lay with a prostitute and have a baby and just let it take the thing? I'm or? not really into girls. Oh, you get okay. what I, I went to night school and I found out that oh, I, did some, I did some experimenting <laughs> and I just found out that the, the woman who I was betrothed to I'm not really into kind of yaps a lot and yeah, yeah, a, I, yeah. just, I just uh, right. identify more with uh, people like myself. Men. Catch my drift. Yeah, sure. Big men. <laughs> no, that's lovely. Oh, that's, that's, great ass. Young man. <laughs> that's me. All up in there. Uh, hmm. You know, I, I, ha I have a library. I, I will go look up your dwarf car and see if I can't find something for you. No, thank you. Thank you so much. And if you know of any, like, Asian kids I can adopt, that would be great. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, so you do watch I have no idea what you're talking about. <laughs> okay, she's well, looking at you. Crazy, crazy yeah. little rich boy. Did you mean, was she uh, looking at the library right now? Oh, you know, the library's not in my hut. It's oh. actually, I'll go and fly <laughs> she's with the my house. Okay. <laughs> she went um, like it was you know and what? came back out. I'll take I you forgot. to join your quest. I'll go look up something about your, your Dwarkar or cool. whatever his name is today. It's a Dwarkar, yeah. Um... And see what I can do there, cool. and I will find you one, cool. once I find some information. But what you need to do is focus on today and now, mm -hmm. and try and stop this dark magic. Okay. Uh, I then take her hand and I, I bow and I, I, I kiss it and I say thank you and I suddenly like women again. Ah, oh. wow, that was fast. <laughs> Hello. Well, I'm going go. through changes <laughs> <laughs> every day. Has she rolled back into babe territory yet, I... or is she still kind of like Milfy? Oh, she doesn't get younger than. I mean, she'll she'll remind you all of your mother. Oh, she okay. won't get much younger than that. I think. Uh, I see. I thought she was aging unless she reverse. purposely wanted to fuck you up, which she's not interested in you guys. Well, so well, I, I guess. I, although she sees great promise in the my guy. my mom died in childbirth, so I don't know what my mom was like. So I guess that's why I feel like a connection to her. Yeah, and it's weird that I want to have sex with her. She cured odd, the gay. She, she might be down. <laughs> in between. She's like a ripped dude I'm just oiled a up with leather straps. Yeah. I'm just a college oh, young man. Just a college kid. <laughs> I'm figuring stuff out, Dad. <laughs> All right, she's still cooking at her fire and stuff. She's kind of piddling about, whist whistling a little tune every once in a while, humming, muttering it's to It's a Saite song. <laughs> she knows it. Should we right. just go to sleep? Yeah, yeah song, unless you, anyone else is with one hand. <laughs> trying to get up to anything. Miri? This is a little bit more complex than what I originally signed up for. And I know you said you were going to consider renegotiating the cost of this, uh... This. I didn't say that. Yes, you did. You said you would think about it. You said we'd talk about it. I think we should talk about it right now. I'm going to hear this and come over and okay. just sit down. I don't remember saying it. that, but well, let's talk about it. It needs to be said. We didn't sign up to save the world. We signed up to kill two orcs. We need to be paid more. I put my hand in front of Decker and push him back. <laughs> we're, we're fucking talking about the same thing. <laughs> uh, I'm over here. I'm I'm getting a bunch of twigs and stuff, and I'm I'm building something. You continue talking. Now. So we need to figure out how you're going to pay us a little bit more for our services. Well, we've already been paid slightly more by picking up gold and silver along the way, robbing unconscious people's pockets and splitting it. I don't think that's how it works, though. That's how it's been working for you. That's how it's been working for you. No. But unless you want, if you want me to go to this last place and get this last Moondog brother, you're gonna have to renegotiate right now. Okay, what do you want? More. More what? 50 gold more. 
Yeah. 50 gold more? Yeah. Okay, fine. Here, I throw him the ice. Well, shoot. Is everyone watching? No, no, no. Meanwhile, this is happening. I'm, I'm busying myself. Say, uh, he's yeah. building something in the woods. Yeah. We're off to the side. Oh, okay. I'm so watching. I throw I throw him the platinum, platinum signet ring that everyone ignored that's worth 50 gold pieces that we picked up at the last thing. Like, here. Dastardly wow. Pattern. Okay, that makes I didn't even happy. see you grab this. <laughs> yeah. Well, <laughs> okay. You were too busy going through an unconscious one-handed man's pockets. <laughs> <laughs> his name is Saite. <laughs> <laughs> you you it would have been great if you were like, his name is Sante. Yeah. <laughs> that's a completely wrong name. <laughs> totally He's wrong. a friend. <laughs> I miss one hand. Is that enough <laughs> for you? We're good. Okay. All right. You got another guy here, though. Yes. I I would like more payment, too. Oh, Jesus. Well, talk to the guys who hired you. I'm just supposed to keep you in line. Was well, that the arrangement? That's good to know. I'll remember. Don't let him talk to you that way, Miri. <laughs> <laughs> Stand your ground. As I admire the ring. Uh, Grimo's like sitting at the campfire, just like trying to. But it, through the tent, he can see the silhouette of Shattercock. <laughs> And like she's, she's dressing herself for the evening. Is she oh. turning on a shower? And it's like, where's the water coming from? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she's showering, and then she, you know, she towels off a little shower bit. Shower spell. She does a little yeah. shimmy where she puts it around her butt and does oh. this thing with it with the towel. No one yeah. does that. Um, then she pushes her ass against herself, the curtain, wraps herself up in a towel, puts mm-hmm. a towel just barely over her boobs. Mm-hmm. Uh, just it's like a very very short skirt. Mm-hmm. Walks out to Grimo, grabs Grimo's collar, pulls just, him into just, the tent, and yeah. says, just, "I need a big spoon." And then. Throws Grimo down on the floor. She she has to be You have to be my big spoon! So you have to lay behind me as we fall asleep. That's the only way I can sleep. Even though I've slept like that a different ways the other lots of other times. You have to be my big spoon. You ready, Grimo? Oh, shut it go. Do you need them do you need them to roll for grappling? <laughs> <laughs> Is Grimo being submissive? Uh, it, don't take this the wrong way, Shadowcock, but you got the measurements of a human ladle. <laughs> <laughs> Well, you're gonna have to stay right there. Put your arm around me, Grimo. Put your arm around me. Uh, Come on. Grimo, he puts his arm around, but it's dark and he fumbles and he thinks he grabs some nipple. Oh. But, uh. <laughs> nipple's like this big. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 that was nice. Thank you. Thank you, uh, oh, thank you very much. So you're, st- you're gonna stay right there, right? Uh, yeah, Grimo's trying to think of every thought that is like not of an, is not of a sexual nature. Grimo, did you bring your sword into bed? <laughs> uh, yeah, you know, in case protect you in case something happens at night. Well, it feels kind of small. That's weird. Oh, it's just a dagger. <laughs> <laughs> right, Here, well, can, you, can you roll to suppress your boner, please? Yeah, yeah always, always. Does it glow when orcs are nearby? So, <laughs> yes. oh, oh no, oh. Oh. three plus what happened? What happened three plus preacher? religion. <laughs> <laughs> what does that make it? <laughs> Sorry, four. 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 Oh boy, yeah. Oh, that so thing's going wild. You have oh, no gosh. control. <laughs> also, how does Shattercock's tail factor into that? She's getting small spooned. Oh, it wraps around her boner. Okay, good. Oh, yeah. no. So, no. It coils up around yeah, it. It coils up around it. It's becoming bit. anime porn. Uh, yeah, yeah. No, no, it's not. A- this is the way she falls asleep, guys. Jeez. So then Grimo. Everyone's are you, got their thing. Are you staying there or what? Are you going to stay there with me? I have no choice. Okay, well, good night. Good night. Oh, beautiful tail as old as yeah. time. Farts a little bit. I can't wait until Disney adapts this. <laughs> <laughs> okay, end scene. Yeah. We're, just, right. we're living in a chair. Shadowcock's tail tends to constrict. All right, so no one else want to do anything <laughs> before sleeping. I, I pass out while building my thing. I I will <laughs> reveal it in the morning. Oh, God. All right. Ooh. It's a, don't worry about it. Ooh. I'm not worried at all. You don't see it. You're too I busy. I also objected to getting onto the thing. Bird yeah. The birdhouse. I know. That's why I'm building a thing. Okay. Yeah, right. Just make sure we're doing it. Gotcha. All right. Tonight, y'all are all asleep. All right. uh, it's like the A-team. Bird lady disappears. Oh. But there's a little, uh... God damn it. A little picnic basket. She fucked us. I knew she was oh, going to leave no us. Bird that's house. why I was like, our goal. Well, why'd you pay her ahead of time? <laughs> that's why I said one of us should keep guard, because I knew she was going to fucking leave. I think she would have just left it. A picnic well, basket, never though. Mind. What's in there? Can I look in the picnic basket? Wait, well, you're still asleep, right? Oh, yeah, are you guys sure. waking up? Well, is it? Let's daytime? do let's do long rest. Okay. Yeah, everybody gets yep. all yeah. their stuff back. back to yeah. Hell. Yeah. 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 I'm gonna oh, reallocate back. my spells so I'm not no. fucking worthless. Grima wakes up and uh, he's just covered in like the sticky fluid. <laughs> Why, Where? why are you so sticky, Grima? Uh it's just uh, you know, it's like a battle uh, like like bomb that I put on makes well, me why don't like, you hop in the shower with me? We'll shower you off. Oh, coming. <laughs> um, <laughs> more ways than one. I, I wake up Derek and I go, hey buddy, I got something for you. 
Uh-huh. And I walk you over and I pull the bush back and it's a little cage that you put animals in when you fly. And so it's like a little kennel. So I'm like, this way you can travel safely. <laughs> That's a great idea. That's a really great idea. That bowl is for your food. I should cut off your <laughs> arms and your legs and <laughs> shove you in there. So you like it? No, I don't like it. I was up all night making it. <laughs> It's the ugliest thing I've ever seen, but my tail's wagging. <laughs> uh, Shattercock coyly drops the soap. <laughs> and then Grimos, he's looking all over for it, and then he, he parts her pubes, and he's looking oh, all over for it. <laughs> Man, she's huge. She's a giant. Yeah. <laughs> she also doesn't shave. That's uh, what's it's just becoming vor porn or anything? Anyway. Uh, no vor yet. Oh. Sure. Anyway. Yeah. I mean, we're getting close to anal vor, I guess. Well, hold on. There's been no penetration whatsoever. Yeah. It's true. You There's very very penetration in vor. Just groping. Someone shoved a branch into uh, oh, Saite's yeah. arm. His socket. Yeah. Christian teens I, do that shit all the time. And I close my eyes and think of that festering wound, and I'm like, man, that guy's got the life. <laughs> Grimo also thinking of another festering wound. <laughs> but <laughs> I like how she's become this, like, repulsive. Oh, no. <laughs> oh. That's even when it can open. I'm good, Jack. Normally, it's just, it's just clamped shut. It's like a fire flower from Mario Brothers. Anyway, so... Uh, uh, hey, look, a picnic basket. Anybody going to get that picnic yeah, basket? Look at the picnic basket. Picnic basket. Yeah, the, you guys are up in the morning. Whatever. Whatever and rummage through. Uh, uh. Oh, sweet. Muffins. I got three muffins that will each have a distinctive effect when consumed. Ooh. Tea? <coughs> she just left us bullshit. Thanks. Well, hold on. Also didn't take us to the mount. Thanks a lot. Fucking, <sighs> fucking witches, man. I love muffins. Wait, what is that? Oh, uh, this cup of tea will restore uh, one day, one D, was it? One, oh, I'm sorry, one D four plus one HP. Gotcha. So you brew the tea; it's basically like half of a health potion. Yeah, yeah. yeah. The muffins, cool. the muffins I'll, each do a little will come, something. Magic come muffins. Out. And I, I think I got the best one here—the magic stick. <laughs> Such a lame. You got, you got that from Grimo last night. <laughs> oh <laughs> no! Uh, this stick will extend to ten feet. Time is your current level. Oh, I, should, I can just read this my normal. Uh, with a magic word. <laughs> Over a long rest, you must study and bond with this stick. You create a word or phrase that will activate the extending powers. Uh, 1d6 bludgeoning, uh, versatile 1d8. So I, It's still basically Grimo's dick. So. <laughs> so versatile is you grab it with two hands, right? So, so this, what do you mean the stick will extend to 10 feet? So basically like... It'll, so it's like a, you know, oh, man, a, it's like a stick. Small. You create oh, whatever, your, whatever your catchphrase is and it pops out to 10 feet times your... Your level. Hey, Wait. Decker. Yep. I'll make a deal. Next battle we get in, if you use this stick, you have to fight. What do you think? I have been fighting. All right, it's mine. <laughs> 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 I deal. wouldn't say if you get in there and use melee or whatever. Whatever. Does Derek get distracted by sticks at all? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you should throw it. <laughs> I'm not chasing it. I'm not. I'm not. I need it back. I need it back. God damn it! And then I, <laughs> I kind of like thought that. Here's your stick back. Oh yeah, yeah sure. Are we, right. are we you know, you have cold rations or whatever you've got in your packs and move out. Cheese, lots of right. cheese. Yeah. Yeah. There's three wedges of cheese left. Wait. There was a ham a couple episodes ago that I don't, I don't know if you guys did anything I with. I haven't that. really been tracking food all that. I use that for Saite's fingers. Your new ham Ham bones. Let's roll out. All right, here we go. Let's. We're on the way out. You're on the way out. So it, it's actually uh, just yet another day where nothing really happens. That's good. Biking I guess. around. Nice. Gallop, Together is one. <laughs> we <laughs> just have yeah, it. Yeah, you find. <laughs> oh, that's all fucked up. Oh, uh -oh. Well, yeah, it is. Yeah. Let's not do that. So that's you find fine. another campsite. Great. Well, this, is, this, this looks oddly similar. similar. I think we may be going in circles. Yeah. This whole land is campsites and rocks. Really just another it doesn't smell day. like my tree. <laughs> uh, you guys get a lot closer to Ravon's spire. Say, in the morning, maybe you have an hour or so to get there. All right, um, perfect. So we're camping outside of Ravon's spire. Yeah, yeah. And I guess can... we should keep our eyes out for flying witch houses. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and <laughs> avoid them. Yeah, she stole our gold. So, uh, is anything anyone wants to bring up? For uh, marching, marching on. I feel like you're setting us up for something like. Just want you know. I want to make sure you all have your moment that you want to have. <sighs> like Thanks. a movement. Grimo. <laughs> Grimo goes to Decker and he's like, uh, Decker, have you ever been a big spoon? I've never. No. I, I think I know what that is, but no, I don't sleep with people. Well, I got a good opportunity for you tonight, cause Shadowcock <laughs> over there, you know, she's looking for. Grimo. 
Oh, coming in the minute. I need you for the big spoon. I also <sighs> can't go to sleep. Maybe you would be uh, the beautiful, voluptuous Shadowcock's big spoon tonight. I don't know about that. Uh, sounds like you're already really good at it. Um, or rather, <sighs> preferred. I listen. Grimo comes stomping out, or uh, Shadowcock comes stomping out of the tent. Uh, as she's walking, her clothes fall off. Uh, okay. <laughs> All right. Rita! All I see is a Are dinosaur. Are you coming or not? It's a monster. <laughs> it's just becoming a bad it's sitcom where you hear this off-camera off voice. I know. Are oh. you coming or not? Are you coming? Just think about it, Decker. It could be a big moment for you. Shadowmundo. Shattercock grabs her hand. Grabs back and drags Grimo yeah. by his. Uh, I'll be watching with my sweet reflective sunglasses. Cheeks get a little red. Oh, <laughs> nice. Just standing there frowning. I slap Decker on the back. Bye. Hey, that would have been the cheapest spooning you've ever paid for, right? <laughs> <laughs> I'm indicating that you use prostitutes. <laughs> <laughs> I see. <laughs> Not yet. Uh, I don't but know, someday. Man. I, you're, uh, right, you're still young. It's not necessary. Not because of that. No, other reason. No. It's complicated. You don't have a penis? Uh, no, it's there. <laughs> it's, I mean, uh, mine's in a sheath, but at least I've got one. <laughs> no, I just don't think about it too much. Uh, a lot of other things to do. Okay. Uh, Gamer game. Like your laptop? <laughs> yeah. It doesn't exist in this All world. Right. <laughs> yeah, no, it's in too. <laughs> Actually, hold on a minute. Like, look around. Little shady like. <laughs> Open up my laptop. You want to see something? Sure. All right. Punch stuff up. Hit a button. Ask your titties on that screen. Again? Yeah. <laughs> That's all he's got. I thought it was going to be the dog on the skateboard or something. Oh, yeah. <laughs> nope. Anything. The same old. Minesweeper? No. Doesn't work. Actually, wait. No, it did. Ski free? Uh, that's not out yet. <laughs> uh, so I'll open it up and I'll, I'll show it to Derek and be like, "Yeah, check that out." This is what we're doing before we go to the big battle, <laughs> yeah. so the, the I, end of the world. That's about right. I look at Derek, uh, Decker, and then I look at the screen. And I go, "You probably should have slept with Shattercock tonight." <laughs> you think? I don't know. Grimo doesn't seem like he enjoys it all that much. Grimo doesn't spend most of his time making fake breasts images out of weird symbols on a screen from a device that I've never seen before. <laughs> Well, you know, whatever works for anybody. It is, you know, some people have certain tools at their disposal and other people don't. So. You're right. You can go look at some rocks and I'll keep looking at this. Okay. I'm going to go look at some rocks. <laughs> 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 keep it up, buddy. <laughs> you got it. All right, all right. Uh, you guys, you know, go to sleep or whatever. Again? It was another day. Another <laughs> day of no, oh, nothing okay. happened. Oh, by the way, I'm bonding um, with a stick. Okay, yeah, what's your, oh, what's your magic phrase? phrase? What are you using the magic stick for? Yeah. <laughs> what's your little phrase there? You gotta oh, come up with um, a, a word. Uh, erect. Yeah. <laughs> get, get erect. Get right. hard. Get hard. <laughs> in stiffen. Oh, in stiffen. Good. Stiffen. <laughs> it is. in stiffen it is. Uh, rectus patronum. <laughs> come to my asshole. <laughs> oh, wow. I, like, I like subtle spells. Oh, rectus like, uranus. Wouldn't that accidentally extend all the time? If you're I just shouting it. Kind of my ass. I say that a lot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You're in reverie. <laughs> enjoying the company of somebody. All of a sudden, this Whoa, pole stick. just like shoots out of the wall. Uh, you don't understand. The, sti the stick extends when I say common phrase. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Okay, so you, so you guys wake up uh, the next day, and you've actually all forgotten, but you know this. It's the last day of the month on Jeed, which means it's a dark day. Shattercocks, um, period. <laughs> <laughs> a, a gas giant called Rala which you guys know as, uh, or think of as a moon, but it's really just a, a giant planet. It's, it's really ass. close to yours. Cool. Uh, it, it doesn't completely fill the sky, but it, it looms really large, and it, when it moves between the sun and your planet, everything gets a little bit dark. Uh, so, dark day. Uh, Rala also has rings like Saturn, so it's, you know, it's pretty. There's magical kind of lights in the sky and stuff. Um, because I'm really ethical, so. yeah. 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 strange. Grimo's helping Shattercock affix the straps of her peat moss uh, pad to her garter because it's like a her, tampon. Her blood yeah. is present. Oh, under yeah. the moon. Such bad oh, because it's the blood moon, right? Yeah, oh, I guess. Yeah. Blood magic in the She's, sky. Oh, you got blood magic too. Oh, Shattercock's man. gonna fire that shit out like a super soaker. Well, at least I'm not pregnant. She has one day. Yeah. He puts them on like war paint because they're going into battle. Oh, oh, boom. <laughs> I definitely do that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, absolutely. It helps with intimidation. Okay, so you guys, you guys march along. Yeah. You get going. Uh, would you pick an order? 
actually to to be marching in. It actually mm. doesn't matter that much, so don't agonize over it. Just something I'm supposed to go. make you do. All yeah. perfect. There you go. All right. right. So you're you're going up a mountain. You're hiking. You're you're climbing towards the spire, the area you've been directed to. Uh, the wind wind is list. <laughs> the wind is blasting and whipping around. The trees seem to actually be moving in a, a sort of rhythm with, with each other. Seems like a beat of some kind. Some sort of metal rhythm. Double kick rhythm. Oh, that looks right. Oh, cool. Oh, wow. So this is the entrance? All right, so yeah. If you move everyone down that way. Uh, the, the path you are following reaches its end. Uh, the gates to the entrance of the temple are sitting open, welcoming you. Above the gate, the mountain shoots high up into the sky. You see flashes of light and hear the distant pounding of drums from high above the mountain. It's like Ghostbusters. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Does this seem like one of your games? Yeah, almost exactly like them. Oh. Uh, so, fuck it, man. If we're going to continue this, there's going to be like four or five floors. They're all going to have normal enemies on them, and then we're going to get to the top, and there'll be a boss fight. Have you been here before, Decker? How do yeah. you know this? What are we talking about? It's, it's, shit's predictable. I grab my go. Are you with them? <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'll like, I'll very clearly like be intimidated and scared and just kind of mumble and like, oh, just let me go. No, I'm down. Um, I'm standing next to the cage that I built for Derek and I'm pointing at going now. <laughs> oh, oh. Okay. I put my head down. It's a little too bit. small. Yeah. Don't you see? Uh, the. The demon head on top of me goes, I told you he wouldn't like it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, wait. So if it's dark day, mm -hmm. does that mean your demons wake all the time? They are getting louder. Much, uh -oh. much louder. Yeah, what's Dorkar saying to you? Uh, he, it's just been rambling. And yeah, he's actually mad at me right now because I talked to that witch. Uh oh. And he's basically saying, like, you told her about us. <laughs> well, so this is the weird part. He's getting angry because I was trying to get rid of him, but he's. Seems like maniacally happy that we're going towards this thing. So it's making me a little worried, and that's why I've been kind of quiet and focusing. I've been like, the more I focus myself on stuff like building cages, um, <laughs> the less I hear the voices. But now that we're here, it's just, it's deafening. So are you like visibly disturbed? I, I look like I haven't slept for a good night. Like I, I look a little, a little rustled to. Yeah. Okay. There's Grimo. So, all right. <laughs> We both look at each other and go, rough night. Yeah, you do. You change you change in maxi pads and tampons and stuff. I just stare blankly and go, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> something like that. Yeah, I feel you. I, I, I turn around. <laughs> I look at Derek again and wave. <laughs> this. No. I'll go for, for you. you. You brought the cage with you? Yeah. yeah. I mean, it the whole way. It, it, I mean, it keeps falling apart, but <laughs> you got to stop and put it yeah, It's kind of crappy. I'll go up to Raxan and uh, say... So I know, I know a thing or two about magic. This stuff resonates. Like it's close to each other. You got some shit going on. You, you okay? You gonna lose it? How you doing? No, I'm fine. Um, we, I think, I think a, a lot of our problems are gonna be solved after, after today. That can mean a lot of things. You're not gonna rip anyone's spine out, are you? I mean, not us. You're not very good at picking up on hints, are you? <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean? I was talking to the guy up here. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, okay. You feel better. <laughs> were you talking to me or the? Who are, you, who are you talking to when you said that? Yeah, I'm. I'm getting right. Yeah, I mean, I'm. We all we all have a little voice in our head, right? We Whoa. all have a. I'm not talking to you. <laughs> I can hear it. Though. Oh. <laughs> uh, you know, everyone's got a conscious. Everyone's got a little little voice in their head, and sometimes it tells them to do good things. Sometimes it tells them to do bad things, and. What uh, what a good person does is they fight through that, and they uh, they put themselves through night school, and they get themselves a really sweet job back at their dad's farm. Who's with me? <laughs> what does a bad person do? Take a small man and force him to have sex with you. Um, we never <laughs> had sex. <laughs> what really? I wasn't. I I just put a theoretical out <laughs> there. I didn't. I didn't name anyone. I just needed a big spoon. That's uh. it. Trust me, we never had sex. See? Grimo, he's, he's behind Shattercock and he just hears sloshing and he's yeah. just dreading the next changing, so... Yeah, it's all packed he, up. He kind of he, he looks at the entrance to this, this tower. The pressure's oh. building up. What does he make Her out? Her are just rumbling the whole time. <laughs> <laughs> just, just at the entrance. What kind of yeah. investigating are you doing? Like, He's trying to see if they have, if they have access, if they can enter. Oh, if yeah, it's the, safe to enter. The doors are wide. They're open. wide open. 
Um, it's it's kind of made of marble, uh, marble, excuse me. Uh, yeah, the door's okay. wide open. Looks actually kind of welcoming. Can he see this statue? Yeah, you wanna, you can walk over there and check it out. Is it, yeah, so I guess he'll, he'll check it out and like, try to make out if there's anything significant about it. Okay, so that is a statue of Ravon. You, you know that, you don't really That's know much story. about him, unless you want to roll for it. Uh, you you kind of, you... Oh. No, so yeah, I don't, I don't... Three. So no. oh, okay, yeah. So you know the name, you are familiar with it, him as a, a deity of some kind. Uh, you, you, how, you rolled a three? Yeah. Okay. I guess, I'll, I'll go uh, and give it a look. Yeah, and I can see Grima doing that. I've got, I've got religion ticked. Actually, a deck, you want to do it? Yeah. Like, are you guys just gonna go over on your own? Does Grimo yeah, tell you there's I'll, I'll a weird statue Decker. or something? I'll, I'll yeah, I'll, I guess we'll see Grimo looking at the thing and we'll go over there and check it out. Mm -hmm. I don't know, we really need to move it. every time. Yeah. No, you, you really don't. Yeah, that's uh. Alright, so, like, oh yeah, it's, uh, it's Ravana, right? Uh, jeez, please God. Uh, so that's 18? Alright, yeah. So, what you, as you know, wizard, you're learned, you know these things, uh, you know uh, Ravon uh, is depicted and described as having six heads. Uh, he's a follower of Tiamat. Uh, that's probably one aspect of him. So yeah, Tiamat, the dragon goddess of evil, he's a follower of hers. Oh uh, shit. Ravon was a great scholar, a capable ruler, and a maestro of musical instruments. Interesting. Okay. He had wished to overpower the other gods and devils. His six heads represent different aspects of his knowledge of the world and the dark powers held within it. He's considered to be the most revered devotee of Tiamat, and in some parts of the world, his image is seen and worshipped along with hers. There are six of us. Does, uh, um, does Decker um, tell us um, that? Yeah, it's all right. I'm, I'm just co collating notes so I can tell it in a Decker fashion. Yep. So slightly condescending, annoying and aggravating. <laughs> um, so so. You, you also, in addition to your knowledge of the religion that you pulled from, from the object, do you hear kind of a slushing or sloshing. It sounds like there's water moving. Oh, I thought that was Shattercock. I was about to say. <laughs> it's like, it's slightly louder wow. than, than Shattercock. Okay. Uh, impossible. <laughs> uh, so it, would, I, would I be able to attribute any context to that, or is it just there is sloshing and I have no idea why? You know, if you want to go tackle onto the statue or something, oh, no. I mean, you're going to go clamming up onto it or anything? Nah. Yeah, I didn't think so. All right. So they're like, oh, you're interested in that statue, huh? You know who that is? It's, uh, it's Ravana. It's Ravon. A, Ravon. Oh, this Ravana's a good boss stars, an actual one. Yeah, there, there's another. There's an actual Ravana. There's an actual whatever. Um, so yeah, that's Ravon. That's a. Uh, you know Tiamat? No, I never heard of him. Yeah, this line has some pretty weird, weird shit going on. So Tiamat, super evil dude. Ravana, dragon goddess. Dragon goddess. Well, <laughs> I'm paraphrasing. Oh yeah, yeah. Uh, Ravon is an acolyte of Tiamat, super evil, into music. So, I'm thinking that's what this is all about. Uh, so either we're dealing with an avatar of Ravon in there, maybe Rav some element of Ravon himself, or herself. Can you tell us about the six heads? Uh, not yet, but I will. <laughs> um, so does, does that have six heads, or...? Sure, yeah, okay. pretend it does. So it's, it's got six heads, which is kind of cool. Uh, a lot of different depictions. This one here is a little, a little interesting, a little older, I think. But this appears to be a temple for Ravon. Which is exactly the place you would probably want to do some dark shit, m musically speaking. While he's doing this, I'm kind of just like wandering in towards the entrance. Okay. In through the front. <laughs> so little... And through that gate there? Yeah, wherever Yeah, wherever right. that entrance is. Uh, Shattercock's Wait. listening on. Hello! Yeah. Oh, sorry, sorry, Mary, go ahead. No, is, is this oh. the entrance or is that? That is, that? The, that is the entrance. This is all covered. echo a little So bit. we don't know, we can't see anything. Oh. Okay, um, th that goes into a giant mountain. Yeah. So like all this crap is a mountain. Oh, okay, that okay. is like a tunnel entrance in. All well, right. He's describing all this. Shattercock is listening, and I know she never actually thinks anything. She only says it out loud. So, so she's she says, uh, "Hey, I'm a dragon ancestor. I have a gold draconic bloodline. So that means mm. I'm res like I'm resistant to fire, and I have a, like a pretty cool armor class because of because I've got drag like I, I wear a." I have dragon scale on my skin. I can see some of her bloodline on yeah. the floor. Yeah. <laughs> oh, so, so actually, this might be all right. I guess we are fighting a god all of a sudden, or an acolyte of a god at least. And I mean, dude, just look. Do you see all this shit? Yeah, no, I do. She's Decker. There. She's extra emotional right now. <laughs> Why is that? Shut up, Decker! 
me. Oh shit. <laughs> I mean, I love you. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to do that. Grind. So yeah, there's a few more flashes of light, and you hear the the drumming intensify from like way up on the spire. Ah, EDC. Come on, guys. You're gonna go this back yeah, over. So yeah, you hear your voice you. echo deep yeah, into yeah, the cavern. Are you following too? Okay, so yeah. we'll, we'll jump over. Wait, to you what are you doing with the dwarf axe? What? <laughs> I have my two axes. One is the Orc Ripper. Oh, okay, gotcha, cool. Yeah. Badass. Yeah. So as you walk through the gates, you see the interior of the temple lit faintly from deeper within it. Uh, this <laughs> oh boy. Gotcha. I'm, I'm scared and I, I sing the uh, Friends uh -oh. theme song to myself. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're going to try something here. Let's see if I can make this happen. I think I heard a minstrel play once. <laughs> anyway, you can I use, can I use my uh, dark vision okay. and see more or no? Oh, are you gonna? Are you gonna do gonna it live? And, I'm oh. gonna try and do this. Gonna do it live? Oh, that's exciting. Oh. Hard to control. Oh, really hard to control. You got it. You're doing good. Here you go. Yeah. Oh, whoa, other way. Oh, fog of war. So cool. cool. All right. Oh, oh, that looks like a sm smusher trap. Oh, that's definitely a trap. So, All right. <laughs> so the stairs rise before you, cutting up into the mountain. The air smells stale, but you 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 also get some burnt. Uh, wood kind of fiery smell on you. So I've walked into the middle of that area there. Uh -oh. Okay, so actually, I think that's a great place to probably stop. <gasps> um, so yeah, on, we does entered a temple. Anything happen right yeah. before it stops? You die. Oh, well, you, you, <laughs> you see, you see a pressure that pit plate with all those spikes in it, so you're probably not going to just like walk over into well, it, right? Those are spikes there? Yeah, so that's a spiked pit. Oh. So oh. I'm taking one step forward. Mm -hmm. All right, one step perched above, and like then. All right, to cut. be continued. Right on. <laughs> yeah, I think that's a good place to stop. So oh. we'll see you next time. Thanks, everybody. Ooh. Grimo's like sitting at the campfire, just like trying to. But it, through the tent, he can see the silhouette of Shattercock. <laughs> And like she's, she's dressing herself for the evening. Is she oh. turning on a shower? And it's like, where's the water coming from? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she's showering, and then she, you know, she towels off a little bit. Shower spell. She does a little yeah. shimmy where she puts it around her butt and does oh. this thing with it with the towel. No one yeah. does that. Um, then she pushes her ass against herself, the curtain, wraps herself up in a towel, puts the towel just barely over her boobs. Mm -hmm. uh, just it's like a very very short skirt. Mm -hmm. Walks out to Grimo, grabs Grimo's collar, pulls just, him into just, the tent, and yeah. says, just, "I need a big spoon." And then. Throws Grimo down on the floor. She she has to be You have to be my big spoon! So you have to lay behind me as we fall asleep. That's the only way I can sleep! Even though I've slept like that different ways the other lots of other times. You have to be my big spoon. You ready, Grimo? Well, it's Jenica. Do you need it's them do you need them to roll for grappling? <laughs> huh. Is Grimo being submissive? Uh, it, don't take this the wrong way, Shadowcock, but you got the measurements of a human ladle. <laughs> <laughs> Put your arm around me, Grimo! Put your arm around me! Uh, Come on! Grimo, he puts his arm around, but it's dark and he fumbles and he thinks he grabs some nipple. Oh. But, uh... <laughs> nipple's like this big. <laughs> 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 oh, that was, oh, oh, that was nice. Thank you. Oh. Thank, you. Uh, oh, thank you very much. So well, you're, you're going to stay right there, right? Uh, yeah, Grimo's trying to think of every thought that is, like, not of, an, is not of a sexual nature. Grimo, did you bring your sword into bed? <laughs> uh, yeah. You in case something happens at night. Well, it feels kind of small. That's weird. Oh, it's just a dagger. <laughs> <laughs> right, Here, well, can, you, can you roll to suppress your boner, please? Yeah. So you guys wake up uh, the next day, and you've actually all forgotten, but you know this. It's the last day of the month on Jeed, which means it's a dark day. Shattercocks, um, period. <laughs> <laughs> a, a gas giant called Rala, which you guys know as, uh, or think of as a moon, but it's really just a, a giant planet. It's, it's really ass. close to yours. Cool. Uh, it, it doesn't completely fill the sky, but it, it looms really large, and it, when it moves between the sun and your planet, everything gets a little bit dark. Uh, so, dark day. Uh, Rala also has rings like Saturn, so it's, you know, it's pretty. There's magical kind of lights in the sky and stuff. So you're, you're going up a mountain, you're hiking, you're, you're climbing towards this spire, the area you've been directed to. Uh, the wind, wind is blist... <laughs> the wind is blasting and whipping around. The trees seem to actually be moving in a, a sort of rhythm with, with each other. Seems like a beat of some kind. Some sort of metal rhythm. Double kick rhythm. Oh, oh, that looks right. Oh, cool. Oh, wow. So this is the entrance? All right, so yeah. If you move everyone down that way. Uh, the, the path you are following reaches its end. Uh, the gates to the entrance of the temple are sitting open, welcoming you. Above the gate, the mountain shoots high up into the sky. 
you see flashes of light and hear the distant pounding of drums from high above the mountain. It's like Ghostbusters. All right, welcome to Twits and Crits, the season finale of oh. our D&D show. Uh, who wants to let us know what we did last time? Mm. Quickly. Lots, lots of camping. Spooning. Lots of camping and spooning. Yeah. Oh, God. Spooning. At least the wettest episode. Of, yeah. we, uh, <laughs> tail on cock action. We finally uncovered the big mystery, which is there is a big blood orgy about to happen, and we That's need That's to exactly get in right. on that. Yeah. Also, some houses have wings, hmm? we've learned. Decker pissed um, on a lot of trees. Or Derek, mm-hmm. Derek mm-hmm. just thought, I own a lot of trees. Now, I'm sorry, you own a lot of trees. <laughs> we beheaded one of the Moondog brothers, accidentally. Ac- we didn't mean to do that. Is it really a beheading if it's on accident? <laughs> Is it Ax? Ax- oh, oh sorry, there. sorry, that's no, why okay. Decker and Grumo, you know. We, we found out <laughs> that Decker, Decker might be from some other time. Yeah. Parts unknown. Oh, oh, a video hi, game. Yo, he may be inside something. a video game He's right now. Basically Captain N, the Game Master. <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't have a belt buckle yet. <laughs> Maybe at the top of this tower there's a shiny treasure chest with a Nintendo belt buckle in it, Dan. Maybe. Who knows? <laughs> yeah. Miriatus owes Derek some money. Mm. And so now we're Wait, over. No, I don't. Square. Yeah, they well, uh, for the down payment. Ah. <laughs> so now we're Revan Spire? Revan Spire. Revan Spire. Yeah, you guys made it. Derek was made walking forward. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Into Precipitously hanging what over. What looked to be so that. some sort of dangerous yeah. situation. Kind of yeah, he's dead. Spring powered clamp spike trip. Yeah. So, are those spikes or floor texture? As seen from above. <laughs> that is a spike a trap. So, yeah. Uh, Decker had, I mean, Derek what? had his one foot Her? about to step out into that trap. Uh huh. Um, was there anything else last episode? I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't remember. It was 10 minutes ago. So. I don't know we had identified happened. that this was a temple of the Dark God Ravon. Shattercock's on our period. Who? <laughs> oh, yeah. N- now we're caught up. The yeah, wolves are hunting us. <laughs> I got some muffins. She's right. like an overinflated balloon, just ready. Yeah, you all got little gifts yeah. from the little old witch lady. Sharks True. are on land, just crawling towards her. <laughs> <laughs> it's like the seasons in Game of Thrones. This is going to last <laughs> three months. So, uh, oh. the inspirationless. Uh, Raxon yeah. did a wonderful job. Hey, nice. So he should not be inspirationless heading into the, nice. the final dungeon. You're, you're my, right you know what, Dan? You're my inspiration. Oh, oh, that's so sweet. Oh, yeah, can I have another one? <laughs> you, go. you get a big one. What? Oh, oh, suck, your, suck your dick. <laughs> <laughs> no, here, here's actually an extra special one. Oh. Hand, hand me that thing back. Oh, yeah. That's, oh, yeah, you found your dice? Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I'll trade Time you. before last. Oh. Mm. Oh, you can wow. Play that. You'll drop that. Don't drop it. Actually, yeah, we forgot to mention. Raxan made it through an entire episode without dropping his dice. Hey, yeah. well, well, actually, because we didn't before roll. we started, oh, yeah, right. yeah. before we <laughs> rolled true. on the last episode, he had already dropped it. And <laughs> oh, found it. And There's no footage started. of it. You can't yeah. prove it. Yeah. Right. So what All right, so yeah, you, you guys are headed into this uh, temple yeah. uh, up the stairs. Yeah. Derek, you, you taking a big step? Yeah. Do you danger have any sort sense. of whoa? Well, wait, gotcha. Danger sense. An uncanny sense of when things nearby aren't as they should be, giving <gasps> you an edge when you dodge away from danger. Do I need to dodge away from this? Well, yeah, I guess you're taking your blind step into it, okay. and your danger sense activates, and you're gonna try and do an. Oh, oh God, God. twenty! Twenty! Oh fuck! So yeah, you uh, the you... trap explodes. <laughs> the, the building, the, the whole mountain collapses, <laughs> killing everyone inside. Every, everyone surrenders. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, so I, I guess you. Your awesome sense kicks Walk in. Kick. Yeah, you you hit, oh, you hit the wall. Oh, go. Get a sex with shatter cock real quick. <laughs> yeah, wow. Wow. She didn't notice. Uh, Something really cool like that. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, you see you see that pit that's already been exposed. I'm glad I'm glad that I wasted my 120, <laughs> 120. dice roll on <laughs> doing a backflip over a spike pit. Yeah. It was already yeah. like deployed so that you clearly visible. Yeah, oh. there's a hole in the floor. The spikes at the bottom. So do, you, we, do you tell the rest of the party? There's a spike pit right there. <laughs> and unless you could do sweet backflips, I would recommend avoiding it. <laughs> I won't jump in it. It also appears that there's some sort of pressure device around the edges, too. Huh. Yeah, does someone want to investigate that? Or yeah, I've... So, Dungeon Delver, um, not nearly as cool as Danger Sense. Advantage on perception, investigation, find secret doors, which doesn't seem to be the case. Advantage on saving throws to avoid slash resist traps, resistance to trap damage, search for traps at a normal pace. I don't think any of that really applies here, but I do have investigation. Yeah, roll roll a dice. All right. I'm like, yeah, yeah I'll, I'll poke around, and I'm like, studying the walls, <laughs> smelling a little bit. Weird. Ah, uh, man. Is that a nine? Yeah, fourteen. Right, modifier. It's, well, it's it's actually pretty obvious. It seems like someone might have been through this room before okay. and deactivated the trap. Oh, okay. <laughs> do another backflip. <laughs> so I'll say the trap's already actually been activated. That's why we can see it. Somebody's been here. Right. Uh, so that's either. I guess the orcs came through. That makes sense, right? And 
Is there anyone dead at the bottom of the spike trap? It's a skeleton, so it wasn't a recent oh, death. Okay. Like someone maybe 80 years ago oh, okay. fell down there. Maybe even last week. Like, well, I guess we have the luxury of knowing that somebody stomped through here before we have, so. Well, probably good. Should Just someone stealthily go ahead and I can do that. Yeah. Check not, check I'm, what's going on. I have dark vision. Yeah, there we go. Um, Wait, who's saying that? Doesn't sound like. I mean, I have dark oh, vision. Oh, there we go. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Big titty mini mouth. <laughs> uh, so I'll go to the left. Yeah, is the whole thing dark, Dan? I'm. Well, he said it was. It, it is torches. faintly lit. There's okay. maybe some oh, okay. some fires deeper it's dark deeper day. in. Uh, dark you know, if you really want to see well, you could light up a torch. But we can generally like kind of make it. Uh, yeah, I mean, I'll, I'll take my time on this one. Walk kind of okay. slow. But and you have dark vision. I do. Right? Dark so you're you're good. Absolutely. I don't. That's why I'm asking. Yeah, Mary and I do. Mary, you want to go the other way? Sure. I'll I can press to digitate a ball of light. Sneak around the other way. All right, Mary's going this look, way. Look uh, over there. I hear a dwarf. So you. Whoa. Oh, no. uh -oh. <laughs> what did I just see? Uh -oh. Immersion right shattered. Click. Right click. Uh, oh, man, yeah. Nice job. That's really good. There we go. Cool. Huh? Huh? Axes. Those more traps. Huh? Huh? Okay. All right. Well, I'm getting there. So, so the, the fire, edge? the fire kind of lights up the rest of the dungeon, right? Once we walk, once oh, there's the rest of this room. All right, guys, it's clear. Oh. All right. <laughs> put your stuff and put your defenses down. <laughs> I didn't so say that. I'll be like shaking in my stupid jacket, yeah. like rattling all my stupid '90s electronics, from just like clanking, and I'm like stepping around the pit. Yeah. Like, yeah. Cool. See, so, yeah, this this room has a large tiled floor. It seems to actually be in really good shape. Uh, it, it's held up well over time. Mm -hmm. uh, you you notice there's two uh, axe spin traps that have been also uh, deactivated oh. by somebody. Man, uh, there's also We're similar similar spike pit traps up at the up at the end. Oh, the I bottom see. of the uh, stairs. Yeah. Should we move in? Like live here? <laughs> <laughs> I guess yeah. I guess you can go over there. Hey, if it's rent controlled, <laughs> so I'll be poking around at the traps. Like yeah, these have all been sprung and disarmed. I don't. I don't quite know what's going on here, but somebody somebody went out of their way to disarm every single trap they could find. I guess they wanted to move a large number of people through, so they made it all safe to begin with. Which is not good for what we're about to fight. But it also means that they didn't set the traps after they went through. And they probably didn't care. Mm -hmm. I, I imagine if you're going to cast a world-ending spell, you probably don't sweep the floor on your way in. So, uh, Shatter, while they're talking, Shattercock moves up further. Um, if you wouldn't mind. Uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> obviously, yeah, I can see the trap. So I kind of just jump over the trap, and then I slowly right. oh. start looking up the stairs. Oh, I noticed so the yeah, stair. that, that stair has been caved in. All right. So you found the dead end. This caved in! Ha! <laughs> uh, Sweet the, moves. She's so buoyant. I'll check the lower one. <laughs> right. closest to yeah. Derek. Oh. Okay, all right. All right. All right. I'll move forward into that room. Derek, did you make it? Are you all right? Yeah, it's, I mean, it's not caved in. It looks like it moves into a different room, but it's still pretty dark up there. All right, I'm going to check the middle one. So the Shattercock. Right. What is that? <laughs> Shattercock. Sleeves keep hitting my character jumps, sheet. Jumps over that other <laughs> trap, checks the middle. Whoa. That's okay. Yeah. Immersion. Right click's going to be a thing. Do you know how yeah, far your that. dark vision extends? Like how far That's you can feet. see? 60 feet. Yeah, 60 oh, really? All right. To the nearest uh, well, anyway, so as, as you're as you're rising these stairs, you kind of hear the ch the familiar chattering of the Ishigurons, which were those lizard bird creatures. Oh, right. Mm. Yes. So are you guys are you sneaking? Are you? Yeah, you're kind of you're kind of talking, talking really loudly. We're taking our time. It's stage whisper. Yes. I'm a, I'm naturally stealthy if obscured by a larger creature in front of me, so I'm just hanging behind ah, Derek underneath my tail. Calling you large. <laughs> Everybody else moving up? Or? Yeah. I'm just, I've just yeah. got my laptop open on my hand I'm, and I'm just tapping yeah. away. I'm basically like investigating, seeing if I can pick up context clues as I go yeah. about what's right. going on. All right. So we've got a big old room here. Okay. Uh, Ceilings are about 30 feet tall. Wow. It goes about 80 feet across, actually. Jeez. Wow. Um, and it's, it's lit, so you don't need your dark vision. Got it. It's a temple. Oh, do you want to look? Yeah. Oh. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh. All right. That sort of works. Cool. Strange fog. Or is that blue? <laughs> are those like blue lights? Something. Oh yeah, what or is? That? Is that? So yeah, the. Blah, 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 blah. We'll get is there. Is that the wind again? Water. Because <laughs> it looks like there there are six of those blue things. Three are lit. There were six heads of the. Mm. the god. Good point. We have to solve a puzzle. Got it. I hope so. <laughs> so All right. So you see, <laughs> there's just a giant. Oh, oh fuck. 
Green. Oh. He's bad. Oh, Gron. Gorn. Gron. Gorn. Gorn. It's Gorg. Gaknog. <laughs> this one's Gron. Kababble. Oh, there he is. Oh, he left nice. his gift from beyond the grave. So wait, is that the guy that we decapitated? Moss. Yeah. Oh, no, you, you, this is, you oh, decapitated what? that dude. Oh, Gron. We'll okay. superimpose this. Multiple graphic. layers. He's Multiple layers. Yeah. So fucking cool. <laughs> So, so that was the guy you got earlier. You murdered him. Oh, that yeah. was his ear. Is there a version of him with no head? Oh. <laughs> nope. Damn. Damn it. And that Fucking would be, Napoleon. That would be the guy you see, the, the eye patch moon dog. Challenge. Oh, yeah. Cool. Now I know what he looks like. <laughs> so like Imagination her. engaged. Cool. Alright, so you, you see you see Gron, the the moon dog with the eye patch. He's tending to two Ishigurons that are actually uh, chained to the wall there. Mm -hmm. So there are six spheres in the middle of the sunken floor. Three of them are glowing and pulsing, kind of a muted blue color. Uh, I told you the ceilings are pretty tall. Mm -hmm. This is a pretty, pretty large room. Looks like someone used to do some weird shit in here. Uh, is this like an altar in the middle? Is this a raised platform? Is that the same? Yeah, yeah, there's, there's actually a little bit of water in there. That's not a trap. I don't know. Oh, <laughs> but it's like waist high or something like oh, yeah I'd say it comes up so uh, maybe to the top of your knees or something we should, us? well we should probably well yeah you guys just walked in the room so he turned around and, and he see, he sees you immediately uh oh yeah. shit uh, uh, uh. So, yeah, so he sees are, we in, are we in battle mode and, well hang on. hold on so uh, Gron he Gron, Gron turns and goes oh it's you people huh hmm what did he at least die in battle <laughs> with an axe in his hand he died with an axe <laughs> in his hand. So we could go and join the great battle in the sky. Did you do him that honor? Or am I gonna have to do y'all dirty too? Raxan, what happened to him again? Alright, so he charges it. Yes. <laughs> have you seen this cage? <laughs> so yeah, let's, let's roll for initiative. Oh, shit. I got seven. Ooh, Bruce. Oh, wow. Fifteen. Nineteen. Ooh. Fuck. Five. Six. 2-0. Oh, really? Yeah. 19. Oh, do I have negative ones? Yeah, you got a minus. Oh, I'm sorry, yeah, yeah, I'm sorry, 19. No worries. Well, I'm, I mean, you're still, still fucking nailing top. it. Yeah. Can I get your little card things? I feel like it helps you guys keep track. So Bye -bye. should Adam and I roll again to see who goes first? Oh, yeah, I forgot you got a 19 too. And battle. Uh, so, 10. 6. Raxon goes first. That's perfect, because you did kill his brother. Yeah. And now he gets to kill me. I'm Perfect. No, no, you no. can stand no, your you ground. Strike. Kill him too. Oh, First blood. You well, need to Shaka. join your brother. Oh yeah, he's an orc, right? Yes. Do you yes. get any kind of bonuses hey, for menstrual rage? Yeah. <laughs> menstrual rage. Yeah. <laughs> that would have passed already. Now oh, it's a right. phase of just being. Also, I have. Didn't see premenstrual rage. Yeah. I have that bracer. You gonna pound it with him? You gotta take pound his bracer. You can do team power ups. You could accidentally punch his other fist, huh? And then you guys will both be super strong. This requ uh, requires a phrase, though. You oh, gotta yeah. say it. Oh, yeah. yeah, you kind of have to bond with the guy that you're, oh. you're you're pounding with. Well, I mean, we have something in common. But yeah, if you want to talk to him really well, <laughs> everybody's, everybody's gonna leave that one. Leave that one. You'll home. you'll die for those words. All right, so. That's funny, yeah. Raxon. Raxon, do it. Yeah. Okay. I guess we'll see. I got my second win, but Charge. I'm. Charge. I'm gonna I'm Charge gonna start off with a uh, a Charge javelin down. throw. Damn it. What? No, I, come on, man. I gotta start out strong. So, uh, how far is he? That's oh, here, I'll throw, have grid. I need to throw up that grid. Boom! Boom, all right. Okay. Oh, we actually are kind of um, already there. See, I move up. Sorry. Now, I'll see. Charge him. About there. Well, I'm gonna throw a javelin. Oh. Get into position. Oh. Is this what? thing in the center room a giant column? Does it obscure view, or is yeah. it? Nope. Nope. He said it's like an altar with okay. water in the so middle that's like waist right. high. Okay. So these little these things would be columns going to the ceiling, mm -hmm. but they don't yeah. really seem to be big enough to obscure much. Damn. So I before I throw my javelin, I shout, "Your brother uh, died an honorable death, on accident." And then, <laughs> <laughs> so I roll to throw my javelin. Uh, it's an eighteen. Nice. Yeah. Sure. yeah. You want to look down your here? Tactics. You have a plus five to your roll. Yeah, yeah. So that's for that's javelin. Hold on, for javelin throwing. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Wow. Because he's he's proficient and adds his strength. Wow. Yeah. So I rolled an eighteen. So, so yeah, that hit, that definitely hits. Yay. Uh, okay, and then for damage, I roll a six. And then add three. Okay. It was an accident. 
Two plus straight <laughs> fire. So yeah, your your javelin goes right into his shoulder, sticks in pretty well. Okay. Uh, does up some damage, but this is a this is a tough bastard. Yeah. Kinda so so he, he seems really unfazed by it. He kind of like looks at it. Yeah, and, I'm just trying to wear him down. How many I got javelins do you have left? One left. Oh boy. I agree with so I'm gonna run up here and try to grab and try to grab that blue orb. Oh, sorry, two more. Hmm. Roll a twenty for me. Does it remind you of a particular shape that you're intimate with? So, do you want me to add something to it? What is it? Round, 18. Grabable. I mean, you use all your strength, all your power. It, it doesn't actually move. You know, this thing is cemented into the ground. Do I notice anything about it? Uh, it just continues to pulse. You actually, you see the, you kind of feel, because you kind of rolled badass, the one in the middle there that's not lit up, you kind of see it stirring a little bit. Okay. I, uh, oh, sorry. oh no, I was, I'm gonna use then, uh, I have cunning action where I take a bonus action at the end of my turns in combat, so I can dash, disengage, or hide, so I'm gonna roll for stealth and try to hide then, okay. after this, like in the, the shadows or something like that, if it works. Mm. So, oh, it doesn't, so three plus, uh, ten? Okay, so yeah, oh, sorry, I you're kind of, seven, ten. there's maybe some slight shadows, those, those, uh, orbs are really lighting up the room, so you're kind of like hunkering down and near a wall. <laughs> okay, so I, I just I think I'm hidden, but yeah. I'm not. I that's called power. <laughs> yeah. Is that light or flame? Uh, it is light, kind of coming out of an orb. Okay, um, I'm gonna cast no flames. Uh, I'll move up with just a touch and cast acid splash nice. on Gron. Nine plus. So it's 15, the roll of 15 to it. So does it hit? Yes. Okay. Uh, five. Five damage? Yeah. So yeah, your your acid splashes up on his armor, starts to burn it away a little bit, gets to his skin. Great. Uh, also doesn't seem to phase him too much. It, it's kind of pissing him off. Like, he likes it. He, oh, he This is battle. This okay. is his thing. He's he's feeling it. He's All twisted. Right. Right. Derek. All right. I'm going to run up. Uh, over here, and I have three axes now. I'm gonna take the one that isn't Orc Ripper. I'm gonna throw it at him. Cool. Uh, Eleven plus bud, your dex probably. You can uh, use strength as well since it's a melee so weapon that you're throwing. Sixteen hits. Uh, all right, it's one d six. Six. Damn. Should have thrown Orc Ripper. Oh, it's Gron's turn. How many characters can an, an enemy kill in a single turn? Uh, that would depend on the enemy. Mm. Uh, some enemies can multi-attack. Oh. Um, some can do shit loads of like you're fighting a dragon. That thing could kill everybody in a turn. All right, well that's good to know. All right. He's looking to die. Not looking to. Preparing for. It's the only way right. out. Yeah. So <laughs> Gron takes a step this way. Oh no, I knew, do that. I knew no, no, no. he was gonna do Unchains it. Unchains that guy. <sighs> Throw cheese at it. <laughs> <laughs> and then takes a step over here and hurls a uh, actually pulls the javelin oh, out of shit. his arm, uh -oh. turns around and hurls it right back at Fuck that's the Oh you can try and catch it. I'll that's the try. Move ever. Oh, man, that'd be awesome if you got it. <laughs> fourteen hit, swallow it. Which is fourteen it's four oh my armor class. Uh seventeen. Okay, so the the javelin kind of clinks off your armor. And goes flying a couple feet. Oh, lands behind you. Can I grab it midair? Yeah, sure. You, you <sighs> I grab got it, it midair. Great. Actually, nice. roll it. Roll a twenty. Oh no. Sure. Yeah. Like Slap it roll next. For that shit. Uh, oh. Okay. Sorry. You tried. You actually tried to grab it, and it went right through your hand. Uh, pierces. <laughs> oh my hand. <laughs> like hits it, and it alters the trajectory. Goes yeah. into me. <laughs> All right, Decker. Uh. Okay. So. How do reactions work? You have to declare it, and then you get to cast it if- so, Yeah, there's a whole bunch of different reactions, but probably what you're talking about with a spell is, oh, he steps here and I'll do this spell to him. So this is this is a spell for myself, shield, so it's it's a reaction spell. So I don't know, can I just say, oh, I cast shield if I get attacked? So yeah, if he comes after you, and you, you would be like, oh, Gron comes after me and swings at me, I would cast shield. Okay. As a reaction. All right, so that is what I plan to do if I get swung at. Um, <laughs> So let's see here. One, two. Go. He is the chosen. <laughs> Start levitating. Oh man, you're close. Yeah, he's right oh, in there. Boy. Oh no. Suicide mission. Started, let's oh, pick it on him. Please, take her now. I'll show you. Grimo sees us in the corner of Zion. He... No, he's too busy hiding in the shadows. <laughs> he's half uh, yeah. 
Um, I'm gonna cast Thunder Wave, which is something I can never cast <gasps> because everybody's always around. Thunder Wave. So, oh, um, each creature in a 15 foot cube originating from you must make a Constitution saving throw. On a failed save, creature takes 2d8 thunder damage and is pushed 10 feet away from you. On a successful save, creature takes half as much damage and isn't pushed. God, this works. So do I? What kind of saving throw was it? Um, was Constitution. The... Which, All right. So what's yeah. your uh, spell save? It's on your second page there. Yeah. 13? Thirteen. All right. Constitution. Yeah. He's probably got a lot of constitution. See, so yeah, a Gron saves. Oh no. What about the two creatures? So this guy, this guy gets hit. This guy and this guy save. So what was the damage for the hit guy? 2d8, um, I think. Yeah. 2d8? 2d8 thunder damage, yeah. This used to be one and of And then the other guys get half. Yeah. So I love let's thunder see. wave. So I'm rolling the two first. Alright. So that's... Four, four and seven. seven. Eleven. Yeah, eleven. All right. And the other guys will just take half that, yeah, actually. So just won't. Oh, so I don't re-roll for them? No. Oh, okay. You just roll once for the spell. That makes sense. Not when it's Rounded pushed up, ten right? feet. Yeah, yeah. six. <laughs> and then one of those. Well, creatures... he's still chained up, poor fucker. Oh, so he doesn't get pushed to ten feet. Uh, up to Dan. Is my uh, yeah, so well, his, his chain's got ten feet on it, so yeah, oh. he'll, he'll fly back. <laughs> All right. You could snap its neck. Yeah, that'd be nice. Dan. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Dan. I really want to know if this is the final battle or not. If this is not the final battle. Yeah, so he's gonna be a fucking guy. god. We have to fight. He's yeah, gonna get possessed by. I'm saving my spells. Ravon. Yeah. All right, Miri, what are you up to, buddy? I'm gonna. Run from way back there. Yeah, and I make up as much ground as I can, kind of settle in right behind Rack's hand and whatever I can move five squares. And I'm going to cast Aid, which bolsters allies with increased five HP or adds five HP to their maximum, up to three people. Kills you over a course of like 30 years. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's the trade off. Takes it from the end of your life. <laughs> yeah. Hair gets a little more gray every mm. time. Yeah, um, you gotta yeah. take pills. So you're getting five Aww. HP to to I guess to, to three. three. I don't, I don't, I don't think I don't think anyone's missing HP. Well, you get but it adds. Yeah, oh, it cool. Okay. It adds to the max. Yeah. Yeah. Decker. yeah I, since Decker's in range, and I'm really worried about Decker. Yeah. I'm gonna don't worry about I'm gonna me. buff Decker, uh, Raxan, and Grimo's cowering Dirk. doing this. Right. <laughs> Please, Grimo. Yeah, you're really Deckering it right now. So Raxan, Derek, and Decker. Yeah. Nice. Gosh, right so on. <laughs> All right, so uh, monsters are going to be the Ishigurons. Uh, okay. That's just so it's easy for everyone. This, one. this one's going to go straight at Nyrick. Oh, ah! Ah, ah! <laughs> it even, it even kind of it takes a step up on the, on that ridge right there, and it's it's kind of in the air coming cool. at you. Oh boy. Um, uh oh. Nine doesn't hit, does it? No. Okay. Uh, so you do uh, kind of a cool dodge move, and the thing tumbles to the ground. Nice. This one's gonna snap right back at Derek. Oh, Sweet. oh, oh Decker. 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 Too many D's. Yeah. I don't know. Uh, hmm. Here comes the shield. <clears throat> Maybe. Seven for Gron. Yeah. Fourteen. Yeah, that hits. Ooh. Yeah. But you did. You said you had a shield as a I'm reaction. I'm not gonna cast it now, though. Okay. I'm gonna save it in case Gron gets mad at me. All right. I can't wait till the moment that Decker has to hold up his laptop to oh, like no. stop an attack and the whole <laughs> yeah. thing shatters. It's the last connection to Ohio. Uh, Actually, I have a plan. Oh, I can't wait to see. I like when we come up with cool moments. So in eight our head and damage. Someone else at the table goes, "What if this happens?" <laughs> sorry, <laughs> sorry, I didn't mean it that way. So yeah, way. That, that that guy with his bite comes right at your chest and uh, uh, oh takes a goodness. giant chunk out of Is you. Is my cell phone oh. okay? <laughs> it wasn't okay. Uh. <laughs> Did the boost from Miri okay. help at all? Oh yeah, of course. That's, the, that's why he's our leader. All right, yeah, Raxon. Come on, Raxon. Behead this guy. Fuck something Ended. up, buddy. Yeah. All right. So I do a cool combat roll. Yeah. Oh, sorry. I just, I just move forward, basically. Oh, oh. Damn it! <laughs> Don't be afraid of the combat roll. Fine combat roll. Acrobatics are part of the panache. Yeah. All right. I roll for. Combat also, roll. do you have to roll to keep the heads on your head while you're rolling? <laughs> roll there, for heads. We'll see I mean, how the roll does. I, at this point, I've lost all control of those heads. They kind of just do what they want. Mm. Uh oh. So they're being, they're like, it's like a Does it right? recognize his brother? His yeah. What? Does the head recognize its brother? Oh, wait. wait. Oh, yeah. I'm, yeah, wearing, I'm, wearing, wearing, I'm wearing his brother's head, by <laughs> oh, the way. Oh, shit. Yeah, yeah, he, might, not, he might see that now. Oh, shit. He's <laughs> okay. Uh, combat roll. That Fuck. magnificent tumbling bastard's wearing my brother's head. Oh, 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 so, yeah, that, that's Perfect the most badass roll, roll yeah. executable if Excellent. you want to tell us how it happens. Uh, yeah, so. Huh. Man, so good. <laughs> <laughs> so, almost like a breakdance fight, oh, I rolled forward and, like, 
put my head up oh, this to is the brother. <laughs> yeah. And I was just like, I'll just kind of like, what? Oh, wow, you're taunting. Yeah, and then I kind of moonwalked a little bit backwards oh, oh, yeah. to get into position as I raised my Michael axe Jackson. to bring it right into his head. Slips cool. right out of your hands. Um, <laughs> But now I have to roll for a hit. Yeah. Fuck. Yeah. <laughs> you can do it twice. But advantage, though. He's intimidated, twice. right? He has to be a little freaked out by that sweet right. roll. He's, I think he's more entertained. Like, oh. There's, no, there's an ally. Doesn't he get advantage uh, he, for that? They're not close enough. You've got oh. that. You've also got your inspiration. Yeah, you got inspiration. If you use it now? It's up to you. It's a bad yeah, I mean, I well, think that that deserved inspiration We do have to itself. fight a god next. You know, that little combat roll get inspiration. Roll. Super sweet oh. roll. Why not? Why yeah. not? Oh. I spend one. I there one we back. go. All right. All right. Yeah. We're done. Roll again. Yay. For that great let's axe. Just, let's see if you do this. Oh, Please. Oh, that's better. Uh, that's plus. Good. Plus, <laughs> plus five. Yeah, yeah you got good. it. Oh. Yes. Better. Better. You got him. Oh, okay, and then I got to throw the twelve. <laughs> Oh, that's a five. I like how Adam Plus chooses seven. not to wear his glasses for D&D. &D. <laughs> yeah, so it's just five? For, it's just for reading. <laughs> Monitors. Uh, <laughs> plus three slashing, yeah, eight <laughs> damage. <laughs> Nothing but reading. <laughs> what? what you, well, I mean, it's not a computer monitor. No. Ah. Yeah, nerd. <laughs> <laughs> for driving. So he, he took eight damage. So he's yeah, yeah. He's, he's taking some damage, yeah. but he's he's like loving it. Like, yeah. this is his shit. I mean, the, he, the, the head of his own brother didn't... Oh yeah, so yeah, you, you'll have a reaction to that when it I'm, comes to his. I'm head. wearing the the bracer uh, <laughs> that so he has the other one of chunks of your brother's skin. Just mm, happened to be yeah, there. and I'm wearing his brother upon a, like another lesser decaying orc. Mm. It's two heads. I look like a Team Fortress character. <laughs> um, no intimidation. He's he's still having a good time. Oh yeah, yeah. we'll see how he reacts when it's his turn. Remo. Uh oh. Oh, Defend no. me, brothers! <laughs> and then Grimo what? tries to grab that that oh, unlit yeah. orb. Oh, yeah, you're across the room. <laughs> Defend me! Yeah, no, no. <laughs> Why are you getting not attacking? It's like first so time to grab I need help. Sure. Yeah. Does he grab it, or do I need to roll for it? Yeah, let's roll a dice. See okay. what happens. Be very bad. Boy, so boy, ten nice. plus. What would you like to add? Your strength modifier. Oh, okay. So my strength. Yeah, snatching. What do you have in the snatch? So I, I mean, I got sleight of hand. Oh. My and. This is a man. All right, any, okay, I'm sorry. Don't worry about it. The, the thing's stuck in there. This thing stuck is cemented there, to but the But it, it sort of wiggled the last time, huh? Well, you, like it was like rumbling, like like it's a, almost an earthquake like or, shaking or something. Like but not popping out. Yeah. Those okay. things don't want to move. They seem to be there. Keep pulling. Yeah, we need you, we need Keep, you for on the attack. Try them all. I need you <laughs> trying every trying. single one. Yeah. Yeah. You can also, <laughs> I mean, he I could loop going on behind here. and just shank trying you. Trying to find the elegant solution. I'm trying to... Yeah. Um, Just tap something twice. Well, I guess I'm going to use that, that cunning bonus action to run and jump and hide in the water. Oh, oh my gosh. You ran across the room, hid, said protect me, and then belly flopped my, into the water. My, oh, my I, hero. I have to roll for stealth on the cunning action. Yeah. I hope he drowns. So 19 <laughs> and then no my 7 stealth. Yeah. No oh, splash, no nothing. Wow. So does no, anything, no, Olympic wow. anything yeah. happen Just when I go in that water? Uh, yeah, you regain all lost hit points. What? Whoa. I didn't even lose any. Wow. Oh, oh, shit. Grimo, what wait. happened? You're not thirsty anymore. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I could change a billion tampons. <laughs> <laughs> Good thing, because I've got a billion of them. Yeah, oh. we, we need to keep Shattercock out of that pool. Yeah. <laughs> um, <laughs> a shark. <laughs> okay, I guess I'm, I'm hiding in the water. Cause okay. I, cause I, yeah. How does how do cantrips work again? You, you can you cast do whatever you want. Over and over and constantly. Over. Yeah, uh, acid splash again. Acid um, splash. Yeah, we're gonna do acid splash again. That means we gotta <gasps> we gotta keep Gron out of that pool. Like a terrible roll. Um, push him was in. that for damage or attack? That's for that's for Is attack. Um, Thirteen. Against who? Uh, Gron. Uh, sorry, no. So yeah, the the however the acid splash is going kind of splits off his armor yeah. and does does nothing but kind of give him a little smirk. Balls. Would, would that have hit the bird though? I know that's what I was thinking about, but damn. Uh, um, I'm going to do a double axe attack on this bird that's nipping at me. Right on. So the your primary hand you'll get your bonuses to. Uh, your secondary, the second attack is just the straight up roll. You don't get any sort of bonuses. So to it. okay, so what? What do you mean? So you would get. So the first one you add your proficiency and your strength. Yeah. And the second one you would just add your proficiency, gotcha. and not your strength. Gotcha. I think that's right, and that's what we're gonna go with right so now. So <laughs> eleven plus five on Hits. my right hand. All right. And then it would just be, you want me to roll again for the other hand, or? Uh, we'll just say it hits. Yeah. Okay. Let's get through this fight. So they both they both hit. 
And that's a D6. Come on, Derek. Five. Nice. Five. Nice. nice. So that was five. Ten total damage to that Whoa. little thing. You didn't add in, you had your mods? I don't have any. The, uh, the orc ripper is against orcs. Okay. I don't have anything right. against bird things. Ten, ten's good damage. <laughs> Lawrence is just sort of <clears throat> looking at the other one. Yeah. How are so, you? Yeah, the, do I go or do you go? That, that one is is bleeding profusely, just Ooh. gushing gushing blood. Kind of looks weak. Not doing <laughs> it's a so shatter hard. Gun. Yeah. <laughs> uh, they they kind of like, share I'm a like, nod of understanding, yeah. uh, even though like, they are sworn ah. enemies. <laughs> just chopping. Uh, so so Gron looks right into Raxon's eyes oh, and goes, "I look forward to drinking your blood, human." Uh, and uh, swipes at you with his his huge fucking. Has sword. he noticed his brother's head yet? I think yeah, yeah. 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 He, he sees what's going on. Does not care for this guy. Yeah. Sounds like he's like you've met your match here because he's crazy just like you are. It's a great showdown. Yeah, yeah. he's flicking his tongue. He's like, <laughs> yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. The difference is I killed his brother <laughs> <laughs> without trying. That's true, good point. <laughs> I tripped and your brother died. <laughs> yeah. What are you gonna do, yeah. big man? <laughs> okay, yeah. So uh, he's he's swinging at you. Yeah. Uh, s- Twenty. Three hit? That's high. That is. Yeah, I'm does. down to two health. No, 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 no. <laughs> no, no, no. That was for hit. Yeah. Oh, oh. That's hit. higher than 17, so you got hit. So he, he hits you once, actually swings back around, gets to get you a second time. Oh, uh, a 12, 18 hits, yeah. probably. Yeah. Alright, so yeah, nine damage. Oh, uh-huh. that's not bad. Don't forget about still I got that plus five. I'm and fine. You got the pool. Oh, so if I dive in that pool, it heals me? Yeah. Oh, you can fuck, change my awesome. tampons. <laughs> Uh, do I we just, do we know about that? Like, yeah, that's, that's why I asked Remo in character. Reloading oh. bullets. Yeah. What happened? Uh, I feel like I could change a million tampons. <laughs> gotcha. Implying that because I didn't, you know, I Tampon. didn't have any hit points to recover. Right. Gronk from uh, getting to the water you though. Caught too. up. Exactly. And Gronk. If only had somebody had said that five minutes ago. <laughs> I was reading about my character. Sorry. <laughs> why didn't you have your glasses? Actually, I'm sorry. I have, a, I have a signet ring, and I was just trying to figure out like, what does that do? <laughs> I don't know. Uh, Gronk wasn't in the book, so. Gronk actually. Oh, it's just. You, you took the signet ring. No, I, I, it was in my um, mm-hmm. items initially. I was just, it doesn't say oh, what it There does. might have been one earlier. I thought but, yeah. gave it to anyway, you. Anyway, there was actually a, a, there was two more damage. Oh, it should be 11. Okay. Uh, Gron has a feature called Brother's signet, Fury, but, which ah. gives him a, bo- a slight bonus to his melee attacks. Ooh. Okay. But his brother's dead, so. Yeah. so. That's why he has the Fury. Decker? Oh. Um, it's like Jet Li's the one, basically, but with orcs. I've never seen it. Can you explain it to me in full detail from the beginning? Absolutely. <laughs> There's a lot of new metal in that. So I'm going to go here. Cast. That Yushi Euron was like engaged in battle with you, so if you step away, you will take attack an of attack, at, uh, yeah. attack of opportunity. Okay. Um, does. Shit. Does, does. You can take an action called disengage, which would be your action, but it means you can retract from uh, a fight without taking that hit. Does a, does a reaction count as an action? So if I take the reaction. Oh, I see. But you shield. Can the I reaction then move a reaction. And do something? No, you can do both. Okay, so I'll do that. I'll take the attack of opportunity. Okay, you'll let him swing at you. Yeah, so I'll, I'll like look out of the side of my eye at, at Remo yelling about tampons, <laughs> and then I'll. Uh, All right, does eighteen hit? Yeah, so I'll cast shield. Uh, an invisible barrier of magical force appears and protects you till the start of your next turn. You have plus five bonus to AC, including against the triggering attack, and you take no damage from magic missiles. So that puts so. me up to. 17. What is a tie? I hit 18. Oh, shit. <laughs> Close there. Shield! Oh, yeah. It just goes straight through. <laughs> uh, okay, I guess I get hit then. And so this was his claw. He kind of swiped at you with his little, you know, dino arm thing. <laughs> should have okay. done the math before I decided that. <laughs> Six damage. Okay. Get to the pool, Decker! He's down to one. It'll make yeah, it feel Oh, boy, better. he's down to one. Uh, uh, I already moved. Can I move somewhere else? <laughs> technically, technically, every you're still there, right? Yeah, you. you, you this, we had oh. to rewind time to do the sure. shit stuff. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Ow. All right. All right. So did uh, you disengage? Sorry, I zoned out. No, no, I did. No. He Wait. tried to cast a shield. Yeah. He cast shield. shield. He attack of opportunity. He cast a shield. It went through the shield. Then what? But you still have the high AC, right? For it was for that attack. Until my next turn. Yeah. For that attack. Well, no, it says until my next turn. Yeah. So, but you know, if I get attacked again, great. So yeah, I'll be like, holy fuck. <laughs> so I'm in here. And then my action will be to cast Unseen Servant. Uh, oh, little invisible man. Oh, little guy. All right. And I'll just splash oh, down thing. in that water. Oh, yeah. Forget about him. Does the water affect any of Decker's electronics? <laughs> it actually doesn't affect him at all. Okay. Oh, shit. Oh, I don't get yeah. healed? Sorry. Great. Oh, no. Uh, 
Oh man, I hope no. Grimo didn't use the one healing property of that oh, pool no. water. <laughs> the pool's oh, starting no. yellow. Oh, so it only heals once? We don't know. That's the thing. We uh, can't have all the answers. tampons that Grimo was carrying just all yeah. full. <laughs> so they're all, un so they're all unusable. Give me those you can <laughs> squeeze it. <laughs> <laughs> they're all unusable. Took a few under my armpits. <laughs> <laughs> all right, those Miri. Those aren't the ones from Miri, the fountain. What are you doing, buddy? <laughs> oh, <laughs> shit. Uh, okay, so... I'm gonna run over toward Gron. Fuck, man. If it doesn't heal everybody, I just wasted two spells in a row. Yeah. And okay. took a lot of damage. Let's settle okay. there next oh, to Raxan, because okay. I see him over there by himself now, getting hit. And I want to use my fighting style, which is protection. And that's when a creature I can see attacks someone other than me within five feet. I can impose disadvantage on that attack. I must have a shield, which I do. Cool. So, so you, you're I'm, imposing disadvantage on Gron? Yeah, I'm anticipating him attacking Raxan further. Nice. So, so caring about everyone. He's strategic, too. He's like, you're <laughs> like our Cyclops. I haven't used my fighting style yet, so I'm excited. Oh, do you have healing potions? Excellent. All right. I do, but I didn't have any action. So the, this guy snaps at Derek again with his, his big old bite. 23 hit. Yep. <laughs> Ten damage. Okay. So he, he, I guess he takes a nice, huge bite into your midsection. Mm, hot. <laughs> <laughs> All right, and uh, this guy will take a step up at the uh, little dwarf oh, uh, and try and swipe at it. Oh. Um, oh no. That was a one. Let's we'll say he 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 swipes at you with so much of his might that he actually kind of topples over and is fallen prone. Um, so he's he's now actually laying on the ground next to you, prone. I just scratch his belly. <laughs> <laughs> Put him to sleep. You get, you get his leg going. Yeah. Uh, Raxon. Okay. Uh, so I need to take one of my potions. Because <laughs> I don't trust that water. So does that that count as a move? Or That's a bonus action. Okay. <clears throat> and I switch to my fighting style, which is defense. So while I'm wearing armor, I gain uh, plus one of my um, armor class. That should actually already be built in. Like oh, that's just built all in? All the time you have. Oh, okay. I thought because Peek mentioned his. I didn't know if I had to, like, equip it. Uh, cool. Um, I do have second wind, though. So I have a limited well of stamina, so I can draw on to protect yourself from harm. You can use the bonus action to regain hit points. Oh, equal to that. Oh, so I can gain... Wait, I can regain hit points. So I can actually just roll for hit my hit points to get them back. So I probably don't even With second my wind? Potion. If you, yeah. If you want to take that back. Yeah, I'd like. Uh, yeah, maybe I don't need to use a potion completely. So I need to roll a, a d10. I think it's a little fifty, eighty, like the higher. Yeah, it's, oh, the, it's one, the really yeah. freaky one. Okay, I'm gonna roll uh, to get hit points equal to this. Okay, so. And it's that plus your level, I think. Oh, is it? Is that what it says? My level's two. Yeah. Okay, so I got uh, eight hit points back. Cool. Fantastic. Because nice. I lost eleven. So that's your bonus action if you want to do no, anything I else. Uh, I would like to attack. Murder. Uh, Derek, you need help? No, I'm good. Okay. Uh, Mary? Uh, Get a bird on you. Maybe. I'm just in the midst of thinking he's going to hit you right now. Yeah, so there's, a, there's a giant guy with a large weapon. I know. Hang over here. I got it. Okay. <laughs> going for the big man. I got it. <laughs> I got it. Okay. Rolling for attack. Uh, great axe attack. It's a four. <laughs> Fuck me. You got inspiration over there. Oh, That's real spicy. Yeah. <laughs> it's too Let's use it. Yeah, Look into your heart. Yeah. Yep. Do a head spin. Yep. Come on, Raxon. Please. There we hey. go. Oh. 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 Plus. Oh, sweet. So yeah, your, your first swing kind of clangs off of him, and deep within yourself, you know you can do so much better than that. And you yeah. spin around and hack at him. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, and then so I roll what for damage. Uh, that, uh, I keep forgetting. My 12, okay. 12 plus the slashing. Please. Uh, cool. That's uh, 10 damage. On Gron. On Gron. All right, so he's he's actually starting to feel it a little he bit. He's be. breathing a little heavy. Taking like kind of 20 Gushing damage. from wounds all over the place. Cool. Uh, but he is into murdering you. Yeah, no shit. <laughs> so I'm lying on my back in the water. I have the spear that I took from Saite. Saite. And I, at first I thought, I was, I was like, man, maybe it wasn't right what we did to Saite. But now I'm thinking, man, that was the best decision I ever made, <laughs> taking that spear from him. So I, I tossed the spear at that 
creature that's perched on the edge of the pool. Okay. So you you kind of like pop out of the pool. Well, I'm I'm sliding on my back and I just do one of those. From under the water or like? So the spe the spear is above the water and I'm I'm in okay. the water and I just do that. All right. So advantage because you're you were stealthing and hiding. Uh, yeah, I don't know. If, I guess I was hidden. So oh, she's I, playing water polo. I guess it would be my sneak <laughs> attack. Oh, oh, nice oh it, Cock. it rolled do with it again. the. That's a nineteen. So eleven. One, Oof. but then I have a natural reroll All on right. the ones. Let's just keep rolling. Ooh. So ten. So I guess eleven, and then plus I don't really have the stats for the spear. Oh, um, do you have? Uh, my attack bonus on my other weapons is five, but I don't know if you had something do you know for Saite. You're Saite. proficient in spears. No, I, I, no. <laughs> You're not, or you don't know. I'm proficient in simple weapons, right. and I don't we'll, know if that we'll is considered you, a spear. Add your strength or dex bonus, whichever one is biggest. So five. All right. Um, so, so sixteen. Sixteen. All if right. it hits him. Sixteen hits. Oh, nice. And damage for the spear, if you're throwing it, is four. Uh, uh, excuse me, d6 plus your dex mod. No, plus your strength. So uh, five, and then my strength is, is negative. Er, yeah, my strength so have, is negative one. Is your dex better? Uh, I, I mean, I'll take whatever it is. It's, it's yeah, I mean, you're throwing it, so it, it's, a, it's a melee weapon that you can throw, so you can use whichever one you yeah. want. Yeah. Uh, I'll, I guess my dex is, is plus five, my strength is negative one. Let's use that plus five. So, ten then, I guess. Nice, ten. Okay, so yeah, you, your spear ends that Ishiguron, if you'd like to oh describe what, yes. in which what, what way that happens. Um, so I, I toss the spear, and I'm thinking like, man, like that's Saite, great guy after all. Like, <laughs> I got the spear from him, wonderful. Uh, the, the spear hits the beast, beast crumples. I spit out the water that I had had in my mouth, and then I put a put a cigarette in its place. <laughs> Can we have a quick flash of what Saite is doing right now? <laughs> yeah, I would love that. But he's stuck Limping in a tree. Like he's, he's got that stick uh, in his arm. He's kind of like black, thrashing around. If only he, he had a spear to like wedge himself yeah. out. He's still there. There's like a wolf attacking him. He's like, Fuck. <laughs> um, all right, so I'm gonna Man. I'm gonna go six squares over to the furthest issue you're on. One, two, three. Any help I'm put me over here. Wall, no, no, not that close. Oh. Uh, right there, yeah. Exactly. Will you flip that one? And then, uh, oh, oh yeah. I got it. Um, and then I'm gonna. And Stefan. Nice. <laughs> nice. Yeah. That's yeah. Sick. So it says versatile one d eight. What does that mean? So versatile is uh, one hand. You would have the whatever the first damage is. If you grab it with two hands, I can grab it with two. Then you get you get the extra damage. Yeah, I'll, I'll do two handed, and I'm also proficient in quarter staffs, so I'm assuming oh, this is a quarter staff. Yeah, yeah. Staff. So you would add your proficiency bonus, which is two, and your strength bonus, which is uh, not negative minus two. two? Yeah, negative. All right, so yeah, it balances out. Zero whatever you roll. Um, but this is this is for attack first, yeah, yeah. right? Fourteen. Um, Fourteen hits. Okay, fantastic. Uh, and then I'm rolling a one d eight. Which would be this guy? Ten. Ten, because oh, you're using two hands. Oh, well, it's, no, a, it's, it's a 1d8 one one for two hands. Yeah, 1d8 for two hands. One. Does that get modified by strength? Or is it just 1d8? Uh, well, it would, it no, would be it plus matter. his strength, plus his proficiency, and his strength is negative. Oh, it's just zeroes out. Okay. So. I didn't know if that affected damage or not. Oh, oh, boy, that, that was awesome. I'll take it. Eight. 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 <laughs> 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 fucking trick throw. It looked like it banked off your pinky. I don't know. I didn't touch my hand. That was weird. Oh. All right, so it's got eight damage. Oh yeah, so yeah, that thing is fucked up. It's still laying prone on the ground. Right. Uh, you know, your belly. stick whapped it right in the, the middle uh, and and broke a couple of ribs. So it's it's starting to wheeze and cry. Uh, Derek. All right. Um, Need I, help. The, I have blood. I reach down. And I feel the blood, and then like my eyes go crazy, and I go into a rage. All oh, rage. So now I'm all raged out, uh, and then I charge at him. With my both my hand axes. This guy? Yeah, I'll just okay. go to the right of uh, yeah. Rex in there, and I'm gonna take two swipes at him. Okay. With my rage. I'll, I'll say you've got advantage because he's so fucking surrounded by you guys. Do I get right a double now. advantage? Because that I'm doesn't raged. exist. Just one <laughs> advantage. <laughs> oh, oh nineteen. Shit. Oh my god. Uh, Sixteen. So both of those hit. Okay, so yes. nineteen, and then I'm gonna use the orc ripper. Yes. And him. Cool. This is 1d6. Nice. A six. six. Mm. Right, so nice. 10. And then I, this is the other axe. 
Wow. Ooh, oh. 16. So I get pissed. I touch myself. 16 total. Fuck. I get pissed off, and then I come charging at him, and then I just start chopping. Um, <laughs> when you're done with him, you know what I... <laughs> you you're done with him. I need a new head. Yeah. Uh, There's some bits in there I want to salvage. <laughs> so yeah, Gron is... He's really doing poorly now. You uh, really fucked him up with the, the orc ripper All and right. double damage and whatever you nice. did. Raging. Did you add your plus two? What? Don't you get a plus two to damage? I mean, the only thing raging? I get with the... Oh, yeah, because I'm raging. Yeah, I do get plus two. Damn. My rage plus. Oh, shit. 18. Wait, is that plus two per? I was going to say per. per uh, no, we'll give no, him one. I think he it's gets total one. damage. Okay, right. Yeah. 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 <laughs> oh, oh, my gosh. Just turn it to paste. <laughs> yeah, right? I tried. All right, yeah. it's, it's Gron's turn now. That All right. Gone. Oh, you, you oh. can flip that issue, Gron. Oh, is this out? It's no, no, no. Oh, no. it's not dead. dead. It's still, oh. he, he's, got, he's, he's laying on the ground, <sighs> but not dead. We can still torture it. <laughs> yes, you can. Interrogate. Question him. I, mean. yeah, I don't torture animals. Sure, no, that's, that's cruel. So uh, Gron stares deeply into Raxon's eyes and, and goes, I love you. And swings at you. <laughs> Derek's the one who, uh... Yeah. So, yeah He's huh. fucking weird, I don't know. That's fine. I like him. I do too. All right, his, so his first attack completely swings and uh, misses. Uh, but then he, he, he turns around and uh, crits you. Oh, yeah. Ooh, boy. Um, does my it's gonna be the thing over there. Does my get pushed into the fighting ground. style disadvantage play into that, Dan, at all? Oh shit! So I was trying to protect ah. Raxan. Oh, I forgot about the disadvantage. It's just heads and ankles. Sorry. No worries. Oh, 19. Oops. Oh, it would have been. He sweet. tried. <laughs> um, you moved his blade just ever so slightly. Yeah. <laughs> so that was 12 damage. Uh, with with his second swing back around, oh. uh, right into Raxon's <laughs> like, Miri, thigh. I don't as it says, the blade comes down. Miri goes, "I will protect you." It's <laughs> 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 the hip. I'm too short. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Decker. It sees it happening with bloodshot eyes. Okay, come on, Decker. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna request humbly request a bit of a retcon here. So I cast, <laughs> I ca and I know it takes time, I'm, I apologize. I cast Unseen Servant, thinking that my little dude would splash healing water on people. But given that the oh. water's not healing, and the second that I hit the water, I would not have cast, but I declared that before I jumped in the water. So I don't know if you want to roll that back or not, or if I just have a useless, invisible man standing there. <laughs> I could steal his wallet. <laughs> sure. Maybe the water will work They're going to loot this corpse as soon as we're done with it anyway. So you splash into that water, and you probably would not have cast the Servant had you realized it wasn't doing any healing. Kind of, yeah. So I'll, I'll give that to you. Thank you. Because uh, I'm trying to get this done. Yeah. <laughs> okay. I'll cast Firebolt. No, no, I'll drink a... Uh, I'll I'll get up and be like, what the fuck is with this water? I thought you said it... Maybe it's, it's got too many people in it. Maybe because I was in here alone at work. <laughs> I'll uh, rifle in my, my sweet coat for a healing potion. Too many right. nerds in the pool. So that's, that's <laughs> that's, that's, <laughs> two like, D4 plus like two. I'm splashing regular okay. water on this wound. It's not working, it's not working. <laughs> One. Okay, so that's seven. seven. All right, tip top. Uh, then then I'll, I like all the documents. Yeah, <laughs> a lot of pages. Mages are complicated. I'll just like flop out of the pool, <laughs> <laughs> and then just drink it over there. All right, that's my turn. All right, uh, Miri. Wait, was it eight hit points? Seven. Seven. Yeah. Okay. Miri, get so, it. Uh, I think. I'm gonna use Cure Wounds on Raxan. Thank you. I just saw him take a huge hit. I'm concerned. <laughs> Love you too. Always thinking of others. I know. Yeah. <laughs> He's keeping me alive. I mean, well, I'm trying to. I'm no, you're doing a great job. Also, anytime he tries to attack, he gets one of us hurt. <laughs> that was one time. One D eight plus spell casting modifier. That's eight. So four uh, spell casting modifier. What is that? I think it's usually is it, a, is it charisma yeah, it's for a paladin. Charisma. Oh yeah, yeah, that's right. Oh. Which is that uh, zeroes out plus zero, so four. Yeah, it is charisma. So you're healing it for is? a paladin. Okay. Yeah. Do you get four hit points? Yeah, four hit points. Awesome. awesome. Puts me back up to fourteen. It's the monster's turn. Oh. <laughs> that one issue girl on his butt. Oh, cracked ribs. Half dead. Lying on his back. <laughs> 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 uh, so he'll he'll stand up because he was laying down and oh, kind proud of animal. and kind of hobble. <laughs> uh, oh, I guess he's engaged, sort of with Miri. He'll he'll use whatever little strength he's got. It's pretty pitiful, but he like moves his head to oh, try and out. bite at Miri. Like, moves it under your foot so you can stomp on his neck. Just do it. Does 13 hit? 
No. Yeah, he's got an insane AC. All right. Even without my shield. Sad little movement. All right, Raxon. Woo! You feel um, better now. Yeah, I'm feeling much better. Um, first, I turn to Mary and go, "Thanks, buddy." Thanks, <laughs> sure. Buddy. Thank you, friend. Wear his head as a second hat. Well, I give him a little wink, like, "Hey, like, want to catch a drink after this? You let me know." Oh. In a bro kind of yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right on. Dwarves are stout. Yeah. Yeah. And a lot of high armor class. <laughs> It's short, but it's long, and they can take. Paladins shot. start with chainmail. I would. That's what it is. Yeah. Oh. You better defend yourself. Okay. Nobody's yeah. judging. Uh, all right, so I'm just rolling for my great axe attack. Yeah. Uh, oh, so I just rolled just to attack. Uh, which? Is, fuck. You got any inspiration? <laughs> <laughs> what is it? I, I think you have another inspiration, don't you? No, he doesn't. Oh. What? All right, so yeah. Well, well I, have my, I have my second wind. Yeah, yeah, you do. That does not. Oh, can I? Oh, wait, wait. Got these. You can use this feature. Yeah. Special. Can we use inspiration oh, no, I, I out of turn? The one time. You can give him your inspiration. Yeah. Do you want to give it to me? I'm gonna say, yeah. I just healed him. I'm like really trying to bolster him, so I throw my inspiration <laughs> at him. Oh no! I, I'm, I'm gonna try. Raxan, Raxan, he's our man. <laughs> he can do it. No yeah. one can. He missed. I'm Raxan's, <laughs> I'm Raxan's cheerleader this round. Oh please. Yeah, <laughs> better. Not much better. <laughs> Plus, uh, God, what's that, my initiative? Efficiency. No. I'm being straight everything! Five. Five. Eleven is not enough to hit. Oh, oh, no. No. Oh, no. That peaks. No, no, that's fine. Hey, we tried. It's all oh, good. I'm saying I have so, so one, I have inspiration. One, never no, okay, that's another. enough. That's enough. You I can't would. keep doing this all say, day. Yeah, I can. have to hit him. I'm keep the most... Keep putting gas in that tank. Damn it. So yeah, both of your axe strikes seem to just fly off of his armor. What does Miri do? I just go, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I, I I look back at Mary in a single tear, <laughs> and I just I just mouth. It's blood. <laughs> and Gr Gron just sits there laughing. He's loving it. Green will do it. Uh, so now that Derek has left the water, no, Decker, sorry, Decker, Decker has left the water. Does it, does it fault. regain its properties or is it still defunct? I mean, you're you're all healed up. No, but I was already Stab healed when I got into the water, yeah. so oh, okay. like uh, it's it's not doing it's not anything. okay. I'm really interested in these orbs. Uh, I know. I'm oh so gosh, curious what the so curious what the puzzle is there. Part of me thinks that maybe they represent the heads of the god that are still like present in in the corporal beings on this earth. Well, you have a crossbow, um, right? <laughs> yeah, just kill Ra. <laughs> uh, yeah. I kind of want to pour some water on one of those orbs and see oh if it my works. Gosh. I just like puzzles. I love she's puzzles. Trying, a whole trying, other battle. She's, she's trying to stop the car from going by ripping off the dial on the speedometer. <laughs> <laughs> I just—that's my favorite part of D and D—is the puzzles. The puzzles uh, yeah. Decker gets. Yeah, I, Decker I gets it. I, 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 um, I tell you though, when, Grom, you're, when Grom's anyway, dead, we can I, do all the puzzles. I know. I know. Do whatever you want I'm, to do. I'm just, hey, I'm just, we can roll this back. This I crawled over one of those orbs with wet clothes. Did anything happen? No. So yeah. I'm, I'm just, I'm just giving you guys my stream of consciousness here. What I at least play a thing. We've already tested that. Um. You know, I'm looking at do. this and I see damage, damage, hey. damage. This is Adam hey, gets hey, fucked. Hey, hey. I'm not <laughs> saying I'm not going to attack. I'm just telling you guys what I'm thinking. Yeah, this is. Yes, she killed something the last turn. Yes. I'd and, love for her to do it again. And this Him to do it again. conversation is taking longer than whatever action she was going to do anyway. Well, I'm sorry. So. God forbid I speak for one Screamo no, fan favorite. I'm just kidding. You went into it. I was kidding. Yeah, I'll follow, fire my bow at uh, oh. <laughs> Fire my bow at, at oh. Gron, but you know, I'm, I'm kind of I'm looking at the orb. Oh. <laughs> it should be disadvantage. Nah, it's fine. Nah, it's not. Nah. Nah. It's, it's good. Gron. Oh, I should have anyway. looked at the orb. I got a three. I should have just kept it in my orb reading. Research. <laughs> so, uh, it's like research. the lowest roll she's ever made. Yeah, because I'm distracted. And my heart's not in it, so I guess I miss him. With a three? Yeah. Yeah, your your shot almost goes the other direction. Oh, Go play backfires oh, kicks me. <laughs> well, yeah, you're looking there? at the orbs so much, it makes sense that yeah, your shot yeah, is I'm, pretty I'm, poor. Oh, it's gonna be a puzzle day. <laughs> All right, I'm, I'm sorry, the gyre loves puzzles. <laughs> I love living. I'm casting an acid splash on those two creatures. Um, My name's oh. Raxon. Oh, you can do it on two? I can. I can do it on two. I just checked. Is I, it a I cone? Didn't do it before. Um, okay, so I'm gonna cast 12 plus... So that's 18. That'll hit them both. Okay, excellent. Nice. Um, and then that is 1d6 on both of these little guys here. Two. Ugh. Two on who? Uh, on the bird. Oh boy. Just put it out of its misery. Fucking three on Gron. That's good. All right, well. More acid. Odds oh, up. It's you kind of funny that your, your magic ability is something that I could do in real life. 
<laughs> Two face. I almost feel like. But yeah, you, so you, you splash them both. They both take a little bit of damage. How's that bird but, uh, doing? Th that bird is just clinging to life. Come on. It has so much internal strength that it, it doesn't want to go down with an acid splash. <laughs> its beak is melting off its face. <laughs> I, I feel like Shattercock needs like a special ability during her period that like she only gets when Ooh. she's menstruating. Blood rage. Maybe if, if there's a season two, we think about that. I don't know. Yeah, so that happens. <laughs> All right, Derek. All right, I'm just gonna move to a slide. Slightly more advantageous position nice. behind. Nice. Still in a rage. Pulse man, Sam. <laughs> Poke him in the butt. 16. Tie shoelaces together. <laughs> 19. 19. Both of those hit. All right. Thank you. Time to orc rip. No oh boy. He's done. Five. Ooh. Please save me. Whoa. Six. Oh. 11. Uh, 13. Wow. Dude, tell us how you kill Gron. Yes! So I, uh, oh, I slide cool. behind him. My hero. And then I come up with two axes. And I put plant one right into his back shoulder blade and the other right into his lower back. Oh, no. And then I rip him over uh, on top of me and slam him behind well, me. That's pretty incredible. Dude, people's elbow. I don't know. Yeah, I know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, are there ring ropes around yeah. <laughs> The ref comes in. <laughs> you roll so well that ropes yeah. manifest. Oh, shit. Axe slam. Right, Decker. Oh, there's a oh, yeah, there's a lizard bird thing clinging to its life. If you want to go kick kill it, kill the bird. Go kick it. Oh, shit. Right, right still combat. Kill me. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'll throw. I'll throw. I like the idea of it just going like. <laughs> <laughs> Finally, I'll have my glory kill. Uh, I'll throw a match at it. Firebolt. Yeah, firebolt. <laughs> my time. Yeah, it's my yes. time to shine. <laughs> Whiff, um, <laughs> whiff, whiff. Range spell attack. It brings Grom back to life. <laughs> <laughs> so, twin, 22. Boom. Gets him. 1d10. The oh, roll. Come on. All right, yeah, he's dead. Yeah. One. You got him. Oh. One damage. Stop playing with your food. No, that's, that's a one. A one. Wait, is that. That's a one. No, yeah. there's a zero. That's the 10. That's a one. You got him. Yay. Oh, so, your, your no. fireball. Oh. Crisps him up. Thank you. Finally ends his life. Just gonna like slump to the ground. Just, uh, just exhausted. Uh, uh, yeah. You I saved came. the day. <laughs> yeah, I did it. I saved everybody. <laughs> I only got down to one hit point. I imagine that leaves marks on a man. Grima runs to, over to Decker and he gives him a health potion. Just Actually, like shoves it in his mouth. Yeah. Holds I, his head in his lap. Well, so. Um, I, I miss I, you. I, uh, I drink a health potion. Oh. You said you were down to one hit point. I, I was. I look over oh. and I notice that um, when uh, Grom fell on the bird, that's actually what killed it. No, oh, no. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Firing right before it. Yeah. Grom died of a broken it anyway. heart. <laughs> yeah. does, does Decker do something like, that's my kill? <laughs> that's Basically. So, so Shadowcock's going to start investigating the other, because I saw the doors as we yeah. walked out, okay. but didn't go because of the, the orc. But Where are you not, going? I'm gonna go with that one to the, the closest to Shattercock yeah. right now. Yeah. How's your flow? I wanna. Ah. I wanna inspect uh, Gron. Check him for anything. Yeah. Room here. Tombs. Um, so obviously I investigate that that Spectre area. Is there anything in there? Sorry. Nothing. Yeah, I mean they're, they're like uh, you know people no buried there a long time ago. Yeah. There's some some clay pottery. If you're actually into clay pottery, there's probably some good stuff in there. I'm not. Okay, oh. sorry. <laughs> um, right. well, I'm pulling my axes out of him and I'm cleaning it off on his whatever tunic or pants or whatever. And then I want to start checking his pockets, <laughs> see what he's got. All right. Uh, 23 gold, Fuck. 103 silver. Um, the other matching bracer. Ooh, cool. And his sword. Yeah. Ooh. Milk tooth, ooh, a long sword. Cool. So you and me, we can uh, bro fist yeah, you it. You guys can bro fist it. Nice. Uh, hey Miri, you want the Aww. sword? Yeah. You don't want it? I have this cool orc ripper axe. Take and it. It's Mary. been doing pretty well for me. Take it. Mary. I just don't want to be weighed down by a heavy sword. Okay, thank you. <laughs> Plus, I kept the bracers of pound. I saw that. <laughs> We're gonna send some dudes to Pound Town. Yeah. <laughs> Grubo can't wait to see what his friends will offer him someday. <laughs> <laughs> you want when, a muffin? He adds, when he adds friends. <laughs> yeah. Do you want some muffin? Like Decker's just out of breath at Please. your knees right now. <laughs> uh, so, there's also a lot of gold if we want to distribute that gold. It's up to you. Yeah. You, I, you did the most work on that one when you fucking took him down, yeah. man. Those four hits you did? Uh, it's crazy. I'm just going to take five of his gold. Wow. Um, you investigating? Yeah. Right. I'm over there looking in there. 
cautiously. Gotta, oh, you got to right. yeah. There's a trap you die. <laughs> Season over. Oh, there we go. All right. Oh. So it's probably a portal. Uh, some. The top of the stairs, you see a glowing object above a small plinth. The blue crystal floats as if weightless before you. You see a wisp of silver color spinning inside. You, you hear uh, kind of a, a, a voice calling you to come and, and touch it and grab it and you you know get me. I w you want me. Come to me. Uh, before we do anything, I take Grom's brother's head off of my head and I put it next to him and I go. You're home now. No, no, I remove all the orc heads and I put my family's helmet back on because I'm oh. now ready for war. Hair Sweet. must be a mess, but that's okay. Uh, Shattercock's gonna go back over here to this room. <laughs> Give that a shot, see what's in here. I'm gonna take a guess. Come on. Oh. Back there. Oh, wow. Uh, what? Oh, oh is this, uh, that's outside. Uh, oh. is it? There was a side entrance. Uh, look at that. Uh, you go down in there to look down the. I bet it's the, behind the fucking you just, statue. You just look down the hole. Uh, absolutely. Man. We didn't do shit. Damn. Oh. Damn. So there's a hidden entrance behind the statue. There's a little entrance there. There was buttons. Doesn't really matter. But you guys check the statue. Hey guys, there's a hidden entrance over there by the statue. That's great. I'll. Uh, I'm still. I'm gonna go over here and check this one too. No. Just because. God mm -hmm. damn it. Yeah. So it's two, really two rough, fingers. Man. Oh, oh another, another one. Another one. Okay, all right. Cool. All right. So yeah, as you walk up the stairs, you see a glowing object, but a small plinth, blue <laughs> glowing crystal. It calls to you, wants you to touch it and those, feel it and have it. Those look like puzzles. Uh, I'll, I'll definitely touch it. I will definitely. Oh boy. Touch it. Yeah. All right. Absolutely. Oh, brave. So yeah, am, am I uncontrollably drawn to this thing? No, or no. Am I... You can resist the call. Okay. This thing is like kind of speaking to you I see, tele okay. telepathically. It's it's I'm wanting you. Check up there, up those stairs there. All right. So I, all right, I'll well, touch the orb. All right. Let's see what happens with that orb. So, okay, yeah. I would have I'm just said staring something to at you mine. before you left. Hmm? I would have said something Sorry. to you before you left. I'm just waiting for a, a moment. Say it real quick. All right. Stop. So, while you're there, I'll be like, man, fuck this. This is supposed to be different. This is supposed to be easy. This is supposed to be, like, we're supposed to be heroes, right? Why are ah, ah, that really hurts. Decker, you are a hero. You're the bravest hero I've ever seen. <laughs> his, his muscle atrophy. <laughs> <laughs> Shaky. <laughs> All pale. Uh, no, this is not right. This is not... Uh, how come some things are what they're supposed to be and other ones aren't? It doesn't make sense. This isn't the... This isn't the experience it was supposed to be. I was supposed to be strong and, like, kill everything. Uh, uh, Dick, are you okay? I'm just like, get up. Yeah, I'm fine. I'm just like, kind of walk off. Dick, why did you think that you had some predestination for this adventure? <laughs> that vaguely Chinese to you? <laughs> it always does. <laughs> I don't know, I was, I was me. I was, I'm always the hero. This is, this is messed up. This isn't right. I can't wait until Lawrence wins a DD. With the award for best D&D. &D. <laughs> 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 I'm, I'm to me, you're always the hero. <laughs> Gotta go check this room! <laughs> I go get All right, the treasure. So, so Shattercock, uh, oh, yeah. are you gonna touch the crystal? Absolutely. Okay, so you, you grab it, you form a, actually a telepathic link with it. it. It's talking to you, it's it's speaking directly to you, and, and it's offering you a gift. Ooh. It wants you to accept its gift. Bigger boobs? <laughs> <laughs> Two uh, orbs. Heavier flow. Yeah. Yes, I will take the gift! <laughs> <laughs> well done. <laughs> <laughs> I did it. Right, so, so glamour the spirit within the crystal is uh, the vestige of uh, Say Ocal, the crimson spider. Uh, Say's gift is the power to walk on walls and ceilings. What? Oh. Spider Man! So, spider so you, you've, accepted, you've accepted this gift and everything that comes with it. Okay. Um, I was ominous. Uh oh. Yeah. Uh, the gift allows its beneficiary to climb difficult surfaces, including upside down on ceilings, without needing to make an ability check. Mm -hmm. oh. uh, the beneficiary of, their, of this <laughs> gift your uncle. has the mark of Say Akol, and their left eye turns red and demonic for an hour every time that they use Fuck. this ability. Yes. That's cool. What's the disadvantage? Yeah, that's awesome. More stuff comes out of her holes. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> now you can it. spray <laughs> webs. <laughs> <laughs> just doesn't, when she engages it, yeah. Just... All right, cool. Excellent. Nonstop spray. I like that a lot. What does Pete get? He hasn't touched it. He hasn't touched it. Yeah, well, oh, yeah. uh, uh, Grima was looking in the hallway too. So Derek just pushes him out of the way. I want it. Just another dark <laughs> hole for Grimo. Yeah, what's what's the, what's the, what's for Grimo is. Yeah. Oh, sorry. You get trash. Oh shit. Ah, so the, these stairs actually down. go down. Up. Oh, sorry. Oh, up. Oh, gotcha. Okay. 
couldn't quite figure out how to sell well, it that. It shouldn't be shadowed no. if they're going up. Doesn't yeah. make sense. It's kind of stupid. Yeah. Primo's entranced by the stairs. <laughs> Time. They should be displayed like over this a little bit. So you yeah, can tell yeah, it's yeah, overlapped. It's that, so I mean, it looked, it looked kind of weird. I it looks that. great. It looked weird. It looked yeah, kind of yeah. stupid. Everybody could figure that out. I think That's we should just cancel the whole season. Yeah. So it's right. done. So, so later, guys, Mirios, does Mirios have a chance to touch that orb or no? I'm know. just kind of staring at it, and it's like <laughs> my eyeballs. <laughs> the eyes are crossing a little and bit. And I'm not sure what I should do. All right. Well, I'm gonna I'm gonna run out. Get it too. I'm gonna run out on the ceiling. Be like, guys, check it out. And I run down the ceiling, run down the wall, up and down. Even though my eye is demonic, who gives a shit? I'm running all around on the ceiling, checking it out. I sort of turn around and like see this, and then so I run back down there and grab it. <laughs> <laughs> I want to be a spider. All right, so you, you grab the crystal and it starts to speak to you, and it wants you to take its its special gift. Will you take my gift and everything that that entails? Do I get to climb on walls also? It doesn't really answer your question. <laughs> It's a risk. It's a I say, yeah, I'd like to climb on yeah, walls. All right, so you grab it. Yeah, All right, so the thing, it, like, you know, forms a telepathic link with you, and it's thank you, thank you. You, you will now have my gift. Uh, and the crystal, the vestige uh, within is the spirit of Ame Ko, the true believer. Ame's Ko, Ame Ko's gift is the power of many lives. Upon receiving this gift. The beneficiary instantly reincarnates when die when it dies, Whoa. and everything that comes along with that reincarnate spell, which you might want to read. Oh. oh, yeah, reincarnates when it dies, as though the target of the reincarnate spell. After it has used the gift twice, it vanishes. The beneficiary of this gift must once a day speak aloud in company a thought that it would not normally say amongst others. Mm. This uh, disappears once you use that for the second time. Okay. Pretty good. I don't get to climb on walls? <laughs> nope. Yeah. Shadowcock runs on, just, the, on the ceiling. I, you basically oh, have to play Twitter. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> My god makes you. I assume it, it just doesn't answer me. I'm like, what? Yep. You I live in a 14 year old slumber um, party. I'm going to use a healing potion. Sometimes I think about kissing okay. girls. Uh, what, how does that work? 2d4 plus 2. 2d4. So, seven. A uh, quick question. When he does his spell that raises your maximum HP, how long does that last? Like, if I use a healing potion now, can I heal? I have a feeling that thing that said temporary maximum? health so, points. Okay. It says it lasts uh, eight hours. Oh, so oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, cool. Huh. Nice. Everybody done what they want to do yeah. before moving on let's all, let's to, to doing um, something else? Am I able to get uh, a magic touch heal real quick? Yeah, we still do that. Oh, There's not only nice <laughs> Oh, you're all um, out. No, I have one more, but I, guess yeah. I, I can just use a potion. I real have quick. a, I have one more potion. Okay. Do you want it? I have one. Oh, okay. I have two. I can uh, either one. Use a potion, or I can yeah. use my last. I've been saving spell. for a day I also like have this. Muffins. What is the muffin? The muffins. We don't know. Oh. You could have brewed that tea. Oh, I saw that. Oh, tea. I don't have the tea. I mean, it's just tea leaves. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You had to kind of brew it. Are you guys like uh, down on your spell slots? Yes. Wait, I can brew tea no. here. There's a I fire, right? Do you want to take like a short yeah, you're gonna rest? You're going to take like 15 minutes. Recover um, any of those? So there's booming and crashing yeah, like, noises oh. coming above you. Your cave is, uh, or the temple here is shaking a little bit. Time for tea. <laughs> uh, I just use a potion. So I just roll one of these? Uh, yeah. Okay. Two, actually. Uh, one. Ugh. Four. So and then five. add two. Uh, so seven. Nice. Seven hit points. Badass. That's great. How long is a short rest, dude? If we take a An hour. An hour. It, it, honestly, if you want to do it, you can. It just doesn't seem quite appropriate Natural. to the scenario. Sure, yeah. No, I agree. That oh, I doom is, in, you know, some yeah. sort of doom is coming. But, you know, it's, I guess it's kind of funny if, you know, something horrible is happening. Y'all are just chilling. Just <laughs> listening to the drum, drum circle. <laughs> it's actually kind of relaxing. <laughs> All right, so you guys are going to take up the stairs? Sure. All right. Let's you've done go. all the. You've done all the. Whatever crap you want to do. Hopefully that was the harder boss. Sure. That's yeah, how these things tend to yeah, go. They usually do the harder boss first. <laughs> okay. So yeah, as you walk up the stairs, the beat gets even louder, almost deafening. A light show is is going on. A kaleidoscope of colors. 
The, the waves of sound are almost turning physical. You can see rushing air kind of swirling around you. Um, I'll say, uh, we're not high enough. Oh, oh fuck. Awesome. Cool. We're about to die. Yeah. Whoa. All right, yeah, so this this used to might maybe have been a place of worship uh, long ago, though. It's it's past its, mm-hmm. its prime days. It matches the lights. The, the pillars have crumbled and collapsed. The floor tiles are disintegrating. The grass is retaking the ground. The, basically, the wild is coming back to this place. See a massive, massive statue of uh, what you assume now is is Ravon, uh, in across uh, the way there. Is that a strawberry? Uh, it has six heads, <laughs> each with a different expression. He sits cross-legged with his palms facing upward to the sky. Let's see. Uh, oh, oh shit! Oh no! What the fuck is the, that? A massive tiefling with red skin and long looping horns stands at the base of the statue. He has a huge beard, long scraggly hair. He's, he's a fucking wild do man. Do we have any art? He looks like me! <laughs> we do. Uh, oh. yeah, honey, he does. <laughs> <laughs> Got some sweet oh, veins. Oh, awesome. Oh. El Banyo. <laughs> <laughs> so he, he stands shirtless. He's like cut as fuck. He's, he's, his muscles are rippling as he's beating on this Massive, cool. massive, ornately carved drum. Oh, we're fucked. Uh, his his tails tapping on the other side, keeping kind of a sub beat going. Uh, between you and the statue is a sunken pit. There are six crystals within the recess, half of which are glowing. Oh, that's a lot of stuff. Oh. So there are six men stripped down. Oh yeah. Wearing nothing, and beating on drums. These three. Are actually kneeling, still beating on the drums. This is the, this is their blood kind of pooling uh, beneath Ooh, them. Yes. Could Shattercock run to this one and put her blood in that one? <laughs> you probably don't want to add to it. <laughs> so one man is walking amongst them, uh, and he's got two friends hanging out. Holy shit! Oh, we're oh, fucked. Whoa! The the knight walking amongst the men is decked out in a suit that's an impeccably clean, shiny armor. He's got a sword and shield on his back. We got a stick. He's tall and skinny, uh, but he, he's pretty muscular. He has graying hair, high cheekbones, almost uh, elven-like, although he's a human. Oh, he's God, he's so beautiful. Oh, wait, is that the general we met? No. The insignia on his chest is of a falling star. The blue and gold coloring of his garments places him in the Ga- Gaelian army. His flair him. marks him as a general. I love him so much. <laughs> I want to be him. Never let him go. I want to cosplay. So, yeah. So general, aim him down. So he stabs this guy right, right in the belly, oh. guts him, and he falls to his knees, continuing to drum. Damn. That it. Pool, pool fills with blood. Um, we didn't get any XP for that last battle, did we? <laughs> oh, mm, sorry. We got something. not to interrupt the flow. But we have no, no time to. We control. need to rest, like. Right. What? Don't we have to rest to level up? No, I don't think yep. so. So you all get 250 experience for that last fight. Cool. We did it! We did it. As you're in the midst of battle, we'll have to figure that out for uh, a possible next season. So yeah, you see glowing blood filling the bowls around the pit. Uh, Banos, the tifling down at the end that's banging on the drum, starts to go wild. He start, he, he's hitting a climax of the, of the beat. Visible air is kind of gusting skyward. If you guys are still standing there, uh, this guy... <laughs> Gonna walk towards him, oh, watching him. Really can't let him do that. <laughs> well, are you guys gonna have any sort of reaction at I all? Can we do something? <laughs> I mean, I'd like to. I feel like I need to sprint over here and grab this guy, <laughs> so we can't sacrifice him. Hmm. Does any is anyone good at long range stuff that they can do interrupt in some way? I can uh, have a jab. I can, try. I can definitely cast. You have yeah. magic missile, right? I have magic missile. I'll, uh, we gotta stun these guys. That's force though, damage. Right? Yeah. it's not piercing. I can I can try and put him to sleep. We'll see. Well, you gotta move him, though. Yeah. Well, I might be able to put... I kinda wanna see what happens <laughs> when they all fill up. I'll be able to put the general to that sleep. Might we might for initiative. Odds are low. Yeah, are you guys gonna start a fight here? <clears throat> I, I feel like we I should. think we should. We're not gonna sit here and watch. Alright. Alright. James? 21. What? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Bruce? 3. 5. Four- Matt? 14. Lawrence? 14. 15. There we go. Oh. Decker wins third place. Yes. <laughs> it's funny. We got the Moondog brothers. We should just go. <laughs> <laughs> Could have done that. We'll get the reward if you ain't around to use it. 
There you go. On solo. Yeah, man. <laughs> we ain't gonna be around to use it. Looking at this, but no. Where'd be, they, where'd be the fun? Us? Do we just sneak backwards? Well, yeah. How convenient. Where'd be the fun in that? Ceilings or walls so here for you. You guys both got 14. Know, trust uh, me. We rolled again. He won. So, okay. or he got higher. All right. So, <laughs> what you doing? Is it me? Oh, yeah. Shit. Um, hey, you were the one who's all rearing to go. No, you rolled initiative and got it. Let's yep. see the plan. <laughs> the plan, huh? Yeah. Um, all right. Well, I'm gonna run forward. God, there's a lot of ground to cover. To about here, and I'm gonna throw a javelin. Nice. At Downs. Just down. Aiming for like a limb or something, so a shoulder or something like that. Okay. Take out his cutting arm. Oh, we should have pounded before. Damn it. You gotta pound. Go to yeah. pound town. You wanna? You wanna? Oh man. Seven. <laughs> you could have pounded. Can that be a reckless attack? <laughs> Would you describe this as a reckless attack? This is pretty reckless. Oh, oh no. dang it. Uh, so seven so plus three, ten. Uh, you threw something at him? A javelin. Oh, yeah, that javelin. He doesn't even fucking notice it. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> Stealth. Good job. I mean, if he notices that you don't know, he's trying to be a badass, gotcha. maybe. But yeah, that, it just kind of whizzes past him. Throwing isn't my thing. I, I mean, you could have given <laughs> it back. Hands on. Uh, Raxon? Yeah, Raxon. Uh, so first I run up behind Derek and I pound it. You want to pound it? Right, so the, the way I was thinking this works is one of you says attack, one of you says damage as you're pounding. Mm -hmm. Don't say the same thing. So when you have to, have to agree, okay. But you know, if you get in battle long enough, you guys would kind of have an innate sense of how to do this. But oh, okay, yeah, okay. Yeah, I don't want right, to. So we can't try discuss doing it. it. We can't discuss it. We just have to say one or the other. Yeah. I feel like we're at some point we're gonna have to keep doing it till <laughs> you guys it works. can figure it out. Mm -hmm. And, well, and we this can't like, say the same thing, right? I'm saying this would also probably be a, your bonus action since it takes a little bit of movement. Yeah, yeah. Just try um, and see what happens. So we should say pound town, and then one of us says attack, and one of us says damage. Yeah, okay. And this is, okay, okay, got it. Pound town, and damage. Attack. <laughs> oh, I like that. Wait a minute, it worked. It worked. It worked. It worked. It worked. It worked. <laughs> All right, yeah, whatever. It worked. Yeah. Yeah. You needed the better odds of making this attack count, right? Yep. That's the situational shit right there. There you yeah. go. That's good stuff. Okay, so I have two javelins left. I use my... One of them to do the exact same thing that Derek tried to do. I roll for that thing where I try to aim for an artery or something. It's 10 uh, plus 5. Uh, yeah, plus 5. 15. It, that hits? Yeah, thank Because his shield is on his back. Yes. Nice. Okay. Uh, and then roll the 6. Which one's this? God damn this. That's the regular. I, yeah. Yeah, there we go. So I roll 6 for plus 3 per thing. Uh, and then it's uh, the. This helps with my attack because we. You already got it. We pounded right? that it. That gave you plus one to your likelihood of hitting him. Gotcha. Good call. Uh, four plus three. That's seven damage. Like I said, that was I another. Mean, that was another for javelin. A vein, anything. <laughs> well, at least really you noticed important. it. Yeah. So uh, that it was a javelin. Yes. Right. It sticks sticks into his back. Okay. Um, are you? Is your turn over? Are you trying to do anything else? That, I think that's all I can yeah, do. Time for a one liner. Oh, uh, I go. Pounded it. Nice. <laughs> I miss I, having the evil voice in my head. <laughs> and Derek kind of like oh, really? second guesses who he's tied his pound brace into. <laughs> so yeah, he kind of he he turns and and looks at you. Um, pulls that spear out. Uh -oh. Um, actually turns back to this guy first, slashes his belly. Oh, uh, he falls to his knees, no still stopping. beating the drums. Should have thrown Grimo. Oh yeah, that always works. It always works. Uh, and then turns back and throws the javelin right back oh, at you. Oh, man. You get two actions? What a dick. <laughs> That's pretty great. You don't All get right. to be a general with one action. <laughs> what is the damage on the javelin? javelin? Uh, that's the uh, D6. It's a six plus yeah. three piercing. Oh, for you with three piercing. Oh, he, oh only for me, though. I don't know what he has. I, I just have one D6. So that, was, that would be six damage. <sighs> I've had worse. <laughs> All right, and with his movement, he walks towards this guy. Damn oh my it. God! What the oh, fuck? Guy yeah. yeah, gets three moves. Yeah. Well, two actions and one move. He's a he's a fucking general. We're fighting he's, Uber bosses now. He's so now. beautiful. I like that. Our, my javelin in his body, like 
stuck him. Shield well, and, and, and he kind of shouts back at you guys, Don't mind me right now, I'm just doing something, I will tend to you guys in just a moment. Hang on, please. Just need a second. I just attempted murder. Not a big deal. Didn't really hurt. Okay. Okay. Decker? He, uh, so Decker is, like, clearly out of his league. Um, like, bug-eyed, staring at everything. Um, then he kind of snaps out of it. Fuck, man, I, there's so much distance to travel. I can't do shit. You can um, walk further than everybody else. I got one more square, you're right. Uh... <laughs> And I'm done. I guess I could dash. Conjure an invisible man to scoop out the blood. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Throw a straw. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> maybe we're doing this all wrong. Maybe this is for the best. It might end maybe up. Maybe these are the. Maybe we're the bad guys. Uh, <gasps> Braid. Twins and grits. Is your robot, Mr. Robot? Mary. Uh, couple quick questions. <laughs> so resurrect. My Divine Smite, which is kind of like my rage ability, it says I have to use a spell slot, so if I've already expended all my spells, I can't do it, right? Correct. Is that correct? Okay, cool. You and expended all your spells? Healing Raxon? Uh, it was that, but I also buffed everybody okay. else at the beginning of that last battle. That's okay. Um, so then the other question is... Oh, yeah. Wait, you didn't do anything, Decker? You just moved? What am I going to do? Mm -hmm. There is nothing in range. Absolutely nothing. All right. I would love to. The other Maybe question. Sorry. Fireball the drums. <laughs> the other question is, I have all my gear. I, do I have to have weapons equipped ahead of time going in to like pick one of the things that I have that I'm carrying to use? No, you not? could. If, if it was something major, you would use a bonus action. So okay. you know, say you've got one weapon, you want to stow it and grab another one. That would be a bonus action. But if you're like just grabbing an extra knife for your offhand, that would probably be okay just uh, to say you did it. And I can I do care. a bonus action plus movement or no? Yeah, yeah. Okay. What are you trying to do? I'm trying to move as far as I can and throw one of the three great axes I have <laughs> and hit a guy, even though I'm not going to do it. And All my right. dexterity is bad. I just want to do it because I'm feeling super empowered at this point. Right on. Uh, so, okay. I'm gonna walk to the, that toward you, Bruce. Yeah, as far as I can, which isn't that far. I can only go five spaces. Oh, like there maybe? Uh, well, that's still like you, ten. Right? Over here? No, toward yeah, toward Bruce physically, actually, in, oh. in the real Two, world. Oh, three, four, five. Probably yeah. And I'm gonna hurdle, take one of my great axes out and hurdle it as far as I far as I can, and try and hit this dude Ooh, down there. <laughs> He's got a much bigger axe than you. I know that's a long throw. Makes it twenty feet. Clank, clank, clank. Yeah. Ah, Which would I probably think, uh, be, I don't know if that's dexterity yeah, and uh, strength. Honestly, fuck this <laughs> yeah, just call it, uh, do a twenty. Uh, you're proficient, and use your dex bonus since you're throwing it. All right. Twenty. I'm proficient in the axe. That's thirteen. Uh, but my dex bonus is minus one. Twelve plus your proficiency, though, right? Yeah, I guess. So Which 14. would be. And who are you 14. aiming at? This guy? That, guy. that guy? Yeah. All right. Um, yeah, roll for damage, man. That hits. Wow. Wait, what did I, wait, yeah. what did I say it was? I'm sorry. 14. No, 14. Wait, I'm sorry. Yeah, that, uh, that oh. axe, that axe it's, it's a strong enough throw that it kind of like <laughs> sticks in his chest armor, oh. but it just kind of sticks there, ah. and he does not seem to be phased by it. They, I mean, these, these knights are decked out in full... Yeah. Fucking armor. Yeah. Way out of our league. Yeah. I really think Might that we, we maybe we should have a conversation. <laughs> yeah. I think we need a raise. Running out and throwing stuff, maybe. <laughs> I got a. I got Crash. a. Punch. I picked up a lot of rocks on the way. <laughs> That's great. <laughs> Banos. So yeah, uh, Banos. His uh, his drumming. <laughs> last last time we were there, his drumming was kind of climaxing. Air is swirling, filling the air, uh, and it kind of comes to a, 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 a slow stop. I mean, it's, he's not done, but it's slower, it's calmer, it's at a quieter pace. Uh, the the two wands that he was actually using as drumsticks are kind of floating on their own. They raise up in the air, they're kind of spinning and glowing, and the, the drum beat continues, even though they're not like hitting the drum anymore. Hmm. And he takes a, he, he'll actually take a step back. No, if, don't. If someone can okay. move him back. Just one? Uh, yeah, just to the base of the statue is fine. Yeah, that works. I think I like your thought process. We should get diplomatic at this point. Should we talk to them? I Wait. Think I, I, <laughs> Using all the leverage we have. I mean... Well, what leverage? Yeah. Listen. 
We know this is bad. The fact that the general said, one second, I'll be back, is like, should is a red flag. Or they view us as the pathetic peasant, level two peasants that, that we, we actually are. are. Level three. Like they're just going to bring this well, god back to life, yet. and then the that'll be that. Yeah. Bring this god back. Well, I guess it's just a thousand <laughs> years of darkness. <laughs> what is oh, he's wow. like a super sweet metal god. They've been playing double kick bass drum the whole time. Uh, my <laughs> question is, the, the <laughs> army officers that sent us on this mission yeah. must have known. Uh, absolutely. He's right there. Yeah, he's right there. All right. That's him. All right, so. Is it? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, well. Same general. Yeah. All right, that'll be Banos' turn. Oh. He doesn't need to fuck you up even more. Thank you. Oh, Thank you. He's you. casting a spell and stuff. Oh, yeah, he's got to concentrate. Oh, That's great. Right shit. into range, baby. <laughs> right into my <laughs> trap. Falling into my trap. Oh, boy. As expected. Well, do we have to do Pound Town every time for every turn? No, it should, it'll last, uh, let's say it lasts fight? three minutes or okay. a fight. Okay. So this this knight guy has a heavy crossbow, which is pretty massive, and he uses uh, his kind of turn to <laughs> pull it out, cock it. And um, fires it at Miri. Oh, oh no! Uh -oh. Oh, He's got a shield though. Um, <laughs> <laughs> it just rips through. It just <laughs> takes his arm. All right. Yeah. In uh, so he he fires it and Miri deflects it with, ah! with her shield. Ah. Um, <laughs> this guy also has a heavy crossbow um, and uses one of his actions to kind of pull it out, crank it, and fires it. At who's this? Dear. Dear. 18 hits, I'm guessing. Yes. I got I got plenty of health. Eight damage. That's a lot of damage. That's okay. For a ranged mm. attack. Yeah, that is a lot of damage for ranged attack. Uh, Grima. I'm going to use my bonus action, cunning action, to dash to that guy that's right there. Wait, this one? Yeah, and push him out of the circle. Cool. I suppose do I have to roll to push yeah. him? Yeah. Roll a 20, use Spin your strength. You push so him nine. Oh, over. so my strength is eight. I'm sorry, sorry. So my roll, including strength, is eight. I'll get you. So I just kind of hug him. <laughs> oh. <laughs> well, yeah, only, only because he rolled a 20 does he, oh. is he able to actually uh, resist we you. Just kinda, we just kind of do this. Are you doing that thing where you're like, you're like backs against <laughs> him? Come on. He's just looking <laughs> down at this childlike thing. So what Grimoss is doing when he changes his Shattercock's tampon, he's just pushing <laughs> it off. Just shoving it in, using all his, his body weight. He kind of felt One that. Both hips and a heel. <laughs> <laughs> At, at first, you were able to force him, and you were moving him, but there, uh, there was some kind of click of magical energy that oh, popped no. him back in uh, with his his kind of critical yeah, save. His blood make, is running into. It. You make like a boing yeah. sound, and he goes back in. So did, like he was moving, but it, something kind of pulled it's like him one back. Of those clowns at the sand bit at the bottom. Just yeah. It's probably a puzzle here. Should I, should I go and try the same thing? Some kind of puzzle, maybe. Maybe a puzzle. Because I, I want. Puzzle. 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 I mean, just leave. <laughs> these, are, these are also naked guys, so they're not wearing any armor. Right. They, they have no handle. defenses. Maybe they're okay. just waking the god. Them, I know. If that, well, choke them out. You, you magic oh, missile okay. is force damage. Well, it keep doesn't them, cause but, bleeding. But will it? They're already bleeding. Yeah, right. I was going to say, will, will, they, will they die in the pit, though? I don't know. All right. Um, still got blood in them. Oh, yeah. Well, but will they? if it's force damage, it won't make them bleed. That's what I'm saying. But he can still stab them open. That's knock true. him out. That's true. I don't know, man. I don't know how this shit works. Yeah. Actually, so have to decide. it was going to be on my next turn, but I was going to like roll shit to see if I could figure out. What the naked guys are drumming, though, right? Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, everyone drums. that's in their blood is kind of kneeled down, still drumming. They, they, they appear to have bled out, but look like there's something is compelling them to continue doing what they're doing. Uh, what is going on with this? So, so, so Shattercock then dashes towards this way and notices that uh, Greenwell tried to push the guy out. So instead, tries to push the drum out. Tries okay. to kick the drum out of the pit and see if that makes a difference. So uh, should I roll gonna, for that? Yeah, you're gonna try and kick the drum. Yes, you're gonna right, try yeah. to kick the drum or whatever. No, I'm gonna try and push the drum out with my hands. All right. Nine. Thanks. Yeah, that would be your strength. Yeah, which is minus two. Uh oh. Yeah. So you're, you're struggling to move that, even though it doesn't look that heavy. Ow, my toe. <laughs> it must be buried. Oh, that's that, the problem. That was less than ten, right? <laughs> Yes. Yeah. Once you splash down in that pool, you got a good reason that your thighs are all bloody. <laughs> <laughs> you right, gotta explain it. Me again? Yeah. Oh, oh, shit. Boy. <laughs> all right. Fuck it. Rage. Rage. <laughs> I'm gonna Wait. charge this dude. Oh, See boy. on the other side. Oh man. <laughs> man. Uh, two hand axes. You're brave. Nine. Ten. 10 being the best, so plus 5, 15. Sorry. Nope. Your axe is kind of clink into his, gotcha. his armor. Shit. 
Braxton. I'm, I'm gonna try the old Shattercock Grimo com wombo combo, nice. and I'm so. I'm just tackling this guy. <laughs> tackling him? Um, I, I mean, I have more strength than I think them combined. So, fuck, man. <laughs> okay, it. rolling for um, push. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. Oh boy! Oh boy! Grimo sees what he's doing, and, and <laughs> he, uh, oh, he's the most inspired. He's, man. he's like, "Good, we're on the same page." Oh, yeah. So, so Raxon is first into his penis. <laughs> <laughs> See, Raxon starts to. <laughs> Where the fuck did that go? Raxon starts to slip in the blood and go flying, but let's. <laughs> but I got a little gosh, bit of inspiration. He, he sees Grimo. Hey! Blading a man, naked man covered in blood. Uh, do I need so to roll for damage? Uh, yeah. You're trying to push him? Yeah. Push him out. Um, My roll. strength is plus three. He's also 20. Um, We're not trying to damage him, we're just trying to. Oh, yeah, but I need to be powerful him. to push him, right? Okay. That's what you guys did. Yeah, but it's true. Yeah, but we you are. The, we had so, yeah, roll, roll a 20 and add your strength. You're rolling to see if, if the push is successful, not. And then you roll for damage, so. That was well, that an interesting was question, though. 17 was to see if the push was successful. Yeah, yeah. but and you're now, not trying to damage him. No, 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 anyway. but now, okay. Right? Well, what's, uh, well, what is, we what, added our strength to our roll, our first only and only roll. Yeah. But so that, that's what he would do. Uh, okay. But so that's he, only he to hits. see if you push. Um, and we're trying to say you're, you're trying to push him out, so yes. you're not trying to damage him necessarily. No, 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 I don't want to hurt him, no. Um, so Actually, just uh, we're gonna wing this and roll roll a twenty. Since you're not right. trying to damage, let's not worry about damage die. Been, okay. So what was the? Been, that, that, I thought that's what the inspiration. Yeah, like that's what the push the is. Seventeen roll. pluses three would have been twenty. Yeah, so that hits. So you are successfully pushing him. Okay. Okay. Um, okay. So what happens? How far he pushes him? So I have to roll again to just see how. Fuck it. Yeah. All right. Whatever. <laughs> I don't, it doesn't matter that much. Nice. You, you push him out. Yeah, yeah. Well done. It, it, it's, uh, I guess, I, I don't know what the D&D &D rules are for non-violent yeah. <laughs> things. Um, so what happens? Anything? I'm not sure. Um, Still filled with blood. Yeah. So yeah, actually, first no of drumming. all, this guy this guy hits the ground and his head caves in. Oh, um, way to go. No, way to go. Oh that's my it. god. He wasn't even trying. <laughs> they were pre-dead. I'm, I'm pretty sure that's what Dan was alluding to. Yeah. Um, and you see this pool flicker a little bit, okay. but nothing seems to change. Fuck! So we have to stop that. Shit. Well, you tried. Fuck! Without, fuck. Without yeah. making him bleed. We tried. That. Or letting him stab that man open. You guys should hurry before I get cut in half. No, no. It is your turn. <laughs> what? The general. Oh, sorry. So he guts this guy. Oh, oh there no. There she is. Yes, I want to see the guide come back. Yeah. It's a scripted loss. You know, I turns. think we switch religions. We hop on board with this new <laughs> thing. <laughs> Repent for the next... 10,000 years. <laughs> we were doomed to fail. The detail on the map. Yeah. Lower. Yeah. I love it. Oh, wow. If it was a straight line, it would shift like that. Look at that. How about that, huh? It's good stuff. I mean, you fucked up the stairs, but this is a map. <laughs> yeah, this is my makeup for it. So good. Here, inspiration to use. <laughs> <laughs> I might need that later. So he turns. He goes, okay, all right. Everybody, what's going on here? What, what are you guys doing? <laughs> uh, I, 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 you know, I, I know you tried to, uh, you yeah. You're fighting my guys and stuff, but no. where are you coming from? Why are you doing this? We need a pay raise. <laughs> we were sent here to take down the Moondog brothers. By him. By him. By, By you. you. No, no. Not oh. him? It wasn't the same general? No. Oops. Someone, we're we're general, general in the same up. army. We're just gonna go. <laughs> yeah. Sorry. You know what? Wrong general. Mistake. Yeah. Enjoy yeah. your god. <laughs> All right. Yeah, cool. Did, did you find the, the dog guess. man, the Moondog downstairs, though? Yeah. I think he was waiting yeah. for his brother. Um, they're, they're together. No. I'm assuming seeing you guys, you might, uh, you know, kill them or something. Yeah. Are you trying to summon a god? Mm. Yeah, no, you are. No, not a god, mm. no. Okay. Um, An acolyte of a god. But if you did kill the Moondog guy, thank you. That's irrelevant that kind right of, now. Kind of like tied up some loose ends There's that a lot I of dark mystic shit. Him. That's more important. So I appreciate it. Thank yeah. you guys. No. Uh, I guess I guess our question is, oh, what are you doing? Oh, uh, you know, we're opening a magic door. Mm. Um, a do good you... magic door? Actually, wonderful question. Sort of. What, what are you guys after? Why are you here? Because, like, I, you know, I could... We, we, we could kill you all pretty easily if, if we wanted to. I'd no, like to a, see you try! Might be a sporting... <laughs> Did, did you charge at him or no, something? No, I, I slipped. Oh, <laughs> in the blood again. I, I mean, it might be a sporting fight. I'm not, you know, you guys look pretty cool. What happens if we go in the door? Oh, well, it's it's going to be here in just a second. You, you saw me cut that guy open just two seconds ago. Yeah, so that's activating this uh, portal that we got coming. So it's just going to be just another minute. 
Uh, a quick question, Mr. General, <laughs> sir, uh, as I'm lying on the ground and uh, man, corpse. <laughs> um, kicking in blood. Were the, uh, the individuals here uh, volunteers, or did you uh, have them go up here against their will? Oh, uh, these these people that I'm gutting. Yeah. Oh yeah, they wanted it. Okay. They wanted I, su- it I suddenly bad. have a, less of a problem with this whole situation. <laughs> oh, who's, starting to see the misunderstanding. Who's that guy underneath the statue? Oh, that's Banos. See, that guy's awesome. Yeah, he looks pretty sweet. Banos uh, escaped from a prison. Oh yeah, not so yeah. Long ago. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that was my plan. Yeah, I wanted him out of there because he's he can do this magic uh, portal magic stuff with his drums and. He's pretty funny. So, Honestly, so what do you he's get cool out of this? What do you get out of this? Oh, uh, well, you guys are asking me a lot of questions without telling me what the fuck you're doing here. We were sent here to find the Moon Dog Brothers. Yeah, it sounds done. You want to go? And when we arrived, we noticed that there was something very suspicious happening at the top yeah. of this mountain. Getting the vibe, this is sort of a destruction of the world type thing. Oh no, 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 not right now. <laughs> yeah, but eventually. Not right now. Not the world either. No, just a little um, part of it. The one that we happen to be living on. Oh, not, not, honestly, I think you guys have completely mistaken what's going on here. Enlighten us. Oh, you still haven't told me what you're doing. We just did. What do you want to do here? What are you well, here uh, for? Stay alive. Look, look, I mean, look, to be, to be perfectly honest, we were told these guys were bad. Yeah, bad. the work guy, you got him. Yeah, yeah, and he was downstairs, so we just assumed whoever was upstairs was also bad. Oh, no, no. I'm that, a good guy. <laughs> you're doing blood magic. You're in a temple oh, yeah, for well, you know, god. Sometimes yeah, right. you've got to do bad things to get a good outcome. You What's your you good outcome? That? I can relate to this. <laughs> this, um, this country is personally, I think it's fucked. The king is, is the worst king we've had in a couple hundred years. The titled and the clergy are, are becoming rich off of the poor people in this country. It's, it's screwed up, and I'm taking back the power. He's summoning demons. Sort of, yeah. There, there <laughs> are serious, powerful, dark energies he out thinks there. thinks he can control it. He can't. No, I can. Sure, I can. he can. Yeah. yeah. All right. He's but got better this, armor than us. Guy. I mean, he's really listening to him. <laughs> yeah, there's great power out there in the multiverse, young man. I've read Accessible all about to it. us mortals. Well, you just what have are we to will it for to make here, it out. <laughs> <laughs> How long do we have to wait? All for right. This so yeah. All right. Um, just summon the fucking demon lord because we can't do <laughs> he's anything. St- I go. He's stalling. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So a, a blinding flash of light has you all kind of cover your eyes. You look away. You hear a, an extremely loud thunderclap, like a sonic boom or something, that blows out your ears a little bit. There's a, a metallic burning smell in the air. You blink a, a few times. Oh, oh that's such a sweet oh, portal. You see a large circular swirling mass of a, of a cloud and light, just swirling weirdness. Uh, it, it slowly flattens into two dimensions and lowers beneath the statue. It touches the ground right in front of Banos. Oh, fuck. <laughs> It's kind of just like a concert at this We're, point. Right? <laughs> this is way too heavy for our first quest. Is still pretty so yeah, incredible. you know, if, if if you guys want to help me out, you seem like pretty strong guys. You've made it this far. Uh, oh. I could make use of some strong folk like How you. How do we help? I open this portal, and I'm going to walk through it in, in just a minute or two. Um, but the downside of this portal is that it unleashed some sort of dark creature. I don't know, somewhere around here. Um, it walked through, and I want to bind it to myself, to, to submit it to my will, and you look strong enough to help me do that. You have to understand what you're saying sounds kind of crazy. <laughs> you a little and bit. And I've been hanging out with crazy all week. <laughs> this, this is for the long-term good of Gael. What's on the other side of that portal? Don't worry about that one. Demon stuff? Well, I have to know what's on the other side before I go through it. I never said you were going through Grimo's that portal. Grimo's going through that portal. <laughs> What's a Grimo? Uh, You're looking at him. <laughs> Grimo, uh, Shattercock realizes Grimo has exactly the same idea Shattercock had. And do we look at each other? We look at each other. All right, you ready? <laughs> Here we go. And so we both charge through the portal. Well, all right. Seems well, like we're, you got to make towards the portal. All right. We're still in combat. All right, we'll go here. Dun, dun, oh, yeah. dun, 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 but, dun, dun, before you make rash decisions, <laughs> I just want you to think about what side of history you want to be on. The portal side. <laughs> <laughs> the portal side! Fair enough. You be boy. careful. And I go, what are these idiots doing? Yeah. <laughs> so do we make it through? No, <laughs> no. no. How far can you guys walk? So we're in combat. I, just, I, wanna, I, wanna throw this, turn. I wanna throw this out there. You know, these guys who have been trying to fight who we can't put a fucking dent in. They're gonna help us fight whatever comes through that portal. 
that you guys are rushing towards. Well, he's binding it to himself. Yeah, but we still have to fight it. We have to, well, I, we have to get to its degree, health. To a degree, I suppose. It's like hunting. Like, we got to take this thing down. Are you talking in character? Sorry, making sure. I mean, what's the difference at this point? Because <laughs> I'm trying to shout sense into you guys sure. because it sounds like you're just trying to go on a suicide run. And right now, well, so Deck, I was like, at this point, it's about survival. We don't know what the fuck's going on, and this stuff is way out of our league. So we need to start making plays. Like, this is not hero time. It's your turn. Yeah. Um, you cannot hope to stop us, young man. The door's open. We've won. Grimo Rude Fellow, Gyre. Uh, how do you intend to bind it to yourself? I'm gonna cast... You're getting into the, the nitty gritty here, young man. I'm gonna cast Charm Person on this guy. We'll see what the fuck happens. Ooh. Okay. Um, so let's see. How does that one work? Good question. It must make a wisdom saving throw, does so with advantage for your... And you and your companions are fighting it. That's right, I can't use any inspiration on this. You said with advantage? Yeah. It misses. Yeah, of course it does. Alright. No, no, no. Um, I'm sorry. It no. misses saving the saving throw. roll. You, you, oh, did, yeah. you did what you were trying to do. Well, thank you. Um... So I'll, sh I'll like cast it, I guess I'll feel it hook, and I'll shout to this guy. Say, is this really how you want to die? Whoever that guy is. <laughs> Unnamed soldier oh. number two. <laughs> <laughs> um, what'd you ask him? Is this how you want to die? In battle? Absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. <laughs> I charmed him, damn it. Uh, I mean, if you were trying to imply something to him, he yeah, would sure, take sure. that, but he was just answering gotcha, you truthfully gotcha. because he well, was charmed. Well, let's make it a spiriting fight, shall we? Die in, a, die in a fun way. Why wouldn't, you, why wouldn't you join the underdogs? Sounds like an awesome time. I know let's, it does. Let's fucking do this. Let's fucking do it! Alright. So he's on our team now? Yeah. How long does that work? Um, good oh, question. Oh shit, this doesn't end well. No, it's, it actually lasts a pretty long time. Let's see here. The charm creature regards you as a friendly acquaintance when the spell... Uh, if it fails the same throw, it is turned by you until the spell ends, or you until you and your companions do anything harmful to it. Okay. Um... I don't know when the spell. It. Oh, it's duration one hour. So this fight's not gonna last an hour, that's for sure. He's gonna be our damage dealer. Maybe. We don't know what he is. We so far we haven't put a dent in these guys, and one more hit and I'm dead. So shoot an arrow at the portal. <laughs> Some angry demon comes this up is, with ten uh, little arrows. This, 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 this is this fuck? is Adam talking now. It sounds like Dan's trying to push us in a certain way. Sure. Yeah. Which I, I know I don't want to like. It, it's an adventure. We can do whatever the hell we want, but like. Yeah. No, there's, there's few yeah. outcomes here. Okay, <laughs> I, I'm just I'm gonna die, basically, if I try to fight. Yeah, we we've already won here. My door is open. I'm gonna walk through this magic door in like 15 seconds, and there's nothing you can do about it. My buddy, hey, you know it'd be fun is if you prevented him from walking through that door, <laughs> just for fun. Let's he goes, mm. He yeah. was just gonna climb in the water again. Aries <laughs> <laughs> turn. Or uh, it doesn't matter. I don't know if we're still turn. in combat or yeah. not. Yeah, we're in combat. Sorry, okay. there's, there's just a yeah. lot of yapping. Yeah. <laughs> so it's Miri's turn. All right, Miri. Uh, I'm just going to dash over to Raxan and heal him if I can. It's not if I can get it, there. Man. There's the only thing I can do. I can't go anywhere else. I can't can do any make damage. Can you that far? Mm. No, maybe. That's why I said as close as I can. Also, can you dash and heal? Raxan's the furthest <laughs> one. Yeah. Well, whatever. I don't know what you're moving no, to. No, no, oh. oh, my God. All right. <laughs> if I can make it over Nailed there. Nailed it. Sure. And whatever, I can save the... I don't know if I can do the laying of hands in the same turn or not, or I have to do it next turn. Just do it. Okay, yeah. fine. That's plus four? Plus five. Plus five. Oh, that's good. That's Banyos' turn. <laughs> Great Albanios. <laughs> so before uh, Banos can go, a string of white lightning shoots out of the portal and kind of explodes in a ball of light. Gandalf! <laughs> a, He's back! A small <laughs> creature appears at that point where the ball explodes and kind of comes crashing to the ground. Cool. Um... Oh, it's kind of falls down there. Oh, that's oh, so it's small. Good. It's a lame little guy. Good land. <laughs> He's back. Yeah, so he comes crashing down to the ground. You see the bare arms of, of what would appear to be a human. It's kind of flesh or flesh color. Uh, there's some sort of design on it, whether it's tattoo or painting, you don't really know. Uh, he has a, or it has a mask, kind of large feathery protrusions coming off the back of it. Carries a sword that's in an ornate little uh, carved uh, sheath uh, on his hip. Kind of gathers itself, spins around, and mo tries to move at Banos. So moves around the portal. That's the creature they're um, trying to. I don't know. No, no. He, he and he he yells out, "Stupid creatures! Have you any idea what you've done? Oh, You're playing with forces way beyond your reach, mortals. 
He holds his sword up and ready and says, cease this dark work before it cannot be undone. Um, so Banos uh, actually pulls out a longbow, or has a longbow strapped on, uh, strapped on his back, pulls out and aims at him, looks over at Down, goes, have any idea what this thing is, buddy? Yeah. They're playing their own game. Yeah, yeah that's cool. All right. Uh, Grimo? Monsters. Monsters. Oh, Monsters. Turn. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> that would be... Oh, shit. Guy. He swings back at Derek. Oh, no. I thought we were truce. <laughs> <laughs> So yeah, the the knight pulls his his sword back, is about to strike at you, and uh, down shouts, "What are we doing here, folks? We can keep doing this if you want. Just want to make sure you don't want to come and you know work for good old General Down." I go, "Okay, okay, okay. okay. <laughs> truce, 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 truce." As I glance at everyone else to see what everyone else. So is yeah, doing. he he actually continues to swipe because you guys got a few on him before Oops, uh -oh. the battle started. Uh, 16? Yep. Hits. Hits. Pack a muffin in your mouth. Eat a muffin. Ah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, like, Crumbling he thinks he stabbed you, but you had a muffin right there. So <laughs> Nine damage to that long sword. And he goes like, oh, are we stopping? Uh, <laughs> I'm down to do this all day. Um, and then all the, the guys in the pit continue to do their drumming. Uh, yeah. Does, does he count as a monster or no? It's charming, um, right? Charm charm oh, wait, yeah, sorry. Um, yeah, what do, you, what do you want this guy to do? Uh, Aren't you able to command him? Uh, sort of. It's he. He just regards us as friendly, but he still has his own volition about him. Oh. So, um, I mean, I just told him to stop Iman from getting in the portal. Oh. He'll, or I said uh, that would be a good uh, idea. Uh -huh. Suggested it to him. All right, uh, Grimo. So I'm gonna take another five. Actually, I'll just dash. I can dash ten toward the portal. Thank you. Oh man, hero moment. Suicide. Portal, your back. Last time we ever. No further. <laughs> you, you're not going in. I, I don't think I'm, I'm in it yet. Okay. Uh, Shattercock jumps in the water, but she's curious. Um, oh boy. What happens? Squirt yeah, you get all your health back. Oh! I didn't even need it. Way to go, guys. <laughs> Keep using that health, the health I water. I was just curious! <laughs> There's a better way to test it. Maybe yeah. stick a finger in. We tested it in the one below. Well, we, I don't know if it does the same thing. Somebody else at max health. Oh, now we do. Yeah. Now we do. And now it's all gone. <laughs> yes, do you have another layer true. that makes I that? I have two healing potions for you. Don't worry. No, I, I have to roll for those. That thing's auto. Do you have another layer that makes the middle part red? I, yeah. I should have done that. Yeah, sorry. Yeah. You, you didn't know it was that time, right? <laughs> I couldn't see uh, that in there. Koozie. Oh, yeah, so, uh, well, you guys didn't ask his name, but whatever. His name's Koozie. Uh, <laughs> What's your name? <laughs> he, okay. continue, he continues to move towards uh, Banos. Um, How far? Like, yeah, like he that? makes it to him and okay. swipes at him. Right, yeah. So yeah, uh, Kuzi uh, with his with his kind of cool sword swipes right into Banos's chest, takes a huge chunk of flesh out. Oh, that was ripped. Um, he, just, he did twelve easy. damage. Oh, he was wow. all that work, all all those fucking bench press. All right, uh, Derek. Oh, okay. Um, you called the truth, didn't you? I mean, you still don't really have a plan. Uh. Shit. Um, so I, I know it seems like a lot of time has passed, I but know. this is all going like yeah. six, five, six seconds at Very a time. Chaotic. Can you just pass? Uh, I mean, I don't really know what to do. If you wanted to pass, you can actually defer your turn towards later in the initiative if you would like, but it does stay there for the duration of the battle. Um, <laughs> you can just move if you want to like I group can't. up. I I'm, I'm engaged. Oh. I thought he can stopped. I, can I... Can, can I disengage like with my hands up peacefully mm -hmm. and move back towards them yes okay I'm gonna do that let me get there okay we just hug each other <laughs> I'm so sorry <laughs> that's so I'm so scared. Scared. I don't know what's happening I mean yeah I hug Derek um, <laughs> <laughs> we just I just cry Calm a little down, bit bro. <laughs> yeah I don't I'm gonna let that dude fight that dude and see how this goes. <laughs> what about some popcorn? Eat some muffins! <laughs> oh yeah. I mean, he's got like a god sword and he's fighting a demon drummer. Like, I'm just gonna let that play out. <laughs> it's the general's turn. General's Alright, yeah, so, uh, still wondering what you guys wanna do here. <laughs> oh, actually, sorry, last time, uh, Bano shouted at him if he had any idea what the thing is. And, uh, Down goes, I haven't the foggiest, uh, old boy. Um... Look how genteel he he's, is. He's really too late to undo anything we've done. Whoops. Uh, maybe our friends would like to help take him out. Looks over at you guys. Have, have you figured out if you want us to kill you or you want to join us? You're the one who fucked join up. Us or, or as far what's as I going see on? It, you opened a shitty demon door, something popped out and said you were an idiot and is about to kill you for doing it. We just had the misfortune of being here. I think we can just leave. And you're you're the one who's fucked you up. You could probably just leave if you want. Um, yeah. 
Why not? Did we just run away? Uh, I'm about to go through this magic door. Mm. Um, Good luck. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I, again, I'll, I'll ask you, the kind of repercussions of this dark magic that I'm working is that there is some creature that's been unleashed upon this world. So somewhere locally to these these mountains. I need your help to track it down and help me okay, get it. Okay, we'll do it. Grimo's in. Yeah. Little guy's Grimo's in. Grimo's in, little guy. Oh, I got him, guy. I'm in. Um, the rest of you still want to die or want to help me out or, or honestly don't care too much, uh, but I, I have. I want to move this along. One question. Yeah. How much you paying? Oh, so money's a big thing for you, huh? Well, it you know, keeps the world moving. <laughs> what if he All pays right. you in your simple, life? Simple creatures. Are you moving to a you new de uh, demon currency in this new world? Because <laughs> if we can get those up front, that would be fantastic. Uh, you know, I don't really carry cash. I don't really have much use for it. But if that's what you really want, that's what you want, I could probably take care of you. What happens if this demon is not subjugated? Oh, I'd have a problem with you guys then. Because that's, that's what I'm asking you to do for me to keep from killing you, is to go find whatever this creature is. Because I don't even really know. It's kind of the fine print of the contract that you make with some sort of demon or devil. Is that there, something comes out and, you know, I can't be bothered with it. What? I'm in. Let's do it. He doesn't read, and you just accepted him as your boss? Sure. Decker. We tell him we're gonna help him, but then really, no, we defeat that. We can turn on any time. We defeat if that. If he gives us a hard time, we'll just make I, a I sad black and white video. Yeah, uh, look, we'll do it, but you gotta help me find my father. <laughs> what the nice. fuck? <laughs> nice. Wow, like your door. father? My father went missing when I was a young boy in the gyre. You choose Last to bring this up now. A portal. <laughs> <laughs> Getting cigarettes. Yeah, sounds sounds good. We'll find your dad. Thank you, my new friend. So All right, little guy. Oh, so we're going through the portal? No, no, no. no. You no, guys are staying else. here. I'm going through the magic door. Okay. All right. Well, so we got to go to the mountains. And get the demon. We. All going right. The demon. We are not going to stop you from going through this magic portal. We Sounds good. You weren't really going to do it anyway. Yeah, and he no. takes another step <laughs> in. Uh, he's done. What's going on with these two, though? They're fighting. What? I mean, that's like an angel fighting a demon, and we're just like, okay, he's best of luck. <laughs> yeah, it's like Gandalf in the Balrog. Yeah, yeah, but exactly. we're, but we're like in a third party. Yeah, <laughs> just watching yeah, them. Yeah, Peter yeah, watching. Like, this okay. movie's great. All right, Peter Jackson, so you should get back off. So we're just leaving. Yeah, I mean, are you, are you guys gonna help him out? Well, what about the other creatures? Were they gonna help, or are they gonna attack us? So let's, well, you've got that guy bound. Um, I'll turn I'm to really the. I'm not sure the, what this guy's gonna do. Party, like, let's be square. He's summoning a demon. I think it's pretty good if Kudzi or whatever wins right now. Then we get we get to square out, and also maybe he goes take care of whatever the fuck that guy summoned. We're not on his side. Let's remember that. I agree. We're on no one's I agree side. Decker. There are no sides. Well, we have to, if we're gonna hit, we have to kill somebody. <laughs> Why? Well, do we just walk away? Let's just wait it I out. I think we just watch what happens with Kuzi <laughs> and the other thing, and try and figure out what's going on. You know, on. yeah, let Kuzi. Yeah, okay. I think let Kuzi all... and Banos fight it out, and then we'll just go with the winner based on that. Yeah, I think we all watch, right? I guess so. This is weird. It's a good conversation. This is not how this is supposed to go. Yeah, no, it's not. I don't think it's supposed to go anyway. We wandered into a... We wandered into a situation much beyond our station. But Was Funhouse supposed to be the fastest growing channel on all of YouTube? <laughs> <laughs> no! Alright, and well, we did that by it. not taking action. <laughs> yeah. I'll, uh... <laughs> I'll just see slap, what happens. Man. Can we let him fight it out? Yeah. Alright, it's Decker's turn. What's he doing? Um, I'm gonna... I'm gonna, like, sit down here on the edge. Um, pop up my laptop. Patented move. Start, uh, <laughs> I'll start researching. Like, I'm gonna roll Arcana Religion whatever on Koozie. See if I can figure anything out about him. Uh, let's see. Uh. <laughs> Auto batteries oh, again. <laughs> <laughs> uh, third, Low internet. Third, 12. Wait. 12? 13, sorry. You, you really aren't able to detect anything specific with the knowledge that you've had. He, he appears to be some sort of uh, demon hunter creature, possibly. Um, clearly from another realm. Um, clearly. Yeah, as you saw him walk through Pulls out a divine sword that shines with the light of seven heavens. Um, I think he's not from around here. I, I would say he is actually pretty obscure, like not something that's been written about a lot. Okay. So, so your knowledge of books and such wouldn't lend to a creature that hasn't actually been gotcha. put down in, in, in okay. those books. Miri. I'm just gonna, again, more or less watch this play out, but I'm gonna anticipate that guy possibly attacking, and I'm gonna 
use my fighting style of protection against either Raxan or Derek. I'm anticipating he might attack them. You can just say just hug, <laughs> you can just hug us. <laughs> it's a triple hug. Yeah. So I don't know what else to do, so that's what I'm yeah. gonna, Pray, the man. most proactive thing I can do, just, just staying there. All right. Banyos. Banyos. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, so Sabanos so takes out his his two. He's got these two giant stabs, yep. uh, look like drums does. or whatever, and, yeah, and tries to cool. beat on the, the little uh, kid. I'm cheering, but it's not clear for who. <laughs> Go, Go Banos! It's just right. so koozie. So uh, he completely misses with both both of his hits. Oh, Monst um, monsters now? Yeah. Um, so this guy's like, so hey, does anyone here know what's going on? Are we supposed to still like be fighting each other or anything? You can go. <laughs> Wait, okay, so, uh, yeah, are we trying to kill each other? Are you guys gonna do something for the big man? We you still know don't what? understand? <laughs> We're gonna see when he when he comes back out of the portal, we'll, we'll figure it out with We're him. We're just observers at this point. Yeah, I yeah. toss him a smoke. Alright, so yeah. Scoot like, back, buddy. Enjoy everyone likes it. the little man. Alright, so what is, does that yeah. guy move? Uh, well, he'll maybe move closer to that portal. Do we know? Shoot an arrow, make it interesting, above ten. It hits Banyos below ten. It hits Kuzi. <laughs> You're sh shooting huh? through the the portal. Yeah. Are they? So, so where, I would, I would say it, it's between you. They're they're closer to the statue. This portal is oh, so between you. So they're like a Stargate. Yeah. So, they're on so the, we can't even help. So they're on the you other side. Go around the side. Take so they're behind the portal. Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay. That wasn't. Sorry. No. 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 It's okay. Okay. So then I'll abandon that, and uh, just watch. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, at this point, you could probably just roll for Koozie and MC. Yeah. All right. Unless Shadowcock's yeah. busting something hard. I was just going to go over there. I think we're pretty much all exiting, exiting combat. All right. So uh, like we got a new friend. Koozie. <laughs> we'll he's say, he's we'll just like, I'm happy to be here. <laughs> you say, guys are great. You know, it, will someone ditch him into the portal real quick? Yeah, all man. right. So he's in the portal. So he, he actually takes a dive into the portal. <laughs> And kind of like with with a crack and a, and a, just a little tiny poof, oh, the shit. the thing disappears. Right. We're in big trouble. And uh, the kid Uzi goes, "Son of a bee sting! They closed it." You want the? I don't, like, band band I don't like this guy. <laughs> Gosh darn! <clears throat> Shoot, where where's the closest node? He pulls out like a small little uh, watch looking thing, looks at it. You know kinda, this Kind of spins. Uh, he, he he then pulls out a whistle and blows it real loud, and then takes off running. Uh, Jumps off the cliff there. Kills himself. It was time cop. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. So, hmm. um, what's going on here, fuck? guys? I mean, uh, uh, um, I'll snap my snap my laptop. Okay. Closed. So, the, the so that, guy, that guy didn't even want to talk to us. He's just he's out. out. I mean, he's he actually out. didn't make it that far. He was kind of like running up on the cliff. I don't know if you guys want to go after him, but uh, say the 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 ground starts to rumble and shake. Uh, the, a giant bright white light uh, fills the sky, and a giant mass comes like crashing into the ground. Sh you all go flying off. You're all ah. prone. Ah. This guy, fuck you. Laying down in pain, ah. smoke is filling. Basically, uh, some some object hit right here, <gasps> created you know a giant crater in the earth, uh, and sm the smoke is clearing. Qu'est-ce que c'est? Uh, and I think that's a great time to stop. Oh, oh shit! <laughs> Cliffhanger. Oh my fucking god. So none of y'all wanted wow. to go through that portal. They tried. I, they they both tried. Wanted I did, to. and then I thought that you were like, oh no, this yeah, is you were telling us not impossible to, so. to no, no. do. You could have gone in the portal. Oh, I, wow. it sounded like DM Dan. Yeah. The yes. did not think that absolutely. there was anything on the other side of the portal. I totally um, wanted to go oh. through that portal. Yeah, I absolutely did. Because you were like, oh well, you're in combat, and I was hey. like, oh. the choice is always yeah. yours, the player. I was just afraid of losing you guys. I know, and Raxon was like, no, don't! I was like, oh, I'm like, we need to make group decision, I don't know. I just couldn't get there. I was gonna, I was gonna try and throw Grimo. <laughs> oh, I wish you had. Throwing um, Grimo's always the best. I can't wait to find out what this this thing is, yeah, though. No. That's wow. it. Well, all right, yeah, so I, I guess that's the end of season one of Twits and Crits. But yeah, I, I think we've all had a great time playing. Yeah, absolutely. Um, the more support we can get from the audience and telling us how awesome this is, how much they like it, how many times they wouldn't subscribe for first, <laughs> will go a long way to getting us to come back for another one. Yeah, all the fan art, all the comments have been incredible. Yeah. Uh, yeah thank so you thank guys you for guys. engaging, and thank oh. you guys for watching us. Thanks, Dan, for Wicked Camera. Yeah, 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 yeah. Thank you. I, I mean, uh, of course, couldn't do it without you guys being fucking funny all the time. That's stupid. Um, <laughs> yeah, Man, I, I, I don't make this like lost. All right, yeah. <laughs> just don't ask more questions. No, no there will be more polar bears uh, next season. Ooh. Okay, cool. but yeah, uh, thanks for watching, and uh, if you support the show however you possibly can, and hopefully we'll be back soon.